Moreover, the Emperor Sheng Dan, but he took it out. The rules of the Temple of Destiny must not be broken. Otherwise, the future battle of hunting the sky will not be held. Another deity said. The Ghost Master took the lead, and the deities of the other races were happy to watch the excitement, all of them said that they must respect the rules of the Temple of Destiny and must not end the battle of hunting the sky in advance. The gods of the Kinglu of the Shola tribe and the gods of the Yanlu tribe fell into silence and did not appear in the Temple of Destiny. Goddess Fula said, the battle of hunting heaven continues, and no deities can intervene in the battlefield. Those who violate the rules shall be punished by the judge of the Destiny Temple. The gods of the undead blood are very angry. They are not angry at Lord Fulu. After all, Fulu sitting in that position cannot help the undead. Had it not been for the ghost to pick things up, the goddess Fulu would probably end the fight ahead of time because of the pity. That way, the undead can lock in the victory. Now, both the greedy infant and Yan Wushan can withdraw from the battlefield. Only Zhang Ruokan can't withdraw from the battlefield. Based on his cultivation, how could he be the opponent of the Supreme Lord? Back in the world of Godland, the blood battlefield battlefield stared diligently, saying, Now, I only hope that Zhang Ruokan will not be so stubborn and immediately withdraw from the battlefield. Even if the undead blood race can only get the second place, God also hopes that he can save his life first. Bendai thinks the same way, Luo Yan said, sitting beside him. The Ancient of Learning froze his beard and said with a smile, This way, naturally, it is the best, but everyone is happy. The blood ground battlefield and Zhang Ruokan's grandson didn't spend much time with each other, but they knew Zhang Ruokan's character very well and felt that he would probably not withdraw from the battlefield. He could not help but sigh. Hunting on the battlefield The greedy infant left the battlefield at the first time. Only the wounded Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan remained in this void. The two of them were wrapped in a ray of elixir, like a chain of gods wrapped around their bodies, unable to escape. Zhang Ruokan glanced at Brass Ding, and then looked at Yan Wushan, and said, Are you still out of the battlefield? If you don't leave the battlefield, I'm afraid I will die in the hands of the Emperor Shendan. I will never retreat until you leave the battlefield. Yan Wushan clenched his teeth and struggled against the entanglement of elixir. The elixir resembles a chain, dragging Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan to brass Xiao Ding. The voice of Emperor Shendan came from Ding, you two, one is the body of the demigod, the other is the body of the demigod, the blood is very powerful. After you are refined into the body, I may have a trace of promotion God's chance. Zhang Ruokan said to Yan Wushan, since we are not planning to withdraw from the battlefield in advance, it is better to cooperate once and suppress the Emperor Shendan first. After that, we will continue the war. Suppressing Emperor Shendan Yan Wushan stared at his eyes, feeling Zhang Ruokan too crazy. Zhang Ruokan said, if I didn't guess wrong, Brass Ding should be able to suppress the Emperor Sheng Dan, so it can't come out of Ding and can only use Dang Guang and Dan Kai to attack us. Just cover the Ding lid, that Emperor Shendan was naturally repressed. How confident are you? Yan Wushan asked. Zhang Ruokan said, I'm not sure. But, always have a try? Anyway, I will never admit defeat, and I will not take the initiative to withdraw from the battlefield. If you are afraid, it is too late to quit the battlefield now. If I quit the battlefield now, the Yan Luo tribe completely lost the chance to become the first. Well, first suppress the Emperor Shendan. If I don't fight to the last minute, I will never be willing to lose the battle of hunting the sky like this. Yan has no Shinto. Okay. I'll stop it and attract its attention. Go and cover it. Zhang Ruokan's broken arm was reconnected, and his injuries were extremely serious. However, this did not affect his belief in fighting against Emperor Shendan. In any case, it is necessary to capture the top ten. Do not move the Holy King. A huge golden light and shadow rushed out of Zhang Ruokan's body, and the elixir that entangled his body continued to expand outward. The next moment, 
Zhang Ruokin's body contracted a little, freed from the restraint of elixir. Want to run away? Emperor Shenden's voice sounded, among the brass dinger, hundreds of thousands of Dang Guangs flew out and shot at Zhang Ruokin. These Dang Guangs are too many in number, and they can't even stop the shortage. With Zhang Ruokin's severely injured body, he is even more afraid to resist, so he throws a purple gold gourd and his body shrinks and rushes in. There were also more than ten Dang Guangs, following him, rushing into the mouth of the gourd. A ray of Dan light contains a spiritual thought of Emperor Pin Sheng. After entering the gourd, Dan Guang still chased after Zhang Ruokin. Dan Guang did not fly straight, like a flying sword, chopped at him from all directions. Puff! Oh! Zhang Ruokin was hit by several Dang Guangs in a row, and his body was hit with blood springs. The last Dang Guang pierced his brows straight. At this moment, a light gate flew over and collided with Dan Guang. Pruchna's slender figure appeared behind the light gate, and her hands pressed forward. The light gate turned into a spiral shape, absorbing Dan Guang into her real world. Fan Ruo then carefully gazed at Zhang Ruokin, Dai Mei frowned, and there was a touch of gentleness that could not be concealed in her eyes, and said, Why are you so hurt? No time to explain, go with me, suppress the Emperor Sheng Dan first, and then say, Yan Wushan is afraid it won't last long. Zhang Ruokin said. Although Pruchna was full of doubts, she still agreed decisively and said, OK. Yan Wushan could not die. Once he died, it would be useless even if Zhang Ruokin hid in the purple golden gourd. In the end, he could not escape. Either die or live together. When Emperor Shenden struck Dang Guang and attacked Zhang Ruokin, Yan Wushan immediately propped up the real space of space, escaped the restraint of elixir, walked to the back of the brass small tripod, and picked up the tripod cover. However, before he took any action, he was spotted by Emperor Sheng Dan. This time, Emperor Sheng Dan divided dozens of wisps of elixir and entangled himself at Yan Wushan. The winding was getting tighter and tighter, squeezing his half Buddha body apart, and cracks appeared in his bones, as if to turn into a mess. Then you refine it first, and then you clean up the undead blood that hid in the gourd. Emperor Shenden said. Yan Wushan couldn't move, was pulled by Dan Qi, and flew to Brass Xiao Ding. Zhang Ruokin. Zhang Ruokin is too, too insidious. Let me build a Ding Gai, but I hid in a gourd. Seeing that Brass Xiao Ding was getting closer, Yan Wushan couldn't say a word, couldn't move his mouth, couldn't shout out the voice to withdraw from the battlefield, only thought that he would be killed today by Zhang Ruokin. Wow! Zhang Ruokin and Pruchna simultaneously flew out of the gourd. Because Pruchna was too low, he burned the blood of Sacred God and Xiao Yuan at the same time, allowing his strength to climb to the top. Subsequently, she went all out to prop up the door of the true ego, and the light of destiny reflected on Xiao Ding Ding. The power contained in dozens of elixir suddenly diminished. Taking this opportunity, Zhang Ruokin turned his right hand with five fingers, condensing thirty-six space swords, chopped them out, and cut off all the ambitions that wrapped around Yan Wushan. Yan Wushan was only one foot away from Xiao Ding Brass at this moment. After getting out of trouble, Yan Wushan's squeezed deformed eyes shot out two splendid flashes, bursting into an unparalleled responsiveness www.mtlnovel.com, shaking his hand like lightning, squeezing Dinga. Well... Ding Gai closed. The divine power emitted by Emperor Shenden disappeared instantly. Finally repressed it. This world fell into a long silence. Zhang Ruokin and Yan Wushan looked at each other with smiles on their faces. At this moment, they forgot that the other party was their own enemy. In the starry sky, two different directions came, and Hu Xiao Long Yin was heard. The starry sky close to Zhang Ruokin turned white and glowed as if it were shining in the darkness of the world. Secretly, a tiger shadow could be seen in white light. The starry sky close to Yan Wushan turned blue, and it seemed to be able to wash away all the brilliance of the world, a dragon shadow winding in the starry sky. 
the battle for hunting for a hundred days finally came to an end. All of the ten monks participating in the war were teleported to the mountain of destiny by the eyes of the gods of all walks of life, all of them were killed and wounded, and the battle was considered very cruel. The surviving slaves were also teleported back. A total of 3,456 people, most of whom were semi-holy, or holy, belonged to the missing fish and had poor points. Only four of them, killed the monks of the undead tribe, saved their lives and gained freedom. The remaining 3,000 slaves were beheaded and killed on the spot. The flesh and blood and the Holy Spirit were divided and eaten by monks of all races, which was even worse than dying on the battlefield of Kiratan. The integral data on the diamond lens has all disappeared. No one knows the final result of the battle between Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan. All monks participating in the war are anxiously waiting. The tiger howling and the dragon chanting sounded, and the picture reflected by the eyes of gods of the realm was broken. I wonder what happened. On the Kishan battlefield, how can there be the sound of tiger howling dragons? Will it be the gods who intervened in the battle of hunting the heavens? At that time, I felt an immensely powerful divine power. If not, the eyes of the gods of the realm teleport me away in time, I'm afraid I have been shattered by the roar. A ghost who entered the immortal realm for the first time said with fear. At that time, he happened to be the star of the ghost family. A great saint from the Kinglo temple shouted in a whisper to the greedy infant, saying, Brother greedy infant, the battle of hunting the sky is over. Why haven't Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan returned? The corner of the mouth of the greedy baby raised, saying, Some accidents did occur on the Kishan battlefield, I'm afraid they can't come back. This sentence was heard by many monks. So they came forward to inquire about the specific situation, but the greedy baby held her arms in front of her chest, very indifferent, and her face was blank, and they ignored them. In addition to the monks in the Kinglo temple, in this era, he only saw a few people such as Zhang Ruokan, Kei, and Yan Wushan. Other monks, in his opinion, were not qualified to talk to him. The grand saints of the undead blood group gathered together and heard the words of the greedy babies, all of them looked dignified, feeling more anxious than any other group. Only the magic sound is still calm, and he does not believe that Zhang Ruokan will have an accident. You know, if Zhang Ruokan fell on the Kishan battlefield, she would also die. Of course, this secret is not known to ordinary monks. Even most monks did not even know that she was a parasitic plant cultivated by Zhang Ruokan. Xi Xi Xi, Zhou Yan and Shen Tu Yung Kong, who followed Zhang Ruokan to join the hunting feast, were still at Mingzi. When they heard all the news about Zhang Ruokan, they suddenly felt like the sky was down. In the world of hell, Without Zhang Ruokan's protection, they might be reduced to blood food immediately. At this moment, there was a monk of the Raksha clan, carrying a slave's thigh, while passing by while eating. They were all nervous. For the first time, they deeply realized that Zhang Ruokan was so important to them and their lives were so fragile. Zhang Ruokan, you must not die. What are we going to do if you die? Zhou Yan said with a pained face. Xi Xi habitually looked up and looked at the sky. Sky, nothing. However, in the hundred days since the Battle of Kiratan, she saw from the sky's projection screen with her own eyes that Zhang Ruokan created miracles again and again and stepped on the peak of Kiratan battlefield. The man's body seemed to have endless fighting power and would never fall. He should not fall on the last day. Xi Xi thought to himself. It seemed to have slept for a thousand years, and Zhang Ruokan's hot and painful body was nourished by a cooling force, and the pain disappeared, replaced by an extremely pleasant pleasure. Zhang Ruokan opened his eyes and found himself lying on the white sand. Although the sun in the sky is bright, the light is not so dazzling. It shines on the body, warming, as if bathed in a fountain, and the limbs and bones of the whole body relax. In the distance, the sea water is blue, the water is rippling, the seabirds dive into the fish, and the scenery is beautiful and vibrant. It is completely different from the dark and dead environment of the world. Next to it, 
a giant tree up to 100 meters tall with green leaves and dense branches, like a green umbrella. On the leaves, a little bit of radiant light is emitted, like white rain. Sitting up, Zhang Ruokan's face appeared blank, and said to himself, Where am I? This is the world of God's kingdom of the Fulu. A voice sounded. Zhang Ruokan turned his head and saw that there was a white tiger, about five meters long, with a big head and a fat buttock. It's weird that it has no hair on its body, its skin is as white as jade, and there is a golden burial character on its head. Zhang Ruokan narrowed his eyes, immediately got up, and asked cautiously, Senior, are you? It's me, of course it's me. The funeral gold white tiger stood up and shook the sand on his body. When Zhang Ruokan saw the burial gold and white tiger for the first time in the ghost family's own star, his body exuded terrible power, his body was huge, and a skull could fill Zhang Ruokan's vision. It now looks bigger than an ordinary tiger, and is completely restrained. The only particularity is that the whole body is hairless. Zhang Ruokan thought of something, his face changed, and said, Here is the world of the divine deity of Fulu. Immediately afterwards, he looked around carefully. Where does this place look like a divine world? No difference from a real world. Unleashing the power of spiritual exploration, the borders of the world are not felt at all. The more you explore, the more frightened. In this world of Godland, there are not only mountains and oceans, but also various creatures. Some powerful beings have even reached the realm of immortality. As for the farther away of the world, it is unknown whether there are more powerful beings. What's even more unknown is whether these creatures were brought in by the deities of Fulu, or were born naturally. If it is the latter, then Zhang Ruokan has to say that the deity of Fulu must be a meritorious devotion and cultivation, which has reached an inexorable level. One person is a big world. He is the creator of this world. Well, the gods can know everything in the world of the divine realm. Will the Fulu already know some of my memories, or read my thoughts directly? Zhang Ruokan's heart became hesitant. In the face of a powerful terrorist who can't control himself, Zhang Ruokan can hardly keep calm. The voice of the burial gold and white tiger sounded in Zhang Ruokan's mind, Don't worry, you have merged the spirit of my extreme burial gold, and I have sheltered you without any gods. I can read your memories and thoughts. No way. Zhang Ruokan stared at it, feeling even worse. It's over. With this tiger in, don't try to keep a secret in the future. Funeral Gold and White Tiger said, Rest assured, I will not read your thoughts anytime, anywhere. Say no, why are you reading it now? The Funeral Gold and White Tiger said, You do nt ask me, of course I can only read it. Besides, here is the world of the divine deity of Fulu, you do nt seem to want to expose some secrets, you see nt say it, then you can only read it your thoughts communicate with you. Zhang Ruokan was completely speechless and wanted to make the brain blank. Funeral Gold and White Tiger said, don't be so nervous. You have passed my test. Now you are my guide. Our destiny is connected. You don't need to guard against me. You are the of hell. Zhang Ruokan thought so. Funeral Gold and White Tiger said, No, I don't belong to the world, I come from the ancient nest of God. Although Zhang Ruokan had speculated for a long time, when she heard the burial of Jin Beihu admitting it herself, she was still shocked. God's ancient nest, but one of the most mysterious places in the universe, is known as the prehistoric civilization. Zhang Ruokan relaxed a little, finally spoke, and asked, You just said, I am your guide. What does this mean? Now that you are awake, go with me to the Lord Fulu and he will tell you what is the guide. Come on my back and I will take you to see him. Zhang Ruokan looked hesitant, and said, It's, not good. The seniors are leading in front, I'm flying in the back, just keep up. Just kidding, this one in front of you, but the beast of God's ancient nest, can sit on an equal footing with the gods in hell. The gods dare not think of it as a mount. How dare you be a big saint in other places? 
Depending on your practice, you can't get there after flying for 10 years. Don't grind up, come up. Funeral Gold and White Tiger said. Seeing that it seemed serious, Zhang Ruokin took a deep breath, no longer hesitated, took a leap, and flew onto its back. It's really too dreamy, Da Sheng can actually ride a flying beast. Wow! A peaceful white light bloomed on the body of the burial gold white tiger, turned into a light, flew to a certain direction of the world of the divine realm, and crashed into the void. A regular pattern emerged from where the void was struck. It flashed for a moment, and the regular lines disappeared again. My injury seems to have healed, Zhang Ruokin said. The funeral gold and white tiger guessed what Zhang Ruokin thought, saying, Don't worry about it so much. I will heal you for half of your injury. The Lord Fulo didn't probe you and didn't know you had the heart of truth. Zhang Ruokin fainted and wanted to jump out of the burial gold and white tiger. Really, there is no secret at all. After a long time, Zhang Ruokin calmed down and secretly said, Be calm, you must be calm. I am because of the fusion of the ultimate burial spirit, so it can read my thoughts anytime, anywhere, and other gods can't do it. Yes, you are right. This is indeed the case. The relationship between the two of us is, in a sense, closer and equal than your human husband and wife relationship. You should absolutely trust me. Road. Zhang Ruokin smiled bitterly and secretly said, If the relationship is really so close, then equal, why can you only read my thoughts, and not me? Because your cultivation is not as high as mine, and your mental strength is not as high as me. If one day in the future you surpass me, you can naturally reverse all of this. Funeral Gold and White Tiger said. There is no way to refute. Zhang Ruokin no longer thinks about these messy things, and asks, You said, half of the injuries in my body are for me to heal me. So, what about the other half? The other half, of course, is yourself. Your self-healing ability is very powerful. I suspect that by tearing you into pieces, your body can be reunited together. However, time will be very long. Funeral White Tiger Road Zhang Ruokin stopped asking more questions, and began to think about how to let himself be free from thinking about anything. Being read by a tiger all the time is no different from and streaking on the street. If you feel that reading your memory makes you feel contradictory and uncomfortable, then from now on, I will not read it. After just saying this, without waiting for Zhang Ruokin to return a word of good, Burial Gold and White Tiger said, However, I read your thoughts and wanted to know more about you. Only in this way, we can get along better in the future. Let's go and see Lord Fula first. With that in his mouth, what Zhang Ruokin thought was how to get rid of the identity of Guide. This burial gold and white tiger seemed to get along well, he also helped him heal, and he also made his mount, it was just a silly white sweet. However, Zhang Ruokin has too many secrets and does not want to be known to outsiders. He must not take it with him. The best thing is to let the blood evacuate the burial gold from his body and completely cut off the burial gold and white tiger. The burial gold and white tiger took Zhang Ruokin to the sea of the world of Shenjing. Yan Wushan stood on the head of a blue dragon and had already waited on the sea. When he saw Zhang Ruokin coming, his face was surprised before he smiled. The burial gold and white tiger landed on the sea surface and stepped on the water with all four feet, like walking on the ground. Zhang Ruokin carefully looked at the blue dragon under Yan Wushan's body, and a faint expression appeared on his face, and finally he understood where the ten dragon souls in his body came from. So he clenched his fists and said, Thank you, senior. I see that you have mixed the spirit of the ultimate burial gold, and it is likely that the leader chosen by the tiger will help you. In fact, depending on your physique and perseverance, you may not be able to survive that crisis. Word Ching Long Road. Wow. Clouds rolled in the sky. Layers of white clouds have been pressing towards the sea surface, condensing into a majestic gaseous face, exuding the momentum, so that Zhang Ruokin and Yan Wushan, the two holy gods, only feel sinking, 
can't help but want to kneel worship. However, they were all very people, holding their bodies up and not kneeling. Meet the Lord. Yan Wushan took the lead in saluting. Zhang Ruokan held his fist and said, Meet the deity. The gaseous face of the deity of Fulu made a shocking voice, Very good, both of you are good, qualified to represent the world of and become the guides of the two prehistoric species of God's nest. Zhang Ruokan immediately said, God, can you not be a guide? Yan Wushan was surprised and looked sideways. He knows that Zhang Ruokan is proud but you do nt even deserve the status of leader of prehistoric gods, and do nt you think of prehistoric gods too? Do you know that many deities www.mtlnovel.com want to be the guide of burial gold and white tigers, but have no chance? Before waiting for the welfare god to ask, burial gold and white tiger said, Furu god, I have a secret, and I need to report it to you. It's about me carrying this monk. Hearing this, Zhang Ruokan's face froze. No, this white tiger is too unprincipled, just unwilling to be your guide, do you turn your face away now? Zhang Ruokan only knew that the burial gold and white tiger could read his thoughts. As for whether he could read his memory, it was unknown. If you can read the memory, it will be very troublesome and it will affect many people. Most of them can read the memory. After all, its mental strength is much stronger than Zhang Ruokan. When Zhang Ruokan was asleep, his thinking defense was extremely low, for he had done everything to him. What a beast! I thought you were silly and sweet, but I didn't expect you to be scheming. What is it? The sounds of the gods of Fulu, such as Hong Zhong de Luo, spread throughout the world. Zhang Ruokan was in a state of confusion, but he was not lost his thinking moved quickly, and his coping strategies were considered. The funeral white tiger opened his mouth and said, I carry this monk on my back. Because of the fusion of the extreme funeral spirit, I can read his thoughts and some memories. I found that he came from the heavenly court on the other side of the sky, and a Tian slave in the Tian Tian battlefield has a deep friendship, but he killed the Tian slave for some purpose. The Tian slave, named Wild Sword, is a great saint in the cold world. A pair of divine eyes of the deity of Fula stared at Zhang Ruokan, and said, Zhang Ruokan, why do you kill the great sword of the sword? It's true. I was forced to helplessly in the past. I left the heavenly courts. The sword sage really took care of me. It is also a teacher and friend. However, I am now a member of the world, representing the undead blood. My grandfather even tried to disagree and put all my hopes on me. On the battlefield, even if there was nothing but helplessness, I had to take a shot. Furthermore, the great sword master knew that he could never leave the battlefield of Kiritan alive. He didn't want to involve me, and he didn't want to fall into the hands of other monks in the world and tortured to death. Therefore, at that meeting, he wanted to die. Zhang Ruokan calmly and calmly came. Many things can't be concealed from the deity of Fulu. Rather than deny your relationship with the sword of the wild sword, it is better to tell the truest situation directly. At the same time, Zhang Ruokan breathed a sigh of relief. Obviously, the burial gold and white tiger's move just now was a tentative threat, and did not drive him to a dead end. If Zhang Ruokan continues to refuse to be its leader, what he says is definitely more important. Goddess Fula said, you can recognize that you are a member of the world, and it is a good thing to understand your own camp. However, since the sword of the great sword is close to you and is also a teacher and friend, why do nt you advise he joined the world? In this way, you can not save his life? It is not difficult to save the life of a great saint with your natural strength and the background of the blood sacrifice family. Zhang Ruokan shook his head and said, the savage sage is not the same as me. He is in the cold world, with disciples and people. If he joins the world, I don't know how many people will die because of him. Besides, with his integrity, I if you ask him that question, he will feel that I am insulting him. Goddess Fula was silent, and after a short while, he asked, You really don't want to be a guide to bury the golden and white tigers? 
I'm afraid you don't know what is a guide. Of course, Zhang Ruokan did not dare to refuse in a hurry, and asked curiously, I really don't understand. Please ask God to explain. This has to be said from the origins of the burial gold and white tigers and the symbol dragon. They were brought out by the ancient emperor of the capital from the ancient nest of God. The ancient nest of God, known as the prehistoric civilization relics, refers to 50,000 yuan. Before the meeting. The gods agree that before the 50,000 yuan conference, there was a major destruction in the universe, destroying everything at that time, and only the five prehistoric civilizations remain. There may be other prehistoric civilizations, but at least heaven and haven't found it yet. The fetal eggs of the burial gold and white tiger and the symbol dragon were preserved from the 50,000 Yuan Conference, and they went through a great destruction until the Yuan Conference after the 50,000 Yuan Conference, and finally hatched them. So, said they are prehistoric gods. The hearts of Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan were greatly shaken. The two fetal eggs were not destroyed in the great destruction, and 50,000 Yuan society were also saved. The 50,000 Yuan meeting didn't even turn into a dead egg, and it hatched out. This. The cosmic fetus of the greedy baby gave birth to three Yuanhui. The hundred flower fairy has survived from the ancient times to the present. It can be said to be rare and rare, belonging to the universe's rare treasure level. However, compared with the funeral gold white tiger and the symbol dragon, it is a lot worse. They are afraid of being the only two prehistoric gods. Goddess Fula continued, they have experienced the great destruction, and may even have absorbed the special powers of the great destruction, and they will surely become the first class hegemons between heaven and earth in the future. However, they cannot get out of the ancient nest of God. Hearing this, Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan showed their doubts. Can't get out of God's ancient nest? God Fula said, the rules of heaven and earth are completely different from those of prehistoric times. Once they get out of the ancient nest of God, they will be attacked by the rules of heaven and earth, causing heaven punishment. Thirty thousand years ago, the great emperor of Dudu hid them in their own divine world before taking out the ancient nest of God and sending them to the world of hell. Even so, they could only stay there. In an independent world, there is no way out. It took 30,000 years for them to slowly conform to the rules of the world of this era and not be attacked again. However, once they mobilize the power in their bodies, when the power is strong to a certain extent, they will still be noticed by the rules of heaven and earth, which will lead to heaven punishment and no place for death. Zhang Ruokan gradually understood that the burial gold and white tiger and the symbol dragon were not living creatures of this era, and they should have died before the great destruction. For instance, the rules of prehistoric heaven and earth require that living beings live in water. The rules of the heavens and the earth in this era live on the land. The burial gold white tiger and the symbol dragon are two powerful fish that live in the water. However, no matter how powerful the fish is, when it comes to land, it will still die. Heaven and earth rules are different. The gods could not resist. Goddess Fulu also said, not only that, they cannot practice under the rules of the world of this age. Yan Wushan said, since they came out so dangerous, why didn't they stay in the ancient nest of God? Goddess Fula said, the deities just said that they have experienced great destruction, and it is even possible that they absorbed the special powers of the great destruction, and they will surely become hegemons in the universe in the future. But there is a premise that they must go out of the ancient the nest must be integrated into this era, otherwise it will be the shoal of dragons, and their current achievement is their limit. Zhang Ruokan asked, guiders can help them solve the problems of being rejected by the rules of heaven and earth and being unable to cultivate. Yes. God Fula said, you have mixed the air of Ji Dao's burial gold, and the air of Ji Dao's funeral and blue, which has been preliminarily fused with their power. As long as they are with you, the rules of heaven and earth will affect them. Exclusion will be much lessened. Zhang Ruokan said, however, this is a cure for the symptoms and not the root cause. They cannot fundamentally change their situation. Goddess Fula said, 
so after you become their guides, you must help them cultivate until they can fully integrate into this era. Of course, as a reward, they will protect your life and teach you some of the prehistoric gongfa and knowledge. At the same time, you and the ancient nest of God can establish a close relationship, which is equivalent to a strong backing and background. There are other creatures in the ancient nest of God. They all originated from prehistory, but they were born in this era. They will not be excluded by the rules of the heavens and the earth and can walk the world. The remains of the five major prehistoric civilizations can still be seen. Their strength has been seen without being flattened by heaven and hell. Yan Wushan asked, They are divine beasts. We are just holy gods. How can we help them cultivate? God Fula said, This requires you to communicate with each other. Zhang Ruokin pondered for a long time, and asked the last question, God, I still don't know anything. Since there are so many benefits to the guide, why choose our two great saints in a hundred realms to be the guide? Instead, to be Lord God, or Emperor Biedu, wouldn't it be better? Not that simple. Goddess Fulo is very patient and said slowly, when you merge the spirit of burial gold of the Taoism, you should know how difficult it is. For thirty thousand years, the undead blood tribe has been born, but you are the only one. Success. Zhang Ruokin frowned, and said, the deities and emperors of the capital are incapable of merging the qi of burial gold. Goddess Fulo said, the fusion is possible, but if you want to fully integrate with our body, I am afraid that even if you bury the golden and white tigers, they will not be saturated. You cannot be a guider if you cannot fully integrate. Even if other gods can completely integrate the burial gas of the Jideo, but the amount of the chi of the guild burial will absorb the burial gold tiger for a long time. This is one of them. Second, the growth potential of many deities, the funeral gold and white tiger simply do not look down, and do not want to let him be his guide. Third, the most important. The body and the way of the deities have been fixed, and they will affect the burial of gold and white tigers. On the contrary, the monks in the great holy realm have a larger base and can find the one that suits them best. After listening to Zhang Ruokin and Yan Wushan, they suddenly understood what the guide was all about. Goddess Fulo asked, Zhang Ruokin, are you still unwilling to be the guide of burying the golden and white tigers? No, I'm willing to be a guide to bury the gold and white tigers, Zhang Ruokin said. Jokingly, when the funeral of the white tiger started to report him, Zhang Ruokin had no choice. Besides, Zhang Ruokin feels that becoming the leader of the burial gold and white tiger seems to be a retreat. If you can't stay in heaven or hell, you can at least go to God's nest to take refuge in the face of death. The funeral white tiger snorted softly. It seems to be dissatisfied with Zhang Ruokin, but also proud of Zhang Ruokin's compromise. Goddess Fula said, since your injuries have recovered, it's time to go out. The battle for hunting the sky has ended for about an hour. Suddenly, a white brilliance wrapped Zhang Ruokin and the burial gold and white tiger. As the sky turned upside down, Zhang Ruokin noticed that the surrounding scene had changed and appeared at Wujin Square under the Destiny Mountain. The burial gold and white tiger's breath was restrained, and the mighty Xiong Jun stood aside. In front of the square is the gate of destiny piled with tens of thousands of star cores. It is majestic and scary, and it seems to be able to penetrate ancient and modern and Xingai. Look, Zhang Ruokin is back. Sure enough, it's Zhang Ruokin. He didn't die. The majesty that radiates from his body is really powerful. Countless eyes, looking at Zhang Ruokin, some people were fortunate and excited. Others were disappointed and frowned. At this moment, Zhang Ruokin was showing his muscular upper body, his hair was loose, his pupils had a layer of blood-red light, and the whole person was full of evil and masculine beauty, which had a fatal appeal to female monks. In the other direction, Yan Wushan and King Ziching Long returned to the Yan Luo camp and caused a great commotion, surrounded by many monks. On the contrary, the burial gold and white tigers and symbol dragons at the level of gods and beasts were ignored by them, as if they did not feel the terror in their bodies, 
and thought that they were just two holy beasts. In his heart, Zhang Ruokan communicated with the burial gold and white tiger and asked, Can you really only read part of my memory? Yes, your sea of consciousness is blocked by many powerful forces, even if I can't break in. I really want to read it forcibly, I'm afraid your sea of consciousness will break down, and you will die. There is a wonderful feeling between Zhang Ruokan and the burial gold and white tiger. It can be judged that it is telling the truth, without deliberately deceiving. A lot of power? In addition to the mother-in-law, the god of blood, and the moon god, are there other gods who have imposed a chain of blockade in the sea of my consciousness? Zhang Ruokan frowned. Funeral gold and white tiger said, there is a blockade that is very powerful. I feel that the caster is more powerful than my spirit. That blockade isolates your consciousness. What do you mean? Zhang Ruokan's eyes became sharp. The funeral white tiger said, it means that you have a memory that you don't even know. How is this possible? Zhang Ruokan said. Even if the gods want to operate on Zhang Ruokan, at least Zhang Ruokan will have an impression. How could he not know at all? The magic sound first came to Zhang Ruokan's side, his eyes obsessed with Zhang Ruokan's body, and smiled, Congratulations to the master, cultivation is advanced. Zhang Ruokan's face was solemn, but he nodded. The magic sound no longer talked, turned into a light, rushed into Zhang Ruokan's back. Later, after the wind, the sword prison emperor, Yi Xian Dashan, Gu Chunzi, and other people rushed up and asked Zhang Ruokan one after another about the outcome of the battle of hunting the sky. More undead sacred saints rushed forward to meet. Zhang Ruokan has the demeanor of a leader of this era. After the wind and the blade king emperor, he completely stole the limelight and became a foil. Before waiting for Zhang Ruokan to open his mouth www.mtlnovel.com the top priest of fuel black robe with a body of thousands of feet came out, holding a scroll and slowly opening it, saying, the ranks of the ten battles in the sky. With ten solemn expressions, all ten monks looked to the high priest in the black robe of Fulu, and no one dared to make a noise. In fact, only the top four rankings have suspense. Yan Luo and Undead Blood raced until the last moment. Among the stars of the Hades, the Hades and the Raksha races were very fierce in order to compete for the third place, and the points were very close. Of course Zhang Ruokan knew the final result, so he seemed very calm. However, the monks in the whole world of are tense at this moment. Many monks gathered near the Mountain of Destiny are holding their breath. Although it is only a ranking, it is related to the glory of the family and the huge interests. In the battle for hunting the sky, the undead blood ranks first, and all monks participating in the war reward the opportunity to enter the relics to choose a treasure of destiny. In addition, each monk can also enter the temple of destiny to practice for a hundred days. The undead monks are all excited. Actually, he can enter the ancient ruins and get a treasure of destiny. Even the great saint is ecstatic. A treasure of destiny, even if you don't use it, it is also astronomical if you sell it. With God's stone, what can't I buy? As for the opportunity to enter the temple of destiny for cultivation, it is the dream of the whole monk. After the wind, the strange light lingered in the eyes, and secretly said, My destiny feather is the treasure of destiny in the relics. Now my cultivation is higher, and I re-entered the relics. Maybe I can find more precious wonders. Treasure. It is said that the core disciples of the Temple of Destiny all need to make great efforts to be qualified to enter the Temple of Destiny for one day of cultivation. But we can practice for a hundred days at a time. Taking advantage of this opportunity, not necessarily, I can consolidate the door to fate in one fell swoop. My gate of destiny can become stronger. Don't be excited. This is just the reward given to us by the Temple of Destiny. After returning, the reward given by the Immortal Temple, Tribe, and Family will definitely be more generous. Haha. <laughs> the monks of the Undead Tribe fell into Carnival, only to feel that all the efforts of the Battle of the Hunting Sky were worthwhile, and finally got their due. The monks of the other races were all jealous and jealous. 
The voice of the deity of Fuel sounded again, the Yan Luo tribe ranked second, and all monks received a Wang Pinyun Dan and the opportunity to enter the Temple of Destiny to practice for a hundred days. The so-called Yun Dan is said to improve monk luck after swallowing. This kind of thing is mysterious, but since the Temple of Destiny is openly given, it should have a certain effect. Whether you can improve your luck or not, it is a blessing. Perhaps when breaking through the realm, the probability of success will be higher. After all, after the battle of hunting the sky, those monks who have been staying in the Baiwen realm will definitely sprint Qunwen realm collectively. Breaking the country is not that simple. The Rakshasa ranks third, and all monks have the opportunity to enter the Temple of Destiny to practice for a hundred days. Only the top three monks can get rewards. The Hades, the dead, the Shura, the monks of the other races are angry and envious. They only hate the defeat of the Kish nation, otherwise all the benefits belong to them. Wu Jiang said in a deep tone, Yan Huangtu and Luo Shengtian, I am afraid that I will receive countless rewards. With these rewards resources, the speed of cultivation will increase by leaps and bounds. I must redouble my efforts to ensure that I do not fall behind them. In Wu Jiang's eyes, Yan Huangtu and Luo Shengtian are competitors. Although Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan acted amazingly, they were destined to practice in Baiyun realm for a long time, not only to break the shackles, but also to polish the divine will. Yan Huangtu, Luo Shengtian and Wu Jiang have accumulated enough, and they will break through into a thousand questions instantly, and then continue to sing and advance. Whether Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan can catch up with them in the realm is still unknown. If there is a big gap, even if they are stunning again, Wu Jiang has the confidence to crush them. Wind. The Fuel called this name. After waiting for a long time for the wind, the spirit suddenly rose. He immediately stepped forward, knelt on the ground with one knee, and said, See God. The wind is just the name after the wind. Her surname, called Yin's, is a large surname of the Huangtian tribe. It rules a vast territory and is a very mysterious place in the tribal world. Goddess Fuel said, the deity announced that you have officially become the goddess of the Temple of Destiny and will take care of everything in the next Millennium Temple. Would you like? After the wind slammed the excitement in his heart and said, the disciples are willing. Success, finally success. From now on, she will reach the pinnacle of power in hell, and be called the first person under the gods. Those sacred gods and demigods, who saw her, were inferior by three points, and could even sit on a par with some false gods. The deity does not ask too much about the world, and she is the worldly master of hell. What about Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan's natural talent? No god, after all, under her. What's the point of Prujna cultivating the door of true self? By virtue of her status as a goddess, she can obtain a large amount of cultivation resources, and she may not be able to cultivate her true self. Moreover, as a realm, you can make rapid advances and throw away Prujna far. Even as long as she was willing, she could use the help of others, and God would kill Prujna without knowing it, completely eliminating the threat. Becoming a goddess, it is only a matter of time before I catch up with Wu Jiang, Luo Shengtian, Yan Huangtu, and Greedy Baby. By then, it will be enough to stand on the pinnacle of this era and it may be possible to cultivate into God earlier than them. After the wind is very clear, how impressive the resources that can be mobilized by the gods and goddesses in the Temple of Destiny are full of expectations for the next cultivation. Zhang Ruokan Fuel God said. Zhang Ruokan was very calm. He walked to the side of the wind, bowed and saluted, and said, See God. After the wind, there was some discomfort in her heart. She also met Fulu, Zhang Ruokan just bowed and salute, but she was kneeling on one knee. Didn't Zhang Ruokan do this to place Her Highness, the Goddess, in an awkward position? When other monks saw this scene, what would they think? Does Zhang Ruokan feel more honorable than the Goddess? I wanted to stand up after the wind, but I found that just as soon as my body moved, between heaven and earth, there was a heavy weight like stars, 
and she was set there. It's a mighty god. It is easy to kneel, but it is difficult to get up. Especially when the deity has not spoken, how can a kneeling person get up? Of course, the deity of Fulo did not deliberately press her there, but the invisible Shinto will before he finished speaking could not move. God of Fuluo said, Zhang Ruokan, you have performed outstandingly in the hunting battlefield, leading the undead blood to take the first place, and even killing the slaves of the ten thousand lives, you can get the final reward, thirty thousand destiny and a destiny. Wow! Wow! The two destiny orders turned into two white streamers, flying towards Zhang Ruokan and the wind respectively. Zhang Ruokan grabbed his hand and just touched the token. Suddenly, the token disappeared. Do not. The token was rushed into his palm. Well. Dense white light, wrapped around Zhang Ruokan's right hand, gradually converged back. In the palm of the hand, a wordling appeared. The Destiny Order is a combination of the Twelve Deities of the Destiny Temple. It contains the doctrines of the Twelve Deities, and no monk can imitate them. With the Destiny Decree, Zhang Ruokan can have the same transcendental status as the Goddess of Destiny, and can enter the various secret realms of the Destiny Temple to practice at will. Of course, the fate of Zhang Ruokan is not the same as the fate of the fate obtained after the wind. Zhang Ruokan's destiny can only be regarded as a status symbol. However, the destiny after the wind represents the supreme right, just like the monarch's power. The deity of Fulo did not continue to mention the mystery of destiny, and said, let's retreat. Immediately after the wind, I felt the pressure on my body was relaxed. I slowly got up and resumed the noble and elegant posture. I looked at Zhang Ruokan and expressed my dissatisfaction in my heart. I said, God is the most powerful existence between heaven and earth. Be in awe. Okay. Zhang Ruokan replied and returned to the undead camp first. Regardless of the deity, you don't kneel without kneeling. Between heaven and earth, there should be uncompromising pride. God of Fulo said, this generation of world has a great generation, there are cosmic fetuses, demigods, demigods, imperial bones, thousands of hands and eyes, and those who control nothing. The deity came to me and wanted to give two marriages. Immediately after the mighty divine voice came out, it immediately caused the noise of a mountain tsunami, which was even greater than being a goddess after the wind. What honor and care does God honor to marry in person, and on such occasions? There is no doubt that those who are given a marriage will rise in the world in the future. Luo Shengtian grinned and whispered to Luo Yan who was standing next to him, and said, God blesses himself, there are once or twice every millennium, but never happened before personal marriage. Luo Yang Qiao's face is like a jade, and Dai Mei's eyebrows are lightly condensed. She said, it's really weird. The gods can't intervene in the world but marrying a monk in the holy realm is tantamount to participating in a disguised game among the major forces. God Fulu always ignores in the world, Zhong Yang keeps peace, and I'm afraid that doing so has some profound meaning. Luo Shengtian said, I don't know who will be married. Luo Min pondered carefully, and then his eyes were bright, saying, in fact, it is not difficult to guess. There are only a few people who can enter the eyes of the deity and personally marry. Lack, greedy infant, Yan Huangtu, Wu Zhang, Huang Xiang Yu, as well as Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan. Is it? Luo Yan's pair of slightly charming eyes glanced at Zhang Ruokan in the distance, and he secretly guessed that it was the god of blood jealousy who asked the Afulo to marry Zhang Ruokan? This possibility is very high. After all, Zhang Ruokan has too many enemies in the world, and it is difficult to grow up without the protection of a deity. Luo Shengtian followed Luo Yan's gaze and said in surprise, Will it be him? Most likely to be that guy, and the one who was given a wedding, most likely was Yan Jaxian. In Luo Min's heart, somehow annoyed, very irritable, sore, and some jealous, obviously Zhang Ruokan is her destiny. Why did Yan Jaxian come to the top? Too unfair. The gods have personally given their marriages. From now on, 
Yan Jaxian must be Zhang Ruokin's first wife, with a status that no one can replace. In the future, if she wants to find Zhang Ruokin, she will first be suppressed and targeted by Yan Jaxian, and her name will change. Luo Yan never thought that he would be married. Because of her special status, her father was Emperor Luo Yan, and her father would never allow her to marry Zhang Ruokin. No matter how powerful the goddess Fulu is, it is impossible to overpower her father's will. The owner of a kingdom of God cannot compromise and yield to anyone. Luo Shengtian said, Yeah, Zhang Ruokin is really a bastard. On the Kishin battlefield, Yan Jaxian has a big belly. Only the marriage of God Fulu can he calm the anger of the Yan Luo people. Whoever married him must have been blood mold for eight lives, but unfortunately, Yan Zexian, the godly daughter of the Yan Luo tribe. The voice of goddess Fulu heard, Zhang Ruokin, Luo Yan. Hearing his own name, Zhang Ruokin was not surprised. He had already speculated in his heart, but he did not expect that Luo Yan would be the one who was given the marriage. After all, in the cognition of many monks, he and Luo Ling have more hatred. Not only did he capture Luo Luo, he also spit her blood on the battlefield of merit and killed countless monks of the Raksha tribe. If it weren't for Zhang Ruokin and Luo Yan who had cooperated on the battlefield of merit, I am afraid that many monks would think that their hatred is deep. How did Emperor Luo Yan promise this marriage? Zhang Ruokin did not dare to disobey the will of a deity and stepped out. When Luo Yan heard his name, the whole person was holding her back, completely beyond her expectation. Then, the white and glaring face could not hold on any more, and a moving smile appeared, and the pace went away happily. Go out! Soon she caught up with Zhang Ruokin, and they walked side by side. Luo Shengtian stayed in the same place as if he had petrified. The fuel was crazy. He even let his sister marry Zhang Ruokin asshole. How much grievance did the sister suffer after marriage? But Zhang Ruokin bullied Luo Luo many times. No, absolutely not, absolutely can't let them be together. Luo Shengtian took a step forward. Suddenly, his body could not move, as if there were countless chains around him. The voice of his mother sounded in his mind, God honors marriage, who dares to disobey? But after the mother, we can't watch our sister jumping into the fire pit, right? Father Emperor can't stop the deity. Luo Shengtian said. Tian Yin's voice sounded, This marriage, your father and I have already agreed. Luo Shengtian was full of anger, and suddenly died, and the whole person was messy. Goddess Fulu said, The deity intends to marry you too, Zhang Ruokin, would you like to marry Luo Yan, the princess of the kingdom of God Luo? I do, Zhang Ruokin said. As Tianyin said, God honors marriage, who dares to disobey? Blessed God is the marriage of monks in the whole world of www.mtlnovel.com Whoever disobeys his will and rejects his kind will have very serious consequences. It is thousands of times more serious than rejecting the marriage of the emperor in the secular world. Luo Ye, would you like to marry Zhang Ruokin, a son of the blood family? Luo Ye's red lips were slightly frowned slightly shy, and he said, I do. Luo Yan, the goddess of countless days of the Raksha tribe, wanted to marry her and saw that she had been married to Zhang Ruokin by the god of Fulu, and her eyes became red and jealous. No one dared to stand up against it. Prujna stood in the crowd, distant, looking at Zhang Ruokin and Luo Yan standing side by side, a handsome and handsome, a beautiful as fairy, just like a golden girl. Under her eyes, a gloom appeared, her fingers stabbed into her palm, her heartache was angling, but she immediately lowered her head, not wanting anyone to see her emotions. At this moment, the voice of the deity of Fulu sounded again, shouting, Yan Wushan, Prujna. How could it be me? Yan Wushan whispered aloud, then seemed indifferent, and stepped out. His cultivation path is destined to be ruthless in his life and his partner is optional. However, since it is God's honor to marry, then there must be deep meaning, naturally it is to promise. Moreover, 
he was not impressed with Prujna. The thing that shakes the most is Prujna and Zhang Ruokan. Zhang Ruokan didn't change any expression, but a pair of pupils contracted quickly and breathing stopped for a moment. But soon, everything returned to normal. Prujna's performance was much more obvious than Zhang Ruokan's, suddenly raised his head, and looked at the Afuelo with an incredible expression. There were so many shocked monks, even some gods were surprised, so no one noticed her apparently something wrong. In the distance, Xian Xian's sword stunned his heart, his face changed, and said, Well, how could the Fuelo come here? Emperor Qian Bone said, What are you worried about? Both Prujna and Zhang Ruokan are disciples of Xian Yuan Sword Master, and they have some understanding of their personality. He said, The most difficult point in the world is the relationship. The Empress should know that Zhang Ruokan is a person who keeps his promise and promises to do everything he can, even if it is difficult. In this case, it is true. Emperor Qian Bones said. Xian Yuan Sword of the Sage, in the past, when Zhang Ruokan proposed to Huang Yanchen, he once said a word. My friendship with my sister, the three reincarnations of Sans Hung Three and Sans Huan also remain the same. Perhaps because of the various things they have done, they have become a stranger. Ian is righteous, but the feeling in Zhang Ruokan's heart has never changed. Emperor Qian Bone said, Are you worried that Zhang Ruokan will not be able to restrain himself and prevent the marriage of the Fulu? I don't know what he will do, but he will definitely do something. Immediately afterwards, Xian Yuan Jian Sheng said, I am more worried about Prujna. Her character is more stubborn than Zhang Ruokan and her emotions are deeper than Zhang Ruokan. The Emperor of the Bone Bone said, The goddess of Fuel gave Zhang Ruokan a marriage. In a sense, he wanted to use the relationship of his in-laws to leave Zhang Ruokan in the world, and change his relationship with the world. It is even closer. Therefore, Zhang Ruokan must not refuse. Once he refuses, it will definitely cause criticism and be attacked. Prana, who has cultivated the gate of the true self, but has not become the goddess of the temple of destiny, is already very dangerous. The goddess of blessing from marriage, in a sense, wants to protect her. If she refuses, she does not being aware of current affairs will only accelerate your own death. But she is not afraid of death at all. Xian Yuan Jian Sheng said. God honors marriage, and ordinary monks dare not discuss it, but some gods hummed, the temple of destiny wants to conquer the two Yuan level Tian Jiao in advance. This comes from the dark temple, but this word is only dared to be spoken in the world of his own divine realm. Prujna represents the temple of destiny, Rose's mother is the former goddess of destiny, the second daughter and the temple of destiny are deeply involved, and marrying them to Yan Wushan and Zhang Ruokan is indeed meant to win over. After a moment, Prujna's face calmed down, and walked to Yan Wushan's side. Goddess Fula said, The deity intends to give you two a marriage, may you. I do. After Yan Wushan finished speaking, he couldn't help looking at Prujna, but was surprised to find that her expression was quite different, her clear-cut face, the iceberg as cold as possible, without the slightest joy, but full of resistance. How could it be that she wanted to refuse marriage? With this thought, Yan Wushan's face became dignified and ugly. In his view, a princess who is extremely intelligent should not do such a demented thing. Besides, what's worse with Yan Wushan, I don't know how many women in want to marry him, but have no chance. If Prujna really refuses to speak, soon Yan Wushan and Fulu God will be reduced to jokes in countless monks. Perhaps the monks in did not dare to laugh at God. But what about monks in heaven? Yan Wushan may not care about being humiliated like Prujna. But don't the Yan Luo people care? As usual, after a long absence of promise, the atmosphere gradually became dignified, not only the monk's face on the dock gold square was shocked, but even the gods in the temple of destiny showed a serious look. Xiu is a high principal black-robed high priest, who is so scared and pale, and sends a voice to Prujna, what honor is God's marriage, and not yet to thank him. Prujna was unmoved. 
the atmosphere between heaven and earth became heavier and heavier, all the voices disappeared, and the silence was incomparable. Goddess Fula seems very patient and has not urged, just waiting quietly. There was a smile in the eyes after the wind, and quietly waiting for Prujna to take his own way. Luo Yan couldn't help looking at Prujna, it was difficult to understand, why did she resist the marriage of God so much? Is it because you haven't become a goddess of fate and are unhappy? Should not. Prujna should not be such a short-sighted woman. Zhang Ruokin didn't look at Prujna, but there was an inexplicable feeling in her heart, as if Prujna was waiting for his statement, and she was waiting for him to protect her. Suddenly, Zhang Ruokin exhaled a long breath. Because it was so silent, even the sound of exhalation seemed extremely clear, attracting the attention of many monks. God-honored marriage, and supreme glory, I will protect Luo Yan for my whole life, and I will never lose her. Zhang Ruokin uttered this sentence in a loud voice, and then, under the eyes of her eyes, stretched her arms to embrace Luo Yan and kissed her white forehead. Luo Shengtian's eyes stared like bronze bells, gritted his teeth, and felt that Zhang Ruokin was simply lawless. He actually looked thin at his sister in the presence of so many monks. Luo Yan was just a little confused at the beginning, and soon his mouth was slightly tilted, his head bowed, and he was extremely sweet and happy. As long as it is a smart person, you can see that Zhang Ruokin's move is to break the atmosphere of depression, and it is also a reminder to Prujna that he must not disobey the blessing of the god of Fulu. After all, this is about the face of the deity of Fulu, the face of the Temple of Destiny, the face of the Yan Luo tribe, and even the face of the world. Prujna understood Zhang Ruokin's intentions and felt a sense of despair. The coldness in her eyes finally melted and said, Thank you God for your marriage, Prujna is grateful. Immediately, she knelt down on the ground with her nose on the ground, and no one could see her expression at this moment. The shadow of the fuel finally dissipated. The black robe high priest cast a grateful expression on Zhang Ruokin, and then preached some issues about the battle of hunting the sky, and made a final summary. When everything was over, the monks who participated in the feast of the hunting sky left one after another. Zhang Ruokin took the burial gold and white tigers, the blood monks of the blood clan tribe, blood slaughter, blood slugs, and other monks from the blood clan tribe, as well as Xi 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 Zhou Zhe and Shen Tu Yung Kong, walked out of Dock Golden Square and boarded the Seven Star Emperor Palace. Looking back, I saw that Prujna still knelt down on the square. Beside her, there was only Yan Wushan. Shweturin said, His Highness Prujna is really incomprehensible and even God's marriage is promised so reluctantly. If God honors me with marriage, in the future, I can walk sideways in the world. Said Yi Xian Dashan enviously. Gu Jin's face was so calm, she said, fortunately, she promised, otherwise it would cause a uproar. Shui Tu laughed, she has to thank my elder brother. If the elder brother didn't hit her kindly at a critical moment, she would be afraid of losing her life because of her stubbornness. Shut up, Zhang Ruokin said coldly. Blood Slaughter immediately felt an icy chill and couldn't help shuddering. He didn't dare to say more. Eighteen ghost kings of six calamities carried the seven-star imperial palace and went straight. In the city of Bingjing in the city of Han Page, there are already tens of thousands of monks from the Blood Heaven tribe. When they saw the Kixing Emperor Palace and Yuxuan Dashan, they suddenly heard deafening shouts, greeted them with joy, and greeted them with joy. In a manor house in the city, a holy feast has been prepared for a long time. A big man of the Blood Tribe stepped out of the banquet venue and came to the gate to personally greet the triumphant Yixian and Gu Jinza who returned triumphantly. The three great ancestor families, the six seas of blood, and the seven ridges and twelve cities, all the top powers of these tribes are attended by top powers, and the most beautiful women in the power are brought together. Obviously they are attracted and associated the meaning of. The strength of each force is at least comparable to the top 4,000 worlds in heaven. For example, the Xia ethnic group where the Emperor Yu belonged, there were 340 billion ethnic groups, and once there were gods sitting in the town. 
However, the Xia people are just a force under the Nanling in the Seven Ridges. The Angel of the Immortal Temple, Lord Huiwen, looked repeatedly in the crowd and asked, Where is Zhang Ruokan? Zhang Ruokan is the protagonist of the protagonist of the feast tonight. All the major forces want to associate, and they are eager to marry him to the most beautiful sacred place in the forces. After all, the news that the blood god of war wanted to marry the parties has been released. Shui Ying welcomed him, bowed and saluted to the prince Huiwen, and said, Cousin Ruokan was not able to attend the sacrament because he was injured. He has returned to Hanhai Manor to rest. Upon hearing this, the monarch Huiwen and the monks of all major forces were all stunned. After being transformed by Zhou Zhen, the master of the sea, Hanhai Manor has beautiful scenery, scent of birds and flowers, and turquoise lakes. There is no difference compared with those practice holy places in Kunlun. At this moment, Zhang Ruokan was sitting by the lake, staring at the reflection in the lake. Outside the manor, the hustle and bustle shook the sky, and the lights were like fire, but he was unmoved and completely immersed in his inner world. The funeral gold and white tiger can feel Zhang Ruokan's thoughts and thoughts, saying, Like you, the demon will become stronger and one day will swallow you up. What you want to do, let it go. The more you disobey, the more disasters you have in the future, the path to becoming a will be difficult. Zhang Ruokan said nothing. In this way, he sat by the lake all night and no one dared to disturb him. The next day, Yi Xian Dashan, Blood Puppet, Blood Slaughter, and so on, the monks who participated in the battle of hunting the sky came to visit one by one, but all were blocked by Zhou Yi. On the third day, the principles of the Six Square Blood Sea, Seven Ridges, and Twelve Blood Cities led the beautiful descendants of the forces to visit, but still failed. On the fourth day, Emperor Sword and the Wind came to invite Zhang Ruokan to participate in the celebration feast hosted by the Immortal Temple. Zhang Ruokan refused to attend. Ten days later, countless forces ate behind closed doors, and none of them saw Zhang Ruokan. The reason he gave was still to retreat. During this period, the blood passed later and asked Zhang Ruokan why he did so. Zhang Ruokan spoofed the past on the ground that he did not like this lively scene. Zhang Ruokan was told after the blood that since the divine respect gave him a marriage, it is necessary to go forward as soon as possible, at least in the destiny realm, to settle the relationship thoroughly to show the importance of this matter. He does not need to do the preparations for marriage proposal and marriage proposal. The Blood Sacrifice family and Tian Luo Kingdom will discuss and handle the monks. But on the day of the appointment, Zhang Ruokan must participate. The date of family appointment has been announced to the outside world. It will be held five days later and will be held at the Fulo Shrine. Yan Wushan and Prujna also decided to marry on this day. Jian City, in a magnificent temple. Yan Wushan was standing alone in the center of the temple, with a sturdy figure with a strong and deep temperament, and a body of Yan Luo Qi staggered with light. Wow! Suddenly, above his head, the space burst, and a hole three meters in diameter appeared, as if the door of time and space was opened. In the hole, Yi exudes ancient and amazing divine power. In the eyes of Yan Wushan, respect appeared, and he bowed and said, Master, this battle of hunting the sky, I lost. Don't blame you, isn't Yan Huang to defeat it? The opponent you met is the most outstanding Tianjiao of the Yuan society. The sacredness he cultivated is even more powerful than the blood and wasteland. You lost to him, no wrong. The black hole was spinning, like a vortex. Yan Wushan, but I am not willing to fail like this. So, this is why you want to see me. Wei An's voice came out. Yan Wushan, even if Zhang Ruokan is following a path of divine goodness, I am confident that he will stay with him to the end. However, he is the master of time and space. His cultivation speed is too fast. My cultivation as a state has been thrown away by him a lot. I must catch up with him, or even surpass him. The one in the black hole was silent for a long time, and said, The difference between the two of you is the opening of Diablo 3. Instead, you go to Diablo 3, 
where the proportion of time is amazing. And there is also an incredible opportunity. If you can come out of it alive and become a realm, you must exceed Zhang Ruokan. I'll go to Dark Star number 3 www.mtlnovel.com Yan Wushan, even though Xiao Yuan has suffered a great deal, knows that the interior of Dark Star is extremely dangerous, but there is no fear on his face. In this era, he is unwilling to submit to anyone. Zhang Ruokan's existence may be his motive for forcing himself to become more powerful, and he can be the enemy of his life. The sound in the black hole sounded. I can send you to Dark Star number 3, and I believe you can come back alive. But do you really make a decision in the cultivation of divine will? You need to know, from since ancient times, no monk has ever cultivated a saint. At least not in all the records of the classics. In the eyes of Yan Wushan, there was no hesitation, saying, Zhang Ruokan cultivates the sacred meaning of yin and yang and the five elements, and follows the path of the first grade of sacredness. My six reincarnation sacredness is also the path of the first grade of sacredness. He dares to go, why do I don't dare? The voice in the black hole came out, do you really know what the six samsaras are? Without experience, you can never understand it. Without it, you can never practice it successfully. Zhang Ruokan's true body, sitting by the lake, was settled by an old monk, but consciousness entered the world of Qunkan. Standing under the sacred tree, Zhang Ruokan's eyes stared at the sword-shaped upright mark on the trunk, and he said loudly, Prince, I have captured the first battle of hunting heaven, can I see you? The sword-shaped upheaval was left by the Emperor of the Thousand Bone, and contained a spirit of her will inside. When Zhang Ruokan shouted her name, the Emperor of the Thousand Bone on Zijin Island instantly felt the induction. The next moment, a divine thought, across time and space, descended into the world of Qunkan. The Emperor Qian Bone is unique and unparalleled. Although it is a divine thought, the momentum emanating from it is like the day of transit. Zhang Ruokan was expressionless, sad and unhappy, and said, I have received the destiny order, and now I can give it to you. As for the mystery of destiny, I have not yet given it to me, it should be because my destiny is too low to bear. Live the power of uprising. There is no destiny, what is the use of destiny? Zhang Ruokan, you see me, it should be for another purpose? Hurry up, I can't stay here too long. Emperor Qian Bones said. Zhang Ruokan said. When I promised to participate in the battle of hunting the heavens and seize the destiny order and the mystery of destiny to lend you the enlightenment, the Empress promised to send me an order of inferno. That's right. Every infernal order I send is because of a huge humanity. That's why, as long as a monk comes to see me, I will do one thing for him. Road. Zhang Ruokan said, Is everything okay? Shang poor green fell Huang Chuan. No matter how difficult and dangerous it is, there is no need to look back. The Emperor Qiangu's tone was firm and divine. Zhang Ruokan said, I want that order now. How wise is the Emperor of the Bone Bone, when Zhang Ruokan spoke, he had faintly guessed what he intended. I don't need to give it to you. You want to ask the cabinet owner to help you, just say it. The tone of the Emperor Qiangu became official, paused and said, but you better think clearly are you really using this opportunity now? Zhang Ruokan clenched his fists in both hands, bowed slightly, and said, I already think very clearly. Please ask the emperor to help me kill someone. Be sure to kill her within five days. Who? Said the emperor Qian Bone. Zhang Ruokan's lips moved, and Chuan Yin said a name. After listening, Emperor Qiang stared at Zhang Ruokan deeply and said, You are embarrassing me. Zhang Ruokan said, I only have this request. If you kill someone in the destiny realm, it would be easy to shock the gods of the destiny shrine, not to mention that the person you want to kill, and the guardianship of twelve deities. Once you hit her, you will be instantly deity level. Existence is known, which causes earth shaking waves. In the world, I am afraid that no monk dares to do this. Zhang Ruokan said, 
but it doesn't include the Empress, right? The Empress Thousand Bone was silent for a long time and said, it is not difficult to kill her. However, in the eyes of the rescue of Tai's Hang, I don't want to do such a thing of grass and snakes. Not to mention, let the deity of the Destiny Temple know that I here comes destiny. Zhang Ruokin said, the emperor once said that Shang Purbai fell into Huang Chuan. The emperor Qian Bone shook her head slightly, her eyes were quite severe, and said, the lord knows what you want to do, but this matter is very dangerous. It is tantamount to fighting against the will of a deity, and even defying destiny. You are you ready to die if you fail? I know exactly what I'm doing, Zhang Ruokin said. Well, in five days, Wu Jianj will kill her. The goddess of the One Thousand Bone God dissipated, leaving only Zhang Ruokin to stand alone under the heavenly tree, with a slender figure, but his eyes were sharp and firm. In the next five days, Zhang Ruokin turned on the sundial in Hanhai Manor, used the goddess of fire to purify, and sacrificed one warrior after another, including the mantraji that was taken from Wu Jiang. The monarch's holy weapon captured from the hunting battlefield was taken out by Zhang Ruokin and handed over to Shen Yuan's ancient sword for refining and absorption. The king-level inscriptions in Shen Yuan's ancient sword grew rapidly, exceeding 300,000, reaching the critical point of impacting the sacred artifacts of the three-dimensional king. Five days later, blood weeping, blood sorrow, blood coagulation, and the three youngest saints of the family's generation came to Hanhai Manor and looked at Zhang Ruokin, who was wrapped in the field of Shen Huo. Xuaning Xiao's eyes flickered and said, If my cousin is too hard, the Battle of the Hunting Sky has just won a great victory, everyone is immersed in the carnival, but he is not affected, and still chooses to cultivate and improve himself. It is really worth our learning. Blood sobbed, the more powerful the character, the more a sense of crisis. Shui Yu said, today is the day when he and Princess Luo Ying are going to marry. The monks of all the major forces have rushed to the Fulo Shrine. He is the protagonist tonight and must not be late. Let me go. The blood weeping came to the edge of the realm of Shen Huo, feeling the heat wave coming from his face, bowing and saluting, saying, if the Lord is a holy God, it is already too late, we should set off. In the center of the fire domain, Zhang Ruokin took back the pieces of warfare, and the flames turned into dragons and got into his body. At this time, everyone could see clearly that he was wearing the crimson armor of Vulcan and wore a sacred dragon-like white bone whip, and Manchuji was worn around his neck, holding the seven-star ghost lotus in his palm, the mirror is suspended in the position of the heart with purple gold gourd hanging on one side of the waist and Shen Yu an ancient sword hanging on the other. Those mighty powers, so that everyone who is also at a Shangxiu dare not look directly at each other. Blood weeping looked at Zhang Ruokin's body, and secretly swallowed a spit, his heart sulking, just to make a relationship, as to reveal so many of the supreme holy artifacts. Too exaggerated. Although exaggerated, it really makes people very envious. The idea of blood crickets and blood weeping was completely different, and his brows frowned tightly. He felt murderous from Zhang Ruokin. His condition is very wrong. It is not like going to marry, but rather like killing. Bringing all fighters on your body is not about showing off, but by paying great attention to the people who will kill next. Shui Yan cautiously said, the marriage gift has been prepared, and we can now set off at Fuel Jingwu. Okay. Zhang Ruokin responded and took the lead in going out. Outside the Hanhai Manor, there was a long convoy parked, pulled by the Holy King level white bone monster, and the car was filled with various treasures. Zhang Ruokin didn't go to check the dowry and took the maid XIXI to the Seven Star Emperor Palace. Blood Puppet and Blood Weep, each sitting on the back of a large holy fire monarch, opened the way in front. Eighteen ghost kings of six calamities carried the seven-star imperial palace behind them. The news of God's honor for marriage has spread throughout the world of hell. When I saw the blood-raising family's family-promoting team, wherever I went, it attracted the onlookers and discussions of countless monks in the world. I don't know how many people were envious. 
Princess Luoyan is absolutely beautiful. It is a goddess that the entire Rakshasa man dreams of marrying, but he never imagined that he eventually married Zhang Ruokan. How talented Zhang Ruokan is, the peerless figure of our undead blood tribe, worthy of Princess Luo. A monk of the undead blood whispered, I don't think Zhang Ruokan may want to marry Princess Luo Luo, but Goddess Divine Marriage, as a last resort, he must promise to come down. How is that possible? Princess Luo Yan is so beautiful, how could Zhang Ruokan not want to marry her? The undead monk shook his head and said, Although Princess Luo Ye is beautiful, is there a beauty around Zhang Ruokan? Which one of XIXI Fairy and Xiaoyu is not a first-rate beauty? It is said that Princess Luo Ye is very powerful. Once Zhang Ruokan marries her, where else will she be so happy now? Zhang Ruokan's mental strength is strong, and of course he can hear those arguments. However, he didn't mind it at all, just holding the ancient sword of Shen Yuan, using the white silk scarf handed over by XIXI, repeatedly wiping the sword body. Then he took out a human-sized stone and sharpened the sword on it. Well. The sword and rubble rubbed, sparks splattered. The supreme sacred artifacts of the Tibetan mountain magic mirror and purple gold gourd are extremely powerful, but every time a major decision is made, Zhang Ruokan prefers to use the ancient sword of Shen Yuan. Holding the hilt of the sword, there is a feeling of being connected with blood, and even the impetuous heart can become peaceful in an instant. The funeral gold and white tiger can feel that Zhang Ruokan's killing intentions are getting more and more fierce during the sword grinding process. Funeral gold and white tiger said, Why is it necessary to kill someone on a wonderful day to make a marriage? Well. From the sword's edge, the sparks flying out from the sword are brighter. Funeral gold and white tiger again said, You are killing today, the motivation is too obvious, it will cause suspicion. Of course, it will be doubted, Zhang Ruokan said. Funeral Gold and White Tiger said, When is it abnormal? Heart Demon invaded, Zhang Ruokan lost his mind and became a demon. Zhang Ruokan said. XIXI stood aside and felt the substantive murderous power emanating from Zhang Ruokan's body. He just felt that he was like a peerless killing god, and he couldn't help but be shocked. Zhang Ruokan in this state is simply terrible. Zhang Ruokan no longer suppressed the demon, letting it explode recklessly, and then the pupils of both eyes gradually turned red, as red as blood drops. Boom! With ten wings spread on his back, Zhang Ruokan carried Shen Yuan and flew out of the Seven Star Emperor's Palace. In front of the Seven Star Emperor Palace, the blood weeping and blood sorrow sitting on the back of the Fire King Beast were shocked to fly out by the blood sharp gas flowing from him. The two fell to the ground and looked at Zhang Ruokan's direction in shock. It's so murderous. What does he want to do? Today is the day of marriage. I don't know how many big people have been waiting at the Fulo Shrine. Among them, there is a deity level. Does Zhang Ruokan dare to escape marriage? Once fleeing marriage, not only offend the royal family of Tian Luo God Kingdom, but also the of Fulu. Shui Yan said, the advance team cannot stop and continue to move forward. Immediately afterwards, the blood cricket immediately portrayed two messenger light symbols and hit them. Fukuro Shrine is one of the twelve shrines of the Temple of Destiny. It is located on the floating island of Fulu, about 90,000 miles away from the Mountain of Destiny. In ordinary times, the floating island of Fulu is completely hidden in the space, except for the gods, no monks can see it. Today, the Fulo Temple is manifested, suspended in the sky, emitting a dazzling light. Below the shrine, there is a group of palaces built on a lake with red walls and green tiles, surrounded by gods and mist, and stretches for thousands of miles. This is the outer temple of the Fulo Shrine and the place for all disciples in the Holy Realm to cultivate. The place where Zhang Ruokan and Luo Yan got engaged was in this outer hall. It was getting dark but here it was brightly lit and lively. Monks from all ten races come to the engagement banquet. The Undead Blood Tribe, the Ghost Tribe, the Strange Stone Tribe, and the Mystery of the Dark Tribe. The banquet inn is always full of blood and horror. 
the food at the banquet is often you can see human heads, soul food, infants, and blood. Luo Yan wore a red suit, with a phoenix feather embroidered on it, and a jade badger on his head. She was not Fande, but today she drew her eyebrows, stained her lips, and walked between a horrifying Rakshasa, ghost emperor, and monk of the bones. When she saw the flesh and blood of a monk at the banquet table, her brows frowned, and she said in a deep voice, Did I have already ordered it? Are you O Chen Chen has half of the human blood, tonight's engagement banquet is forbidden. The appearance of any food related to humans. The two Rakshasa girls immediately fell to their knees. One of the Rakshasa girls trembled, His Royal Highness Princess Atonement, this, this was ordered by His Royal Highness the God, we have already told him, but, but the Royal Highness said that he just couldn't get used to it. Intentionally. Luo Yan said, don't listen to him, and quickly withdraw. Remember, this is the taboo of Ruo Chen. Don't make such mistakes in the future, otherwise the princess will not be lightly. Over there, I will personally go talk to him. The two Rakshasa girls should say in a hurry, and hurried back. Luo Yan lifted his white head and looked at the night sky that had been completely dark. In his mind, he couldn't help thinking of Zhang Ruokin's words under the mountain of destiny, and a smile of happiness appeared in his mouth. Suddenly, she felt something in her heart, as if stared by a pair of eyes, so she looked sideways to the right. A hundred feet away, Pruchna also wore a red suit. The two women look at each other. Luo Yan is a woman with a good mind, but just glanced at one another, and she was aware of the extraordinary emotion in Pruchna's eyes by virtue of her instinct. His Highness Pruchna looks calm, but why do I feel a little hostility? No, it's envy. No, it's sad. It doesn't seem right, why is her eyes so complicated, what is she hiding? When Luo Yan looked at Pruchna again, there was no figure in that place. Zhang Ruokin didn't know how long he had flown www.mtlnovel.com The speed slowed down and landed on a blood-red river. This river, connected to the lake in the outer hall of the Fulo Shrine, is as wide as a hundred feet wide, with turbulent water and blood. Zhang Ruokin closed his eyes and listened to the currents and waves. After waiting for about a quarter of an hour, a huge ship was approaching on the river. The bow of the ship had a black flag emblazoned with the word Yan Luo. Zhang Ruokin opened his eyes suddenly, and the blood of his eyes flew from his pupils, causing Dehi to set off a wave of more than ten feet high. The thick voice sounded, Yan Wushan, haven't you always wanted to fight with me? Here we stand against each other and completely determine the identity of the strongest in this era. This battle is divided into victory and defeat, as well as death. Boom. The water crashed and stopped the high-speed ship. In the Yan Luo tribe, Yan is the largest surname, representing the noblest descent, and has the strongest inheritance. However, in the Yan surname, there is a division of 223 gods. The so-called Eren refers to the Tianyan Tianxi of Tianyi and Lianation Yunqi. The 13 gods refers to the 13 other Yans who had borne the gods. Because the places where they lived and practiced differently, the ancestors had different traditions, so they became thirteen relatively independent forces. Although their strength is far inferior to that of Urji, they have many people in the tribe and become an important part of the Yan family. The Yanqi Tianqi, who sits in Yan Tian Tian Tian, is the most powerful. In a sense, they are the representative of the Yan family. Most of the strong surname Yan who is active in are from this. Yan Wushan, Yan Huangtu, Yan Jaxian, and the ancient gods of learning, including the patriarchs of the Yan Luo tribe, are all from the Tian White Yan Yan clan. However, since the last Yuan conference, the Yan people have made another statement. The reason why this is said is because after 100,000 years ago, the last patriarch of the Yan Luo family, Yan Huangyu, disappeared. Most of the people belonging to his veins were stationed in the Dark Abyss, and rescue may be trapped in the Dark Abyss office of the Universal Patriarch. At this point, Tian White Yan Yan's family was divided into two. Over the past 100,000 years, 
this part of the Yan people has been separated and faintly separated and is called the Yan family of darkness. Of course, the Yan family of darkness and the Yan family of Tian Yan have the same blood relationship with the same clan and family, at least in the eyes of the monks in the whole world, they still belong to the same vein. Yan Wushan was born in the dark place Yan Yan. Yan Chu, an old man who looks 60 or 70 years old, is ordinary in appearance, wearing a white scarf, holding a long cigarette rod, standing on a giant ship 27 feet tall, swallowing clouds and mist. He has lived for 25,000 years, but he is one of the strongest under the Yan of the darkness. Under the circumstance that the gods can't cross the world, Wen Chu can run the world and solve all matters. This is exactly why Wu Qing Zong sent him over, and must protect Yan Wushan's safety. Even the deity of Fula saw that Yan Wushan was in a dangerous situation. He married him and Prujna and used the power of the Temple of Destiny to deter the heavenly Yan family. He didn't want this genius, and he would die in Yan in the future. The scourge of the struggle of the previous generation. Why couldn't Wu Qing Zong see this? The feast of hunting the sky is over, Yan Wushan has lost his last use value, and it is time to it. This generation of the Yan Luo tribe has only one Yan Huangtu, which is enough. Call. Wen Chu looked at the billowing water and spit out a ring of smoke. He was waiting for Tian Yantian's shot. Tian Wei Tian Yan would not be willing to see Yan Wushan marrying Prujna. In that way, behind Yan Wushan, it is equivalent to having two great patrons, Fu Luo and Nushan. Anyone who kills Yan Wushan will never be a god. The action of the gods is tantamount to breaking the rules established by everyone in a subtle way. By then, the world will not be as calm as it is now. Every move of the gods will set off huge waves. The battle between monks under the gods is like an undercurrent underwater. Even if the collision is fierce, at least on the surface, it is still calm. Either the Temple of Destiny, the Temple of Darkness, or the rulers of the Ten Races, they are all trying to maintain such calmness. At least, the world cannot be turned upside down until the realm of heaven is destroyed. It should come, after all, who will come? Who will be the shot? The of the demigod Yan Yu? The dark walker Yan Zwele? Or the Fuxiang girl? Wen Chu's thoughts were confused, and a figure appeared in her mind. Each figure has a mysterious charm and represents a peerless powerhouse. It was then that Wen Chu felt a strong murderous spirit. I saw that the blood red river set off more than ten feet of water and swept towards the giant ship. Yan Wushan, aren't you going to fight me? This battle is divided into victory and defeat, as well as death. Zhang Ruokin's voice turned into sound waves and surged. Wen Chu's old eyes shrank in shock, revealing an unbelievable look, and he said, That's the case, it's the case. They should have borrowed the hand of Zhang Ruokin, and the murder was just and right. I should have thought about it. Squeak. A hatch of the giant ship opened, and Yan Wushan's body figure stepped out, looking at the murderous blood mist in the night. He said, Zhang Ruokin has never been a real lust, but Yan Zexian was pregnant with his child on the Kishin battlefield. Beauty plan. Wen Chu said. Yan Wushan shook his head and said, If a beauty can win Zhang Ruokin, then I don't need to consider him as the enemy of my life. I believe it is the Yanqi of Tian Weishan, who has reached some agreement with Zhang Ruokin and promised what's wrong with him. Zhang Ruokin wants to gain a foothold in the world and needs their support. In the world, Zhang Ruokin's situation is more difficult than me. Wen Chu said, since Zhang Ruokin is the knife of the Yan family in the outer world, then we don't need to ignore him and go to the Fulu Shrine first. As long as we marry Prujna, you are standing on the back of the gods Fulu and Nushan too strong. Yan Wushan shook his head and said, fighting with Zhang Ruokin has always been my mind. If you retreat without a fight today, your mind must be deeper, not to mention that six reincarnations cannot be repaired, I am afraid it will also affect Qian Wenjing and the cultivation of a lifetime of death. Battle Either Zhang Ruokin or Yanqi outside the sky, any enemies that stand in my way will be cut off. Battle 
In the Holy Kingdom, I've been trapped for hundreds of years. How strong are I in accumulation, and why are I afraid of Zhang Ruokin? Battle Zhang Ruokin came with a purpose. The heart of war is not pure. Fight I will fight him today if he fights one day. Only when the heart is fulfilled can the six be united. A series of four battle characters made Yan Wushan's momentum rise to the apex. This space seemed to be frozen, and the world was extremely silent. Yan Wushan was dazzling, with long hair flying, and shouted with a smile, Good job! This battle is long overdue. I will support Kun Lun after you die. After returning from the third dark star, Yan Wushan repaired it. However, to say that he can win Zhang Ruokin steadily, he has no clue. Facing the battle of life and death, Zhang Ruokin paid great attention and came with a battle treasure. Can Yan Wushan not pay attention? To say that just now is to mess up Ruokin's heart. After you die, Kun Lun I will raise it, in other words, if I die, Kun Lun will die. Zhang Ruokin was not affected by Yan Wushan's words at all and was not worried about Qi Kun Lun's safety at all. The battle between him and Yan Wushan was not personal revenge, but a decisive battle. If the Yan Luo tribe killed Yan Kunshan's disciple, Qi Kun Lun, they would be laughed at by monks in the world, and they would also be severely retaliated by the family. The Supreme Family sees reputation as more important than life. How could it be possible to do so without a lower limit? Nonsense, war. The blood gas under Zhang Ruokin's feet condensed into a weird pattern of lines, like maggots and earthworms, which caused the rules of heaven and earth to be motivated, the power of heaven and earth turned into thunder and lightning, and they overwhelmed the giant ship. When Yan Wushan punched out, he hit a black punch that was larger than the giant ship, shattering all the thunder and lightning that came from it and spreading it on the blood. On the river, all lights flashed. Roar! On the giant ship, the Buddha light burst. Yan Wushan inspired Zhu Zhang Liujin's body and issued a roar of angry Buddha and lion. The roar contained the true meaning of the six-character daming curse. Hey, 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 hum, Mike, hey. Six words were synthesized. On the surface of Yan Wushan, a ten-foot-long golden lion phantom emerged. The sound of the lion's roar was all golden the space was roared into chaos, and the river was roared into gas. The six-character daming curse, each word is comparable to a hundred-level high-level holy art, can clear the evil barrier, cut off life and death, destroy wisdom, cut life. The combination of the six characters is transformed into a roar of lions. Cut. 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 Zhang Ruokin did not retreat, but turned into a streamer, rushing towards the golden sound waves coming out of his face, waving the ancient sword of Shen Yuan, breaking the layers of ripples. The unbroken sound wave rushed into Zhang Ruokin's ten feet and was blocked by the real space of space. The sound waves rotate in a circle in the real domain, rushing backwards. I heard that you went to the dark star number three, and it was a great improvement. Zhang Ruokin flew over the giant ship, and the Vulcan armor on his body burned, emitting a light that illuminated the night sky, and the vegetation on the banks of the river burned into ashes like paper. One foot was pressed down, and more than twenty million flame patterns appeared on the legs, condensing a thick cloud. Wen Chu looked up at the sky, exposing the color of surprise, and said, So powerful! Da Sheng is able to possess and control divine power, which is already very remarkable. Being able to control such a powerful divine power is naturally even more shocking. Wen Chu finally understood something, why Yan Wushan regarded this son as a lifelong enemy. Yan Wushan felt great pressure, his eyes were dignified, he leapt from the giant ship, took out the heavenly wish, and slashed away with supreme power. Tong Tian Ruyi originally belonged to Yan Huangtu, but fell into his hands, and of course there is no need to return it. Wow! Tong Tian Ruyi became more than ten feet long and collided with the cloud formed by the legs. After the earth-shattering roar, supreme power and divine fire shot out in all directions. Every blazing fire will smash the ground into a pit the size of a few feet. In the pit, 
the flames of flames burned for a long time. Yan Wushan fell into the withered blood river, and on the river bed, he hit a large crater-like crater. There was a divine fire on his hair, burning strands of hair into fly ash. With the current power of God's legs, Yan Wushan can't completely block it with the supreme holy weapon. On the Kishin battlefield, although Zhang Ruokan's sacred leg broke the fourth seal, the flame pattern he could control was only over ten million. In the five days when the sundial was turned on, Zhang Ruokan spent five years refining ten million flame patterns. The power of God's leg is naturally far better than before. It can be said that this battle has just begun. Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan are already using their strongest moves, and there is no tentative attack at all. Thousands of Hands Yan Wushan is divided into thousands, standing on the earth, a combination of extremely bright and extremely dark Hell Yan Luki, covering hundreds of miles of the earth into a sea of gas. In the Sea of Anger, the figure of the first ancestor of Yan Luo emerged, stepping on Huang Chuan, holding the ground book. Yan Luo's ancestor waved his big hand and slapped Zhang Ruokan. Zhang Ruokan pulled out the Shen Long bone whip wrapped around his waist and waved it. The whip body crackled and cracked. From inside, he rushed out a huge Shen Long to release the terrible divine power. This white bone whip is made from the backbone of a dragon, and the dragon soul is immortal inside and saved by divine power. At the same time, Zhang Ruokan's body burst into a virtual shadow. It's not immovable. The form of that phantom, growing twenty-four pairs of golden wings, is actually the form of the blood ancestor. If you stand and watch from a hundred miles away, the sight you see is that the blood ancestor was holding a dragon, using the dragon as a whip, and slamming towards the Yan Luo ancestor. That picture is extremely shocking. Booming. The sound of the sky was constantly spreading. A thousand miles away, two figures, a man and a woman, stood under a large black umbrella. They are the demigod gods Yan Yu and Fuxiang girl, both of whom are first-rate powerhouses in the realm of world. They are at the top of the list of God's Book and Red Dust. Character God's Book Volume from the Temple of Destiny The Red Dust Peerless List is composed by Tian Gong. The woman Fuxiang wore a blue crystal veil and had a long jade arm. She opened a crystal bow. On the bowstring, the rules of heaven and earth were twisted together to form a translucent arrow. The direction pointed by the arrow tip is Yan Wushan who is thousands of miles away. On the art of shooting, the Fuxiang woman can be called the first in the entire universe. Compared with her, Emperor Amori Luo is no different from a child who can just take a bow. Yan Yu's voice was mild and said, take it away first. Fu Xiong and didn't collect her arrows, her voice was cold, and she said, Do you think Zhang Ruokan killed Yan Wushan? But I heard that after Yan Wushan returned from the Dark Star No. 3, he not only made great progress, but also Xiao Yuan Yi Tianzeng www.mtlnovel.com There is no doubt that he got some kind of chance there. Yan Yu said, It is best not to be us who kill Yan Yan. The Yan Luo clan has no internal fighting. The Tian Yantian and the Dark Abyss Yan is the closest family. No, exactly, there is no Dark Abyss Yan. What he said. The Dark Heavenly Umbrella can indeed cover up all heavenly heavens, and even conceal the gods. However, it is impossible to hide the hearts of the people. As long as Yan dies without an arrow, then everyone knows that the person who shot him must be you. I don't know why Zhang Ruokan wants to kill Yan Wushan, but I can feel the murderousness on him, and he seems to want outsiders to think that he is representing us. Fuxiang Women's Road, opportunity is fleeting, and you will not kill it at this moment. When the deity of Fuo deity arrives, there will be no chance. Yan Yu carried his hands on his back, his clothes fluttered, and the wind was light and light, give Zhang Ruokan a chance. I can see that his murderous heart is very firm. The woman Fuxiang released her finger, and the arrow on the bowstring disappeared automatically. The crystal bow was carried on her back, a little longer than her slender body. Although the destiny realm is built on the leaves of the world tree, the area is quite wide. 
At this moment, the area of Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan duel is relatively barren, and there are only a few monks living there. They were already alarmed by the aftermath of the battle and fled far away. It's terrible. It's so powerful. The rules of heaven and earth throughout the city are disturbed. Who the is it? How dare you fight in the realm of God, wouldn't you be afraid of being taken away by the law enforcers in the temple of destiny? Absolutely a great saint level powerhouse. Let's step back a little, so as not to be killed by the aftermath of the battle. The destiny temple prohibits monks from fighting privately. Even if there are personal grievances, they must go to Wudu city. The battle between Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan quickly alarmed a team of law enforcement personnel who passed by here. They wore battle armor, rode the bone bone beasts, and held holy swords, emitting the light of death. The leader of the law enforcement team, named Yan Xiao, had a human body, but his skin was covered with stone skin. The law enforcers behind him are all holy king realms. A ghostly law enforcer said in shock, it seems that there is still a wave of supreme power coming from such a powerful war. They are far away from the center of the battle wave. They can't see who is fighting. They can only see blood red and golden light, sometimes bursting thousands of miles, sometimes dark. The vigor formed by the aftermath of the battle was like a raging wind and waves that swept the world. Yan Xiao's body is as straight as a gun, and Leng Hung said, the two people who are fighting are known as Yuan Hui level geniuses, and they have the combat power of a slave who lives with a hundred lives to repair the dead. Can they not be strong? What, turned out to be them? All law enforcement officials were uproar. In this era, who can be called Yuan Yuan level genius, who else can there be besides Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan? Oh! Oh! The sound of the breaking wind kept ringing and teams of law enforcement officers rushed, and the team leader was the great saint of Beigzijing. For a moment, there were as many as seven law enforcement officers in the Beijing realm here. All law enforcement agents add up to seven or eight hundred. Every law enforcement leader arrives and will question Yan Xiao why not capture private monks. However, when they knew that the two men who were fighting were Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan, they all became silent and shocked. An undead blood law enforcer said in amazement, if I remember correctly, today should be the day when Zhang Ruokan and Princess Luoying are going to marry. Many big men have gone to Fula Shrine. How did he fight with Yan Wushan? Yan Wushan and His Highness Pruchna are also today. These two are really fighting madmen, dare to ignore the temple regulations. Is the destiny realm where they can fight at will? A law enforcement leader standing on the head of a black python, said Shen Sheng that she was wearing a black robe, with a thin face, and said, Catch it, anyone who breaks the rules, regardless of identity, will be severely punished. Yan Xiao I smiled, Catch Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan? It's up to us? Any one of them can kill us all. The leader of the undead blood law enforcement team looked up to the horizon and said, Master Xi is here and Master XIXIN. Two spinning black gas tornadoes flew out of the clouds and landed on the ground, condensing into two powerful and deterrent figures. His grandmother wore bone armor, and his body was a dark mist of ghosts, with a firefly-like flare, flying and beating in the ghost mist. The adult Wu XIN is as tall as seven feet tall, with a skull like a cow, holding a spear. The two of them are the masters of disarmament in the Department of Adjudication. They are under the jurisdiction of the Divine Enforcement Judgment. They have reached the peak of a thousand questions. They are the top ten strongest among the disarmers. A female law enforcer wearing a black robe and with a thin face jumped off the top of the black python and bowed to the two disarmament leaders, saying, The private combatants are Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan. Do you want to take them down? Master Yi waved his hand and said, My sister and I have received the order of the adjudicator. This place is already on the fringe of the exclusive territories of Fuljing. To a wider city. What? The woman in charge of the Black Robe Law Enforcement showed a startled look, saying, The ruling division manages the order of the entire destiny gods, 
and naturally also includes the Temple of Fulu. The three divisions of the zodiac are independent forces in the Temple of Destiny. The status of the adjudication department is aloof, even if the disciples of the zodiac palace violate the temple regulations, they must accept sanctions unconditionally. Are you questioning the verdict? Master Sun Xian's lantern-sized eyes glared at her. The eruption of Shen Gui made her tremble with shock. Dare, dare not. The black-robed female law enforcer said repeatedly. Under the leadership of Master Sun Xian and Master Sun, nearly a thousand law enforcement officers formed a large formation of enchantment, covering an area of thousands of miles, preventing Zhang Ruokin and Yan Wushan from spreading the battle. The news of Zhang Ruokin's decisive battle with Yan Wushan quickly spread throughout the realm of destiny, causing a great uproar. What? Didn't they get engaged at Fukuro Jingu today? How did they fight? It is said that this battle must not only be divided between victory and defeat, but also life and death, and determine the identity of the strongest in this era. This battle is so interesting. I'm going to watch it. Maybe I can witness the fall of a Yuan level genius. I feel excited when I think about it. Because of the battle of hunting the sky, there were many young monks of the ten groups gathered in the destiny realm. They ran to tell each other, and then rushed to the place where the battle broke out. Blood cries and blood crickets heard the news in the blood-raising family's relatives' prostitution team, and their faces turned pale. Feelings Zhang Ruokin ran to a decisive battle with Yan Wushan after leaving. Why? Even if there is a decisive battle, why choose today? Shui Yan said, I have already passed the aunt and father to fourteen and believe that they have already passed. What does Zhang Ruokin think of it? Does it seem to him that the battle of life and death is more important than marrying Luo Luo? I hope the two of them are not a real battle between life and death. Whoever falls today in a day like this will cause uproar. Side blood weep. The news reached Fuel Jingwu. Luo Shengtian, who was already depressed, slammed a jar of wine on the ground with a slamming blast of spirit, condensed into a armor, and shouted, OK Zhang Ruokin, the date of marriage, run to battle with Yan Wushan for life and death. What do you mean? Hang my sister here? The princess of the kingdom of Tian Luo, is so ignored? Where is the holy army of Tian Luo kingdom of God, go with the prince to capture Zhang Ruokin? A holy army composed of the holy king and the great holy saint gathered near Luo Shengtian, all with a breath like a dragon and a sky full of war, are the most powerful guards in Tian Luo's kingdom of God. They are guarded in the palace. Luo Yan, wearing a crimson shirt, chased out, looking worried, and said, I'll go with you. Luo Shengtian shook his head and said, Don't worry about the sister Huang, leave it to brother Huang. Today is the big day for your marriage. Don't go anywhere, just wait for me to take Zhang Ruokin to you. Luo Yan's eyes were filled with anxious expression, saying, No, you can't stop Zhang Ruokin, I have to go. Wow! The shadow of Tianyan manifested and stopped in front of Luo Ling, saying, Well, are you wit and calm in your daily life? On the day of beloved, you better not go anywhere. Luo Yan said, after the mother, Zhang Ruokin, and Yan Wushan will have a life and death. How can I not go? Tianyan said, the battle between Zhang Ruokin and Yan Wushan will break out sooner or later. Zhang Ruokin chose to decisive today, may it not be for you. For Huang Mei. Luo Shengtian was puzzled. Tianyan said, Zhang Ruokin obviously has no absolute confidence in this battle. If he married in the hands of your sister and died in the hands of Yan Wushan, wouldn't it delay your sister's life? Can't you stop them both? Luo Shengtian said. Tianyan said, the fighting has broken out, and no one can stop it anymore. Even if it is stopped, they will still fight again. The blood and wasteland of that year was just lacking their determination to make a life or death in a battle, so they stayed regrets that are hard to make up for in a lifetime. The god of blood must fight to rejuvenate the blood of the pure family, destined not to forget it. The barren sky also has fetters, and life and death cannot be completely set aside. Tianyan said, 
whether it is the blood god of war or the Wuking sect, it should be a supportive attitude. Only by reaching their height can we understand the significance of this war. Not far away, there is another Wan Yuan in Fuel Jingwu. Prujna heard the news of Zhang Ruokan's and Yan Wushan's decisive battle. The whole person was stagnation. For a moment, the taste was mixed, and the mood was long and difficult to settle. Standing under the wall, staring at the sky, if there was a fluctuation of breath, the beautiful eyes became clear. After the wind, they sat on a golden holy car and were pulled by three holy beasts. The two teams of desperate guards hurried to the temple of Fuluo to join the tonight's engagement banquet. Oh! A messenger light flew and rushed into the golden chariot. After the wind grabbed the light rune and stared at it, revealing a startled look, this, this is also very interesting. Hee <laughs> hee! A dark, hoarse voice appeared in the corner of the holy chariot, His Royal Highness, what happened, why are you so happy? After the wind laughed and groaned, Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan's life and death decisive battle is advanced, and one person will fall tonight. No matter who died, it is a matter of joy. Shadow said, this is indeed a happy event. If Yan Wushan died, Prujna would also lose the support of the Yan Luo tribe. Her Royal Highness will remove her, and there will be much less obstacles. If Zhang Ruokan dies, Her Highness will be a monk of the undead blood race China's position will definitely climb a lot. How can we miss such a wonderful battle? After the wind, her red lips turned up, smiling like a flower. Oh! Suddenly, the golden chariot shakes violently. The three sacred beasts pulling the cart roared in horror. After the wind showed an unpleasant look, he yelled, Three beasts, what is it? It became silent outside. After the wind, the practice of destiny is very sensitive to danger. When it is not good, it changes its face, and whispers, Uncle Yan. The dark shadows in the corners, like a piece of black paper, suddenly stood up and turned into an elder white-bearded old man with bright eyes and no old-fashioned look. Yin Xian is a supreme saint of the Huangtian clan. Although it has not been officially crowned after the wind, but already has the identity of a goddess, naturally it needs the protection of a top powerhouse under the divine realm. Boom! Yin Xian's blood-shaking air was like a sword blade, shattering the golden chariot. Outside the car, there is a weird world, with slender rivers flowing to the endless sky. The three sacred beasts that had pulled carts had already decayed and their flesh had turned into thick water. Godland world! Yin Xian's face changed suddenly, and she yelled, His goddess, run away. Yin Xian immediately fired the forbidden technique, the great holy blood in the body burned, and a more dazzling gaze than the star broke out in the body, urging a sacred sword of the king to split into a corner of the world of divine realm. The power of this blow is no longer lost to demigods. Unfortunately, he was unable to break the world of the divine realm, but was hit by a large golden hand and the immortal sacred body burst apart and turned into a mist of blood. In the presence of the gods, even the Supreme Holy One is like an ant, without any resistance. After the wind, his face was as pale as paper, knowing that he could not escape, staring at the big golden hand, and chanting, Who thee is going to kill me? The gods shot and broke the hidden rules of the world, and you will surely bring yourself into the sky. Wan Jianj never thought of the rules of hell. A thick voice sounded. The golden hands fell, as if the entire sky and earth were pressed against the head of the wind, the of the world could squeeze the holy spirit of the saint into fragments. At this moment, the word life in the palm of the hand after the wind suddenly erupted into a glorious divine light, bursting out of the twelve Shengzia, and condensing into twelve magnificent gods. The attack from the golden big hand was blocked by the shadow of the twelve deities. It is at this moment that the true body of the twelve gods is all induction. The deity of Fulu, sitting in the temple of destiny, issued a roar of gods, many thousands of miles apart. The voice of the roar, across time and space, rushed to the world of the godland behind the wind. The whole destiny realm is filled with thunderous sounds that make the monks under countless holy trembling kneeling. 
The Emperor Qian Bone stood in the dark and boundless void space, and a long river formed by the marks of time flowed under her feet, and her palms were pressed out of the air, forming a wall of time and space, and colliding with the voice of the roar. Well! The wall of time and space continues to shatter, and the roar of the gods gradually diminishes and finally dissolves. The Emperor of the Bone Bone looked towards the direction of the world of Godland www.mtlnovel.com, the true body of the deity of Fulo has moved. Within one breath, you must kill the wind dagger and seize the destiny. In the divine world after the wind is trapped, a looming figure condenses, hangs in the air, looks down, and proclaims, it's just a shadow of the twelve deities, it can't save your life. After looking at the figure after the wind, it was found that it was a middle-aged man with a tall figure, who looked a bit like Zhang Ruokin. However, the temperament of a middle-aged man is like the abyss of the sea, which cannot be seen to the end. This is the last glance seen after the wind. The next moment, the twelve gods were taken into a bottle by the middle-aged man. And her body shattered into particles, the bones, the Holy Spirit, and the Holy Source were all annihilated, losing any possibility of resurrection. Even if it is beautiful, the talents are unparalleled, but under the palm of the gods, it disappears instantly, as if never in this world. The three world trees in the forest of no return belong to the core area of the starry sky in hell world. Yan Lushan Tian Tian, Fate of Destiny, and Ghost City of Ladu are all on the world tree. Although there is a in the destiny domain, there has not been a war of gods for many years. The roar of God of Fuel contains immense anger, shattering the peace in the destiny world for many years, and making countless monks in the world tremble. Even the great saint can't help shaking. On the sky, clouds piled up and thunder and lightning shuttled. I don't know how many cultivations are strong and powerful, looking at the direction of the mountain of destiny, terrified. What is going on that can provoke God's anger? Is there a in heaven, breaking into the realm of destiny? The gods in the heavenly court dare to break into the realm of destiny? Even if the first battle Tian Zhuang of Tian Gong comes, it will definitely die. Compared with the gods' roaring divine voice, Zhang Ruokin and Yan Wushan's decisive battle is just as insignificant as the two children fighting. Although the Temple of Destiny has twelve deities, there are only one or two who usually sit in town. Other deities, some will sit on the battlefield of merit, some will retreat and practice, some will travel to the Xingai, some will explore the secret world of the universe. During the hunting feast, only the goddess Fula was sitting on the mountain of destiny. As soon as the god of blessed god moved, he immediately triggered the rules of heaven and earth for hundreds of millions of miles so that the deities of all races still in the destiny realm had a sense of horror. The deity's roaring divine voice failed to kill the enemy. Need to use his real body. Is it really that the Tian Gong Ares level powerful broke into the realm of God? No matter who is coming, since the deity is in action, there must be no place for death. Even if Zin Zhuang comes, it is useless. The rules of heaven and earth in the destiny realm are not that he can easily move. The gods were intended to follow in the footsteps of the deity of Fulu and fight against enemies who invaded. At this moment, a sky of billions of miles appeared in the heavenly dome of destiny, like the Ganges that fell for nine days. The night sky was illuminated by the light from the river, reflecting daylight. It's a river of time stamps. A trembled. How many time marks does it take to mobilize to converge into such a river? Once in the realm of destiny, how many monks will die from it? Time is chaotic, and the rules of heaven and earth are being reshaped by time. In the destiny, monks in the world, Xiao Yuan quickly lost, from a teenager to middle-aged, and finally became grey-haired. Seeing hundreds of millions of monks are about to die and become dead bones. God fuel aside, stopped chasing, raised his right hand above his head, communicated with the temple of destiny, and sipped softly in his mouth, reverse. Wow! The Temple of Destiny emits a radiant white light, and the light reflects the entire domain. Standing in the starry sky, the leaf at the top of the world tree was wrapped in white brilliance, emitting a brilliance brighter than the star. 
Those monks who had been severely lost in Xiao Yuan's hair turned from white to black, wrinkles on their faces disappeared, and they turned back into juvenile looks. The chaotic time was calmed down by the Temple of Destiny. In the void, Emperor Qian Bone held a divine sword, looked at the direction of the destiny, and sighed. The long time just now was that she struck out with all her strength. Unexpectedly, it did not cause any substantial damage to the destiny domain, and a monk did not fall. There is no doubt that her current cultivation is far from reaching the point of shaking the realm of destiny. Of course, her purpose has been achieved, successfully holding down a breath of time for Fulu. Not afraid to continue, the Emperor Qian Bone took a step back, crossed the endless void, and disappeared. Almost at the same time, Emperor Fulu and Emperor Luoyan rushed into the void and descended to the position where the Emperor Qiang Gu had just stood. Emperor Luoyan is tall and looks like a cloud covered by gods. Nothingness can corrode him, saying, There is time left upright, it is the little girl of Wujianj. I did not expect that in just 100,000 years, she has grown to be able to, to escape from under our eyes. Goddess Fula said, she has mastered a lot of time and mystery, and is hidden in the void. Naturally, there is no shadow or trace. If the Emperor of Thousand Bone dared to appear in the realm of destiny, even if she had a lot of time upright, it would be difficult to escape. In the destiny God's field, more than half of the destiny of heaven and earth are gathered, and it is not that the Emperor of the Bone Bone can fight. Once exposed, it will undoubtedly die. Emperor Luoyan said, the man who killed the wind must be the deity of Wujianj. He must be found and killed. The who killed Feng Feng has retreated, and has been hidden silently. Emperor Luoyan and Lord Fulu agreed that he was hiding in the realm of destiny and was one of the ten deities, so they acted separately. The goddess Fulu rushed back to the temple and gathered all the deities who were stranded in the realm of destiny to bring them together and investigate them one by one. Emperor Luoyan rushed to the fall of Feng Feng to find the remaining clues and traces. When he arrived, he found that a woman in a palace costume had already come here to investigate. Emperor Luoyan recognized her and said in amazement, the fourteen girls of the family. After the blood, he stood on the empty street, his eyes were clear and peaceful, and his face was pondering, until Luoyan approached before waking up. She didn't have a trace of respect and humility from her juniors, and said calmly, it turned out to be in-laws. Emperor Luoyan's teeth clenched, and his heart was very angry. The grand generation of the emperor is higher than that of the blood-zest god, but now, it is too angry to have a conversation with the young daughter of the blood-zest god. What kind of character Luoyan the Great can hold back even the anger, said calmly, is there a clue? Who killed the new goddess? After the blood, he shook his head and said, the man who shot was very cunning and walked away for the first time, and, I suspect, he is the in the temple of destiny. What? Emperor Luoyan was shocked, his face was solemn, and he said, why do you say that, do you have evidence? Bloody road, there is no evidence, but this person can quickly get away and disappear. It can be seen that he and the rules of heaven and earth in destiny realm are very compatible. Except for the deities in the temple of destiny, the world can do this, there should be few is that right? Emperor Luoyan nodded and said, this time is a big trouble. Don't say anything at this moment, only you know what I know. After the blood, of course, once the incident spread, the impact would be terrible, and the reputation of the temple of destiny would be a serious blow. In the absence of absolute evidence, no one dares to preach. The decisive battle between Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan, a sitting near the town, was not affected by the chaotic time. The two men had been fighting for almost an hour, and they encountered all kinds of sacred arts, and all kinds of fighters fiercely collided. Although Zhang Ruokan carried many supreme sacred objects, he did not occupy an absolute advantage. Because, Based on his cultivation of Beijing realm, he can only urge at most two or three pieces of the Supreme Holy Grail at one time. Moreover, by urging two or three of the Supreme Holy Grail at the same time, the power of the Supreme Holy Grail will weaken. 
Fortunately, Zhang Ruokan's mental power is strong, and he will be urged by a supreme sacred weapon to be replaced by another Bai Dijing De Sheng. Yan Wushan uses the Death Book to protect his body, holding the sky to the sky with his right hand, and wearing the supreme sacrificial gloves in his left hand, like a hell killing god. Wherever he goes, mountains and rivers collapse, the earth cracks, and space trembles. The formation enchantment, which was gathered by nearly a thousand law enforcers, was also irresistible, and was shattered by the power of the supreme holy artifact. All law enforcement officers under the great saint were injured. In the end, it was Wen Chu and Qing Sheng De Sheng who took the initiative and used the means of the supreme saint to control Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan's battlefield within a certain range. Both of them are treasures, and they will take out a warrior who is a supreme holy weapon, and the gods will be envious. Is this the luck of Yuan Hui level geniuses? Under the call of destiny, the supreme holy grail automatically converges to them and becomes their weapon. I can fight across borders if I have the sacred holy protector and the sacred holy warrior launches an attack. With hundreds of realms, I'm called Ban Qunwen. Yan Wushan has made great progress in the Dark Star number 3, and has broken 70 yoke chains. The rules of the holy word in the body are nearly 10 billion. Zhang Ruokan, I practiced for 150 years on the third Dark Star, but after I didn't expect it, I still can only fight with you. Yan Wushan said longly. Diablo has practiced for 150 years inside, but it has actually passed more than an hour outside. 150 years, how is this possible? Zhang Ruokan was startled, revealing an incredible look. You know, the time inside Dark Star number 3 is very weird, and the proportion of time is amazing, but it is not a land of cultivation, but a place of death. Because staying in it for a year will consume a thousand years of life. For 150 years of cultivation, Yan Wushan had to spend 150,000 years of his life, even if he was a god, he had already died in it. After all, there is only one Yuan Shao Yuan of the deity. Yan Wushan's Shao Yuan was cut off by Zhang Ruokan for more than half. How can he do it? practice in the interior of Dark Star No. 3 for 150 years, and Xiao Yuan will increase instead of decrease. Yan Wushan said these words because he intentionally wanted to disturb Zhang Ruokan's state of mind and lead him to think. Suddenly, Yan Wushan, who had been in a disadvantage, seized the opportunity to fight back fiercely. Booming! Tong Tian Ruyi turned into a hundred-foot-long cloud crushing Zhang Ruokan's real space of space and colliding with the seven-star ghost lotus above his head. The powerful shock wave of supreme power passed through the ghost of the Kixing Gailian and fell on Zhang Ruokan. However, the multidimensional space formed in the secret of time and space resolved the remaining fluctuations of the supreme power as much as possible and did not hurt Zhang Ruokan. Zhang Ruokan cleared his thoughts in the hollow and stopped thinking about what happened to Yan Wushan inside Dark Star No. 3. As long as he was killed, everything would no longer matter. Yan Wushan, it does nt make sense to go on like this. Even if we fight for another 10 days and 10 nights, we see a nt kill each other. As long as we see a nt kill each other, we will never be considered truly successful. Why not fight in the void? Zhang Ruokan said. Yan Wushan said, Yeah, it is too difficult for us to kill each other. If we want to win or lose, it is estimated that we have to fight for a month, or even months, to exhaust each other's strength and die. It's a good proposal, and I just want to take this opportunity to feel nothingness more thoroughly. Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan are not absolutely invincible in this era. After all, there is still a vanity who has no control. It is precisely because they both consider lack as a threatening opponent that they want to learn more about nothingness. The monks watching the battle nearby were all frightened by the dialogue between Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan. Fight into the void? The power of nothingness will erode everything that enters it, no matter whether it is heaven or hell, life or death, all can't be avoided. Once you fall into the void, you are dead. Do they think they are gods? Only in the realm of hunger, they dare to fight in the void. Crazy, crazy, 
even the gods don't dare to stay in the void for a long time. A great sacred in Begzu realm, in the void space, even if he does nothing to defend his defense, he will not be able to persist for an hour, and he will become a part of the void. Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan dare to enter the void and fight. In half an hour, life and death will be divided, and it may even fail. The great saint enters the battle in the void, as if two mortals were fighting underwater, and they will soon be divided into life and death. If the two people's cultivation is equal, the high probability will end up all together. Wen Chu and Qing Sheng De Sheng were both frightened. The two little guys were really brave. With their self-cultivation, they were still in awe of the void. Two hundred realms, but the void space is a battlefield. Luo Shengtian swallowed a spit, and finally understood something that the emperor said when he took the quasi principal sage Dan from his hand, your courage is not enough, you are destined to condense the second grade sacred sacredness and swallow the quasi prince Saint Ethan is purely wasteful www.mtlnovel.com leave it to your sister. Compared with Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan's bold and bold personality, he seems to be worse. Of course, this is not to say that Luo Shengtian is timid and afraid of things, but it is just that he is too cautious and conservative to show a little lack of courage. How can a timid person reach such a level? Really encountering right and wrong, Luo Shengtian will still not be vague. Blood Slaughter stood among the crowd, rejoicing, and shouted, Enter into the void, and divide life and death. Brother, I support you. Fight, although there is no regret. A great saint next to him looked at him with a puzzling look and said, You are not afraid. The dead person is your brother Zhang Ruokan? Or, Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan all together? Really? That's a big chance, right? That's great. The blood slaughter was even more joyful, and shouted again, We must enter the battle of nothingness, we must divide the birth and death, let us witness the two genius level geniuses confronting each other. The living is the king, the dead is the cow. Brother, fight! Wu Jiang's injuries on the Kishin battlefield have not healed yet. Hearing news of Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan's decisive battle, he decisively chose to stop healing and came to watch the battle. The same is true of Yan Huangtu. Beside them, there were a large number of dark temples and monks of the Yan Luo tribe. Wu Jiang said in a firm tone, the destiny realm is located at the top of the world tree, and the spatial structure is stable. With the cultivation of Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan, it is impossible to break the world wall and enter the void. Only the gods can break a corner of the space of the divine realm. The demigods and the supreme lord of the supreme realm may also break the space, but the cracked gap is absolutely not large enough to allow the monks to enter the void space. Yan Huangtu made his judgment. Even a crack in the space is fatal to the monk. Entering the void is as dangerous as a mortal jumping into the sea of fire, and it is a death act. Yet, can the space of the destiny domain be easily broken by the two of them? Wen Chu and Qing Sheng Dashen reacted, relieved, and immediately began to think about whether they could separate the two in the decisive battle. Why is there a life and death battle? Like the god of blood and Zhang Tian, isn't it good to be a peerless era of the era? Why do we have to separate life from death? Boom! Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan each mobilized tens of millions of spatial rules in their bodies to perform space holy arts. The space was violently shaken at once, like boiling water. Closer monks are all unstable and their bodies are pulled and deformed by the undulating space. In the central area where the spatial fluctuations are most intense, a space hole with a diameter of Su Su appeared. Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan rushed in like two fishes. This. Yan Huangtu and Wu Zhang were both stunned, and then reacted, Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan were not ordinary saints, but two space controllers. It is naturally easier for the space master to tear the space than the Supreme Lord. Wen Chu and Qing Sheng De Sheng were frightened and immediately flew to the area where the space was broken. However, when they flew, the caverns and space had been calmed down. The two attacked the force and wanted to tear the space apart again. However, if they did their best, 
they could only tear up a half-meter-long space breach. What can I do? There are fierce dangers that the gods are afraid of in the void. They are so taboo-free and dare to enter the decisive battle. Qing Sheng De Sheng was anxious. If Zhang Ruokin falls into the void, it will be a huge loss for the blood-stricken family. Qing Sheng Dashen is even more afraid of the unreasonableness after the blood, asking him for trouble. Wen Chu is relatively calm, but he still burns the light beam of communication to prepare to inform the gods of the Yan Luo tribe. Wow! The god of blood and a deity of the Yan Luo tribe showed the shadow of the gods and came to this chaotic battlefield. Qing Sheng Dashen breathed a sigh of relief and went forward to salute, saying, The battle between Zhang Ruokin and Yan Wushan has been out of my control. Please ask God of War to stop them from going on like this. The God of Blood, waving his hand, said, They're going to a decisive battle in the void, and it's up to them. Qing Sheng's great sacred heart was a little shocked, did not expect that the God of Blood Jeremy turned out to be such an attitude. But he knows better than anyone else, how much blood god of war respects Zhang Ruokin, and his love for Zhang Ruokin is even more than his son. God of war doesn't care about Zhang Ruokin's life and death? Seeing the gloomy eyes of Qing Sheng Dashen, the blood zealous shook his head and shook his head slightly disappointed, saying, Zhang Ruokin and Yan Wushan both took the same path of divine goodness, and both reached the final checkpoint. Kin make history there will be no ancients and no comers. But that step was too difficult. In this era, there is only one Zhang Ruokin, or only one Yan Wushan, they will not be able to make that step. But the two were born in this era at the same time, and at the same time cultivated the Tao that is closest to a saintly meaning, which made the impossible and a little possibility. They need to find the true meaning of a divine will in the battle of life and death, and they need their own state of mind and spirit. This war will not break out now, and it will be a few years later, and no one can stop it. Qing Sheng De Sheng Dao, but just in case. How can there be so many roads to the true strong? If there is a chance to hit unprecedented heights, then even death is worth it. The blood of God of Blood Zans has a profound meaning, and then expresses the spirit, if Zhang Ruokin can kill Yan Wushan in a war and become a holy spirit then I will even marry the unmarried goddess of fate who has become a god. They should all think seriously. Why did you talk about marriage again? Qing Sheng De Sheng was a little speechless, and felt that the blood of the god of blood Zhang Zhang was too big, and he wanted Zhang Ruokin to marry the of destiny. Those prideful women, all of whom have high arrogance and are themselves peerless powers, how could they be willing to marry a junior junior? Even if the god of blood Jeremy wants to marry himself, they may not be willing. The Yan Luo deity was Wuking Sect, a giant figure of the Yan family in the Dark Abyss, and the fifth son of the previous generation of the Yan Luo patriarch, who had survived the five-dimensional calamity. Wu Qing Zong didn't mean to stop Yan Wushan and Zhang Ruokin, and held the same attitude with the blood god. Just entering the void, Zhang Ruokin and Yan Wushan only felt their bodies light as if they were falling off a cliff. Immediately thereafter, invisible pressure surged in all directions, eroding the Yan Luo Qi and the blood Sha Qi that they escaped. Even their real space of space is constantly being eroded and becoming smaller and smaller. The source of Yan Wushan's practice has a strong restraint on the power of nothingness, quickly adapts, urges the supreme holy glove, and makes a trick of high-level holy art, which will layer Zhang Ruokin's real space into one layer the layers are crushed. The power of nothingness eroded away towards Zhang Ruokin along the cracks in the real space of the broken space. The dragon elephant is gone. In Zhang Ruokin's body, the sound of the tiger howling dragon groaned, ten dragon souls and ten tiger souls, with their palms, gushing from their arms, erupting into a mighty battle. With the help of ten tiger souls obtained from the burial gold and white tigers, Zhang Ruokin has already practiced the dragon elephant like a palm to the point where the high-level enlightenment of the Qunwen realm is completed. Of course, the dragon elephant can't be called now, it should be called a dragon and tiger like a palm. Boom! Fists intersect. In the void space, a huge cloud of strength and energy appeared, and both of them flew backwards. 
Zhang Ruokan once again propped up the real realm of space, and then protected the body with the secret of time and space to play out the hidden realm of the Tibetan mountain. A boundless mountain group manifested by the magic mirror wrapped Yan Wushan and suppressed it below the mountains. Seizing this opportunity, Zhang Ruokan released the realm of truth. Break me! Yan Wushan had a long flurry of dances, waving Tong Tian Rui, breaking up the magic mountains and rushing out of it. Above the top of Zhang Ruokan's head, there was already a shadow of blood grinding, and a lot of flames beating in the blood grinding. The roar of the blood mill turned Zhang Ruokan's eardrums into pain. Yan Wushan developed a strong sense of danger and his face changed. No, Zhang Ruokan has incorporated the truth into the thousand question high level holy art blood mill embers, which will explode ten times the attack power. Yan Wushan just came up with this idea, the blood mill is spinning and flying, crushing his real space of space, breaking through the light of the origin, colliding with the death book guarding him. Wow! Death book flipped quickly, forming a page-by-page -page book shadow. Zhang Ruokan managed to seize the opportunity, and how terrible the tenfold attack power was. The death book could not be prevented. Yan Wushan had no fear in his heart, with a long whistle, and the supreme holy glove, boxing was burning with blood. Boom! The blood mill hit him and flew away. Yan Wushan vomited blood and was finally injured. The arm wearing the supreme holy glove became blood dripping, and bones were visible. It's a pity that nothingness eroded the blood milling embers, and the power was reduced a lot. Otherwise, even if he can't kill Yan Wushan, he should be able to hit him hard and lock the victory. Zhang Ruokan sighed in secret, and then chased after the victory, knocking out the Tibetan mountain magic mirror and kicking Gailian in turn, and Yan Wushan continued to retreat. The blood of Yan Wushan's body rolled, and each time the supreme holy artifact fell, it was like a hammer striking the heart, and his body seemed to be torn apart. There were several shadows of the gods, broke into the void, and watched the two men fight from a distance. I saw that Zhang Ruokan was fighting more and more fiercely, like fighting a of heaven. He had endless power. He didn't care about nothingness eroding the flesh, he just wanted to kill Yan Wushan at the fastest speed. Yan Wushan was extremely dangerous every time, but he was always able to save the danger and block Zhang Ruokan's attack. Naiho Bridge Yan Wushan seized a little bit of time, clenched his teeth, his hands quickly printed, and a strange mark appeared on his brows. Boom! A stone bridge rushed out of his brows. Only half of the bridge body flew out, simple and atmospheric, and the secret lines on the bridge were revived, and all the attacking powers of Zhang Ruokan were wiped out invisible. Zhang Ruokan's sacred soul, affected by the strength of Nehi Bridge, showed signs of flying away. It has the power to hold the Holy Spirit. This stone bridge is no small feat. Zhang Ruokan flew out of the Holy Spirit half of his body, pulled back, and then quickly backed away, hiding the Holy Spirit in the Holy Source. Yan Wushan finally redeemed his disadvantages, would he miss this great opportunity? On the bridge, the secret lines dazzled brightly, and instantly broke through the boundary of void space, appeared in front of Zhang Ruokan, and penetrated all his defenses. Boom! Seven Star Ghost Lotus, the secret of time and space, the Tibetan magic mirror flew out and fell into the dark. Zhang Ruokan's fighting spirit boiled, his armor of Vulcan burned, his arms hit out at the same time, attracting the power of ten dragons and ten tigers, and colliding with the stone bridge. The shadow of the dragon and tiger collapsed instantly. The magical fire broke apart and turned into a gorgeous cloud of fire. Zhang Ruokan's arms bleed, and his body was struck by Nihekiao. Yan Wushan made a long shout, followed closely, and wanted to make a final decision, killing Zhang Ruokan under the stone bridge. He vomited blood and drew on the stone bridge, which made the brilliance on the stone bridge further bloom. At the same time, more bridges rushed out of his brows. Yan Wushan and Nihekiao were connected together, and the erupting power grew to the peak. Even if Zhang Ruokan hid the Holy Spirit into the Holy Source, he was pulled out by the ancient power of the stone bridge, 
and the soul body was uncontrolled and flew outside. At the same time, the stone bridge was like a stone sword, chopped down from above, and slashed at Zhang Ruokan's body. Even the blood-threatening god of war could not be calm at this moment, and a pair of divine eyes suddenly became radiant. If Zhang Ruokan was hit by this blow, the body and the sacred soul would not be able to keep it. Boom! Nihi Bridge smashed into Zhang Ruokan's head. To everyone's surprise, he was not defeated. Instead, he blocked the attack and his body only sank dozens of feet. Above Zhang Ruokan's head, a circular stone plate was suspended. It is Sundial. At the moment when the Sundial collided with Nahi Bridge, the blue brilliance bloomed, and the dense light spots of time imprinted. In the void space, there was no time and space. However, under the influence of the sundial, in this area, the sea of time appeared, and it struck Yan Wushan. Disorder of Time In the area where Yan Wushan is located, the time flow rate is unpredictable. Yan Wushan is also very human. He is very clear that the reason why the light spots of time can exist for so long is because his space sphere has blocked the power of nothingness. To mitigate the effects of time, simply collapse the space domain. Close. After Yan Wushan retracted the space domain, his body was completely exposed to the power of nothingness, and his skin was instantly blurred. There was blood, which escaped from the body, and disappeared into small blood spots. It's over. Zhang Ruokan held the sundial and came on the river for a long time. He waved the ancient sword of Shen Yuan and cut off Yan Wushan's body. As the controller of time and space, how fast Zhang Ruokan is, is not comparable to Yan Wushan. Even if he saw his sword, there was no chance to resist it. After Yan Wushan's two bodies flew out, he was quickly devoured by nothingness. Even the Nehi Bridge and the Supreme Holy Glove can't resist the erosion of nothingness. Yan Wushan's body, like sand, is turned into particles and lost into the darkness. That's it. Zhang Ruokan is standing in the dark and boundless world, surrounded by a hollow, without a hint of joy, but some loneliness and loneliness www.mtlnovel.com Since training, Zhang Ruokan has encountered countless days of pride, but never one can like Yan Wushan, he was under tremendous pressure. This pressure has also turned into motivation. If it wasn't for Yan Wushan's persistent pursuit and aggressiveness, Zhang Ruokan might not have chosen to take a path of Holy Spirit. Unexpectedly, Yan Wushan failed so quickly, after all, the time and space controller is more powerful. Time and space are the most perfect combination of the nine ancient and ancient ways. Zhang Ruokan said in the future that it will not necessarily be the next Su Mi. Watching the shadows of God, whispering. The god of blood Zhan Zhan did not show his joy because of Zhang Ruokan's victory. Instead, his face became dignified and he looked at the shadow of Wu King Zong's god. He seemed to want to confirm the conjecture in his heart. Wu Qing Zong was very calm and calm. This made the heart of the blood desperate warfare sink slightly. Nothingness, no boundlessness, nothingness. Everything in the heavens and the earth will be eroded by the force of nothingness and eventually dissipate. Zhang Ruokan's real space of space was eroded by nothingness to a diameter of ten feet. Therefore, after killing Yan Wushan, he did not dare to stay long and prepare to leave. At this moment, he suddenly felt induction, staring with amazement at the position where Yan Wushan's body disappeared. Use the eye of truth and finally see clearly. In the void space, Although Yan Wushan's two bodies were reduced to particles and integrated with darkness, there was no void. Those particles, like strands of black gas, flow through. Nothing can't erode it in a short time. Well, the pure dark air is more pure and of higher quality than the power of the borderless cultivation as the dark master. Zhang Ruokan felt incredible. He and Yan Wushan have fought many times, knowing the strength of each other. Yan Wushan practiced the dark way, and his accomplishments were not low, but far from reaching the level of Wu Jiang. So, where does this dark air come from? The dark power continued to increase, and the intensity of the wave quickly surpassed the Biyun realm, 
exceeded the thousand questions realm, and even surpassed the lifetime realm of the dead. It seems that it will never reach its peak. The mighty power shook Zhang Ruokin back and forth. Even the shadows of gods hanging in the void reveal an incredible look. Wow! The strands of dark air gradually solidified, twisted and twisted like twists, and finally condensed into Yan Wushan's body. He has a long hair stand upside down, his eyes are shocking and powerful, and there are few monks in the realm of God to compare. If Yan Huangtu and the borderless people are standing in front of Yan Wushan at this moment, they will tremble as if they see evil gods. Zhang Ruokin was shocked by Yan Wushan's body and retreated 800 miles away. He only felt that Yan Wushan had become completely different from peace, as if he had entered an evil state, which was very similar to the original evil. There are some differences. More evil than evil. Zhang Ruokin called back to the secret of time and space, the magic mirror of the Tibetan mountains, and the seven star ghost lotus, as if the enemy was staring at Yan Wushan, and said, It is the breath of the dark star number three, where have you absorbed the dark power? Yan Wushan was like an evil god, with red pupils and long voices, dark power? No, I swallowed the third dark star. Swallowed. Zhang Ruokin muttered to himself, his eyes solemnly. The dark star number three is thousands of miles in diameter and one hundred thousand times denser than iron. Picking up a stone, it weighs more than one million kilograms. A great saint who can devour it. Calling it a planet, it is better to say that it is a big world, a big world formed by hundreds of thousands of planets. Even the beast that travels around the world cannot swallow it. In the corner of the empty space, the blue dragon with the character wrapped around the body, with blue clouds on it, smiled slightly proudly, Zhang Ruokin is very powerful, but unfortunately, he should not have been born with Yan Wushan in an era, destined to become Yan Wushan to board the universe stepping stones on top. Tiger, after Zhang Ruokin's death, why don't you let him be a guide? The burial gold white tiger stood above a lake-sized golden light and said, it's too soon to say such a thing, right? The symbol blue dragon shook the dragon's head and said, although the dark star number three can only be considered as a medium to inferior size with a diameter of thousands of miles. However, it is extremely ancient and has dark power inside. Gave birth to spiritual wisdom, and gave birth to dark primitive spirits. The dark primal spirit swallowed up the true blue prince of the stone tribe, who had been practicing inside the third dark star, and captured a little consciousness of the blue priest, who passed the cultivation method and reached the height of the supreme holy cultivation. Yan Wushan was hunted down by the dark primordial spirit for decades when he was practicing inside the dark star number three, and even was almost devoured by the dark primitive spirit in the flesh, and was robbed. Unfortunately, the oppression of the dark primordial spirit, instead, allowed Yan Wushan to integrate the fifth kind of sacrament, making the reincarnation of the six paths nearly a success. Instead, he suppressed the dark primordial soul into the six paths of reincarnation. Imprisoned After decades of refinement and purification, the dark primal spirit was almost completely absorbed by Yan Wushan and became part of his body and holy spirit. When the fifth kind of sacred meaning was merged, a vision of the universe was drawn, Yan Wushan was in harmony with the rules of heaven and earth, and Xiao Yuan's adversity increased greatly, creating a miracle of no one before and no one after. Atheism blends into the sea of energy, and the flesh and the third dark star merge into one, without distinguishing each other. If you urged the third dark star and the dark primal spirit, Yan Wushan could even call Ban Wu Shang Jing De Sheng, how could Zhang Ruokin fight him? The funeral gold white tiger was still calm, and laughed, through the cultivation of the Beijing realm, to motivate the power of the supreme holy level, Yan Wushan would have to die even if he killed Zhang Ruokin. Not necessarily. Yan Wushan possesses a half-Buddha body, but also has a strong spiritual power that can withstand the power of the supreme holy one. Funeral gold and white tiger said, the realm is not enough. It is like an ignorant child who is in charge of destroying the world. Even if he can kill the enemy, he will hurt himself. In the end, everyone will die together. 
This time, the symbol blue dragon did not raise the bar with the burial gold and white tiger, and said, this is the battle of life and death between the two of them. Yan Wushan has reached the time when he has to use the power of the Dark Star. The number of deities receiving news is increasing. Some of them were very interested in Yan Wushan and Zhang Ruokan, so they lowered the projection of the gods or the shadows to come and watch the battle. After the blood, the real deity appeared not far from the god of blood, with a worried look in his eyes. As long as it is a god, where can't you see that Yan Wushan has absorbed the dark souls and carries a dark star in his body? There is no suspense in this battle. As long as the gods of the Blood Jew family don't step in, Zhang Ruokan will die. The Ghost Master looked at the Blood Jew god with a condensed expression on his face, and a cheerful smile appeared on his face. As soon as Zhang Ruokan dies, it must be a heavy blow to the family. Just after winning the battle of the hunting god, the blood god of war was congratulated by all parties. Everyone can see that the three generations of the blood king family are talented. It is a sign of great prosperity. After a few Yuan conferences, I am afraid that they will dominate the undead blood. Megatron the whole world. Not to mention the blood clan tribe and the undead blood clan, even the forces of the other races sent gifts to congratulate them on their own initiative. As the ghost master of one of the biggest losers in the battle of the hunt, naturally he is jealous. Now, only half a month has passed, and Zhang Ruokan, the unicorn of the blood master family, is about to fall. Can the ghost master not be happy? The King Luo God King nodded his head slightly, and breathed a sigh of relief, saying, the King Luo Temple has already resented itself with the blood sacrifice family. Fortunately, Zhang Ruokan is about to die in the hands of Yan Wushan. Otherwise, the King Luo Temple will have a hard time. Once Zhang Ruokan cultivates to the full consummation of Bei's Hang Realm and breaks all the shackles in his body, the power of the demigod can fully erupt. When the deities cannot intervene in the mundane world, the King Luo Temple can suppress Zhang Ruokan, and there are only so many areas left. A few. When Zhang Ruokan reaches a thousand questions, a life of ten thousand deaths, he will master the power of the demigod body more perfectly, plus the power of cultivation into the realm, then, under the gods, he will be more invincible. If God does nt do anything, Zhang Ruokan will surely sweep the hell. If the takes the shot, the god of blood Zhan Zhan, Emperor Luo Yan, and god of Fulu will come to the door together, and no one can carry it. King Luo God King attaches great importance to the cultivation of the younger generation, so he is very worried about that day. You know, when Zhang Ruokan was in the Sacred Kingdom, he almost killed a generation in heaven. The King Luo King spoke to the Ghost Master, saying, Zhang Ruokan is about to fall, and the gods of the family will likely block it. The Ghost Master smiled cruelly, and said, Will you and I be present, would you give them a chance to intervene? Since it is a battle between life and death, naturally you have to divide birth and death. The ancestral monarch of the dead race descended into the void, and beside him were three great saints, all of whom were his children, the source demon son, the source non-sage saint, and the source emperor true emperor. The source demon son is his seventh son. Yuan Fei Sheng is his sixth son. Both were a generation of Tian Jiao. They were prestigious in their contemporaries and were capable of becoming gods. They were cultivated by the Emperor Yuan Tian and regarded as proud. However, Yuan Tian monarch most valued it, but the fourth daughter Yuan Yuan. Yuan Yuan's age is no more than 2000 years old, and it is not much older than Yuan Fei Dashan. It is the first child born after King Yuan Ashan's calamity after the Yuan Hui calamity. Xiao Wei broke through to the top. No accident, before long live, Yuan Zhang must be a god. Just like that, Yuan Zhen was named the true emperor, and he managed everything under the control of Yuan Tian King, and was the master of a starry sky. Although the true emperor Yuan Di is dead, he has no vitality. Instead, he is smart and beautiful, with white and translucent skin, the scorching light on his body, and the emperor's temperament to rule the world. The source demon son and source is not the great saint, 
standing in front of Yuan Tian monarch, somewhat awesome, not standing upright. However, the true emperor Yuan Zheng had a firm heart, without a trace of weakness, and his eyes were broad and sharp. Yuan Tian sovereign sighed, even the dark primordial spirit cultivated by the supreme realm can devour and fuse, let alone this Yuan Hui. Even in the past few Yuan Hues, it has not been so proud. Within a thousand years, Yan Wu God must be God. Yuan Yuan, would you like to marry him as a wife? The source demon son and the source of the great sacred heart were shocked. How much the father and valued Yuan Zhang and regarded her as his successor, but in order to win Yan Wushan, he was willing to marry her. Yuan Fei Dashan bowed and said, Father God, Sister Yuan Yuan also has the ability to become a god, and maybe he will become a one step ahead of Yan Wushan. Why should he wrong her and marry a man he doesn't like? Moreover, if marriage was granted by God, it must be the right room. Sister Yuan Yuan would have to be awkward if she married him again. The source demon god said, Sister has reached the supreme realm, there is a first class existence under the divine realm, and Yan Wushan is just one hundred realms. It is not too late to consider the matter until Yan Wushan becomes a god. Yuan Tian, the monarch of Shen, said, Your eyes are too short and you don't know anything about the world of the divine realm. Many forces, in order to do one thing, can be laid out 100,000 years or even a million years in advance. It is only now to Yan Wushan. The layout, I feel, is a bit late. The Fulu is still very powerful, and the battle of hunting the sky is to marry Yan Wushan and Zhang Ruokan. After Yan Wushan becomes a god, Yuan Yuan wants to marry him again, I'm afraid he won't look at it. Yuan Fei Dashan never thought that the father's attention to Yan Wushan had reached such a point. No wonder Yan Wushan and Zhang Ruokan, the two great saints, have drawn so many deities to watch the battle. Not to mention that his origin is not a great saint, even if it is the borderless, Yan Huangtu, it is far from having this weight. Is it because of the condensed meaning of the second product? Suddenly, the monarch of Yuan Tian said meaningfully, saying, Yan Wushan is likely to open up a precedent and consolidate a quality of divine will. After becoming a god, no one knows how terrible the height will be, I am afraid that god, he will be trampled under his feet by the king of god. Being a child is like a godless Yan. A bright light emerged from the eyes of Zhen Yuan Emperor, saying, Yan Wushan is truly unparalleled in the world. He is so lucky that he is rare in ancient and modern times. Marrying him is not a grievance. However, it is not easy to defeat Zhang Ruokan. Yuan Tian monarch showed a surprised look, and said, Yi Er actually thought that Zhang Ruokan could fight against the power of a dark star. Emperor Yuan Zhang stared at the two in the distant void, and said, Change to another Bai Dijing De Sheng, already frightened by the power that erupted from Yan Wushan. However, Zhang Ruokan did not escape, instead he fought. It has become stronger. Is he scared silly? Said the source demon's son. Yuan Zhen really said, if you think so, the fool must be you. I think Zhang Ruokan must still have a whole card unused, and there should still be a battle. There is some expectation, who is the king in this Yuan Hui? Yan Wushan reunited physically and imposingly, and slapped out the invading power of invasion, and the dark power erupting from his body shrouded thousands of miles. Six reincarnation, life and death. Yan Wushan held his hands slightly, and the power of darkness was above his head, condensing a palm, and patted Zhang Ruokan away. This palm contains the power of the dark star, with the true meaning of the six samsara samsara. Although it has not reached the level of the sacred shot of the Supreme Holy One, it is also powerful and horrifying, far exceeding Yan Wushan's own power. Zhang Ruokan stood in the darkness, only feeling that the heavens and the earth were squeezing towards himself. The walls in all directions were walls, and the power erupted on each side was more than ten times stronger than the previous Yan Wushan. Yin, Yang, and the five elements, the world revolves, endlessly. Zhang Ruokan fought all kinds of soldiers, all kinds of forces poured out, and inspired the yin and yang five elements, forming a Taiji mark, 
suspended above his head. Wow! Pieces of the supreme sacred instrument collapsed, and the real realm of space, the realm of truth, and the realm of virtual time were all penetrated. Big Dark Hand and Tai Chi marks are in contact. Zhang Ruokin made a long howling sound, manipulating the divine will, and went all out to absorb the dark power from the big hands. However, the big hand was like the dark and deep sea, which could not be absorbed at all. Like breaking through a layer of paper, the dark hands penetrated the Taiji mark and patted on Zhang Ruokin. Everything is over. The master smiled, feeling extremely happy. King Luoshen Wangdao, the yin and yang five elements of sacred spirit cultivated by Zhang Ruokin www.mtlnovel.com are not weaker than Yan Wushan's six reincarnation sages. However, Yan Wushan can control the power of the dark star, but also merge the supreme divine darkness and primordial spirit, strong in strength, is it that Zhang Ruokin can block, what, actually blocked? All the gods who came here were taken aback. I saw that Zhang Ruokin was burning the flames and supported the big dark hand with his arms. Then, his eyebrow fired a beam of light, breaking the big dark hand to pieces, and disappeared. What is a dark star, but there is a big world in my grandson's body. The power of the world is mobilized, and no one can fight against him. Who can fight with him? The blood-threatening god of God hummed. Just a moment ago. The god of blood zest broke the seal of Kyunkin world, allowing Zhang Ruokin to enter the strongest state, no longer subject to any suppression, and he could fully mobilize all his powers. Whether in the battlefield of merit or hunting the battlefield, Zhang Ruokin never used the power of Kyunkin world. In fact, the realm of the world is a part of Zhang Ruokin's body, not an external force. It's blocked, actually, it's blocked. Yuan Tian, the prince of Yuan Tian, and Yuan Li, the sacred god, lost their sight. The beam of light shot from Zhang Ruokin's eyebrows, crushed the dark hands, as if they had hit them. Zhang Ruokin and Yan Wushan are so strong. So it seems that even if Wu Zhang, Yan Huangtu, and the greedy babies break through the thousand questions, they must avoid their edge. The battle of hunting the sky has limited their strength. Yuan Feita Sheng smiled bitterly. Although Wu Zhang, Yan Huangtu, Greedy Infant, etc. also have cards that can't be brought to the battlefield, but when they encounter a dark star and a big world, those cards can't be blocked at all? Yu and Yan Monarch said, Now do you still feel that Yan Wushan is not worthy of your sister? Yu and Fei Sheng Sheng and Yu and Li Da Sheng both shook their heads. Yan Wushan came out of one Yu and Hui. It was so amazing that it was a hundred realms in a life of death. As the blood god of war said, there is no great sacredness in the supreme realm, and no one can hold Zhang Ruokin and Yan Wushan in the sacred realm. A ghostly fire emerged from the ghost master, and he even said, I didn't expect, didn't expect that Zhang Ruokin's body was actually a big world. When he carried the big world in his physical body, he shouldn't be in the great holy realm. Of. On Zhang Ruokin's body, Several gods helped him cover up the secret, and the ghost master failed to calculate the secret hidden in him. Besides, Zhang Ruokin's gas sea wall has the marks of gods. The ordinary deities, even if they captured him, could not detect the secrets in his sea. At most, he could only kill him. King Kinglo's eyes narrowed, and he said to himself, Only the five elements of chaos, in the realm of the holy king, can't carry a big world. Does Zhang Ruokin inherit the mantle of the sacred monk Sumi, which has a spatial meaning? Yes, it must be so. Yan Wushan was able to absorb the dark primitive spirit and carry a dark star, but he possessed a half-Buddha body, and succeeded through the six sacraments of reincarnation. Luo Sheng Tian was able to condense two lively planets of the planet of God, because he has a pair of natural gods. The so-called divine eye is no different from the eyes of the deities, and has a huge space inside. Even so, the two star-like living planets of Leo were also sealed by layers. It is worth mentioning that Luo Shengtian was so powerful because when he was born, his mother's Tianyan had already broken into a god. 
the baby born of the flesh and blood of the gods is born with a blood, a bone, and even a soul. What's more, his father was still the great emperor of the Raksha clan. For example, two children born of humans are humans. The children born by the two gods, even if they are not gods, will achieve the same height in the future. This is why many monks have children only after becoming a god, or they will have a calamity after one yuan, and only have one child. The stronger you are, the stronger your children are. The children of female deities and the children of male deities are not at all a level. When the children of female gods are born, they are blood, bones, and spirits, which are equivalent to natural divine fetuses, like cubs of gods and beasts. As long as they are not too wasteful, their future achievements are at least pseudo-god level. However, every time a female conceives a child, it will be damaged, and there may be one or two children in her life. Moreover, the children born are too weak and incomplete, and cannot control the power in the body at all, and the divine power will be sealed up to reach the state of great sacredness, and then it will be gradually unlocked. This is true of Luo Shengtian and Luo Yan. When Zhang Ruokan carried a large world, he was neither a demigod nor a child of a female deity. He had no unique advantage, and why was he so bad? In addition to the upright space, the king of the Deerqing couldn't think of other possibilities. Lonely came to the deficiency in the void, looking at Yan Wushan and Zhang Ruokan in the battle, a little confusion appeared in his eyes. The master taught him that he was surrounded by nothing, but only one person and one sword could sweep the world. When Xiu reached a certain level, he would even abandon the sword, and truly be the only one in the world and the ego in the world. Each has its own way, and each has its own way. The confusion in Q's eyes was quickly cut off by his sword, he decisively left the void, and made a secret determination in his heart. He would never be born without a perfect second-class sage. The dark power of the third dark star can cover millions of miles in the sky. In nothingness, although only covering thousands of miles, it is also very scary. Zhang Ruokan's body, like a multicolored stone, blooms in five colors, and uses the yin, yang, and five elements to control the power of the world of heaven and earth, and stirs the dark world for thousands of miles. It seems like an endless black ocean that is constantly shattered by the multicolored brilliance. The sacred will of yin yang and the five elements blends the sacred will of Zhang Ruokan. The six reincarnation sages incorporate the sages of Yan Wushan's five taos, including the origin, space, and darkness of the eternal way. To build the six reincarnations, space is the foundation, origin is the essence of everything, darkness is death, Buddha is creation, yellow spring is flow and change, and finally Yan Luo dominates the six paths. Today, in addition to Yan Lushan Tao, the other five Taos are integrated. This battle was a battle between Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan, a collision between Dark Star and a large world, and a confrontation between the two Taos. Boom! Zhang Ruokan mobilized more and more power in the world, and his body glowed brighter, as if it were about to melt. He broke through the darkness with one palm, and flew Yan Wushan out of his mouth. The power of this palm is to reach the level of the sacred life of all deaths. Again. Yan Wushan yelled, re-supported the six reincarnation, and hit Zhang Ruokan. He urged the power of the dark star to the extreme reaching the strongest state he could control, breaking the seal of Zhang Ruokan's yin-yang five elements Tai Chi and knocking Zhang Ruokan into a thousand miles. This collision was like being hit by a dark star. Zhang Ruokan's body, constantly cracking, seemed to be hit into pieces of flesh and blood. But, to his surprise, his physical recovery was extremely fast and he carried it down hard. Yan Wushan's power was finally exhausted. Zhang Ruokan seized the opportunity to launch a counterattack, punching one after another, like a Ranju, hitting Yan Wushan's chest. Well, Yan Wushan's chest cavity was beaten down, blood rushed down, his ribs and internal organs were broken, and finally, Zhang Ruokan was penetrated alive and his backbone was broken. Those shattered flesh and blood become the original particles and re-aggregate back to build a complete body. Zhang Ruokan's face was dignified, 
and after combining the Dark Primitive Spirit and the Fifth Holy Spirit, Yan Wushan's resilience became so powerful. I'm afraid it will be consumed in this battle. Everyone is swallowed up by nothingness. Yan Wushan obviously realized this too. His eyes were as dark as ink, and he penetrated through the void with spiritual power. He shouted, Zhang Ruokan, how much have you realized about Yin Yang and the Five Elements? Nothing. Zhang Ruokan shook his head. Yan Wushan said, how can you understand the Six Reincarnation without going into the dead and death? The last blow, one blow out, will divide life and death. Are you ready? Yeah, if you do nt enter the dead and death, how to communicate the world and understand the true meaning of yin and yang and the five elements? The last hit is to see if you can really push me into the death and death, and let me see the future of the integration of yin and yang and the five elements. Zhang Ruokan said. Dark Star, Born. Yan Wushan's brows raised a strange mark. The dark air poured out from the inside like ink, forming a light curtain with a diameter of thousands of miles. It looks like a black mirror, standing in front of Yan Wushan. A terrible sense of crisis enveloped Zhang Ruokan's body. The light curtain in front was like a door of death, pulling him desperately, causing his body to ache and crack slightly. There was a loud bang, and a huge dark star flew out of Yan Wushan's air, bursting out hundreds of miles on the black light curtain, much like a fish hook like crescent. The dark star's body manifested only one tenth, but the wave of power erupted by Yan Wushan was far better than before. Snapped. Yan Wushan's half Buddha body could not bear the power of the dark star, and a crack appeared in his brows. The dark star rushed out again by a tenth. Slap. 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 The crack in Yan Wushan's eyebrows has a few more blood flowing. Divine shadows in the distance were all stunned. What is he going to do? Is it to call the dark star out of the sea of gas, and he has such terrible power? Isn't he afraid that the dark star will kill him instead? Blood Queen said. A person who can bear hundreds of pounds of rock does not mean that he can use it as a weapon and wield the battle. If you can't move it, you will crush yourself. The stars of the dark star rushed out more and more, and the power of Yan Wushan reached the point where it was difficult for the great saint to reach the peak of his life. However, Yan Wushan had cracks all over his body, and his skin became like a cobweb, shocking, as if it would be broken at any time. Bearing the blow of my dark star will crush your flesh and holy spirit and destroy your spirit. Yan Wushan gave a loud sigh controlled the half-dark star with six samsara saints, and suppressed Zhang Ruokan in the past. The weight of number three dark star is comparable to hundreds of thousands of planets. Although it is only a small part of it, after being rolled out, it is also full of air waves, temporarily leaving the power of nothingness. Zhang Ruokan stared forward, seeing not a star, but boundless darkness. A wave of great fear, mighty power and great momentum came rolling towards him. If it can't stop him, he must be reduced to dust. The world of Kyun can borrows my strength. The strength and strength of the world in the air, rushed into Zhang Ruokan's body. The colorful brilliance on Zhang Ruokan's body multiplied several times, and he took the initiative to move forward, holding the Yin Yang Five Elements Taiji seal with both palms attacking the boundless darkness. Even the gods didn't blink, staring at each other. Winning and losing in an instant, there must be a peerless Tianjiao fall today, and the other will ride the wind and become the hottest star in the whole world. Who will be alive? Boom! Just after colliding with the dark star, Zhang Ruokan's arms burst and turned into two blood mists, leaving only bones. Even the armor of Vulcan was eroded by the power of darkness. Immediately after, Zhang Ruokan's neck, head, chest, and legs showed cracks. Is Zhang Ruokan defeated? Yuan Fei Dashan asked. Yuan Zhen Zhen Emperor calmly, said, the power of the Dark Star, which attacks Zhang Ruokan and back against Yan Wushan, is unknown. Yuan Tian Monarch said, if Zhang Ruokan had no other means, he would most likely be dead. Oh! Zhang Ruokan's arms were completely broken, 
the bones turned into powder, and his body could only resist the crushing of the dark stars. Yan Wushan yelled, dead. Yan Wushan's body shattered, and the star of the dark star rushed for another point, becoming more powerful. Although the flesh is broken, yet another strand of dark air connects it, it can be said that it is broken, it will die, it will die. Just when all monks thought that Zhang Ruokin would die. Wow! Zhang Ruokin's eyebrows opened a door to space, and branches of the world tree flew out of it, banging with the dark star. Take the heavenly tree! The ghost master sang softly, his eyes widened. The god of heaven is the spiritual root of the world in Kunlun. One of the oldest beings in the universe, the old-fashioned can recognize it by just breath. God of blood, the god of heaven is dead, this is just a seedling growing from a dead root. The ghost master is uncertain, even if he only picks up the seedlings of Tenjin, it makes him covet. Booming! The branches of the heavenly tree rushed out of the door of space, and the dark stars stopped. Zhang Ruokin's physical body was also difficult to withstand such a powerful force and continued to break, but he still gritted his teeth, folded his hands, and shouted, The world is out of the world, suppress the six roads, and destroy the cycle. The light of the door of space rose sharply. From inside, it broke out of a corner of the world and collided with the dark star. The two collided, the black and white rays twined, and the energy burst. It took a long time for the peace to return to nothingness. Who won? Yuan Feta Sheng Ning looked, where can you still see the shadow of Zhang Ruokin? There is only one dark star, www.mtlnovel.com, suspended in the void, exuding heartfelt dark waves. It seems that it is Yan Wushan who has reached the top of this era. Yuan Li Dash and Dao. Emperor Yuan Zhen shook his head and said, the breath of Yan Wushan has completely disappeared, and there is only Zhang Ruokin in the world. In the shocking eyes of everyone, Zhang Ruokin walked to the top of the dark star step by step, his broken body, and stepped together again, showing the resilience that surprised the gods. The tight face of the god of blood Zhang Zhan finally stretched and opened a long laugh, Today, my grandson Zhang Ruokin, the crown cap is in the world, no one can fight with him. Wu Qing Zong, can you be convinced? Wu Qing Zong showed the spirit of the gods, saying, Life and death are decisive, and life and death are recognized. Zhang Ruokin wins with his true skill, and he should be proud of his life. On the day of Zhang Ruokin's and Luo Yan's engagement, he cut Yan Yan and achieved the uniqueness of Yuan Hui. He is a world famous talent and a strong combat force. It quickly spread to all heavens and ten hells. God of blood and blood immediately flew above the dark star. After the blood, his face was full of concern. He grabbed Zhang Ruokin's right wrist, mobilized divine power and blood, and poured it into him continuously, helping him to heal his injuries and resolve the dark power that invaded his body. How horrible Yan Wushan was when he was dying, his power almost reached the level of the Supreme Holy One. The God of Blood, with his hands on his back, stood in the air, not angering himself, observing Zhang Ruokin. It was found that his eyes were red, his body was full of evil spirits, and the five elements of chaos in his body were transformed into blood evil spirits, which was the state of enchantment. The breath of mankind is almost completely devoured by the breath of the undead blood. Of course, the blood god of war did not mind, Zhang Ruokin completely became an undead blood tribe. However, what is worrying is that Zhang Ruokin's mental will and the undead blood do not match, but they are forcibly transformed, and eventually they will not be undead blood, but a madman who has completely lost his mind. He refined by Kang's soil. He can heal himself no matter how serious the injury. But his demon has completely erupted and occupied his mind. The priority is to send him to fuel a shrine, only the way of destiny. In order to suppress the demon, the god of blood zest did not cover his voice, and deliberately let the gods around him hear it. He was shocked after the blood, and said, Send to the temple of Fulu and let the way of fate suppress the demon in his body? No, absolutely not. After the blood, 
Zhang Ruokin recruited souls and helped him fuse the physical body of past and present life. He knew that there were many secrets hidden in his body, and it must not be known to outsiders. The god of blood, knowing the fears behind the blood, said, I know that Zhang Ruokin must have incredible treasures. However, a deity is not too fond of the things of a great holy junior. In the eyes of the deity, Qunkin world and even the sundial after the destruction, are nothing extraordinary. After seeing the blood, he still disagrees, and the blood god of war said, the demon erodes the spiritual will, outsiders can't help at all, only the way of fate can be suppressed. If you don't want Zhang Ruokin to fall into the abyss of the devil, we have no choice, what? Suddenly surprised by the god of blood Zhang Zhang, his gaze moved back to Zhang Ruokin. I saw, Zhang Ruokin's blood red eyes faded slightly. The blood veins on the ten gold wings gradually faded away, no longer as evil as before. Chen Er's spirit is strong, and the demon is suppressed by himself. After the blood, he was overjoyed, released his mental power, and turned into a dense, light spot like fireflies, wrapping Zhang Ruokin's body. The spiritual power of God is enough to affect the demon of the Great Holy Spirit to a certain extent. She sipped softly, wake up. These two words, however, contain the whole life's mental power after blood, like the magic spell of heavenly sounds, shaking the sea of consciousness of Zhang Ruokin, deterring the magic barrier in his heart, and all thoughts are scattered. Zhang Ruokin's eyes gradually returned to clarity, and the chaotic powers surrounding the body were all absorbed into the body. Dust. Whispered after the blood. Zhang Ruokin turned his head and stared at the blood, as if returning from the confusion, hesitated for a moment, and said, Mother, what is this place? After the blood, his eyes narrowed, he wondered, You don't remember the previous thing. Zhang Ruokin thought about it and shook his head gently. After the blood said, your consciousness was invaded by the demon, and a battle between life and death broke out with Yan Wushan. This is nothingness. A decisive battle between life and death broke out? I remember. Today is the day when I got engaged with Princess Luo Yi, how could I be suddenly invaded by the demon? Is the demon suppressed by the mother-in-law and grandfather? Zhang Ruokin's eyes were puzzled and he said, coughing violently, his body was weak and weak and the cultivation of Beijing seemed to be unable to keep, and he was about to fall. Quickly looked inside and found that the wounds were dense. Blood veins, holy veins, meridians, viscera, bones, and even holy sources, sea of qi, and holy spirits all have dense and small cracks. The fissure contains the power of darkness, the power of origin, the strength of Buddha, and the power of Yan Luo. Among them, the power of darkness is the strongest. After the blood held Zhang Ruokin, he said, the demon is suppressed by yourself. The mental power of the mother helps a little. What about Yan Wushan? Zhang Ruokin asked. After the blood said, it has fallen. Hearing this, Zhang Ruokin stood for a long time, looked around, and made a long sigh. The god of blood Zhang Zhang stood by and looked at Zhang Ruokin with a deep look like an endless blood pool. It stands to reason that it is absolutely impossible to recover by your own strength after being eroded by the demon. Zhang Ruokin has great perseverance, he knows it. But there are things that don't depend on perseverance. Let's go, this is not the place to talk, find a place to heal first, otherwise there will be hidden dangers that can never be cured. Zhang Ruokin shook his head and said, I can still sustain the injury. However, today is the day of engagement, and I must rush away immediately, not to lose faith. Otherwise, it will damage the royal faces of the deities of Fulu and Tian Luo. Is also a harm to Princess Rosa. The blood god of war finally showed a satisfied look, and nodded, and said, Very well, having a role is the most basic thing a man should have. Go. God of blood. God of Blood, after Zhang Ruokin left the void, the of Wuqingzong appeared on the dark star, stared at the star for a moment, rolled up his sleeves, and took away the dark star, and then went away. 
Two Yuan level geniuses, one fell and the other must fly into the sky and become the leading figures of this era. Zhang Ruokin, Zhang Ruokin. King Luo Shen Wang sighed, the shadow gradually disappeared. The ghost's eyes changed, and he immediately shook his sleeves, opened the void, and flew back to the realm of destiny. Yuan Fei's eyes condensed and said, Zhang Ruokin cut Yan Yan, and reached the apex of his might. In his desperate state, he could almost be called Ban Wu Shang Jing Sheng. It seems that to revenge the seventh brother, only the four sisters personally just do it. The source monarch Shen Ning said nothing. A pair of beautiful eyes of Emperor Yuan Zhen, as bright as the nine day stars, stared at Yuan Fei Dashen, and said, Revenge? Why revenge? Yuan Fei was stunned and said quickly, The seven brothers killed Zhang Ruokin's hand, and this revenge must be reported. For the failure of the dead in the Kishin battlefield, Zhang Ruokin has to bear the main responsibility. How can he easily let him go? Emperor Yuan Zhen patted Yuan Fei Fei Sheng on the shoulder and said with a long heart, At this moment, at that moment. Yuan Fei Dashen only felt that the palm of Emperor Yuan Zhen was so heavy that every shot seemed to be able to break his immortal body. But when it was about to fall, all power was instantly recovered. Yuan Zhen Zheng said, Zhang Ruokin is in a great situation. Now whoever dares to move him in the world must provoke the crazy revenge of the family and the royal family of Tian Luo Kingdom. You think there are several forces that can withstand their anger. Wu King Zong still chooses silence, why do we need to hit the knife? We can't mess with it. Yuan Fei's great sacrifice stopped and he was very reconciled. Yuan Zhen Zheng said, I just shot you three times, and each one is comparable to Zhang Ruokin's full blow. He weighed himself. The seventh brother fell on the battlefield of Kishin. It was his life and death. Weak, in the future, don't mention the word revenge again, be careful to cause yourself to be killed. Thank you for your education. Yuan Fei Dashen clenched his fists and bowed slightly. Emperor Yuan Ji Zhen nodded gently, and said, However, Zhang Ruokin has too many treasures and is too good. He must have been targeted by many forces. We dare not move him, but the people who dare to move him are not know. Whether he lives to become a is still unknown. After all the god's shadows disappeared. Yan Yu and Fuxiang women took the dark heavenly umbrella and walked out. On their faces, they were amazed. The beauty of Fu Xiong and can be compared with that of Emperor Yuan Zhen. Like the fairy in the painting, the red lips said slightly, Yan Wushan and Zhang Ruokin's cultivation has not yet reached the great consummation of Beizhang realm, but it is so powerful. Fortunately, Zhang Ruokin killed Yan Wushan. Otherwise, I suspect that an arrow shot from me thousands of miles away is likely to kill him. Yan Yu's figure is handsome, yet floating and dusting, saying, after the wind, he was assassinated by the gods of the Wujian Pavilion. Yan Wushan fell in the battle of life and death. I have a hunch that the of the various ethnic groups will soon be broken. And Zhang Ruokin is likely to be the person standing in the center of the vortex. Hell races. Not the ten. The ten races in the world are just the ten largest races, the ten races with all rights. In addition, there are many small ethnic groups. For example, the vassals belong to the undead blood clan, and there are blood spider clan, blood eater clan. Flying Blood Moth Clan, and so on. Even within the Undead Tribe, there are not only ten tribes, but also countless small tribes. Really? The troubled times are good. Only in troubled times can a strong person emerge. It would have been a long time to come up with someone to break the peace. Stars, there is a long way to go. When can I expect it? When can I expect it? Fuxiang's long hair flew, carrying a crystal bow, her body turned into a meteor-like white light, and flew out of nothingness. Yan Yu followed closely. Under the Divine Realm, like the two of them, they can enter the void space at will and leave the void space at will, very few. Fuel Shrine 
the representatives of the major forces were all astonished by the news of being assassinated after the wind and the battle between Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan. Wang Jiang is too presumptuous. It dared to assassinate the newly fortune goddess of fate, and it is clearly provoking the shrine of destiny. In my opinion, we should mobilize all our forces, push them flat, and kill all without pardon. The owner of Wujiang is secretive. He is so unpredictable that he is said to have cut off God. What do you mean, Wujiang killing the wind? Zhang Ruokan is also adding chaos. On the day of the engagement, he ran to a decisive battle with Yan Wushan. Isn't he afraid to anger God? What are you afraid of? If Zhang Ruokan died in the battle, why would the blame him? If Yan Wushan died in the battle, Zhang Ruokan is the only Xi'an of the Yuan society, and the will not be too harsh. The God of Blood and the Lord Luoyan made friends all over the world, and the representatives of the forces who came to the engagement banquet were numerous and well-known names. The tens of miles of area are brightly lit, gathering countless powerful people. Luoyan wore a phoenix and red brocade dress with a beautiful face. Accompanied by dozens of sacred maids, she stood motionless in front of layers of palaces and looked at the endless darkness. Her eyes were constantly changing, showing her worry. Color. As if turned into Wangfu stone. The news about the battle between Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan was passed back one after another. Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan entered the void space, and they are about to be born and die. Receiving this news, Luo Yan desperately wanted to rush to prevent the two from continuing the fight. She knew very well that once they entered the battle in the void, there was a high probability that they would die together. Unfortunately, all the gods were summoned by the Afulo to the Destiny Mountain because of the fall of the new goddess, Luo Luo wanted to enter the void, but there was no way. Luo Shengtian returned to Fulo Temple with a holy army. Luo Yan greeted up and asked eagerly, are there any results? Luo Shengtian shrugged his shoulders, spreading his hands, saying, I can't enter the void space, how can I know who the two lunatics lived and died? However, Yan Wushan's cultivation of the original way has a certain restraint on nothingness. Role, fighting in the void, there will be no small advantage. Luo Yan's heart sank deeply. Prujna was standing in a brightly lit courtyard, surrounded by people, but she felt that between the world and the earth, she was the only one, extremely cold and lonely. When the news of the assassination came after the wind, she already understood what Zhang Ruokan wanted to do. Don't you say that you're already gracious? Why are you doing this and why? It's not worth it. Prujna was blindfolded, covered with a mist of water, and murmured, be sure to come back alive. Otherwise, everything is meaningless. The Emperor Moro drank a lot of wine, wobbled, walked to Luo Yan and Luo Shengtian, and said with a big tongue, Princess. Her Royal Highness, in my opinion, Zhang Ruokan clearly doesn't care about you, if he, if it cares about you, how could it be that on the day of the engagement, run to a decisive battle with your life? It would be better, you would marry me. Luo Yan was nervous and worried. How could he care about him? Luo Shengtian rolled his eyes, even if my sister didn't marry Zhang Ruokan, was your Mora warrior worthy? However, the sentence in front of the Mora war emperor touched his heart, and Zhang Ruokan had a decisive battle with Yan Wushan on the day of his marriage, and it was too to hang his sister and countless monks to the banquet. Even though his mother helped Zhang Ruokan and said something good for Zhang Ruokan, Luo Shengtian was still very dissatisfied. Luo Shengtian exhaled a long sigh of resentment, and said softly to Luo Yan, Let us forget it, let everyone disperse www.mtlnovel.com Let us not say if Zhang Ruo can cant get back, even if he wins, it is probably miserable Sheng, where else can we come to the engagement banquet? Luo Yan stood still, motionless, apparently not listening to his words. Luo Shengtian said, the new goddess has fallen, and both the deity and the father and the emperor are busy working on this matter. I am afraid that the engagement banquet can no longer be taken care of. The emperor girl, there is no need to wait any longer. Zhang Ruokan said, 
he will protect me for the rest of his life, and he will never fail me. I believe him. Luo Yan said firmly. Luo Shengtian grinned and said secretly in his heart that such ghost talk was believed, and Huang Mei was afraid that Zhang Ruokin would be filled with ecstasy soup and lose her mind. Wow! Space shuddered. A door of space was torn open by the light of God. Zhang Ruokin stepped out of the door of space and appeared opposite Luo Yan. Despite his pale face, he was sturdy, smiling, and said, Luo Yan, I'm here. Even if it is only the outer hall of the Fuel Shrine, there are also dense chain locks. Except for the power of God, no one can tear through the space and reach directly. Just like that, when the space fluctuated, the guests gathered in the outer hall immediately sensed it and quickly gathered around. The cracks in the space had disappeared, and there was only one young and handsome man standing opposite Luo Yan. Although he looked like he was hurt, he was still experiencing a disturbing breath. Zhang Ruokin, actually Zhang Ruokin, didn't he say? Zhang Ruokin came back alive, said a monk, his voice trembling. Perhaps, Zhang Ruokin and Yan Wushan just scored the victory and defeat. Yes, it must be so. If Yan Wushan falls, it will definitely shake the entire Yan Luo tribe. No, it will shake the whole world, and the news will spread to all circles in heaven. Yan Wushan has just returned from the Dark Star, causing a vision of the universe. His life has increased in anticipation, and the atmosphere has increased. How could it fall? I don't know how many voices sounded in the temples. However, the place where Pruchna and Yan Wushan got engaged was also here. Why did I only see Zhang Ruokin but did not see Yan Wushan return? Those monks who did not believe that Yan Wushan would die in Zhang Ruokin's hands, his voice was getting quieter, and looked at Zhang Ruokin's eyes, but there was something inexplicable. Luo Yan bit his red lips lightly and stared at Zhang Ruokin for a long time. The mist in the eyes was hazy, and her expression seemed to be crying and smiling. She said, it's good to come back, just come back. This princess thought you had run away, oh. It says just come back, not just come. It means that she cares more about whether Zhang Ruokin can come back alive, rather than whether Zhang Ruokin can come. Luo Shengtian standing on the side, did not feel the breath of Yan Wushan, and immediately understood the results of the battle. I wanted to scold Zhang Ruokin for a few words, but for some reason, the anger in my heart was occupied by emotions such as curiosity, surprise, doubt, and so on. The Grand Saint who returned in advance, and the High Priest of the Black Robe of Fulu, the four sea kings of the Kingdom of Tian Luo, three stood at the corner of the feast and looked at the direction of the gate. Ching Sheng Dash and Ruma Chunfen, with a smile on his face, said, The High Priest, Sihai Jun, I will say that Zhang Ruokin will come, do you believe it now? I am a family member and will never lose faith. The High Priest of the Fuel Black Robe frowned slightly and said, Unfortunately, tonight's engagement banquet, hey, maybe fate has already been destined, no wonder he. Ching Sheng De Sheng and Si Hai Jun certainly understand why the High Priest of the Black Robe of Fuel aside. The two engagement banquets, the one between Prujna and Yan Wushan, were still grand, and many guests came. Unfortunately, the engagement party died, and the engagement banquet could not be continued. It was a happy event, but it became a funeral. Ching Sheng Dashan and Si Hai Jun smiled at each other. Anyway, Yan Wushan fell, and it would not hurt the interests of both of them. Zhang Ruokin came back alive. On festive days, you should laugh more. Not only them, but the entire hall of the Fulu Temple is filled with joy and sorrow. The Yan Luo tribe and the three tribal monks who came to the engagement banquet gathered in Buwen. The atmosphere was low. Everyone looked toward Prujna, all with complex looks, shaking their heads gently. They all felt that Prujna was too miserable. Although they failed to become the goddess of destiny, they were able to marry a Yunhui level Tian Jiao, which is a good belonging. Fate had teased her, and that happened on the day of the engagement. Zhang Ruokin bullies too much. Since he ruined Prujna's engagement banquet, 
we will also destroy his engagement banquet. The heavenly pride of our Yan Luo tribe must never die in vain. A group of monks filled with indignation and rushed towards Nan Wan. Oh! Prujna's figure appeared in front of them, with a glorious fate blooming on her body, and she drank softly, What are you doing? Do you want to work in Fakuro Shrine? A great saint of the Destiny Temple came out of the crowd, angrily said, Sister Prujna, Zhang Ruokan's move tonight will put you in the most embarrassing situation, it is intolerable. Yet, we have to be upset. The noise grew louder and louder into the ears of Ching Sheng Dashan, Sihai Jun, and the High Priest of Fu Luo. Ching Sheng Dashan and Si Hai Jun's faces were all cold. The gods are not there, they are the biggest. Someone wants to have trouble in front of them. Is it true that there is no one in the blood sacrifice family in the kingdom of Tian Luo? Seeing that the situation was not good, the high priest of the Fuel Black Robe quickly said, Since it is in the Fuel Shrine, I will take care of this matter. There is a high priest. Ching Sheng De Sheng snorted. Sihai Jundeo said, It is naturally best for the high priest to come forward. After the high priest of Fuel Black Robe came to Buwen, he quickly suppressed the monks of the Yan Luo and Upper Three Clans, and the noise gradually ceased. Zhang Ruokan and Luo Yan joined hands side by side, entered the center of the outer hall of Nan Wan, came to the bottom of an ancient Yuanhui tree, and bathed in white light rain. From time to time, monks came forward to congratulate. Wang Kai Blood Sea Willow Magpie, in the order of the Golden of Prison, brought three holy medicines, a quasi emperor and a blood dragon, ten holy dragon skins, congratulations to the sons of Ruokan and Princess Luo Luo Tian Cheng, love forever. Blood weeping stood aside, and whispered Zhang Ruokan, Wan Qi Blood Sea is one of the seven blood seas of the Blood Heaven tribe. Jail Jintian God is the master of Wan Qi Blood Sea, and it has been a million year old. It is the God of Prison God. A blood clan tribe, comparable to the top 100 heavenly realms, is full of gods. In the entire universe, Jailjin Tian Shen is a giant level existence, and can sit on an equal footing with the blood zest god. Such big men sent gods to give gifts, which shows that the marriage between Zhang Ruokan and Princess Luo Yan is very important. Lu Kun and Zhang Ruokan have met, and one of the monks participating in the battle of the bloody tribe. Based on his practice of entering the Biun realm, he can become the of the prison gold god. From this, we can see how immense the influence of the undead blood tribe's tenth group on these warriors has almost changed their lives. Lu Kun worshipped Zhang Ruokan so much that he stood in front of Zhang Ruokan and respected him. He could not show his demeanor at all, instead he looked like a soldier looking at his leader. The Emperor Ken King Su, Hai Kang, and Tiger were ordered by the god of Su Sun to send a box of divine stones and ten strains of Yuanhui holy medicine. Congratulations to Princess Ruokan and Princess Luo Yi for their good fortune and fate for three lives. It is also a monk participating in the battle of hunting the sky. The Last Sea of Blood Blood Weeping is a great sacred figure in the Beigzu realm. He knows well-known figures of the major forces in Hell standing beside Zhang Ruokan, introducing and explaining to him one by one. He who once looked at Zhang Ruokan was very unpleasant, but now he admires Zhang Ruokan so much. Fang Mo Feng, Mo Yan, Yan Hanya from the Meteorological Temple, came to worship at the Order of the Lord of the Temple. The Meteor Shrine ranks low among the major shrines of the Shura tribe, only 18th. However, it is still considered a hegemon. In the world of hell, whether it is a deity or a monk in the holy realm, the main friends are the monks of the same race. Just like in the Kunlun realm, there are people, dragons, cats, but most of the most closely related monks are still in their own clan. The owner of the Meteor Temple, one of the 24 temples of the Shura tribe, personally dispatched his disciples to the engagement banquet of Zhang Ruokan and Princess Luo Yi which is undoubtedly a signal of friendship and closeness, which is of great significance. In this engagement banquet, almost all the forces of the undead and the Raksha tribe sent representatives to occupy more than 70% of all monks. 
In addition, the ghost, stone, corpse, bone, and shura all have some forces, big and small, come to congratulate. The meteor temple is the most typical representative, ranking among the top forces of the Shura tribe. The ancient gods of the Yan Luo tribe also sent envoys to send gifts. Only the underworld and the dead, no monk arrived. Even when they arrived, they gathered in Buin to attend the engagement banquet of Yan Wushan and Prujna. Blood monks and blood condensed sorrows, and other monks in the blood sacrifice family, received the generous gifts from all parties and sighed in their hearts. It is just an engagement banquet, and all the major forces sent so many gifts. Would nt it be even more terrible until the day of formal marriage? Is this divine marriage? This is the influence of the marriage of the two major forces. There are many close friends of Luo Yan's girlfriends, including the princess of the kingdom of God, the daughter of the gods, and the pride of the top forces in the world. All of them are amazing but they are comparable to ordinary beauty. After separating from them, Luo Yan quietly came to Zhang Ruokan, whispered, and said, It's just an engagement banquet. You take a break first. I'll deal with them. Zhang Ruokan shook his head gently and said, As long as I don't fight with people, my injury will not worsen. Luo Yan wanted to persuade again, but saw more than a dozen graceful figures came over, with bursts of incense, Accompanied by pleasant laughter, it was the close friends who had been with her since childhood. Feng Qingli, a disciple of Mother Tianyin, has reached the peak of the 66th stage of her mental strength. Although she is a rakshasa girl, she does not have a charming appearance, and she is beautiful and dignified. She looked at Zhang Ruokan for a moment with her eyes of inspection, and said, Yan Wushan is dead. Okay. Zhang Ruokan is also looking at Feng Qingli. This girl is also very tall like other Rakshasa girls. Even if she wears multiple layers of holy clothes, she can still see the amazing curvy outline. Although Zhang Ruokan just glanced at it casually, Feng Qing made her look unhappy and said, You haven't come to for a long time, but there are already many rumors about you. After a pause, he said, There are many bad rumors. After the engagement, treat my teacher and sister well. If you dare to lose her, you will die very hard. It seems that he intentionally deterred Zhang Ruokan. When he said this, his mental power broke out invisibly. In front of Zhang Ruokan's eyes, he immediately looked at all kinds of horror pictures. There were pictures of his body being cut apart. There were pictures of women's souls flying loose, such as the Emperor Yu and XIXI. These pictures, like the real thing, invaded Zhang Ruokan's heart. I have to say that Feng King Gli's mental strength is terrible, far better than Wu Jiang and Kitty. A woman in a red grin smiled and waved the sleeves of the sarong, dispersing Feng King Gli's spirit, saying, Qing Li, if the other man has just returned from a life and death battle, he is seriously injured, but you are so severe. You do nt feel bad. My little sister is afraid of distress. Right? Yet, yeah, your mental strength is so strong. If the son of Chen is only in a state of danger after all, even if he is not injured, it is probably unstoppable. Not to mention, there is still an injury now. In case of ugliness, I lost it to my sister. Face. A sweet, soft voice groaned and laughed. Luo Yan gave a secret glance to Zhang Ruokan, and was relieved to see that he was not angry. This group of close friends, who are true friends and which are fake friends, she is very clear, many of them sluts. Luo Yan smiled indignantly, Zhang Ruokan is on the battlefield of Kishan, but he has killed a sacred heavenly slave. You better not mess with him and be careful to be cleaned up by him, but I won't help persuaded. As the representative of the woman with a soft and soft voice, there are several close friends in the boudoirs, all showing a smirk. The emperor yet is indeed the sacred sage of ten thousand deaths. However, not only the spiritual power is sealed, but his hands are locked by the chain of God, and he is seriously injured. When killed by Zhang Ruokan, the combat power is not as good as the peak of Qianwen Jing. Great Saint 
The soft-sounding woman is Princess Chi of the Yueguo Kingdom, one of the seven great kingdoms of the Raksha tribe. She has reached the pinnacle of Qianwen realm and does not have much offer Zhang Ruokan, a so-called Yuanhui-level genius. Even if Emperor Emperor is at its peak, she is sure to kill it. The close friends of Luo Yan's boudoirs are all well identified and amazing in beauty, and many of them are highly qualified, but unfortunately Zhang Ruokan doesn't like them. After Luo Yan introduced him one by one, Zhang Ruokan found a reason and left decisively. Princess Qi was wearing luxurious sacred clothes, refined from the petals of hundreds of sacred flowers, gorgeous and peerless, as if a flower fairy, and walked to Luo Ling's side, holding her wrist said softly, Sister, Sister thinks that this Yunhui-level genius doesn't seem to be good. Marrying him will hurt you. Next to him, a noble asterisk Yang said weirdly, I did not expect that the talent of my sister-in-law could not escape the fate of marriage. After being attacked by Qing Li's spiritual power, I didn't dare to say a word, it must be because of human blood in his body that makes him so weak. After all, Zhang Ruokan's cultivation is still low, and he is at odds with the sage of the 66th peak of spiritual power. It is only him who loses. It is me, and I will choose to hide. He <laughs> he. It is said that Zhang Ruokan's ranking on the God's Book volume is very low, and it is very likely that he will not become a god. My sister-in-law is really pitiful. Luo Yan smiled again and again, has been controlling his emotions do not want to spoil the festive atmosphere of the engagement banquet. However, the more they talked over the fire, the anger in their hearts could no longer be controlled. At this moment, a sound of surprise was heard at the banquet. It's true, isn't it? Is there a big world in it? How can there be fake www.mtlnovel.com at that time, many big figures entered the void to watch the war, and the news has spread. It's only a hundred realms, and the combat power is so strong that it is capable of overwhelming death. It's unheard of. It's terrible. I am afraid that only the two of them have such ability. It is said that the strongest fighting force they broke out was not as simple as a lifetime. The monks talked and stared at Zhang Ruokan as they talked. The awe in their eyes was stronger. Princess Qi, Feng Qingli, and other close friends, after inquiries, knew that they were discussing the specific situation of Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan's decisive battle. After understanding, they were all shocked. Looking at Zhang Ruokan again, I dare not to look down. This Yunhui-level genius is even more powerful than they thought. Romance Reading URL Zhang Ruokan ignored the discussion and eyes of the crowd, sitting on a chair, closing his eyes to recuperate thinking about the previous battle with Yan Wushan and realizing what he felt. At that time, although he was enchanted, unexpectedly, reason did not completely disappear. It was the heart of truth that helped him keep the last trace of clarity. After the end of the war, the god of blood Zeta planned to take him to the Fulo Shrine and ask the deity to help him suppress the demon in the way of destiny. He also recovered by virtue of the heart of truth. However, after Wu Jianzhi's assassination of the wind, the battle between him and Yan Wushan was at the same time. It will inevitably cause people to suspect the connection between the two things. Therefore, Zhang Ruokan only counted, pretending not to know what happened, and all everything is pushed to the heart. In the battle with Yan Wushan, Zhang Ruokan was as vivid and unrestrained as ever, as if he was traveling around the sky in nine days to enjoy the life he has learned. He has a lot of insights and needs to be digested carefully. You can't hide it from others, you can't hide it from your grandfather. Zhang Ruokan thought back carefully to the eyes of the god of blood, and his heart trembled. Just feeling, those eyes seem to have the power to see all the mysteries between heaven and earth. Russell. A faint aroma is blowing. Footsteps were subtle. Zhang Ruokan did not look back and did not release his mental strength but in his mind, a beautiful figure appeared automatically. A red suit with a fluttering belt, a face hidden in the illusion, a figure hidden between the rules of heaven and earth, like a gust of wind, like a ball of air. Like a red suit walking around without a body. Her figure, 
however, really exists. Does Ruokan have heard of God's book volume? Gu Guqing's voice came from behind him. The voice is like a girl, cheerful and pleasant, it is like a child's voice, sober and innocent, aftertaste is fine, and it is like going through the baptism of thousands of people, and the voice is full of life experience. It was just a simple question, but it gave Zhang Ruokan many wonderful feelings. Among Luoyan's close friends, in Zhang Ruokan's view, she is the most powerful one, and she still can't see her level. However, she was able to dispel Feng King Gli's mental attack with a single sleeve, at least proving that her strength was above Feng King Gli. Zhang Ruokan said, Of course I have heard that one of the six books of the Temple of Destiny. Legend has it that the name of any monk with a probability of becoming a will automatically appear on it. The God Book includes A, B, C, Ding, etc. The first is the best, and more than 70% of the monks who can enter these gods can become gods. Ruo Chen is ranked 87th in Ding and so on God's probability is less than 20%. Gu Shijingzi said that he had come within a foot of Zhang Ruokan. The fragrance is stronger. Zhang Ruokan didn't have much interest in God's book volume and didn't think that God's book volume was really so strange. How vast is the universe? However, when I heard that I was ranked so low on the God Reserve, I was still a little surprised. Gu Shijingian laughed and said, The Yunhui level genius in the world of Megatron, but only in Ding, is really incredible. Laughter doesn't mean mocking. As if curious and interested. Zhang Ruokan said, Yeah, incredible. Actually, the ranking of God Reserve is not static. If it can make up for its own shortcomings, and apply the right medicine, if there is more damage than adequate repair, the probability of becoming a will gradually increase. Zhang Ruokan understands that this is what she wants to say. He said, from the perspective of the fairy shooter, what flaws do I have to make up for? Don't call me a fairy, but you can call me a witch. Gu Shi said quietly. Zhang Ruokan finally looked up and took a look at her. I saw that the sky was full of red clouds, an array of magic entangled in the red yarn, and she could not see her face, but could only feel the bitter cold and the despair of death. Compared with the ghost, the dead, the bone, and the dead grand saint, the death on their bodies is stronger. Earlier, Luo Yan introduced Gu Shijing, saying that she came from the Luozhu Yunchen realm, which is said to be the first fierce land of the Raksha clan. After the death of Mozu Luo, his body fell down and condensed into a world. Gu Shijing said, Heart Demon. I heard that you went to battle with Yan Wushan in life and death because you were invaded by the Heart Demon and lost your mind. The demon has become your biggest obstacle to becoming a god. Zhang Ruokan was very calm, and said, Can anti shoot girls help me get rid of my demon? If you go with me to Luaza Yunchen, it is not difficult to get rid of the demon. Gu Shijing said. Zhang Ruokan pondered for a moment and said, what kind of price do I need to pay? I heard that Ruo Chen has a lot of stone magic stone carvings in his hands, and I want to borrow some insights for a while. Gu Shijing said. It turned out to be stone stone. Zhang Ruokan did not admit that he had the enchanted stone carvings on his body, nor did he deny it, saying, what an incredible place in Luo Ziwiyun Mountain must have included countless magical works. In my opinion, the girl's practice skills are no longer there. Under the stone magic. Gu Shijing heard Zhang Ruokan's euphemism for refusal, saying, My practice method, called Death Map, is indeed not weaker than Devil's Stone Carvings. However, my ranking on the Book of God's Storage, but it's been a long time before the Gore Fiend. Golam. Zhang Ruokan thoughtfully, and said, He ranks very high on the Book of God's Book. A wait for a second. Gu Shi quietly said. Zhang Ruokan knew for a moment. The blood demon has practiced for more than a thousand years, but it can take such a high ranking in the god reserve as the cultivation of Bai Realm, and everyone will naturally attribute all of this to the devil's stone carving. I think it is the reason why he practiced nine stone carvings at the same time. 
Zhang Ruokan sighed and said, Since the girl knows my rank in the God's Book, it is obvious that I have checked. Since I checked, I should know that although I was a monk in the Kunlun world, I am already things of the last life. I of the last life have fallen to the Kunlun realm. Even if there is the stone magic stone carving, it is lost. If you don't have to rush to refuse, you can think about it a bit more. Luo Ziwiun Mountain Reality really has a way to help you clear the demon. Gu Shijing floated and then retreated. Suddenly, he left a sentence, remind Ruokan son, the first in the Book of God's Reserve is the original Kunmo, the relationship with Yan Zexian is invincible. The fragrance is gone, and people have gone. Zhang Ruokan is very clear that the heavy demon is indeed a hindrance to his becoming a god. However, since the heart of truth can help him block the demon, at present, there is no need to worry too much. Moreover, the god of blood extreme said that the destiny can suppress the demon. Next, Zhang Ruokan is planning to spend more energy to understand the way of destiny. It is not only used to deal with the demon, but also ready to accept the mystery of fate. The way of fate is not strong enough to bear the mystery of fate. This is likely to be the reason for the deity of Fulu, who has been slow to give him the mystery of thirty thousandths of fate. As for what Gu Shijing said when she left, Zhang Ruokan didn't even take it to heart. Because for the next period of time, Zhang Ruokan intends to retreat. The first is healing. The second is the perfect mirror that impacts the sacred will of Yin Yang and the five elements. The third is to break through the Biun realm. Once the great consummation is achieved, the power of the demigod is completely released. At that time, Zhang Ruokan may not be invincible under the divine realm, but he does not need to fear anyone. You and Qin Mo. I can be the first in the God Reserve volume, I hope it is not a person who cares about it. Zhang Ruokan did not want to, and somehow had a strong enemy. If Yan Wushan heard Zhang Ruokan's words, the coffin board must be unable to hold back, it's still worthwhile? It's just the divine marriage, and you will fight me to death. Now, you let Yan Jaxian conceive a child, others are so strange, can't they kill you to just hate? Luo Yan came over, smiling, and asked curiously, what did Xiao Jing say to you? She wants to borrow the stone devils. Zhang Ruokan said nothing. Luo Ye certainly understood how Zhang Ruokan valued the inheritance of the Kunlun realm, how could it be passed to the hands of monks in the realm? So she said, I'll talk to her. No need, I have rejected her. Zhang Ruokan said. Luo Yan said, you don't understand her. What she wants to get will certainly be seized at all costs. Fortunately, I can talk to her fairly and maybe I can dispel her thoughts. Zhang Ruokan did not stop again. Luo Yan's identity is indeed not trivial. His father is the great emperor of the Raksha clan, and the master is the deity. Even if Gu Shijing comes from Luozhu Yunchen realm, he must be afraid of it. As for Luo Ye and Gu Shijing, why they can become close friends and the girlfriends, and whether the relationship is really close, Zhang Ruokan did not ask. Boom. Nan Wan sounded a deafening noise. I don't know how many monks followed the howling, and something extraordinary happened. What happened, Yan Wushan has fallen, and they are still so excited. Isn't the engagement banquet cancelled? Did they want to make trouble? The guests who came to the engagement banquet of Zhang Ruokan and Luo Yan were curious, and immediately dispatched staff to check the news. After a while, the monk went to inquire about the news and returned. What the happened? Asked the blood weeping Dashan. The monk probing the news said, It is said that the of the destiny mountain came to prepare to take Prujna to the temple. Go to the temple now. Yes. Just pick her up. Yes. The monks in North Wan all showed horror. Feng Ji was stabbed to death, and the of the god mountain immediately came to welcome Prujna. What does this mean? Would Prujna be blessed by evil and become a new goddess? This is no longer a possibility, but a matter of course. Prujna became a goddess and had too much influence, 
so that the representatives of the major forces of the next three clans all fell into thought. Later, they portrayed a messenger light, like a meteor shower, spreading the news to all parties. There was cooing and jubilation, from South Wan to North Wan. Prujna Ting Ting is like a jade, straight and dignified, wearing a festive red coat, and entered Buwen. Behind her, there were a large number of monks of the underworld and the dead. The god of destiny mountain, bathed in the starlight, stood and waited. Everyone looked at Prujna and whispered. What is she doing in North Wan? Respect the new goddess and be careful to be accounted for after the fall. If you look at the pride of the dead and the underworld, it seems that if you come here, you just want to show off. Zhang Ruokin and Luo Yan walked side by side and greeted them. Prujna stared at the two of them, watching them from far to near, with a cold face, without any mood swings, like a face carved by iron stones. Luo Ting was tall and charming with a smile, and asked, Congratulations, His Royal Highness was blessed by disaster. It seems that he wants to take over as the goddess. I wonder why His Highness is here. Prujna looked at Luo Yan for a long time, and said, Princess Luo Yan's beautiful appearance and temperament are indeed the object that all men in the world like. Being able to marry you is a blessing to Zhang Ruokin. Luo Ling's red lips were crystal clear, and his mouth slightly tilted upwards. He said, Brother Chen is a peerless arrogant who can only get one from the Yuanhui. It is my blessing to marry him. Zhang Ruokin's heart tightened, and Luo Min was a bit abnormal. Why did the sudden call become so intimate and called Dust Brother? Did she guess what? The expressions of Zhang Ruokin and Prujna remained the same, but they were quite tense, not so natural. His Highness Prujna had a chance to marry a Yunhui level Tian Jiao, unfortunately, unfortunately. Luo Yan said. Prujna walked to the side of a holy jade table, lifted the wine on the table, filled it with three glasses, took one of them, and said, I'm here just to admire two new couples. Especially to respect Zhang Ruokin. If you are afraid that there is no goddess. What is good, I wish the two centuries together. After her speaking, Prujna drank. Behind her, the monks of the Ming and dead races all laughed. Good wishes, a hundred years together, a hundred years together. Ha <laughs> ha. Everyone can see that if there is something in Prujna's words, he is clearly declaring war on Zhang Ruokin. The so-called hundred years of good harmony is okay for mortals, but for monks in the realm of the Great Holy, a century is just a snap. Prujna left with the envoy www.mtlnovel.com The monks who attended her and Yan Wushan's engagement banquet did not disperse, but became more festive, drinking and having fun, laughing and laughing. It didn't take long for the existence of the gods such as Blood Extinction God, Blood Queen, Emperor Luo Yan, Tianyan, etc., to descend to the outer temple of the Fulu Temple. Under the testimony of Lord Fulu, Zhang Ruokin and Luo Yan completed the engagement ceremony. The time of formal marriage needs to be discussed separately. Formal marriage, unlike engagement, is never impossible, and there are many things that need to be prepared. After the engagement banquet. In the world of God realm, the blood demon god called Zhang Ruokin alone and asked, Did you fight with Yan Wushan and realize the true meaning of the yin and yang five elements? Just this one sentence is to expose Zhang Ruokin. What demon encroached on reason, and did not remember the fighting process at all, apparently could not lie to the blood of god of blood. There is no monk in front of a deity like the blood god of war and he can calmly relax, let alone reveal it on the spot, a secret that he does not want to disclose. Zhang Ruokin remained calm and answered, slightly realized. Continued deception will only cause the contempt and disgust of the god of blood, and it is better to take the initiative to admit it and face it all calmly. The god of blood Zhang Zhang is not a mediocrity. It is meaningless to be careful in front of him. Zhang Ruokin added that the six reincarnations and the five elements of yin and yang are avenues that can be united circularly and represent the root of the truth of heaven and earth. But it is difficult to make them complete. I have now merged the six sacred meanings, seemingly only the last step. 
However, standing at my current position and seeing the way forward, I found that the last step is far from the sky. It's difficult, yin and yang are in one, almost impossible. Zhang Ruokan, who was standing on the ground, wanted to ascend to the sky, and saw the majestic and tall mountains in the distance connected with the sky. I thought that when I climbed the mountain, I could touch the sky. I feel that this is not impossible. Now Zhang Ruokan has gone through all kinds of obstacles and climbed to the peak. It seemed to everyone standing on the ground that he was only one step away from the ascent to the sky, and he could ascend with just one step. But only Zhang Ruokan, who was standing at the top of the mountain, knew that he was infinitely far away from the sky, and many times farther than the road ahead. Moreover, there is at least a way to climb, and now there is no way. The battle with Yan Wushan was to let Zhang Ruokan see his distance from the sky. The clearer you look, the more desperate you are. If it weren't for Zhang Ruokan III, Daoxin has experienced the fiercest fire, the coldest water in every possible way, and is indomitable. I'm afraid he has collapsed and gave up to go to heaven. The god of blood zest asks, are you going to give up or keep going? Continue, at all costs, consolidate a holy product. Zhang Ruokan said without hesitation. The god of blood, wearing a sacred armor and a burly body, sat in the center of the world of Godland, and remained silent for a long time. Meaning, it has reached the limit of the second great sage, and even a touch of the first great sage is a height I have never been able to reach. At this point, the blood of war paused, and then said, You should be very clear now, how far away is you from a holy product? Very clear, Zhang Ruokan said. The god of blood zest looked at the sky and said, I also thought of taking a path of holy will, but finally gave up because of various reasons. After becoming a god, I deepened my understanding of holy will, mystery, and the rules of heaven and earth. Your own understanding. Do you want to listen? Please war god. Zhang Ruokan clenched his fists and bowed to salute. In the world, there are still few monks who can point Zhang Ruokan to a holy product and find a way for him. The god of blood is one of the few. I don't know how to consolidate a holy spirit. But, surely, with your current ability, it is absolutely impossible to consolidate it. Cohesion of sacred meaning requires external conditions as well as strengthening its own conditions. External conditions, you have Quasi Emperor Sacred Pill, Zijin Gourd, which are rare and extremely precious. Even, I can send you to the Immortal Temple, and use the power of the Immortal Temple to help you. So, the external conditions it's not the point of consideration. Zhang Ruokan said, what else do I need to strengthen? The god of blood Zhang Zhang stretched out his right index finger and said, First, Xiu was first ascended to a great consummation, and all the shackles in his body were broken. Then, he extended his and said, Second, mental power. Your mental power must be raised to a more powerful level. My mental strength has reached level 65. Zhang Ruokan said. The blood god of battle shook his head and said, For the other great saints, the 65th stage is already very remarkable, but if you want to blend a product of the saint, the spiritual power is far from enough. If you can become spiritual god, above 70th order will be of great help in the integration of the will. Zhang Ruokan's pupils shrank. In Bai Dijing, Zhang Ruokan couldn't even think of practicing spiritual power to the 70th level to reach the point of becoming a god. 70 ranks of spiritual power but can fight against the true god. Without waiting for him to speak, the god of blood fighting said, considering that you are too young and you have too little experience, it is almost impossible to train your spiritual strength to the 70th level within a thousand years. So, what I have for you the requirement is that you first cultivate your spiritual strength to the 67th or 68th level. Zhang Ruokan said, I have a sundial to help. Even if it takes 1,000 or 2,000 years, I must cultivate my spiritual strength to the 70th level, and make the best preparation for the integration of the divine will. Zhang Ruokan thought that he would be supported by the god of blood, but this time, 
the God of Blood was staring at him without a word. God of War feels that there is nothing wrong with it. Zhang Ruokan asked. The Blood God's Shinto if only time treasures and time arrays can be used to create top powers without limit, the number of gods in the world will be several times greater than it is now. It has already destroyed all the heavens. The sundial is a great treasure of time. If it is not damaged, it does have that ability. Because it can cover a very wide area of heaven and earth, while a monk is practicing, he can practice, fight, comprehend, experience the world, and live all kinds of life. Zhang Ruokan thoughtfully said, The god of war means that the sundial is already incomplete and can only satisfy me to cultivate in it, but not to fight and experience in it. You can understand that. The Blood Smash War Shinto There are no less than ten pieces of time treasures in this level like the broken sundial. Most of them are handed over to monks in the holy realm for use to quickly elevate their cultivation. God, it's not needed. Unless the scope of time treasures can cover God's entire body and God's entire divine world. Even so, the power of God still impacts the time stamp, making it impossible to enter the time stamp. Just like your current time attainment, it can threaten any monk in the holy realm, but it is nothing but God. God is standing still, and you see ANT cut his life. The God of Blood continued to say your mental strength has been raised from the 60th to the 65th level, and it only takes a very short time. This is the help of the heart of the sacred tree, and the help of the burial of gold and white tigers. But you have almost digested the power of knowledge contained in the heart of Shen Mu? Zhang Ruokan nodded. The Blood Blitz Shinto the knowledge of one elemental meeting of Tenjin is enough. With this foundation, your spiritual training will be much easier. Zhang Ruokan said, the knowledge contained in the heart of the sacred tree is all-encompassing, astronomy and geography, the mystery of matrix formations, rundane, language and logical arithmetic. Although I have merged these knowledge, they are still in my mind. If you deliberately meditate, you can find the knowledge you want. The God of Blood Zest asks, you only have the sacred will of the fire, haven't you merged yet? Yes. Then I ask you a question, what is the way of fire? Zhang Ruokan froze. The blood fighting Shinto doesn't there be anything related to the word of fire in the knowledge contained in Tenjin? Have. Of course, there are many. It is precisely because there are too many and too complicated, but how should Zhang Ruokan answer? If all the knowledge about the way of fire is sorted out and written on paper, I am afraid that it can hold dozens of cars. Zhang Ruokan thinks carefully, the more things appear in his mind, the more dense, the more countless, the more endless, the head is getting more and more painful, as if there are thousands of needles piercing the scalp. What? With a scream, Zhang Ruokan fell to the ground. The blood god of war looked at it quietly and did not help him, saying although you have integrated the knowledge of sky god, but this knowledge does not belong to you at all. You still need countless years of grinding and digestion to fully transform it. For what belongs to you? By then, you should be able to become a spiritually, reaching the 70th level. And this process is not something you can do with a sundial retreat. In a sundial, even if you practice for a thousand years or ten thousand years, the final result is the same as it is now. To fully transform that knowledge into your own things. You need to travel thousands of miles, go through thousands of miles, and truly understand knowledge from the details of your experience. Zhang Ruokan forced himself to stop thinking. Gradually, his head no longer felt so painful, and he got wet from the ground. The blood god of war continued, walk, it's training. Eating, it's training. Marrying it's training. Killing, it's training. It's saving, it's training. Everything you're going through is grinding, you're feeling. Zhang Ruokan said, thank you for your guidance. The blood fighting Shinto you know, with your current practice, you can be even stronger. Strength, how strong can it be? Zhang Ruokan asked. The blood fighting Shinto strong, come again you can defeat Yan Wushan, you don't need to be injured. 
Do you know why you are so weak? If you let the great saints in the world hear this sentence, even if you want to cry. Zhang Ruokan is still weak? Zhang Ruokan shook his head. Blood Shinto Shinto whether it's mental strength or cultivation, you've been promoted too quickly and lack the necessary precipitation. In your body, there are both the five elements of chaos Holy Spirit and Blood Essence, but they are too complicated and not condensed. The consequence is that the speed of the Holy Art is not fast enough, and the power of the Supreme Holy Spirit to erupt is not strong enough. The response to the crisis will also be slow. Zhang Ruokan feels deeply, because when fighting with top masters, it is always difficult to provoke ten times attack. Moreover, it is difficult to perform thousand question high level holy art in the shortest time. The God of Blood Zero continued, You have five elements of chaotic immortal sacred body, and a demigod body. It should have been invincible and swept everything. However, when you fight with K, Yan Wushan, Greedy Baby, etc., you are repeatedly injured. The immortal sacred body is like paper. The demigod is like tofu. Of course, Zhang Ruokan didn't admit it. After all, people such as Lak, Yan Wushan, and Greedy Babies were extraordinary, and they were hurt in their hands, not shame. Besides, they were more seriously injured. The god of blood battle seemed to see what he was thinking, saying, you are a person who wants to integrate a kind of divine will, and you should look far away. Don't compare with them. Think of them as ants. I don't know, how would people like Kei and Yinjua feel when they heard this? Breakthrough Shinto Your physical body is strong, but you do nt understand how to use physical power and protect your own physical body. What you are encountering now is only the great saints of this level who are lacking, Yan Wushan, and can be barbaric use the flesh to carry their attacks hard, and to carry them. If you encounter the sacred life of the dead, the sacred life of the supreme, they can break your body apart in one blow. There are five elements of chaotic immortal sacred body and demigod, but they see a nt carry it. Do nt you think their attacks are ridiculous? Zhang Ruokan said, so, to integrate the third point of a saint's purpose, is to condense the energy in the body and master the body physically. The god of blood Ju nodded with satisfaction, and had to admit that Zhang Ruokan had a high level of understanding. Reach out for the fourth finger, the blood of Shinto Shinto fourth point, holy soul. There are many gods and goddesses in heaven and hell. As soon as they are born, the soul is divine and the soul is quite powerful. Unfortunately, when your mother-in-law gave birth to you, you have not become a god, otherwise your holy spirit is far better than it is now. Strong. The fastest way to improve the holy spirit is to refine the star spirit of the god. It happens that there is a little stored in the seven star emperor's palace, you can find and use it yourself. So much has been said, and there is only one sentence. If you want to integrate a good sense of sanctity, you must be in the Begzu realm, and you must improve to the strongest in all aspects. Spiritual power is the focus. I see. Zhang Ruokan worshipped again. The blood god of war finally asked, why pretend to be invaded by the demon? Zhang Ruokan had already thought clearly how to answer, saying, actually, I was really invaded by my demon, but, there is a treasure in my body that helps me to keep the last trace of clarity. That treasure, which cannot be leaked anyway, at that time there are other gods beside me, so I can't tell the truth. Zhang Ruokan intends to tell the secret of heart of truth and tells the god of blood, because he can no longer hide it. If the blood god of war also not at this treasure, Zhang Ruokan would give it directly to him, and he could save his life. Of course, Zhang Ruokan believes more in the spirit of the god of blood. As the last Yuanhui Association, the best heroes have come to the fore, and there are countless treasures. How can they steal their grandson because of treasures? If the blood god of war did not show an intentional look, Zhang Ruokan could believe him more in the future www.mtlnovel.com can truly regard him as the patron of the world. What happened unexpectedly to Zhang Ruokan? The blood-fighting Shinto since it's leaked anyway, 
then you do nt need to say anything, hide your own secrets. Next, let s talk about the second thing. God Fulo has given you a marriage with Luo yet, you understand the meaning. Understand. It is for me to stand firm in the world. Zhang Ruokan said. The blood blitz Shinto in fact, there is a second level of meaning. It is to keep you in forever, the deeper you and are involved, the harder you want to leave in the future, the more you are a person of love only love can be your bond. I. Zhang Ruokan's face changed, his eyes dignified. Blood peerless Shinto you use denial, even if you really want to leave in the future, you are still the grandson of my peer and the child of the peer family. However, there are many things that I see a nt help you. I am now, the side standing in the world is thinking about the problem, and of course I hope that you will stay and do something. You must be mentally prepared. Wow! The blood smashed war with a long sleeve waved, a brass little tripod flew out, hanging in front of Zhang Ruokan. Six party days respect. Shinto, this tripod originally belonged to Shigzun Jun, the master of the Rotten Sea, and was defeated by Yu Sanja. During the retreat of Yu Sanja, he was stolen by the Blue Marrow. The Blue Pith Jun wants to use the Six Party Heaven to revere him, to cross the bottleneck of the Supreme Sovereign, and is afraid that after the retreat of Yu Sanja, the investigation will be pursued. So he hid inside the Dark Star No. 3. Unfortunately, he didn't expect that the Dark Star No. 3 gave birth to the Dark Spirit, and underestimated the danger of a Dark Star, and eventually died in it. Zhang Ruokan was shocked. He has been doubting that the Blue Pulp True King is just the sage of the peak of a lifetime of death. How could it be possible to have such treasures as the Six-Party Heavenly King? A great saint, how dare to steal a treasure of the gods? This Blue Pith is really bold, Zhang Ruokan said. God of blood, the blue pith Jun has a long life, and with his own strength, he can never break through to the top. In order to break through, to survive, naturally dare to take risks. Zhang Ruokan knew more about the gods, so he asked tentatively, I heard that the gods are omnipotent and omniscient. Is it true that the blue pith monarch stole the six party heavens, and the stone axe prince is not even aware of it? Isn't the Stone Axe Prince left a divine clone to guard this tripod? Or, carry this tripod on his body? The God of Blood dare to call the name of Shi Axe Jun directly, that is the identity and strength, but Zhang Ruokan did not dare to be so arrogant. God of Blood, the gods are not as omnipotent as you think, and the saints are not as weak as you think. The reason why the gods know many things is because they have countless gods. If it's just a divine thought, even the immortal sage can be destroyed. Like your mental power idea, the saintly king can easily destroy it. Secondly, the deduction ability of the deities is also limited. The higher the person being calculated, the harder it is to calculate. It is not easy to calculate a great saint, even for the gods. Unless there is a special relationship between the two, such as blood relationship, master-discipline relationship, etc., it will be much easier to calculate this way. So, unless Yu Sanja releases a lot of divine thoughts and condenses a strong avatar, it is possible to suppress Lan Pohen Jun. In addition, Lai Yu Fang Tianzunding does not belong to heaven and hell, but is a vessel from the starry sky. Its instrument is powerful, but it has been sleeping, and it has not been surrendered by Yu Sanja, so there are huge variables. How can Yu Sanja dare to take it with him when he is in a deadlock? Zhang Ruokan has a lot of secrets in his body. After coming to the world, he has been careful, such as walking on thin ice. The most fundamental reason is that he does not know enough about the power of the gods, and he does not know if his secrets will be detected by the gods. After listening to the words of the God of Blood Extreme Battle, Zhang Ruokan realized that with his current practice, he didn't seem to be too afraid of the gods. Unless, the gods shot it themselves. Zhang Ruokan said, Have you ever seen Shi Axe Jun? The blood god of war snorted softly, Is the sixth heavenly emperor born, Can you not know the three solutions of ignorance? But in the world, 
no one can take things away from the blood of my blood lord. The sixth heavenly emperor is you from the third dark the inside of the star was obtained, and it was naturally impossible to return it to him. Zhang Ruokan just thought for a while, in his mind, he could outline the appearance of the bleeding battle and the stone axe war. Unfortunately, this time, in the hands of the god of blood, Axe Jun is destined to be unable to return the treasure. Suddenly, Zhang Ruokan moved in his heart and said, God of War said that the spirit of the six party heavens is powerful and has been sleeping. To be called powerful by the blood god of war is definitely not simple. The blood Zeta nodded his head and said, There are huge variables and potential crises in this tripod, you can't hold it down, so you can't give it to you yet. I plan to leave it to your mother for the time being, and keep it for you. Do you have any comments? No opinion, Zhang Ruokan said. God of Blood, Sheng Dan, the Emperor in the Tripod, is the true master of Blue Pith who has collected countless years of material and is preparing to refining it. It is a pity that his quality of Taoism is a little bit worse, almost unrefined. The system was successful. In the end, it was the Dark Primal Spirit. He was refined into the elixir and transformed into the elixir before he succeeded in making it. Wait for your cultivation to reach the pinnacle of a lifetime of death, you can ask your mother to ask for it. Swallowing this den will have a great impact on you. Lu Fang Tian Zunding was put away by the blood god of battle, and next, he talked about mother blood shadow and Bai King blood soil. It is said that the true body tree of the mother of blood shadow is to be walked from the Afulo by the learned ancient god. God of blood, Bai Kang's soil is very mysterious. It is said to be the first sacred thing of the undead blood. Many gods have never seen it. You can refine and absorb Bai Kang's soil. For the time being, it is a secret. But this secret, keep it won't be long. What if this secret was made public? Zhang Ruokan asked. The blood of God of Blood Extreme is sharp, saying, you will become a human-shaped magic drug. Everyone wants to your blood, eat your meat, and eat your bones. Of course, you don't have to worry too much. You do nt have many people who dare to touch you with your current background. In the end, the blood god of war reminded Zhang Ruokan, saying, refining and absorbing the blood of Bai Kang, it really makes your physical body stronger and has a stronger ability to heal. Even if the body is torn apart, it can recover, almost immortal. However, there is no absolute immortality in the world, and those who think they are immortal often die the fastest. There is infinite mystery in Bai Kang's soil, and you will slowly realize it in the future. Zhang Ruokan was thinking in his heart, why did the god of blood extinction say such a word, did he refine and absorb the blood of Bai Kang? After all, Zhang Ruokan didn't ask this question. The god of blood battle also mentioned Yan Jaxian and burial of the white tiger, and each explained something to Zhang Ruokan. After listening, Zhang Ruokan kept silent, but nodded gently. One last thing, forget it, you go down. The god of blood and death stopped talking and finally waved his hand to signal Zhang Ruokan to retreat. Zhang Ruokan showed a strange look, and was a little curious, what was the last thing about the god of blood? You know, the god of blood fighting has always been decisive and strong, and rarely shows such appearance. Withdraw. After Zhang Ruokan stepped back, the god of blood Jeremy shook his head and sighed, and said to himself, let's let Ching Sheng talk to him about this worldly thing. I'll talk about it personally, which is a bit out of place. Immediately afterwards, the god of blood Zhan Zhan stretched out his left palm and lay a jade in his palm. The surface of Yuling is engraved with two characters Yahuang. Yahuang world actually opened at this time, it is a bit subtle. The matter of Prujna becoming a new goddess was officially settled, and the news spread quickly. The specific details of the battle between Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan were spread by enthusiasm and encouragement. Some people claim that Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan possessed the precious treasures, and they could use the cultivation of Hang realm as the ultimate saint. 
There are also rumors that Zhang Ruogan was able to defeat Yan Wushan because he inherited the relics of Kunlun realm and held a lot of upright power. Various rumors, exaggerated sentences. The intention is to evoke those bold and outrageous murderers and set off against Zhang Ruokan to achieve the purpose of killing by sword. Zhang Ruokan didn't bother to listen to outside rumors, and didn't mean to come forward to explain. He went straight back to Hanhai Manor, preparing to retreat, and healed his injuries. The Emperor Yu wore a green feather robe, with purple and golden phoenixes interspersed between the green silk on her head, with a graceful temperament without the heinous and evil feeling that the monks in the world should have. The monks of the Blood Heaven tribe who attended the hunting feast, because they are still going to practice in the Temple of Destiny, are now staying in the Bingcheng district. Seeing her walking along the street, she looked with reverence. In the battle with Yan Huangtu, although the Emperor Yu was defeated and almost fell, he also played the style of the Blood tribe and the Undead Blood tribe, and won the respect of countless monks. The Emperor Yu once walked between life and death, and her mood changed greatly. The temperament of the whole person is completely different than before. There was a feeling of hiding in the clouds, and everything was no longer exposed on the face, as sharp as before, and did not know how to converge. Along the way, Emperor Yu heard a lot of news. There are news that the Undead Blood Tribe captured the first battle of the Hunting Sky, news of the Divine Marriage news of falling after the wind, news of Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan decisive battle. I didn't expect that so much happened during my sleepy period. Unconsciously, the Emperor Yu came to the Hanhai Manor, paused, and hesitated to enter. After a moment, she stepped forward and said, Xia Yu, Xia Yu, come to worship Ruokan Dashan. Whether it is because of the inscriptions on the formation of Hanhai Manor now, or because of Zhang Ruokan's status in her heart today, she can no longer break in without any fear as before. XIXI opened the ban on a ray formation, looked at Xia Yu standing outside, and said with a soft voice, The great saint was summoned by the god of war and has not yet returned. Okay, then I'll go in and wait for him. Yahuang Dao. XIXI apparently understood the emperor's cultivation and also knew that her weight in Zhang Ruokan's mind was not low so she did not block it. The Emperor Yu did not have a good opinion of the monks in the heavenly world, and walked ahead, saying, as a fairy in the heavenly world, the goddess in the hearts of countless monks, but now you are a maid to Zhang Ruokan, are you willing? XIXI was silent. Yes, you have no choice. The Emperor Yu went to a pavilion on the lake, carrying her hands, looking at the charming scenery in front of her, and asked, can you tell me what happened in the battle of hunting the sky? Why did I live after I died? XIXI was able to watch the projection of God's eye, and of course knew what was happening. Zhang Ruokan saved you. XIXI whispered softly. Emperor Yu said, I know, he must have saved me. What I want to know is the process, the details, and the answer that has been puzzled for a long time. XIXI didn't want to bother with Emperor Yu but thought she seemed to offend her, so she said, Zhang Ruokan is really good for you. He used his own blood to reshape your body. Blood gas is very important for the undead. Even if the relationship between the undead monks is good, it is difficult to decisively cut their blood vessels and give their blood to another person. Hearing Zhang Ruokan taking the eighth son of Yan Luo's life and death, and using the blood of the eight masters to make up for her lost blood, the Emperor's eyes brightened and her heart beat quickly. Hearing Zhang Ruokan's thoughts to regain your Holy Spirit and spiritual power, he was constrained by Yan Huangtu and Yan Jaxian everywhere. The Emperor's eyes were both angry and moved. When I heard that Zhang Ruokan was between the future of the undead blood and her life, and she needed to make a choice, she did not give up her, and even made the Emperor Yu realize that Zhang Ruokan really cared about her. In the past, Zhang Ruokan helped her everywhere and even gave the Supreme Holy Ghost to her. The Emperor Yu always felt that Zhang Ruokan had no intention to covet her beauty, and wanted to put her in the harem of the Seven Star Emperor Palace. He juggles with women. However, after experiencing the battle of hunting the sky, and deepening his understanding of Zhang Ruokan, 
the Emperor Yu gradually changed his dismissive thoughts. As Zhang Ruogan's identity and talent, do you want any beauty? How could she save her desperately if she only wanted her beauty? Zhang Ruogan is a true and righteous person. He is not the same as those insidious monks in the world, and he is not the same as those in the heavenly courts. Emperor Yu closed her eyes, but in her mind, Zhang Ruokin's figure appeared unconsciously, lingering. This man, already imprinted in her heart, cannot be forgotten in this life. XIXI stood aside, and of course understood what Emperor Yu was thinking. How can a woman be so indifferent to being so proud, so valued, so protected, and so protected? Even she has some envy. Unfortunately, XIXI is also sad for Emperor Yu. After all, Zhang Ruokin is too good. Only Luo Ye and Yan Zexian, who are noble and born, are worthy of him. The Emperor Yu can only make a puppet. If Luo Yan is strong enough, I am afraid that the Emperor Yu can only be an outside room, and he cannot enter the door of the family. When Zhang Ruokin returned to Hanhai Manor, he just saw the two women standing on the shore of the lake with a beautiful view. A surprised look appeared in his eyes. He walked over and said, So soon, the injury has recovered. The Emperor Yu had already cleared up her emotions and said calmly, This time I was hurt too much. Fortunately, the adult took the shot after the blood, so that the spiritual power and the Holy Spirit were integrated into the body. However, at least twenty will be needed to fully recover. Years. Cultivate in the sun, and recover as soon as possible. The opportunity to practice in the Temple of Destiny is rare, don't miss it. Zhang Ruokin said. The Emperor Yu hesitated, and said, You don't have to be so good to me, I'm afraid I can't get you back. Zhang Ruokin frowned and looked at her carefully, and said, What's up? Where did the spirited and imperious Yahuang go in the past? Did NT she lose to Yan Huangtu, but her confidence also lost? Xia Clan, seal you for the emperor, you have to look like an empress. No, it has nothing to do with Yan Huangtu. The emperor Yu repeatedly hesitated, finally summoning courage, and said, I heard that there is also an queen in Kunlun, who has nothing to do with you. Is it because you are so good to me, because I have her in my body? Is she the same? Arrogant and willful, and so arrogant? Zhang Ruokin's expression tightened, and the surrounding air became a bit cold. After speaking, Emperor Yu regretted it. She checked Zhang Ruokin's information and knew that it was his taboo. She couldn't mention it, but today, she couldn't help saying it. The space seems to be frozen www.mtlnovel.com The more Zhang Ruokin does not speak, the heavier the Emperor Yu is. After a long time, Zhang Ruokin said coldly, The Queen is very powerful. You are more than a hundred times worse than you. Don't try to compare with her. I want you to recover your injury as soon as possible. There is a secret. I hope you can help me do it yourself. I do nt have many people I can trust in the whole world. You are one of the few. The Emperor Yu did not get angry because of Zhang Ruokin's derogation. After all, the Empress was indeed a strange and unique woman. Of course, she hasn't given up on this, and she can't match now, but it doesn't mean she can't match it later. She asked, What is it that the Emperor must go? Help me find someone someone from Kunlun. Men, or women? Zhang Ruokin stared at her and said, Women. Looking for backslash backslash free novel? Beta direct search, backslash backslash it is easy to read a novel. The look in Xia Yu's eyes kept changing. One was wondering why Zhang Ruokin asked her to find someone in person. The second is thinking. How did Zhang Ruokin know that a woman from Kunlun Realm came to Hell Realm? Are there monks in the Kunlun Realm hidden in the realm? The third is to wonder whether this matter will attract the attention of the gods and whether it will bring disaster to the Xia people. After a short while, Xia Yu was very cautious, and Chuan Yin asked, Who is it? A disciple of the Moon God, Mu Lingzi. Zhang Ruokin said. 
Xiaoyu couldn't help asking, how do you know she's in hell? Zhang Ruokin took Mu Lingzi's space jade bracelet out and said, do you know why I taught Mora warrior fiercely on the platform of life and death? It is because of this jade bracelet that it is something I gave Mu Lingzi. Xiaoyu breathed a sigh of relief, and said, so you are using this jade bracelet to infer that Mu Lingzi is in hell. Zhang Ruokin nodded. Xiaoyu wanted to ask Mu Lingzi's purpose of coming to hell. But after thinking about it carefully, asking this question was too stupid, so I closed my mouth. With Zhang Ruokin's status and status today, it is not difficult to protect a wooden spirit in the world of hell. Unless Mu Lingzi had too much luck and fell into Zhang Ruokin's enemies. Xiaoyu has checked Zhang Ruokin's information, of course, who knows Mu Lingzi is Zhang Ruokin's first red face in heaven. Since Zhang Ruokin handed this matter over to her, she naturally took it seriously, and she must not leak the wind. Xiaoyu said, you joined the world and killed countless heaven slaves, including even the great sword emperor. Mu Ling must be crowded out by all parties. Of course, he cannot continue to stay in the cold world and come to you in the world. It is an understandable thing. But you can guess that Mu Lingzi has come to the world. Will the Emperor Moro also guess it? Are you afraid of him with your strength? Zhang Ruokin said. A smile appeared on Xiaoyu's face, saying, In your opinion, which way will Mu Lingzi go to hell? Zhang Ruokin has already analyzed many times and said, The closest place to the Huang Xing in the Kunlun and Hell worlds is about one light year away about 20 trillion miles. No one can cross except the gods. So, first exclude her from crossing the stars. The length of the Huangchuanzing, which is the size of the whole world, exceeds 100,000 light years. The distance of one light year is actually very close. It can be said that the Kunlun realm and Hell realm are close at hand. If it were not for the formation of the God of God Island, the Kunlun realm and the surrounding starry sky would have been swallowed and assimilated by the Huangchuan galaxy. Zhang Ruokin continued, the major transport formations and space wormholes in the Kunlun and Hell realms are guarded by heavy soldiers in the Hell realm. Mu Lingzi should be difficult to get through. Therefore, it can be ruled out. I think the biggest possibility, she should go is the Three Ways River Basin. The Kunlun boundary has a special space gap which is connected to the Santuhi River in Hell, plus the vastness of the Santa River, cannot be fully guarded, and it becomes the easiest place to enter Hell. After listening to Zhang Ruokin's analysis, Emperor Yu shook her head and said, Santuhi is controlled by the ghosts, corpses, and bones. It is too dangerous to walk there. Even if he enters the world of Hell, it is also on the territory of the Middle Three. Wanting to reach the undead blood is still infinitely far away. She may never reach the territory of the undead blood without going through the teleportation array and the space wormhole. Zhang Ruokin was slightly surprised and asked, Which way do you think she will go? Yahuangdeo, for the monks in the Kunlun realm, the Three Ways River may be the only gap. However, for the monks in the heavens where the heaven is located, there are actually many ways to enter the realm. The world is too big, and the core area controlled by the ten groups is less than half of the Huangchuanzing. The wider starry sky is in a chaotic area where clan, small forces, and small tribes are fighting each other, and it is also a secret between the major forces of the ten groups. Where the game is played, the battle for interests is very fierce, and the heavenly monks mixed in there are not a few. Mu Lingzi wants to come to you in hell it must be the wing world of the Blood Heaven clan as his own destination. If I were her, the first step would definitely be to go to the edge of Hell. The second step is to spend the Holy Stone, follow the path of the Dark Forces, and pass through the space teleportation array that is not under the supervision of the Ten Clans, the Temple of Destiny, and the Dark Temple, and sneak into the wing world of the Blood Heaven tribe. There are many Dark Forces on the fringe of the world. The most famous ones are Wujianj, Kyunkan Yukatang, Ghost Ship Alliance, Goddess Twelve Square, known as the top ten giants in the dark world of hell. Each giant has a god. Sitting in the town, 
the forces are so huge that even the Temple of Destiny cannot completely wipe them out. The Emperor Yu continued, from the edge of the world to the Bloodwing Tribal Wing world, there is a road that must pass, called Ice King. To be precise, it is the road that the monks of the Dark World must pass. Zhang Ruokan said, since it is the only way to the Wing world of the Blood Heaven clan, why the gods of the Blood Heaven clan do not directly destroy Ice King and cut off this road? The Emperor Yu shook her head and said, Ice King is an 8th level planet, which is 10 billion times larger than the ordinary Holy Gate planet. There are trillions of intelligent lives in it, and countless monks, ordinary gods cannot destroy it. This is one. Second, the interests of Ice King are too rich, and the major forces of the Blood Tribe have their industries there, including your family. Destroying Ice King means breaking a financial path. Third, the owner of Ice King is said to be a very extraordinary character and has a close relationship with the Temple of Immortality. It is the superposition of these various relationships that has caused Ice King to become a place where no forces can manage, the major dark forces are rampant, and the dark transactions are countless. You want me to find her? My first destination must be Ice King. Also, you'd better give me a token of the bloodless family. In this way, I can save a lot of trouble on Ice King. You know better than I do, and I trust your judgment. Zhang Ruokan thought to himself that since Wu Jianj had a huge power in the dark world, he could ask the master to help him find Mu Lingzi. Bright and dark, at the same time. In the past, I was worried that letting Wu Jianj get involved in this matter would actually hurt Mu Lingzi. Now, knowing that the gods are not as omnipotent as they think, Zhang Ruokan is naturally bolder, and he can let things go a little. Master, Ching Sheng Dashan came to visit. Zhou Yan came over and bowed to Zhang Ruokan. Zhang Ruokan said, It's time to come, please invite Sanbo to come in soon. Zhou Zhang retreated. After a while, Ching Sheng Dashan and an old man with black clothes walked side by side into Hanhai Manor. The Ching Sheng Dasheng is extraordinary with red hair like blood, walking all the way, putting tremendous pressure on Zhou Zhen, XIXI and others, and they dare not look up. However, the old man who accompanied him did not have a trace of Shen Gui on his body, giving a simple and unpredictable feeling. Emperor Yu glanced at the old man. She wasn't shocked, and her face changed suddenly. She suddenly stood up and stepped aside. Zhang Ruokan was slightly surprised at seeing her behave like this, and couldn't help looking at the old man in Swan Yi carefully. The more I look, the more horrified I am, I just feel that this person is completely out of space, as if walking in another world. Although there was no trace of momentum on him, the pressure in Zhang Ruokan's heart increased as he approached step by step. It is more terrible than the Supreme Holy Being. You do nt have to guess it must be a god. Zhang Ruokan stood up, folded his hands with his fists, and said, the younger generation meets the gods. A gentle smile emerged from the wrinkled old face of Yuan Che, the master of Jian Che Temple, and said, the son of Ruokan set up a marvelous work for the undead and the tribe. The old man admired it very much, and wanted to become and visit. People like Zhou Zheng and XIXI were so shocked that Zhang Ruokan's status in the world has reached such a terrible level. Even the gods came to visit in person. Emperor Yu stepped back and was ready to leave. The master of Qianche Temple noticed her and said, Xia Yu, don't leave now. The old man came here to see you. The Emperor Yu stopped, but she still kept her face cold and she did not want to bother her because she was flattering and humble because she was a god. Ching Sheng Dashan introduced, If this is the dust, this is the master of Qian Temple, one of the gods of the Blood Clan tribe. The confusion in Zhang Ruokan's heart disappeared instantly, revealing a thoughtful look. Qian Che Shrine and Xia Yu, where Xia Yu is located, are located in the Nanling of the world of the Blood tribe, and are two of the more powerful forces in the Nanling. After the ancestors of the Xia tribe fell behind, the Qin temple has been eating into the Xia tribe's territory, and the two sides have deep grievances. The Xia people are close to 300 billion yuan, 
and they have seven holy cities, and there are countless monks in the holy realm. However, after so many years of fighting, the Xia people suffered heavy losses and four of the seven holy cities were lost. It's not far from the extermination. The world is so cruel, and the internal struggles of the internal forces have never stopped. It is normal for a power without it to sit down and be absorbed by a power with it to sit down. The Emperor Yu's outstanding performance in the battle of hunting the sky, and embodying the three grades of sacred meaning, will definitely receive the key training of the undead blood race, and it is likely to become the true in the future. Yuan Yi, the master of Qian Che Temple, is just a pseudo-god, how can he not be afraid? Once the Emperor Yu became a god, it must be him first. Of course, the master of the Che Che Temple can obliterate the Emperor Yu in the cradle, but behind the Emperor Yu, there is Zhang Ruokan. After the battle of hunting the sky, everyone can see how much Zhang Ruokan attaches importance to Emperor Yu. If he dared to move the Emperor Yu, wouldn't Zhang Ruokan retaliate against the Che Che Temple? If Qian Che Temple is not the power of the Blood Heaven clan, but other clan, other clan, as Yuan Yi deity, will certainly not be afraid of Zhang Ruokan. However, it turned out that the god of blood Zans became the great clan of the blood tribe, and Zhang Ruokan was highly valued. In this way, Yuan Yi had to lower his attitude and take the initiative to visit Zhang Ruokan. Of course, the one who really crushed Yuan Yi was actually a deity passed on not long after the blood, I'm very optimistic about Xia Yu, how about letting the Xia tribe go? Emperor Yu has the power to become a god, beautiful and attractive, and has to be taken care of by Zhang Ruokan. After the blood, it is naturally the love house and the black. For her affairs, I will pay attention to one or two points. The blood sacrifice family is now in the midst of the sky. Not long after the blood was cut, a false Liwei Wei, and the famous Xiaokan god, fight the prestigious god. When Yuan Yi received the blood god, the whole person was scared. He didn't know how, after the blood, he would personally intervene in this matter. The gap between the true and false gods is too large, not to mention the fact that the gods in the family are not good stubbles and cannot afford to mess with them at all. Xia Yu, Qian Che Temple borrowed the four holy cities of the Xia ethnic group. The old man has ordered that all monks in the temple have been withdrawn and returned the four holy cities to the Xia ethnic group. Yuan Yi rode. Xia Yu froze with an incredible look on her face. If Yuan Yi's true body is here, and Qing Sheng De Sheng is on the side, she would suspect that this is a scam. The master of the Qian Che Temple, the that people can only look up to, has taken the initiative to compromise with her. Of course, she doesn't think that she has such great energy, she thought secretly, is it because Zhang Ruokan went to seek the blood god? Is it the result of the pressure from the Blood Lord God to the Temple Master of Qian Che Temple? Yuan Yi continued, the territory occupied by the Thousand Che Temple will gradually be returned to the Xia people within three years. Xia Yu, your performance on the Kishin battlefield is very good, and it has shown the power of the Blood Heaven clan. The old man is very optimistic about you, and follow Ruokan's efforts to cultivate and strive to enter the realm of God as soon as possible. Yuan Yi did not apologize and compensate, but as a god, being able to make such concessions to a great saint is already the limit. Unless Emperor Yu becomes a in the future, Yuan Yi will likely bow her head. After Yuan Yi left, the Emperor Yu remained motionless, as if petrified. For many years, the Xia people have been bullied by the Qian Temple. I do nt know how many grievances they suffered and how many people died. But no one can help them and they see ANT resist. She never thought of it, because of a battle of hunting the sky, because of her relationship with Zhang Ruokan, the master of the temple of Qian Che went to the door and returned the holy city and territory of the Xia tribe. Everything is because of Zhang Ruokan. She only felt that if she owed Zhang Ruokan, she wouldn't be clear in her life. Thank you. The Emperor Yu bit her teeth tightly and tears burst into her stubborn eyes. For many years, I finally waited for this day. She can imagine that at the moment the territory of the Xia people, hundreds of millions of people are probably jubilant and singing, 
and finally no longer need to be oppressed and humiliated. Leave her alone, Ruokan, come with me, I. I have something to discuss with you. In front of Zhang Ruokan, Ching Sheng De Sheng looked a little awkward. At the beginning www.mtlnovel.com The lesson of Ching Sheng De Sheng Zheng Yijeng's words, Zhang Ruokan, told him not to practice the yin and yang five elements, and even claimed that if he could cultivate the yin and yang five elements, he would name himself right backwards. I don't know, Zhang Ruokan still can't remember this. Hope it's forgotten. How did the god of war leave this to me? Why didn't he talk to Zhang Ruokan himself? What is it all, hey, is it so difficult to be a homeowner? And he is still acting as a homeowner. Ching Sheng Dash and it was very unpleasant in my heart. Homeowners can be. He can do the dirty, tired, and cheap work. However, can we remove the word agent first? Can the treatment of the homeowner be further improved? Looking for backslash backslash free novel? Beta direct search, backslash backslash it is easy to read a novel. Ching Sheng De Sheng and Zhang Ruokan walked along the lake, with spiritual flowers blossoming at their feet, and blood trees weeping by the road. Wherever he went, a matrix of inscriptions emerged, like transparent lines, and disappeared quickly. Zhou Sun is a personal talent. He has become the master of mountains and rivers among young masters at a young age. I think his accomplishments are not far from the king of sea and land. There is also Xia Yu, which embodies the Sanpin of the third grade, and can compete with Yan Huangtu. It has unlimited potential in the future and is also a building material. If you are young, you are young, but you have a lot of talents around you, which makes Yan envy. Ching Sheng De Sheng seemed to be careless, so said. Zhang Ruokan nodded, saying that there was not much speech. Suddenly, Ching Sheng Dashen stopped and solemnly said, You have been in hell for a while, what do you think of this place? Fortunately, there is no difference from the heaven side. Zhang Ruokan said. Ching Sheng Dashen struck sideways and said, What do you think of the family? I don't know much about it. I don't know which aspect he is referring to. Zhang Ruokan said. Ching Sheng De Sheng sighed, and then continued to move forward. Zhang Ruokan stared at his back, revealing a thoughtful look, followed him, and asked, I see that the blood of the Ju family is huge, the three gods are powerful, and the god of war has become the lord of the clan. Why sigh? Ching Sheng De Sheng walked in front, his eyes rolled slowly and slyly. Turning around, he lost all smiles and frowned, yet, yeah, the blood sacrifice family is indeed a great family, and it has three gods. But the gods cannot intervene in the world, want to grow stronger, want to keep the family, in the end, it is the children of the Holy Land. The Great Holy One is the pillar of the development of a force. Zhang Ruokan's heart brightened, and he understood something, and laughed, what can I say? The Ching Sheng Grand Saint is full of face, and said with grave words, the blood sacrifice family is in the world of blood sky tribe wings, the core territory is more than 10 million miles, and governs trillions of blood. In addition, in Huang Chuan Zing, there are 8 millions of planets of life. To manage such a large family business, I have more than enough power, mainly because of lack of talent on hand. Before waiting for Zhang Ruokan to speak, Ching Sheng Dashen went on to say, any talent. Every family and every force needs a steady stream of talents in order to thrive, to grow stronger, and to stand in this cruel and competitive world. Zhang Ruokan said, I think the blood sacrifice family is full of talents. In the last millennium, there have been blood weeping, blood sacrifice, and blood coagulation. All of them have been cultivated to the great sacred realm. Not to mention, the blood sacrifice family's children in the middle, I am afraid that there are some Tian Jiao, have you cultivated to the great holy realm? Ching Sheng De Sheng Dao, there are so many great sages of the blood sacrifice family, but most of them are stuck in immortality in a hundred sacred realms. Cultivating a great sacred sacred requires massive accumulation of resources. Some of these resources, it is very scarce, 
it is not something you can buy with divine stone. For example, sacred heart. Zhang Ruo can completely understood. Around such a large circle, the Qing Sheng De Sheng was actually hitting the idea of Dan Yi Dan in his hands. Qing Sheng Dashen struck the iron while hot, and continued, at this feast of hunting the sky, Tai's Hang refined 100,000 sages at one time. In normal times, Dan Dao masters make Shen Ji Dan. It is very rare to be able to make dozens of them in one furnace. Moreover, the grade is far from being comparable to that of Tai's Hang. Even so, it will be the major forces quickly rushed out. If it's Chen, shouldn't you receive a lot of sacred Dan? Zhang Ruokin looked at Qing Sheng Dashen's smiley face, almost like a fox. It seems that the family is really lacking in sacred meaning. Zhang Ruokin said. Qing Sheng De Sheng Dao, who says no, the condensed sacrament is too important for the immortal and the paradise. The saints who cannot consolidate the five saints all choose to stop in the paradise. Accumulation This has had a bad impact on the development and growth of the blood sacrifice family. Zhang Ruokin nodded and said, as a member of the blood family, I certainly want to support the development of the family. In this way, I will take out twenty top heavenly gods and ten king heavenly gods. After all, Qing Sheng Dashen shook his head and said, in this battle of hunting the sky, you have made great achievements and you should be rewarded by the family. How can the family want you to fight for your life? Let's buy it. I bought Santistan from you in the name of the family. A top heavenly sage, a stone. One king's divine goodwill, twenty stones. Zunpin Pinchengi Idon and Emperor Pinchendan, Qing Sheng Dashen knew that they could not buy it with the divine stone, so there was no need to mention it. Zhang Ruokin said, the price is fair. But I want to buy all the heavenly goods and the king's divine goodwill in your hands. Qing Sheng Dashen immediately added another sentence, these holy thoughts are of no use to you. They are worthless in your hands. Zhang Ruokin quickly agreed and said, okay, I have collected a total of 37 Wang Pin Sheng Yi Dan and 458 Top Tian Pin Dan Yi, all sold to the family. If it's Chen, I want more than that. Qing Sheng De Sheng stared at him tightly. Zhang Ruokin spread his hands, and said helplessly, I should have seen the projection of the eyes of the gods of all realms. I only have so much sacred Dan. It is true that there is only so much Sin Yu Dan you have collected. However, you should have taken a lot from other great saints, right? Qing Sheng Dashen looked like an old man. Indeed. Zhang Ruokin defeated and killed a lot of the great saints in the world on the hunting sky battlefield, and they also collected their storage vessels, and received a total of more than 200 pieces of Wang Ji Shen Ji Dan, and more than 3,000 pieces of Top Heaven. But Zhang Ruokin also knows how to plan ahead, no matter whether it is the establishment of the Ming Dynasty or the world of Qunkan, he will definitely cultivate the great saint in the future. Could NTU keep valuable treasures like Shen Ji Dan? After a short while, Zhang Ruokin said, Oh, I have cultivated the second grade sacredness, and the yin yang and five elements sacredness have merged into the sixth. I would like to ask for your advice. Qing Sheng Dashen's face suddenly turned green, and his mouth made a series of dry coughs. No, no, this, if you are hurt, do NT do it as well. I think so, 100 Wang Pin Chen Ji Dan and 1000 Heavenly Pins Hung Dan. There is such a batch Dan, enough for the family for tens of thousands of years. Zhang Ruokin waved his hand and said, I'm too overestimating me. There aren't so many, no, really none. Qing Sheng Dashen touched his beard, took out a box from his sleeve, and said calmly, God of War has a treasure, let me bring it to you. This is. Zhang Ruokin took the box and felt a little pressing. Qing Sheng De Sheng Dao, before entering Tian Tian battlefield, the gods of the moon and the fourteen girls carved on your body have been erased. Actually, when you reach the great holy state, you don't need the pattern to protect your body anymore. The big is a strong man who has grown up, and then protect with the pattern, just like a baby without weaning. 
but in order to prevent you from being assassinated by the gods, you need to prepare more. Zhang Ruokan opened the box, bursting into the eye with eyes, his eyes narrowed slightly. It's a quaint belt. The waistband is smelted like blood jade, crystal clear, and in the center, the wing-like shape is cast with black metal. In the center of a pair of black metal wings, there is a strange text, revealing a heart-warming breath. It is a divine text, which contains a powerful spirit. Qing Sheng De Sheng Dao, that is a word of war. War. Just reflected by the blood, Zhang Ruokan's whole body's blood was boiling, the warfare in his body became stronger and stronger, and the inscriptions on the formation of Hanhai Manor were trembling. Qing Sheng De Sheng Dao, this belt is called the God of War Belt. When the father became the thirteen gods of the undead blood race, it was given by the Temple of the Undead and has incomparable symbolic significance. Only the god of war of the undead blood race is eligible to wear. Even if Zhang Ruokan's state of mind is so high, he is shocked at this moment. A belt that can only be worn by the god of war, even the god of blood gave him this great saint? It's almost like that, when Emperor Luoyan one day, he suddenly asked Luo Shengtian to sit on his throne. Luo Shengtian was afraid that he would be frightened. How can a great sacred of Beiji reality bear such an identity? Qing Sheng De Sheng Dao, if a shoots at you, the god of war belt will be activated instantly, which will shock the father. With the god of war belt, you can borrow some of the father's divine power across the space, and there should be no problem in protecting yourself. Of course, the greater symbolism of the god of war belt means that your father has high expectations for you. If you can also become the god of war of the undead blood in the future, the blood Jew family can really look down on the world. Zhang Ruokan was moved, and his mood was heavy. Thank you grandpa. Zhang Ruokan did not refuse. Because in the world, he is indeed in peril, and the deities who want to take his life are not without. Wrap the god of war belt around the body. Suddenly, the brilliance on the belt is restrained and becomes simple and unremarkable. The eyes of Qing Sheng Dashan are full of envy, and as one of the few sons who are still alive in the blood of the god of blood, has he ever received such attention? The god of blood Zhang Zhang places great importance on Zhang Ruokan, far exceeding all his children. Qing Sheng De Sheng Dao, in the undead blood tribe. When you practice to the great holy realm, you will be assigned to your own land. Based on your cultivation, I decided to represent the family and divide the 300 life planets and 200 stars in the lonely star domain. Or planet, divided to you, as your private land. I have to say that the blood sacrifice family is indeed huge and rich. Zhang Ruokan was only 100 people, and he obtained 500 land defining planets. In the future, will it be more fiefdom? For other great saints, they need to manage their own fiefdom in order to earn holy stones and divine stones and purchase cultivation resources. However, Zhang Ruokan is richer than some gods, so there is no need to waste time on the ground. Zhang Ruokan said, it's too much trouble to manage 500 planets. I heard that the Blood Master family also has an industry on Ice King. Why not assign me the industry and territory on Ice King? Qing Sheng Dashan's eyelids jumped and said, Ice King's power is intricate and dangerous, and there are not many industries where the Blood King family is there. It doesn't make much sense for you to go. It's better to grant you 80 planets, including one six major stars? Zhang Ruokan waved his hand and said, Well, we don't speak secretly. Ice King is an eighth level planet which is 10 billion times the size of ordinary first-level planets. It can give birth to a vein. Even if it only takes part of the benefits, it is stronger than the 800 planets. What's more, Ice King is the only way to go to the edge of the world and the tribal wing world, and the wealth is flowing. Who wants to go there for a share? Qing Sheng De Sheng knew that Zhang Ruokan couldn't fool, and sighed, Ice King is not that simple. Do NTU believe in my ability? I have the confidence to expand the blood and clan's power and voice in Ice King, and even take full control of it. Zhang Ruokan said. 
Qing Sheng De Sheng glared his eyes and said, only the top strongest in the sacred realm can grab their food there and share their profits. Even me, I have no confidence to hold back those tiger and wolf generations, and you are only one hundred demon, dare to say such crazy words. I used to say madly to consolidate the second class sage, didn't it happen? I used to say madly to lead the undead tribe to take the first place in the ten races, and it was achieved. Qing Sheng Dashen shook his head more than he said, not the same, this time is different. You know, who is in charge of the industry and territory of the Ice King now inside the family? Who? Zhang Ruokan asked. Qing Sheng Dashen whispered, the mother of the blood sacrifice family, the godmother of God of War, Xian Suanqi. Zhang Ruokan's pupils shrank and his face became cautious. Qing Sheng Dashen thought Zhang Ruokan would retreat when he knew what was difficult, and patted him on the shoulder, and said, God of War does not want the blood to fight within the family, otherwise he will have a hard time doing it. Zhang Ruokan snorted softly, as far as I know, after the mother-in-law and Pluto return, the first step is to suspend the host and mother, and all her monks are assigned to the battlefield of merit. How did she still control the blood? Part of the rights and interests of the Absolute Family? When Blood Queen and Pluto were young, they were sent to Kunlun realm by Xian Suanqi, trying to kill them. Qing Sheng De Sheng Dao, after the return of sixth brother and fourteenth sister, Xian Xian did downplay and chose to dormant. However, as the godmother of God of War, who would dare to attack her directly? Besides, Xian Xian's background, but Shura Temple. The first shrine of the Shura tribe. Zhang Ruokan said www.mtlnovel.com Ching Sheng De Sheng nodded, and said, Sixth brother and fourteen sisters can distribute the blood monks of her family to the merit battlefield, but they cannot be elevated. She. She can also mobilize the strong of the Shura temple to continue to help her control her industry and interests. After all, the gods can't get involved in the world and the sixth brother and the fourteenth sister can't help her. Now that Xian Suanxi has retreated behind the scenes, we should not take the initiative to prevent her from getting into trouble and cause disputes within the family. Xian Suanxi should have been married to the Blood Peer family after the Yuanhui calamity. She can marry the Blood Peer god on behalf of Shura Temple and she must be talented. What is her cultivation now? Zhang Ruokan asked. Qing Sheng Dashen saw Zhang Ruokan still immortal, in a threatening tone, Xian Suanxi was once the goddess of the Shura Temple. Anyway, I was not her opponent. Well, the reason why you are still acting as the homeowner is because she still has a lot of invisible rights. It is better that we join forces to defeat her. By then, the word agency should be removed. Zhang Ruokan induced said. Qing Sheng De Sheng stiffened for a moment shook his head, no. No, there will be a big mess. God of War didn't directly give you the position of the owner, but let you be the acting owner. It is very likely that you are testing your ability. The family is too big and requires a strong and decisive character to support it. He continued to be so indecisive, I was afraid that he would disappoint God of War. What kind of person does God of War like, does he not know? Zhang Ruokan said. Qing Sheng De Sheng's eyes narrowed, his heart was already moving. Zhang Ruokan gave him a final blow and said, If you have given me the domain and industry of Ice King, I would like to give out 100 kingpins and 105 top heaven pins. Hiss. Qing Sheng De Sheng took a sigh of coolness, there is a lot of divine goodness in this kid's hand. Earlier, she did not tell the truth. I am the owner and do not accept bribes. It was sold to the family. Where is bribery? During the conversation, Zhang Ruokan had poured out all two thousand sacred heart dans, and if the sky was full of steaming pearls, he surrounded the Qing Sheng Dashen. A roll of Qing Sheng De Sheng De Shao, put away all the sacred pills, his face calmed and whispered, the benefits on Ice King are amazing, even if I, as the homeowner, Seal the industry on Ice King. It's no use for you, it's impossible for Xian Xian to let go. If she doesn't let go, 
then she will take it. What I want now is just a fair name. Zhang Ruokan said. Forcible seizures must start a war, and war will bleed. Anyone who has done things since ancient times can't bleed. Qing Sheng Dashan's fingers touched his chin, and felt that Zhang Ruokan was right. To really become the head of the family, he should indeed fight a hard battle. Only by defeating Xian Xian's family and the strong powers in the blood family can he truly serve him. Those forces that are attached to the blood sacrifice family will truly regard him as the homeowner, rather than continue to obey Yu Suanqi. Zhang Ruokan has just won the first battle of the hunt for the sky, and it is when the momentum is like a rainbow that he comes forward and confronts Xian Suanqi. No one in the family should dare to say anything. Moreover, the Qing Sheng De Sheng is still thinking, Zhang Ruo can dare to hit the Ice King and the idea of Xian Xian, is not behind the Blood Queen and Pluto. Ice King, Planet 8 In heaven, the eighth planet is the scale of a small big world. What's more, the position of Ice King is special. Winning it is tantamount to winning an independent channel between the edge and center of hell. At critical moments, it can be of great use. It is definitely a battle for soldiers. Besides, the Emperor Yu has to go to the ice planet to find someone, there must be a reason. 2,000 sacred pills, 3,500 stones. Qing Sheng De Sheng took the stone from a space ring. Each piece of stone emits a dazzling light, containing powerful energy fluctuations, like a burning meteorite all collected by Zhang Ruokan. I need a token that can represent the family. Zhang Ruokan said. Qing Sheng Dashan asked thoughtfully, what is it? I plan to send a strong man to Ice Star first. There are some preparations that must be made in advance. As he said this, Zhang Ruokan stared in the direction of Emperor Yu. Okay, just a token. In this battle, Qing Sheng Dashan actually had no hope. Yun Suanxi's power is too strong, even if he and Zhang Ruokan joined forces, it is still a long way off. However, this battle must be fought. The god of war dislikes the most, who is timid before he fights. Even if he loses, at least he dares to fight, maybe he will let the of war look at him. Being punished is better than being ignored. After Qing Sheng Dashan left, Zhang Ruokan opened the sundial. In addition to Zhang Ruokan and Yahuang, they practiced in the sundial. There were also Xixi, Zhou Yan, Sun, Shen Tu Yung Kong, and Ning also had the Sword Emperor, Stone Emperor, and Magic Sound that followed Zhang Ruokan. On the battlefield of Kiritan, the fourth fruit of Shi Shenghua has matured. The fourth fruit is its law body. The Magic Sound will swallow and absorb it, and it will grow significantly again. It is precisely because of this that it will be separated from Zhang Ruokan's body and cultivated independently. On the Tian Tian battlefield, Wu Wuji and others who were subdued by Zhang Ruokan were banished and left after the battle. The only one is Emperor Amori, who can't rush away, staying dead in Hanhai Manor. Seeing Zhang Ruokan turning on the sundial, he also ran out, sat next to Zhang Ruokan and practiced. What makes Zhang Ruokan speechless is that the father and of Emperor Amori Luo did not mean to pick him up. I don't know if it was because he felt too shameful and had given up on him, or had no purpose. Zhang Ruokan did not enter the Kixing Emperor Palace to practice. At the time of the battle with Zihok and Tian Shen, the sundial showed signs of recovery, and the scope of coverage seemed to be only 200 feet. However, the inner space is far more than 200 feet of the Seven Star Emperor Palace, and it can also be completely covered by the sundial. However, the wider the space covered, the more stones are consumed by the sundial. Zhang Ruokan did an experiment. After he entered the Seven Star Emperor Palace, the sundial consumed the stone twice as fast as usual. After he entered the Zijin Gourd, the sundial consumed the stone at a rate of 15 times. If he does not enter the Seven Star Emperor Palace and Zijin Gourd, even if these two vessels with internal space are placed within 200 feet of the sundial, the sundial's consumption of the stone will not change. The time velocity inside the Kixing Imperial Palace and the Purple Golden Gourd is still normal. 
Zhang Ruokan didn't know much about the sundial. I didn't understand why this happened. I can only guess that he and the sundial should have some special connection. Therefore, when he enters a special space, the time stamp produced by the sundial will pass through the space wall and enter that space. In the sundial, it took half a year for Zhang Ruokan to refine the dark power that had invaded the body, and the wound was healed immediately. The power of Dark Star is too terrible. This time, it is the longest time for Zhang Ruokan to heal. After the injury was healed, Zhang Ruokan did not rush to the Temple of Destiny, but continued to cultivate, preparing to refine the flame pattern contained in the legs. Now it's just refining more than 20 million flame patterns, and the power of the god's legs can already be against the Supreme Holy Grail. If all the 100 million flame patterns are refined and mastered, how powerful is one leg? What's more, not refining and mastering the flame pattern is ultimately a hidden danger. Time flies. Twenty years have passed. The flame pattern refining in the god's legs mastered 80 million words, and the strength of Zhang Ruokan's left leg reached the point of being difficult to control again. Even if not deliberately urged, the leg fire is still burning. Slightly stepping on the foot, the whole leg is sinking into the ground. Once again, become mules. Zhang Ruokan didn't get frustrated because of this, but was very excited. He could sense the horror power contained in his left leg. In the past 20 years, the number of rules of the Holy Word in Zhang Ruokan's body has increased to 13 billion, and the number of broken shackles has reached 76. Spiritual power is still at level 65, and it seems to have reached the bottleneck. Even if he has swallowed a lot of Sheng Dan, he still has not improved much. Wow! Zhang Ruokan inspired the armor of Vulcan, covering the whole body, using the power of the armor to control the continuous overflow of magical fire in the left leg inside the armor, then closed his eyes and coomed out some numb, chaotic and fuzzy consciousness. If a person retreats for too long, there will be problems with thinking and consciousness. It's like a mortal who keeps himself in the room for tens of days, or hundreds of days, without any contact. After a long time, he will certainly collapse and even be mentally deranged. Of course, with the strength of Zhang Ruokan's current mental strength, 20 years of retreat practice has not caused major problems. Many monks, if they retreat too long, may even be unable to distinguish between the real world and the inner world. Or, if you have forgotten the rules, forms and emotions of the real world, you must forcibly turn yourself into an ordinary person, integrate into red dust, and live for the rest of your life to recover. It means red dust to wash your heart and find the true self. Zhang Ruokan took out the copper coffin containing the corpse, opened the coffin cover, and watched the change of the bite worm. The bronze coffin contains half of the corpses, but Zhang Ruokan bought them from the Xingai world at a price of 180,000 stones. Even with half a corpse, it is more than 2,000 miles long. At the beginning, Zhang Ruokan put a large number of eaters on the corpses. Although most of them were poisoned by the divine poison contained in the corpses, some still survived. Zhang Ruokan has great expectations for these living bite eaters and intends to use them to deal with the death of a thousand lives, even the Supreme Holy One. The God-Eater on the corpse is still asleep and motionless. But there have also been some subtle changes. On the surface of these bugs, a layer of blue poisonous cocoons emerged. Poisonous cocoons are not thick, they are translucent, like blisters. Zhang Ruokan frowned, and said to himself, it's really impossible. It may be able to wake them up in a short period of time by stimulating the power of the sundial. Zhang Ruokan now has a lot of stones in his hands, not afraid to consume, and he is eager to try. Behind him, footsteps sounded. Brings a faint fragrance. These half of the corpse and the remaining mist of souls and souls can be used to make secondary gods and souls, and can be used to train the eighteen kings of six ghosts who carry the seven-star imperial palace. If there are three or five of them, to survive the seventh ghost robbery is to make a lot of money. Yahuang Dao. After passing through the seventh ghost robbery, he can be named a ghost prince, 
and he can be regarded as a great saint. Zhang Ruokan asked, Your injury is healed. Um. Emperor Yu said. How long will it take to break through a thousand questions? Although I am a perfect practitioner of Beijing realm, but the accumulation is still shallow and far from Yan Huangtu. They have not even successfully practiced a kind of Qianzhu holy art, and they are far from Qianwen realm. Yu the emperor has less arrogance, and boldly acknowledges the gap between him and the top Tianjiao. Zhang Ruokan said, if there is a sundial to help you, how long do you think it will take to break through the thousand questions? It's not that easy. In order to shock Qian Qian, you must first develop your own Tao. This step is very important. It is not that you have more time to cultivate. You can succeed. In the Undead Blood Tribe, all the hundred realms that have a way to go have great success. Before hitting Qianwen Realm, they will go to the Temple of Undead. It is said that only by going to the Temple of Undead and the Great Holy of the Undead Blood can they develop the perfect Tao. However, the Great Holy of God who is qualified to enter the Temple of Undead there are very few. Yahuang Dao Zhang Ruokan smiled and said, In this battle of hunting the sky, you have made great achievements for the undead blood race. Wouldn't the Temple of the Undead not practice your quota? It's natural. A smile also appeared on Yu Wang's frosty face. Zhang Ruokan waved his arm gently, Kixing Gailian flew out, suspended in front of Ya Huang, and slowly rotated. Emperor Yu's face had a solid smile, staring at the black lotus flower, which is more beautiful than any flower and felt a strong sense of intimacy, but after all, she did not reach out to pick it up. She knew that the reason why Zhang Ruokan handed over the Kixing Gailian to her in the Tian Tian battlefield was because no one was available and had to do it. But now, she can see that the Magic Sound, the Sword Emperor, and the Stone Emperor are all very powerful saints. What's more, when she lost to Yan Huangtu, she had already lost the Seven Star Ghost Lotus where would she dare to continue to control this supreme holy weapon? What are you doing, take it? Zhang Ruokan said. The emperor you didn't seduce. In the face of a supreme holy weapon, it was even more unnecessary to reject it, and she immediately collected the Kixing Gailian. I'm going to the Temple of Destiny to practice now, and a hundred days later, I'll leave for Ice King. I'll go with you. The opportunity to practice in the Temple of Destiny is rare. Zhang Ruokan knows very little about the Way of Destiny, and of course he cherishes this hundred days. After the blood, he walked into the world of the God of Blood, and stepped on the ripples of water ripples under his feet. In the void, his figure was slender and soft. Kill the after the wind have been killed. He asked after the blood. The God of Bloods and Chis shook his head and said, the deities speculate that the assassin must be the inside the destiny temple, so after killing, you can hide the sky and cross the sea. There shouldn't be many deities left behind in the temple of destiny. They can always be found out. Blood Queen said. Shinto, the three divisions and twelve houses within the temple of destiny have a delicate relationship with each other. In the absence of evidence, even the deity is afraid to act rashly. Moreover. This matter must not be made public. Let's say why did you come to me? After the blood was calm and calm, said, Yan Wushan is dead, I want to pick up Kun Lun. Shinto, do you think this is necessary? There is no need for this. God of War feels that he has no blood of the family, no need to conflict with the Yan Luo because of him. The blood of God of Blood smashed, and said, How did you talk to your father? He leaned back and looked away from the cold and cold face of the God of Blood, and said, Dust is willing to come to hell because of Kong Li and Kun Lun. I don't want to hurt his heart. When Yan Wushan dies, even if the Yan Luo people do NT I'm afraid I won't make Kun Lun better when I take the opportunity to retaliate. I'm here just to tell you, whether you agree or not, I have to go. Stop. The blood god of war stood up www.mtlnovel.com The body was mighty and proud, and said, You really treat your father as such a ruthless person? Zhang Ruokan has seen me and didn't mention it to me. 
that's because he doesn't speak well. He said with his back behind his body. Shinto, I don't think so. I think he wants to take it himself. He shot it himself. After the blood frowned, he felt a little. God of blood, it is best for the gods to intervene in worldly things. I trust the Wuching sect. He is not a narrow-minded generation. If I were him, there is a young genius like Zhang Kunlun by his side. He may be bullied. Moreover, Yan Wushan may not have fallen. In the battle, it was not necessarily the two of them who did it. Isn't Yan Wushan extinct? The blood appeared surprised. The god of blood fighter sat down again and smiled infinitely, Girl, you have just become a god, and you have a lot to learn. After the blood said, the flesh is gone, even if it is spiritual, it is useless. Moreover, the battle ends in the void, and the particles of the flesh and the fragments of the holy soul will vanish in an instant. I can't help it, I can only recognize it. The blood Zeta shook his head and said, No, the end of the battle is on the dark star. The field of the dark star is enough to absorb all of Yan Wushan's physical particles and holy spirit fragments. You must know, Yan Wu God fuses the dark spirits, and the dark star itself is part of his body. After the blood, the eyes were filled with an incredible look, and he pondered for a long time, and said, even so, he would not be able to survive. Even if he survived, it was just a wasteful man. Wu Qing Zong would pay a huge price to revive him. At the beginning, Zhang Ruokin first entered the realm of the Great Sage, and his physical body was not destroyed, but he was just calling for the soul, but he almost let the blood fall. Based on Yan Wushan's current practice, if he wants to come back to life, I am afraid that he must sacrifice a deity, and change one to one saint to succeed. Moreover, even if the Holy Spirit is recalled, it will be reborn. It is as difficult as ever to reach the current height. God of blood, so, you have to look at Yan Wushan's spiritual will. The spirit is strong enough to transcend the body and soul and communicate to the heavenly soul. The legendary heaven soul. The god of blood zest sneered, in this world, all souls in heaven and cultivate human souls. Human souls are cultivated into holy souls. However, in the past, there have been a group of practitioners. The cultivation is the heavenly soul. They call the heavenly soul the primordial spirit. Heaven soul is not in the body of the soul, but is integrated into the heaven, which is part of the heaven. Those who practice gas are trying to cultivate the Tao of heaven, go against the sky, and eventually suffer the punishment of the sky, and die cleanly. The six reincarnations are not without records. It is said that they were things that ancient practitioners had always wanted to build to fight against the heavens and go against the sky. Zhang Ruokin killed Yan Wushan and made his soul fly away, which is equivalent to driving him to a dead end and having to steal the sky. Only by stealing the heaven soul, stealing the heaven, and repairing six reincarnations, can he have a vitality. This, too, is six samsara reincarnation, a step that must be taken to cultivate a good saint. The god of blood, looking up to the sky, said, I have reached the top of the mountain and want to ascend to the sky, but there is no way. Unless I abandon this physical body, abandon everything I once possessed, and break the of the heavenly path to the soul in a spiritual way, success possibilities. Creating a path of holy will is the path of confrontation with heaven, and it must break the existing rules. Yan Wushan chose to steal the world and live in a dead place. I don't know, what choice will Zhang Ruokin make? It is so dangerous to repair a holy product. Is there a high probability that Yan Wushan will come back to life? His blood frowned and worried. Worrying, of course, is not Yan Wushan, but Zhang Ruokin who is still walking this way. The blood zest god was silent for a long time and said, what is the probability that a dead person will crawl out of the coffin, and the probability that Yan Wushan will come back to life will be ten times lower than this. She was worried after the blood, and she wanted to stop Zhang Ruokin from practicing the yin and yang five elements immediately, but she knew that it was too late. At this point, 
it was impossible for Zhang Ruokin to retreat. The god of blood Zhang Zun took out the six-party celestial tripod and gave it to the blood, saying, this venerable tribe has given birth to a unique pattern between heaven and earth. It has the potential to become an artifact, and you will keep it temporarily. After the blood was collected, Liu Fang Tianzun tripod was ready to leave. God of blood battle, going to Yan Luo. Since you think Zhang Ruokin wants to pick up Kun Lun in person, I believe your judgment, he will solve it on earth. Side after the blood. She believed in Zhang Ruokin's ability. The battle Shinto, the worldly things are indeed not related to us. But now there is a big event that will soon sweep the whole heaven and hell. Every will smell the wind and move. What's the matter? Asked after the blood. The blood god's Shinto, Yahuang realm is about to open. As a big clan, I definitely want to lead the gods of the blood sky tribe. This time, you walk with me and the six suns stay in the wing world. The practice of entering the temple of destiny is mainly to help the monks understand the rules of destiny and understand the way of destiny in depth. For some special monks, cultivating one day in the temple is more rewarding than cultivating one year outside, and can achieve their own breakthrough. Zhang Ruokin has good talents, but the contact with the way of destiny is short, which is obviously not a special monk. Even though he has gone all out to mobilize the sacred soul and spiritual power, but the rules of destiny learned after 100 days of cultivation have become 2 million, less than 1% of any 5-element rule. The 100-day cultivation is over. Under the mountain of destiny, the monks of the blood tribe and undead blood tribe said goodbye to Zhang Ruokin. Some of them are ready to return to the wing world of their respective tribes, some are going to the battlefield of merit and some are going to the Temple of Immortality to challenge Qunwen. There is no banquet in the world, and every monk has his own way. The Immortal Temple has been announced to the public. All monks participating in the Battle of Hunting Heaven have all entered the temple for training. And, they can choose freely, whether to join the temple and enter the Blood Emperor Demon Camp. The Legendary Blood Emperor Demon Camp. Those who can join it are the elite among the Immortals of the Undead. They can sweep everything under the Divine Realm. Since I have such an opportunity, I must join the Blood Emperor Demon Camp. It is said that in the Battle of Merit Battle, the Blood Emperor Demon Camp drove past, and the starry sky was full of the Sacred Corpse of Heaven. Zhang Ruokin heard a lot of news, including the strength of the Blood Emperor Demon Camp, the reward of the Undead Temple to the participating monks, and the latest rankings of the Ten Clans. In general, Due to the victory of the Battle of the Sky, the monks of the undead are still in a jubilant atmosphere. There is also bad news. The end of the battle for hunting the sky, the world sent more holy army to the Melon battlefield of Kunlun, preparing to launch a larger war, in a short period of time, to completely destroy this supposedly destroyed 100,000 years great world. In Kunlun, there are friends, subordinates, brothers, confidants, and even relatives of Zhang Ruokin. How can I feel happy when I hear this news? Unfortunately, he couldn't stop all this. In the face of this level of war, what he has achieved now seems trivial. Perhaps only by rescuing the Lord of the God Island can he force the world to retreat. Zhang Ruokin stood under the gate of destiny and watched an undead monk leave then stepped on the sunset and walked towards the top of Shenshan Mountain. Based on the rules of destiny that I have now, I should be able to carry 30% of the fate of uprights. Getting uprights is the key to rescue the island owner. What I can do now is only this. The lives and deaths of the monks in the Kunlun realm, after all, can rely on themselves. Go up the Mingzi River, across the layers of stone ladder. Walking to the mountainside, the two sacred guardians of the holy king who guarded Shen Shan killed each of them and raised a spear to intercept his way. It can seem like a mountain of destiny. The two doomed saints are naturally proud, and they don't take Zhang Ruokin as a great saint. If you are a son, the hundred-day practice is over. You are not a disciple of the Temple of Destiny. Please leave Shen Shan as soon as possible. One of the deadly guards, who had only a white bone, said dryly. 
from the Bone family. Zhang Ruokan said, I want to see the high priest. There are twelve black-robed high priests in the Temple of Destiny. I don't know which one you want to see. The other deadly guardian of the ghost family, asked coldly. Zhang Ruokan said, The high priest of Fulu Black Robe. The high priest of Fulu Black Robe is not in the mountain, please come back. Said the two doomed guards at the same time. Zhang Ruokan's eyes sank, You didn't bother to make an obituary, how do you know that the high priest of Fulu's Black Robe is not in the temple? I've asked using the voice of spiritual power, the high priest is indeed not there. The ghost clan's desperate guard said, if the son of Chen Chen is better to go to Fuel Jing, or he can find the high priest. The two desperate saints were not afraid of Zhang Ruokan at all, their faces were expressionless, but their hearts were sneered. No matter how strong Zhang Ruokan is, do you still dare to live in the mountain of destiny? Your Zhang Ruokan is really respected by the god of Fulu, but they are both under the destiny of the heaven and are not under the control of the temple of Fulu. A monk from the heavenly realm came to the world of hell, and he didn't know how to converge. He was still arrogant and arrogant, and he should have been ruled. Yan Hongsheng died in his hands, and the Temple of Destiny lost a lot of face. Be careful, Zhang Ruokan's mental strength is strong, don't be heard by him. What about it, does he dare to do it? I hope he does. There are some big men in the adjudication department and the destiny department, and they have long wanted to clean him up, but they have never found a reason. The two doomed saints communicated with each other through the transmission of spiritual power. There was no trace of offer the great saint from heaven, but there was a sense of provocation. Zhang Ruokan's mental strength is many times stronger than them, so I can hear it clearly. Zhang Ruokan said, Why do you two convey your voice through spirit? If you have any words, just say it directly. Anyway, in the Destiny Mountain, I dare not treat you. Seeing that Zhang Ruokan did not have the decisive decisive power in the legend at all, the sacred guardian of the Bone Clan did not have much fear in his heart, and suddenly disappeared, saying, Say that the Temple of Destiny does not welcome humans, no, you it doesn't seem to be a human, it can only be considered a, hybrid. Boom! The impertinent sacred power erupted and the invisible air waves shook the two doomed saints. Outbreaked with Shen Gui, there is also the flame of flames in the legs of the god of demon god. Divine flame into the body. The two doomed guards immediately made a scream of screams, and after a while, they were burned into fly ash and fell to the ground. The spears in their hands turned into molten iron, dripped on the ground, and squeaked. Divine flames are powerful, and they evoke a series of divine patterns and array inscriptions in the Destiny Mountain. Bold, who dares to break into the Mountain of Destiny? A thunderous thunder rang out, and a destiny sacred destiny in Tianming Division, turned into electric light, descended to the position of dozens of feet above Zhang Ruokan. This destiny saint has three dog heads and is full of ghosts. As soon as he arrived, he shrouded Zhang Ruokan into his own domain. The path cultivated by the nine-step holy king can only release the rules of the holy path that he has cultivated to form a simple field. The great master of the thousand questions, has transformed the domain into a concrete form, or a yellow sand world, or a three hundred battle sword, or a killing field of Shura, or a prototype universe. The strong man who lives in a dead world has reached the perfect state. He doesn't need to take any action at all. He can suppress other great saints only by the way. In the domain of the three dogs, there are nine ghost towns, one after the other is suppressed by Zhang Ruokan. Zhang Ruokan's former sage of ten thousand lives was only Emperor Emperor. However, Emperor Yun was not only sealed with spiritual power, but also bound by the chain of God. Zhang Ruokan was seriously injured when he confronted him, and his morale was almost exhausted. Compared with the three dog spirits at this moment, the combat power is ten times worse. This is the true saint of all life. Depressed by the first ghost town, Zhang Ruokan was unable to move, and his skin seemed to crack. Depressed by the second ghost town, 
Zhang Ruokan immediately released the real space of space, the realm of virtual time, and the realm of truth to fight against the realm of the three dogs. Depressed by the fifth ghost town, Zhang Ruokan must mobilize the forces of Qunkin to resist. A series of nine ghost towns pressed above Zhang Ruokan's head, making Zhang Ruokan's muscles bulge, the flames under his feet were burning, like a cloud of fire, and his eyes were sharp. Is this the true strength of Wan Chen Ji Sheng Sheng De Sheng, it is really strong, isn't it? This is just the strength of the opponent's domain, and he hasn't shot yet. Zhang Ruokan secretly said. The three dogs Ling Zun was shocked. He had long heard that when Zhang Ruokan fought with Yan Wushan, the fighting power that was comparable to the sacred life of 10,000 dead broke out. I thought it was just a rumor, but I didn't take it seriously. But Zhang Ruokan was able to carry his nine ghost towns without bending his spine, which was really amazing. Well. The wind broke and kept ringing. A doomed guard and a destiny guard armed with spears came from all directions, wearing armor. Among them, there are five figures, which are not weaker than the three dogs, and even stronger and deeper. Zhang Ruokan had no fear. When he previously killed the two doomed guards, he felt that the breath of the three dogs was nearby. However, the three dogs Ling Zun has not appeared, and seems to be waiting for Zhang Ruokan to make a mistake. And Zhang Ruokan suspected that the two doomed saints dare to be so presumptuous, most of them are the secret orders of the three dog spirits www.mtlnovel.com Zhang Ruokan, you broke into the mountain of destiny and killed the two doomed saints, knowing what to do why is it? Three dogs Ling Zun's voice was cold, and said with high toes. There was a meaning that Zhang Ruokan finally fell into his hands. Before waiting for Zhang Ruokan to speak, the voice of Sheng Ming Si Shen Gui had been heard on the left. Breaking through the destiny of the mountain is a death penalty, and it is also a death penalty to kill the lifeguard. The two crimes are punished together, the crime is added first, and the soul should be cramped. The head of the dog in the middle of the three dogs revealed sharp teeth and chuckled, Have you heard? Take him down and put me in the heavenly destiny's purgatory prison. If he dares to resist, he will be right there. Let alone kill. Stop. A cold female voice followed the wind. Immediately, I saw a graceful white figure wrapped in the flowing river of the sticks, stepping on a stone staircase, and slowly came down from above the mountain. The ancient realm is one of the many secret realms in the Mountain of Destiny. Legend has it that there are a lot of treasures of destiny, each of which is valuable. Many of the core disciples of the Temple of Destiny are not eligible to enter the ancient ruins. Zhang Ruokan turned on the sundial in Yuan Hudongfu and realized the mystery of fate for half a year. After exiting the customs, I came to the relics to find destiny treasures. Gee! Zhang Ruokan stepped on a piece of green tile and made a broken sound. The ancient realm is completely different from what he imagined. The secret sky is very dim only to the west, with faint green ons. The vast ground is full of ruins, with dead wood and rubble, like a huge ruin. At a glance, you can't see the border. I can imagine the former glory here through the broken walls, the huge boulder, the sacrificial vessels buried deep in the ground. It feels like the Tiangong has collapsed. With such a huge ruin, Zhang Ruokan instantly thought of the original dragon temple. Have there ever been a magnificent temple here and it has been destroyed? Zhang Ruokan was shocked. Even if the whole world was broken, the stone pillars, rusty tripods and altars still exude a divine and solemn atmosphere. This was once the Temple of Destiny. A low voice sounded beside him, with a sigh of tone. Zhang Ruokan's face changed slightly, and he looked sideways. I saw, not far away, I don't know when a black figure stood. He wore a black robe without any trace of breath, like a mortal. However, Zhang Ruokan couldn't see his face and figure, and mobilized the eyes of truth, and he saw only three vague ghosts. Zhang Ruokan's state of mind, for a moment, calmed his mind, calmly said, Who is your excellency, how come here? Although the shrine of destiny has collapsed, there are still some ancient treasures of cultivation. 
I have been enlightened in the ancient realm for 100 years. Today, I just passed through the customs and just passed by this place. Hippeo Humane. Zhang Ruokan said, Is there such a coincidence? Can anyone enter the ancient ruins? Being able to practice in the ancient realm for hundreds of years, this person is by no means simple. The man in black robe walks slowly forward, through the broken walls, stepping on each ditch. Zhang Ruokan did not know why, and chose to keep up. I don't know how long it has been, Hippeo humanely said, you don't wonder how the Temple of Fate collapsed? How long did it collapse? Who is it and built the current temple? Zhang Ruokan was really curious, but he didn't ask. The black robe humane, there is no empire, a family, a temple in the world can be forever strong and immortal. When the great destruction comes, the entire world must collapse. The reason the temple of fate is destroyed is because it is not enough strong. However, as long as the inheritance is not broken and a better latecomer is born, the temple can be rebuilt and better than before. The frustration of the temple's destruction is only a short period of darkness. As long as faith is not defeated and there are countless monks who persist in faith, there will always be light. See how powerful the temple of fate after birth is now. Zhang Ruokan said coldly, Who the are you? He didn't believe that someone who happened to pass by would tell him so. My name is Abandoned Sky. I am a person who has abandoned everything, including myself. Now, I only have the sky above my head, and maybe one day, the sky will set foot. Hippeo turned and walked away. Zhang Ruokan kept up, but no matter how fast he used, he couldn't keep up with the slow gait of the black robe man, only to watch the black robe man disappear into the sky. Zhang Ruokan gasped, biting his teeth, and howling, Who the are you? The appearance of the Hippeo people made Zhang Ruokan uneasy. Before he knew it, he went to the place where the man in the black robe had taken him before. In his eyes, it was a dense grave. Some have monuments and some have only one cross, which is extremely desolate. On the steel and the cross, one name after another is written, all are monks in the Temple of Destiny. One area is full of new graves. It seems that all the monks who fell from the Temple of Destiny will be buried here. Zhang Ruokan took a deep breath and sat down with his knees crossed to adjust his state of mind. After the mood was completely stabilized, Zhang Ruokan opened his eyes again. He no longer thought about the words of the Hippeo people, and was preparing to find the treasure of destiny. After half a year's realization of the mystery of destiny, Zhang Ruokan had a deep understanding of the way of destiny. The Temple of Destiny has twelve houses, life, death, misfortune, blessing, fierceness, good fortune, joy, anger, vanity, reality, past, future, corresponding to twelve kinds of power. However, Zhang Ruokan reclassified them. Life, death, disaster, blessing, fierceness and good fortune actually represent light and darkness. Joy and anger represent heart. Imagination and reality represent nothingness and space. The past and the future represent time. The power of destiny is all-encompassing. A high or anger is not simply two emotions, but contains more power. For example, Prujna mobilizing the power of destiny can restore the monk's erased memory, which is actually a manifestation of heart power. After the wind takes control of Tian Ming Yu, he can manipulate the monk's emotions and disturb the monk's memories, which also comes from the heart power. The powers of life, death, woe, blessing, fierceness, and good fortune are more extensive. After careful consideration, Zhang Ruokan decided to look for the treasures of destiny that can touch time or space. Wow! He released the rules of space, time, and spirit at the same time, spreading inch by inch and exploring the six parties of space. If there is a treasure of fate that fits in space or time nearby, he must have a special sense. What? Just a moment, Zhang Ruokan appeared inductive, looking towards a mountain-sized grave ahead. Although it is also a new tomb, but the scale is far better than that of other monks, obviously the tomb owner has a lot to offer. Zhang Ruokan's figure flickered, 
appeared below the tomb, and looked up at the words on the stone tablet. Suddenly, the pupils condense. The tomb of the son of God Chu. Zhang Ruokin did not expect that the last godson of the Destiny Temple was dead. To be the son and goddess of the Temple of Destiny is so dangerous. Taking a closer look at the contents of the steel, Zhang Ruokin was relieved again. It turned out that the son was not assassinated and killed, but died in a shock to the Divine Realm. The gods and goddesses who can become the Temple of Destiny must be the top arrogance of the era. Unfortunately, their pressure is also great. If you cannot reach the state of God within a thousand years, you will retreat from the position of the Son of God and the Goddess. A goddess and goddess who is not a is too embarrassing and inevitably will be laughed at. There must be countless monks who feel that they have wasted the massive resources provided by the Temple of Destiny. As we approach the millennium, they will fight desperately whenever they have the opportunity to impact the state of God. As a result, the probability of failure in shocking the realm increases greatly for those who are still rooted. Boom! Zhang Ruokin slaps on the ground with one palm, punching out the rules of time and destiny in the body, communicating the destiny treasure in the tomb. The treasure of destiny just trembled slightly. Did not take the initiative to fly out. Why? Do you want me to dig up the tomb and get into the coffin? Zhang Ruokin did not take the liberty to do so. The grave of a son who is close to the Divine Realm is definitely not simple. Once he digs the grave, it is a great disrespect and will certainly suffer backwash. By the way, destiny is upright. Zhang Ruokin squeezed his fingers into his hands to motivate the power of the mystery of fate in the body. Oh! A white light broke through the soil layer of the tomb and flew towards Zhang Ruokin. It flies around Zhang Ruokin at an unparalleled speed. The speed makes Zhang Ruokin feel dangerous, and once hit by it, he will probably be injured. When it was flying, the time flow rate became turbulent between the surrounding heaven and earth, and time stamps appeared actively. Behind it, they converged into a light spot tail. Zhang Ruokin simultaneously released the real space and virtual time space of space, suppressing it. At the same time, spread out the palm of your right hand and carry the power of fate to the palm. Its speed slowed down and flew to the palm of Zhang Ruokin. It is a white bracelet, non-stone, non-gold, non-jade, which looks crystal clear, but not transparent. Wow! Zhang Ruokin mobilized a blood-sharp gas into it, and the bracelet immediately appeared a layer of brilliance. On the surface, three ancient texts Zhou Fan bracelet appeared. Universe. You, representing the upper and lower quartet, is both space. Zhou, representing the past and the present, is for time. This bracelet, named after Zhou, surely has some connection with time. Fortunately, Zhang Ruokin has the mystery of destiny, otherwise he may not be able to conquer it. Follow me, you follow me. Zhang Ruokin wore Zhou Fan's bracelet on his wrist, and left the ancient ruins without intending to search for the treasure of destiny. The destiny treasure of a son is by no means simple, and it also fits into the way of time. It is not easy to find a treasure of destiny better than it. Zhang Ruokin does not want to waste too much time in the ancient realm. As for the power of Zhou Fanbang, he intends to study slowly after going out. After leaving the ancient realm, Zhang Ruokin went to the Fulu Temple to thank and say goodbye to the High Priest of the Fulu Black Robe. When he left, he wanted to ask for the message of abandoning the sky, but he could not stop talking. On the way out of the Destiny Mountain, Zhang Ruokin could perceive that there were monks tracking, and the means were very clear. Even if he had the heart of truth, he could not determine the identity of that person. Zhang Ruokin ignored him, pretending not to notice, and went straight back to Han Page City. A few months ago, the Battle of Kiritan ended. Today, the warriors of various ethnic groups have left almost the same, and the entire city has become quite deserted. Walking on the street, I can't see a few people, and I can't imagine the lively scene of the period before the Battle of Kiritan. The bustling scene is gone, the bustle is gone. The follower who followed later finally left, 
it seemed that he just wanted to determine Zhang Ruokin's movement. When approaching Hanhai Manor, Zhang Ruokin saw a familiar figure on the street. Not who the Blood Slaughter is. Blood Slaughter wore a grey white cloth, and there was no valuable treasure all over his body. He even had two feet bare and no shoes. Standing outside the Hanhai Manor, he carefully checked his whole body up and down again, and determined that it was really simple enough to walk towards the door of the manor. Being a person should be low-key. Although he is frightened by Zhang Ruokin now, but Zhang Ruokin has a sundial and a lot of cultivation resources. He is beside Zhang Ruokin, can't eat meat, can drink some soup, and will make other monks envious. No matter how much, I am also his teacher's brother. With this relationship, he can drive me out. As for debt repayment, don't even think about it, as time goes by, it always depends on it. Shwetu's heart thought so, his mouth could not help but cocked. Blood slaughter, are you looking for me? Zhang Ruokin's voice came from behind, terrifying Shwetu, shaking his body, turning slowly. Seeing that Zhang Ruokin was standing not far away, he squeezed out a smile that was even uglier than crying, and said, Brother, I haven't seen you for a long time. Right, I almost forgot to congratulate brother and princess Luo Yi for their marriage. From now on. Is the stallion of Tian Luo God Kingdom. The engagement banquet, why didn't you come? Zhang Ruokin asked. Shwetagan coughed twice and said, Too busy. Shui Ben thought that Zhang Ruokin and Yan Wushan would die together in the void. Of course, they did not go to the Fuel Jingle to participate in the engagement banquet. Instead, they went to the Goddess Building with excitement, and found two beautiful girls of the Elf Tribe. One Night of Wine Zhang Ruokin looked at him from top to bottom and smiled, Anyway, he is also a son of God, how can he be so poor? What about your shoes? Bloodsucker's eyes were red and weeping, I encountered a ruthless character in the goddess building, and all lost, so I didn't sell my great holy blood. Look at this piece of cloth on me. It's still a fantasy. From. This is half true. In Shangritian battlefield, the goal of blood slaughter is very clear, just to get rich. Therefore, all kinds of sneak attack schemes were used, all of them were robbed. There are only six holy artifacts. Not counting the holy sources of various levels, the great holy blood, the great holy bone, the great holy heart. Leaving the Tian Tian battlefield, he sold all his treasures in the first place, replaced them with a large amount of stones, and deposited them in the Xingai world. He was afraid of being seen by Zhang Ruokin. In the goddess building, he did meet a powerful figure, but he lost face not stone. Of course, Zhang Ruokin did not believe in blood slaughter, and said, I remember that every warrior of the undead can enter the ancient ruins and look for a treasure of destiny. Have you been to the ancient ruins? Been there. Lost that fateful treasure. Yet. Misfortune www.mtlnovel.com Brother, I'm so miserable. I'm anyway your brother, the maiden's disciple, I'm miserable like this, I lost not only my own face, but also your brother his face, and master's face. Brother, do you have holy boots and armor, please give me a pair, I will not choose, only the king's holy weapon level. Shui Tu looked at Zhang Ruokin eagerly, looking forward. Zhang Ruokin asked, where is the goddess building you just said? Blood Slaughter said mysteriously. It is the branch of Goddess Twelfth Square opened in the Destiny Deity. The name of the Goddess Twelve Squares, Zhang Ruokin heard of Qing Sheng Dashan, is one of the ten giants in the Dark World of Hell, and can be as famous as Wujiang. Zhang Ruokin looked surprised, and said, Goddess Twelve Square dare to open up the branch to the realm of destiny. My brother did not know that this Goddess Twelfth Place is different from other dark forces and has a deep foundation in Hell. Especially the owner of the goddess building, the temple of fate, and the black priest of the temple of death, the relationship is extraordinary and the background is big. Zhang Ruokin was too lazy to pay attention to the true and false words in the blood slaughter, saying, 
I happen to have one thing and need you to help me. You should have time. It is incumbent on me to work for my brother. Bloodslap patted his chest. The next moment, his eyes rolled and he whispered, Danger? I'm just immortal cultivation. It's too dangerous, I'm afraid I can't do it. Not dangerous, just ask me something. Blood too breathed a sigh of relief, and said, What's the matter? I want to know everything about Jianese boundary. Zhang Ruokin said. A doubtful look emerged from the blood slate eyes, saying, Jianese boundary? Among the heavenly kingdoms, is there a big world? No, Jianese realm is not the subordinate realm of heaven, but a big world without the birth of a god. It should now be under the control of a certain force in hell. Zhang Ruokin said. The anxiety in Blood Two's heart was swept away, and he laughed, I was wondering how I hadn't heard of it. It turned out that there was a weak world without gods. In a world like this, there are so many things in hell. There is a little thing, I check it out. Just when he was about to leave, he stopped again, and Pai smiled and said without a smile, Brother, look at me. Anyway, I'm also doing things for you. Don't I go with my bare feet? I can't go barefoot. Right? You like to be naked, just go naked. Zhang Ruokin went straight through a layer of invisible light curtain, entered the formation of Hanhai Manor, his body disappeared. Blood squeezing his fists, he was so furious that he couldn't speak, and finally stomped his feet and rushed to Zingai World. It seems that the stone that has just been deposited has to be taken out. Zhang Ruokin stepped out of the array again, watching the direction where Blood Slaughter left, and said to the Emperor de Sen Luo beside him, Little Sen Luo, follow up quietly and closely monitor him. Don't worry, if he dares to play tricks, I will break his leg. Emperor Amori exhibited a hidden technique, disappeared, and quietly followed. Zhang Ruokin agreed to the batch of slaves to shelter the southern boundary of the sword for 10,000 years. Although they have already died on the battlefield of Kishin, since they made a commitment, Zhang Ruokin naturally took it to heart and will surely honor it. Zhang Ruokin opened the sundial again, but did not rush to practice, but found a blood-red bead, and took out the bone of Yanhong Dashin from its inner space. The body of Yanhong Dashin is a bone. According to legend, he was awakened in the depths of the Three Rivers River. He was killed three times by a supreme master and resurrected three times. Body Her skeletal body is as high as 1,800 miles. Zhang Ruokin used a space chain to imprison him, and now it looks like the height of a normal human. Lay her flat on the ground, her body is pink except for her head. The bones are cast like pink jade, crystal clear and exuding a faint light. Inside the bones, there are vaguely immortal patterns, which are extremely strange and contain incomprehensible Tao rhymes. Zhang Ruokin's finger touched the bone of her left hand, and immediately she felt an electric shock. In the bones, the divine light emanates from any monk to contact her. It's a bit interesting. It's a pink skull that can't be killed by the supreme saint. It's really dead and not dead. Zhang Ruokin can feel that the bones on her body are slowly absorbing the dead air between heaven and earth. The skull of the pink skull was once attacked by Zhang Ruokin with three drops of dark space-time material, and turned into dark black. The immortal patterns in the bones have also become very dim. Zhang Ruokin closed his eyes, mobilized his mental strength, and gathered to his fingertips. One finger, point at the brows of the pink skull. Spiritual force condensed into an electric shuttle, rushing from her fingertips into the inside of her skull. Inside the skull, there was a weird area that could not be explored, a grey one. Zhang Ruokin's mental strength had just rushed into the area and was immediately counter-attacked by a powerful force. Boom! Zhang Ruokin's fingertips and the pink skull's eyebrows, where they touched, erupted into a wave of light, with powerful strength and shook Zhang Ruokin back four steps. It contains such terrible energy. It seems that the dark space-time material has not killed the pink skull. Zhang Ruokin did not dare to continue investigating, holding his chin with his fingers and thinking carefully. 
Is the pink skull a wise bony monk or an undead god? If the latter one. It would be an uncontrollable scourge to keep her by her side. For the next six months, Zhang Ruokin was studying the immortal pattern on the pink skull and tried to draw on the spirit paper, but all ended in failure. Those immortal patterns are too complicated and mysterious. The best time, Zhang Ruokin only drew only half of it, the pattern was collapsed and turned into a plume of red smoke. In the library of the Seven Star Emperor's Palace, Zhang Ruokin found some records related to the death pattern. The so-called immortal pattern is a top level that can be cultivated. The more immortal patterns you cultivate, the more difficult it will be to fight against the Yuanhui, and then you will have a greater chance to live an extra Yuanhui. The reason why the true is difficult to kill is also related to the immortal pattern. Forget it, wait until the mental strength rises to the 66th level, then study the immortal pattern. The 66th level of spiritual power is also a big watershed for the Great Holy Spirit. Once attained, the monk can fight against the Qian Wenjing saint by virtue of his spiritual power alone. Moreover, the vitality of the monk has greatly increased, and spiritual power can be integrated into all parts of the body. Even if the physical body is completely destroyed, the mental power can be immortal. The Queen Butterfly in the Qunwen Realm is a 66th level spiritual power saint. With strong spiritual power, he can hide his strength and deceive the false in the Temple of Destiny. Zhang Ruokin didn't want to stun the gods, so he didn't go to the Blood God and the Blood God, and sent the Pink Skull into the world. In the universe, life is thin. There, the Pink Skull wants to wake up by absorbing death gas, for fear it will take hundreds or thousands of years. Even if she wakes up, as long as it is not a true god, Zhang Ruokin can suppress her again. Zhang Ruokin tried to communicate the mark of Kendo uprightness left by the Emperor of the Bone Bone on the trunk of the Heavenly Tree, but this time, her divine thought did not appear. Just after the wind died, the whole destiny realm was at the height of the wind, and all the monks in the invisible pavilion were hidden, and the Emperor should have left. It seems that she can be contacted again only when she is far away from the destiny realm. Zhang Ruokin withdrew from the world of Qunkan, but the blood slaughter and Emperor Dasen Luo had not yet returned. So he took out the bronze coffin containing the corpse again and secretly said, I have exposed almost all of the whole cards in the battle of the sky and the battle with Yan Wushan. If anyone wants to kill me, I must analyze it very thoroughly. Thorough, well prepared and able to restrain all my tactics. I have to prepare one or two, powerful means nobody knows. In the world, Zhang Ruokin has a strong sense of crisis. Therefore, he decided to cultivate God-eaters at all costs. Putting the copper coffin in the area covered by the sundial, Zhang Ruokin did not immediately fly into the coffin, but tried to use his mental strength to communicate with the sundial. Communication failed. There was no way, Zhang Ruokin had to fly into the copper coffin himself, and immediately, the time stamp condensed by the sundial followed him and poured into the vast and incomparable space in the coffin. Falling on the surface of the corpse, Zhang Ruokin first carefully observed the sleeping eater. Later, he found an area free from divine venom and cultivated. The blood god of war has pointed out his weaknesses, and Zhang Ruokin knows what he needs to make up for. At present, in addition to breaking the shackles, there are at least two things to do. First, to cultivate the word of truth and strive for ten times more attack power in a shorter time when fighting the enemy. Second, let the yin, yang and the five elements of sacredness be combined with the sacred art of the thousand questions. The second thing is the top priority. Although the yin yang five element sacredness is strong, so far, Zhang Ruokin has not been able to incorporate it into the holy art and use and exert it as he wishes. Only, simply use the divine will to launch the attack alone. To cultivate the perfect yin-yang five elements sage, it is obviously necessary to integrate it into the holy art first, and to gain a deep understanding of it through battle after battle. Dragon-like Prujna Palm is one of the most inquisitive holy arts I have mastered, so let the sacred meaning of yin and yang and the five elements first be combined with it. Zhang Ruokin's arms spread out, slowly, 
releasing the sacred meaning of yin and yang and the five elements, condensing a huge Tai Chi mark. Time passes quickly. In the copper coffin, Zhang Ruokin practiced for a year and three months. Every day, only the dragon elephant like a palm is practiced, and the sacred meanings of the five elements of yin and yang are manipulated. His proficiency in both has greatly improved. It takes a lot of time and energy to cast a thousand question level high level holy art in the great sacred land of Bailey Jing. After more than one year of cultivation, Zhang Ruokin's time to display the dragon like palm is at least half shorter than before. However, when trying to integrate it with the sacred meaning of yin yang and the five elements, it always failed. Try again. If it doesn't work, I won't waste any more time. I can only settle for the next thing. It should be a lot easier to blend the divine will with the hundred level high level holy art. Wow! When Zhang Ruokin moved his mind, the Taiji mark formed by the sacred meaning of yin yang and five elements was suspended in front of him. Immediately afterwards, he opened his bow and strode, and his powerful and masculine anger made his body burn. On the left arm, the shadow of the ten word Qing Long is entangled. On his right arm, the imaginary shadow of ten burial gold and white tigers howled. As the palm strength got stronger and stronger, the Taiji mark in front and the pulling depression were twisted and rushed towards the palms of both hands. Persist, fast, it's almost a little. Zhang Ruokin's palm was already burning golden, as if it were about to melt, and his palm strength was accumulated to the peak. However, this palm has not been able to call out. Can't call out yet. Press me. Zhang Ruokin made a bold decision to release the real space of space, using space power, forcibly squeezed the Taiji mark toward the palms of his hands. Unexpectedly, it was really useful. When the seal of Taiji and the two palms are completely integrated, Zhang Ruokin only feels that his hands are as if they are no longer his own, heavy like a mountain, and he can no longer control his palm power. Oh. The right palm hit forward and made a terrifying tiger howling. The horrible palm wave swelled out of the copper coffin, turned into a gold pillar, and straightened into the sky. The bronze coffin was struck like a bell, making a loud noise, and flying all the people who were practicing under the sundial. As soon as Shui Tu entered the Hanhai Manor, before he could shout the word brother, he was frightened by the eruption of the copper coffin and flew backwards hitting him against the light wall of the formation. Blood was dripping from his ears. The inner space of a copper coffin. Zhang Ruokin stood on the surface of the corpse and looked at the two palms. The power of that palm just now is too powerful, so powerful that it can't be controlled, and it hurts itself. However, Zhang Ruokin laughed in the sky, feeling very good. In any case, the sacred will of yin and yang and the five elements finally successfully combined with the dragon elephant like a palm. But this is a good start. As long as you practice hard, there will always be a day of integration. At that time, where the heart is, where the palm is. To cultivate the perfect yin yang five elements sage, perhaps the power of space will play a huge role. Space. Yin yang. Five elements. Yin and Yang. Space. Five elements. Zhang Ruokin stood in the place, repeating these words repeatedly, and wanted to find the key to cultivate a grade of divine will. Everything is Yin and Yang. Everything is part of space. Everything is composed of five elements. After thinking for a long time, he couldn't figure it out. Zhang Ruokin had to shake his head. One product of sacred meaning which can be understood overnight. Outside the copper coffin, Zhang Ruokin felt the breath of blood slaughter, so he suspended his practice, his body soared, and returned to Hanhai Manor. The wounds on both palms have healed by themselves. Zhang Ruokin stared at XIXI and asked, how many stones will be consumed in a day? Fifteen. XIXI said. Zhang Ruokin's brow frowned deeply and he said to himself, it's fifteen times the normal situation. Sure enough, the larger the space, the greater the consumption. I don't know, the monks who practiced in the copper coffin are stronger, 
or the greater the number of monks, will it affect the consumption of stones. One year of training takes 15 stones. It takes 15,000 stones to practice for a thousand years. Where the general saint is affordable. Blood Tu walked carefully behind Zhang Ruokan and said, Brother, I have found the information of Jianese boundary. Zhang Ruokan turned around and asked seriously, What is the general situation, which power is Jianese Ji now in? Blood slaughter, the situation is a bit complicated. Originally, Jianese realm was the Department of Heaven and Fortune of the Temple of Destiny, and calculated the position in the universe. It was reached by the Death Shrine, one of the Twelve Shrines, and it was attacked and destroyed personal collar for the Temple of Death. But not long ago, several forces joined forces and spent a high price to buy Jianese realm from the hands of the High Priest of the Black Robes of Death. Zhang Ruokan snorted softly, not long ago, how long? It wasn't long after the Battle of Hunting the Sky. Blood Slaughter Zhang Ruokan nodded gently and thoughtfully said, There is no strong heritage in Jianese realm, no sacred mountain treasure land, and only one monk, through his own exploration, cultivates to the Great Holy Realm, which is a very low value the barren world. Some people are willing to pay a lot of money to buy it. Which forces did it? Led by the ghost town Disha Ghost City, the Bone Clan's hidden bones and the corpse's eternal life hall also produced a large amount of magic stones www.mtlnovel.com blood slaughter. Zhang Ruokan said, it really is a ghost town, it seems to really come against me. However, there are very few monks who know this transaction between me and Jiananja monk. Who leaked it? The master of Disha Ghost City is the master of ghosts. Suddenly, Zhang Ruokan thought of a person, a cold man appeared in his eyes, and asked, Is the sword prisoner still in the realm of destiny? He? He has already left, and is said to be going to the Temple of Immortality to hit Qunwen. Blood slaughter. Dare to betray me, thinking that you can save your life by hiding in the Temple of Immortality, or breaking through the thousand questions. Zhang Ruokan's intention to kill was soaring. With regard to the Jianese realm, Zhang Ruokan thought about it, and the only person who could think of the secret would be the Sword Emperor. Zhou came in from the outside and presented a post to Zhang Ruokan, saying, My son, a ghost repairer just now sent an invitation to invite you to talk to Goddess Tower tonight. If the son of Chen Chen gets in touch. Zhang Ruokan opened the post and took a quick look. Finally, his eyes fell on the name at the end of the post and his eyes suddenly became a bit sharp. Closing the post, Zhang Ruokan chuckled with a chill and said, somehow he took the initiative to find me. Who? Shue Tu asked curiously. Zhang Ruokan said, the fifth child of the ghost master, et. Blood slaughtered, saying, the blood sacrifice family and Disha ghost city are as deep as the sea. Whether it is the god of war and the ghost master, or the monks below are fighting countlessly. How can I invite you? I understand, it must be because of the Jianese realm. As far as I know, the monk who purchased the Jianese realm from the high priest of the black robes of death is a puppet. Zhang Ruokan asked, How much do you know about you? I don't know much. Shue Tu shook his head gently and said, Anyway, the nine masters of the ghosts are all top-level talents and have the ability to become gods. He is said to have passed the eighth ghost robbery thousands of years ago. The last few hundred in 1949, I have not heard of him, and I don't know if he has passed the ninth ghost robbery. Ghost cultivation, through the ninth ghost robbery, is to enter the ranks of the most powerful in the realm of God, comparable to the Supreme Holy. Shue Tu laughed, I guess. I definitely want to rely on Jianese realm, to fight against brother. Unfortunately, he made a wrong abacus. The blood must have a great family. Will he put a Jianese realm in his eyes? Tonight's invitation brother, do nt go there anymore, we see a nt afford to make such a strong man for now. Go, why not? Zhang Ruokan said. Blood slaughtered for a while, and said, brother. We are not in the mood for anything. We might as well start the sundial, 
practice for a thousand years, and then go out and kill the quartet. Blind retreat, the speed of entering the country is very slow, but it is consuming your own life. Zhang Ruokin said. The battle of hunting the sky, but in a hundred days, Zhang Ruokin's cultivation is ascending, but it is greater than the hundreds of years of cultivation in the sundial. The road to cultivation is inseparable from sharpening an opportunity. Jianese's position in Zhang Ruokin's heart is indeed very light. However, the promises made by myself are as heavy as mountains, no matter how difficult, we must try our best to fulfill them. Disha Ghost Town, hiding all the bones, and the Hall of Longevity, joined forces to buy Jianese realm, perhaps in part because they wanted to target Zhang Ruokin. However, a large world contains countless souls and buries hundreds of millions of bones. These creatures, when killed, can give birth to countless corpses and ghosts. White bones buried underground can cultivate a large number of bone repairs. If Zhang Ruokin didn't go to the appointment, I could order the slaughter of the South of the Sword and turn it into the realm of undead ghosts, which would strengthen the strength of the three major forces. By that time, Zhang Ruokin will not be able to save his life and fail to fulfill his promises, and his mood will be affected. Naturally also achieved the goal. Zhang Ruokin looked at the sky and said, Let's go to the goddess building now. Blood slaughter, lead the way. Brother, if I have something to do, I won't go to goddess building. If you change the time, of course, the blood slaughter is very willing to go to the goddess house to be happy, but only two days ago, after a big loss in the goddess house, lost face, naturally embarrassed to go again. Besides, what a powerful existence it is to invite Zhang Ruokin, it is definitely not good intentions. He is a great holy immortal, where dare to join in. Really not going. Zhang Ruokin said. I didn't want to go. It was my father who passed down the shrine. I had to rush back to the world of blood tribal wings immediately. Zhang Ruokin said casually, I heard that you have a lot of stones in the Xingai world. Switu's complexion turned pale as paper. Emperor Daesun Luo has returned to Hanhai Manor and stood at the gate. Just now, it was his voice that informed Zhang Ruokin of the secret of the blood slaughter. The blood was sweating like rain, and he was trembling, crying, Brother, how do you know? How much is saved? Zhang Ruokin asked. The blood slaughter almost burst into tears, and said, These stones were all brought by my life. It's not easy for me. Brother, the stone that owes you, I will definitely return it. But the road to cultivation costs so much, I can't afford to save at all, right? I didn't say, I want your stone. What are you so nervous about? Zhang Ruokin said. Hearing this, Shue Tu was relieved. Zhang Ruokin asked again, Will you take me to Goddess Building? No problem, there. I know. Aren't you in a hurry to return to the wing world? No rush, no rush at all. What can be more urgent than the brothers? Well, all the consumption in the goddess building tonight is paid by the god of blood. Blood slaughter's complexion that had not recovered easily turned pale again, and the whole person seemed to be petrified. The goddess building is built in the land of metamorphosis. It only needs one space teleport from the city of Han Page to reach. Zhang Ruokin still couldn't fully control the power of the God of God's legs, so he was wearing the armor of Vulcan, and the blood slaughter of the funeral test, standing on the shore of Tian Shen Lake, overlooking the brightly lit goddess building in the center of the lake. The goddess building is not a building, but a magnificent water temple complex. The palace is golden and glorious and there are holy trees rising from the jade tiles, emitting purple brilliance, purple leaves falling, as if the lights were flying in the sky. The sound of singing and dancing came out faintly, giving people endless reveries. On the lake, there is a constant flow of ships. Most of the monks on the ship are well built, and they can often sense the breath of the great saint. Suddenly, Zhang Ruokin sensed a familiar breath wave, and his eyes fell on a Cyan sacred ship. The holy ship seems to be made of holy jade and is engraved with large holy inscriptions, 
which can block spiritual exploration. With the eyes of truth, Zhang Ruokan faintly saw the inside of the hole. I saw that the Prince Luo Shengtian sat cross-legged, his body was radiant, his breath was like a dragon, and he gave birth to a faint divine power, which seemed to be able to upset a world. It was him. Zhang Ruokan's face was weird. Actually, in a place like Goddess Building, it was unexpected for Zhang Ruokan to meet Luo's brother. Zhang Ruokan can see that Luo Shengtian has broken through to a thousand questions, and his cultivation and combat power have all multiplied several times. With his current fighting ability, it is estimated that they can be seriously injured by only one move for the lack of hunger and greedy babies. Luo Shengtian was able to walk in front of several other people and take the lead to break through the thousand questions. In fact, Zhang Ruokan was also expected. After all, Lack, Greedy Infant, Yan Huangtu, and Wu Zhang are all on the battlefield of Kishin, and they have suffered extremely serious injuries, and it takes a lot of time to heal them first. Luo Shengtian has accumulated for many years, and he is only a step away from Jian Wenjing. Without an injury, he naturally broke through easily. What makes Zhang Ruokan difficult to understand is that Luo Shengtian has always been serious. Unlike a person who is addicted to wine, why did he just break through and not be able to perfectly control the surge of power in the body, but secretly ran to the goddess building? The Cyan holy ship was docked. Luo Shengtian put on a special holy robe, his body became a little short and thin, and he wore a golden mask on his face. He was accompanied by a sixty-year-old man on a white jade staircase. Obviously, the goddess tower knew the prince of the gods, and sent a Roxa clan beauty slash woman to wait on the shore. As soon as Luo Shengtian got out of the boat, Tsing Yi Mei slash Wu bowed down and salute, respectfully, invited the two into the goddess building. None of this has escaped Zhang Ruokan's observation. Zhang Ruokan was curious, what happened to Luo Shengtian, how to make it so mysterious and secretive. Zhang Ruokan, like the blood slaughter around him, asked, when you enter the goddess building, can you hide your identity? Blood Slaughter quickly shook his head and said, of course not. The goddess tower must clearly grasp the identity information of each monk. The destructive power of the monk in the holy realm is too terrible. In case a madman emerges, once it is disrupted, goddess tower is afraid it will be destroyed. Suddenly, Shwe Tu thought of something, and said calmly, the brother has just engaged to Princess Luo Yan, it is really not suitable to show up in such a place. If the brother does not want to reveal his identity, he can first contact the landlord of the goddess building, with the permission of the landlord it is not necessary to show people the true face. No trouble. Zhang Ruokan shook his body, making a sound of flesh and blood moving in his body. After a while, he changed his face and turned into a cry. Even the Vulcan armor has changed, and the divine light is completely condensed, which is no different from the ordinary armor. Blood weeping is also the pride of the blood sacrifice family, less than 1000 years old, and it is reasonable to go to the goddess building with blood slaughter in order to reach a hundred levels. Although blood slaughter and blood crying are both great saints, there are many great saints who come to the goddess building and have not received special treatment. They can only take the spirit ship on the goddess building and enter with other monks. Goddess Building After getting off the boat and arriving outside the hall, Zhang Ruokan finally felt the luxury of the goddess palace. It's just a hall to lead the temple, which is built from the materials of the king's holy vessels. It is as high as 100 feet high and magnificent. Two copper doors can allow dozens of people to pass by. Every detail is meticulous. For example, the phoenix carvings on the gold pillars, the lanterns on the sides of the gate, the design of the window lattice, the decorative bone carvings, the planting methods of the holy tree spirit flowers, all the designs and arrangements are all master level, and the monk sees everyone will be amazed. It is completely different from the wind and moon place imagined by Zhang Ruokan, but it looks like a museum with a strong artistic atmosphere. Step by step, beautiful. This is only seen in the leading hall, and I don't know how many mysterious sets there are in the goddess building. 
Compared to here, Zhang Ruokan's Hanhai Manor is no different from a humble hut. Without these noises and noises, Goddess Tower would be an excellent place for self-cultivation. Zhang Ruokan said. Blood Slaughter stood on the right side of Zhang Ruokan, gazing at the lights in front of him, and sighed, I do nt know, the Goddess Building has nine palaces. Among them, there are also extremely peaceful and natural places. You are welcome to say that any monk when I come to the Goddess Tower, I am afraid I will be addicted here, and I will never leave without spending all my treasures. Zhang Ruokan chuckled and shook his head, apparently disagreeing with the words of Shuetu. Dashin's will is very strong, can control his desire, and will not easily indulge. Of course, except for monks who have a demon. In the hall, many monks gathered, and a beautiful woman in white clothes shuttled between them, communicating with them, and setting up their place. Some of these women are charming, pure, and some are from the undead blood, Raksha, Hades, Yan Luo, and so on. There are also humans, elves, dragon girls, foxes, from the side of heaven. They are at least semi-sacred realms, and they are at ease even when communicating with the great sacred realms. Zhang Ruokan saw two more familiar figures, Yan Zexian and Yan Huangtu. Both of them changed their appearance and body shape, wearing robes that covered the breath, and were followed by more than a dozen strong guards, who were full of style and attracted the attention of many monks. The master of the temple, who leads the temple, is a woman who looks twenty years old to reach the realm of the Great Holy. According to Shuetu, her name, Han Yunj, is a human. Seemingly young and with a green temperament, he is actually over 3,000 years old and is a very savvy figure. A human woman, who can mix in the world to the level of the temple master, is not smart. Han Yunj greeted Yan Zexian and Yan Huangtu actively, and Shi Shiran saluted, smiling with a smile, and communicating with them with spiritual strength. No one knows what they communicated. After a while, Yan Huangtu said, Tonight, I am still stationed in Swaying Wan. You should understand how to arrange it. Clear. Han Yunj immediately summoned a young girl in white, led the people of the Yan Luo tribe, walked through the entrance hall, and went deep into the palace group. Who has such a big head and actually speaks with Master Han Dian in such a tone? Ordinary son, absolutely has no such energy. Is it the strong man who has a thousand questions or a thousand lives? I don't think it's that simple. That person is definitely a lot. Except for Zhang Ruokan, few monks saw the disguise of Yan Huangtu and Yan Jaxian, all of them were discussing and speculating. Zhang Ruokan's confusion was stronger, and he secretly said, What the is going on, and how are Huang Huangtu and Yan Jaxian coming? Is there something serious about the goddess building that cannot happen? It's just that Yan Huang plans to come and understand. Well man, just experienced life and death fighting on the Kishin battlefield. It is reasonable to spend a lot of time and relax the tense nerves. However, the emergence of Yan Jaxian made Zhang Ruokan have to think deeply whether the masters of the Yan Luo tribe drove to the goddess building for a different purpose. Subsequently, Zhang Ruokan found the traces of several powerful men, all of which were received by Han Yunj in person, apparently a lot. Even Blood Slay realized that something was wrong, and whispered, Brother, the goddess building is a little weird today. In normal times, you can hardly see Han Yunj. Unexpectedly, today, the master of the lead palace's actually reality came and received several waves of monks in person. In the tone of the blood slaughter, there was both envy and curiosity. He added, the status of blood weeping is still a little lower. If your brother shows you by your true body, even if the goddess tower is so high, Han Yunj will certainly take the initiative to greet it, rather than the treatment that is now ignored. Han Yunj was wearing Maluo, and his wrists were wrapped in fairy magpies. His temperament was clear and elegant. A maid in white, holding a volume, walked quickly to Han Yunj, her lips moved, and she whispered something. In Han Yunj's eyes, a surprise appeared took a look at the volume, and then couldn't help looking at the direction of blood crying and blood slaughter. 
Han Yunj walked over, like a gentle girl with a hand on his waist, saluting slightly, Yunji, I've seen the blood weeping great saint, the blood slaughter god. In the hall, many monks looked towards this side. Some of these monks were very surprised. How could Han Yunj be so respectful of blood slaughter and blood weep? After all, Han Yunj is also a great saint. Blood Two's heart was excited, and he was finally taken seriously. He couldn't help but stand upright with honor. Zhang Ruokin was not surprised and showed extraordinary demeanor. Han Yunj transmitted his voice with spiritual force, and only introduced it to Zhang Ruokin's ears, if the son of Chen Chen is coming, why not let me know in advance that Yun Ji has neglect, please forgive me. Zhang Ruokin said, how do you know my true identity? If the son of Chen Chen's change is brilliant, Yun Ji can't see through it. However, Goddess Building knows that Blood Cry has returned to the world of blood tribal wings, and is not in the realm of destiny. Han Yunja's pure face showed a soft charm, which made many monks dizzy. Zhang Ruokin secretly said that it seems that the information system of the Goddess Twelve Square is very powerful. I am afraid that most of the information and trends of the great saints in are under their control. Han Yunj didn't make another voice, and asked, Blood Crying Saint is a noble guest in the Goddess Building. Do you want to order flowers? Some flowers. Zhang Ruokin said. The blood slaughter revealed an envious and jealous expression, and quickly sent a message to Zhang Ruokin, saying, Han Yunj is smart. It seems that you have already guessed your identity. In the Goddess Building, only those who have outstanding status and cultivation talent are qualified flower. In other words, if you just have the current talent for cultivation, and you don't have the status of the grandfather of the tribe and the grandson of the queen, you are not qualified to pay. Even if you are the grandson of the grand clan, you are also the son of God, but you do nt have the current talent for cultivation you are also not qualified. Talent and background are indispensable. Of course, if your practice has reached the limit, and you are ranked second or higher on the God Reserve list, you are also eligible. Zhang Ruokin shook his head and said, Forget it, I'm not interested. Blood Slaughter heard this, and the whole person was stupid. No monk was qualified to order flowers, but he did not. He was even more anxious than Zhang Ruokin and quickly spread the word, Brother, the flowers cultivated by the goddess building are not comparable to ordinary women in the sacred state. They are versatile and gentle, and some of them can even reach the spiritual strength by virtue of piano art and calligraphy. At the same level as those of the great Confucian and holy Confucian in Kunlun. What's more important is that once you light the flower, she will belong to you for life and will never contact other men. Why the Goddess Tower is so detached, because they know that sexual desire can only attract ordinary monks, and only love can resonate with the top Tianjiao and the Crown Prince. In the words of being slaughtered by blood, Zhang Ruokin was a little more curious, and asked, A woman of your kind is hard to find. Can the Goddess Twelfth Place cultivate a batch? Blood slaughter, yet, yeah, the energy of Goddess Twelve Square is so great. Each of the flowers they cultivated is like a daughter, a monk who can fall in love with them, in a sense, it is the son-in-law of the goddess twelfth place. It is said that the owner of the goddess building, the temple of destiny, is the lover of the high priest of the black robes of death in the goddess twelfth place. No wonder you said that goddess twelfth place has a deep foundation in hell. It turned out that son-in-law is all over the world, and all of them are extraordinary characters. Zhang Ruokin laughed. Blood slaughter, so, brother is ready to order some flowers? I want to try one. Brother and I want to see how beautiful the flowers are in Goddess Palace, so that so many powerful and talented people can fall. No, Zhang Ruokin said. Switu held on again, and said, Why? I see. Brother is afraid to be known by Princess Luo. Zhang Ruokin stopped paying attention to the blood slaughter, shook his head at Han Yunj, and smiled, Thank you for your kindness, don't order for now. Well, Goddess Building respects Ruokin's choice. Although Han Yunj said so in his mouth, 
how could the goddess twelfth place, like Zhang Ruokan, give up investing in him? Once Zhang Ruokan becomes a in the future, the position of the goddess twelfth place will be further consolidated. However, Han Yunj understood that Zhang Ruokan was surrounded by the shadowless fairy in nine immortal beauty pictures and the first beauty of the tribe Xiaoyu, as well as the fiancé Princess Luo Yan who was both intelligent and beautiful. How high is it, and how can it look like a normal flower? Perhaps, only Ching Er can enter his eyes. Unfortunately, Ching Er also has his eyes above the top, and he treats the world as an ant. He may not be interested in this Yuan Hui level genius. Han Yunj thought of Bai Ching Er, who was in the destiny realm, but even the landlord of the goddess building, she could not force her to do things. After all, Bai Ching Er's father was too big. In the last Yuan Hui, he was also a genius at the Yuan Hui level. Zhang Ruokan said, I came to the goddess building to make a treaty for the concubine. Where is he? Then, Zhang Ruokan handed the invitation to Han Yunj. After reading the post, Han Yunj said with a smile, I know the grudges of the bloody family and Disha Ghost City. I hope Ruokan can respect the rules of the goddess building and not fight. Even if there is a battle, the goddess building has a god-patterned bucket. Wu Tai, if there is any contradiction, you can go to Wu Tai to resolve it. Don't worry www.mtlnovel.com as long as they follow the rules, I won't do it, Zhang Ruokan said. Han Yunj said, the three great saints are all in Feng Quiven. Don't tell them the news when I come. Zhang Ruokan said. Standing next to the blood slaughter, when he heard the name of the pale child, his face became weird, with both anger and fear, and the pestle was in place without moving footsteps. What's wrong? Zhang Ruokan asked. Blood slaughter, no, nothing. Brother, I have to remind you that the pale child is a master of the palace of longevity, and his cultivation is unfathomable. The evil star is a big man who hides his bones, and his strength will not be weaker strong, none of them is provoking. If you're scared, don't go. Go and explore something. Zhang Ruokan said just half of what he said, suddenly stopped and looked in the direction leading to the gate of the hall. I saw a woman dressed as a man and walked in. In the palm of Zhang Ruokan's palm, a scarlet blood sharp gas poured out around the gaming table, hitting the cracked warmer, and the hammer body suddenly made a rustle sound. The warmer turned into dust and spilled into the ground. At the center of the warmer, there was an irregular black crystal that flew out and fell to Zhang Ruokan's palm. A surprise sounded, the warmer has not completely corroded. The king's sacred art has been eroded into dust, why is it intact? It seems to be an extraordinary treasure. The monks cast their eyes on the black crystals. It is about the size of a walnut. Although it is a crystal, it is opaque, unremarkable, and there is no strong breath. However, after Zhang Ruokan mobilized a ray of blood evil spirit into the black crystal, a powerful dark power burst out in an instant. Air waves swept the four sides, shaking everyone backwards. I don't know who it is, exclaimed, dark crystal. It is a who cultivates the dark way, a crystal of divine power that has been tempered. The value of the crystal is generally ten times that of the stone. Darkness is the eternal ancient way. The price of the dark crystal should be higher. In my opinion, this crystal can sell at least fifteen stones. Kang Yu has been resurrected with blood, and he got up from the ground, ecstatic, and said, What? Fifteen stones are fifteen billion holy stones? Ha ha. Win. I win. Mine, it's all mine. Don't move. It's you, don't move. The chips on the table are all mine. With his arms open, Kang Ye blocked the red crystal cards in front of him. A total of 77. This is equivalent to 7.7 .7 billion holy stones. Apart from your own 3 billion pieces of capital, plus the 3 billion pieces paid to the goddess building, and 77 million pieces drawn from the gaming table, the net profit is more than 1.6 billion sacred stones. 
a sacred stone that wins is comparable to the majority of the family that has accumulated for hundreds of years. Cool. Kang Yun felt that the Holy Spirit was about to get out of the ordinary, and the laughter was endless. With the wealth he now has, it has been enough to support the cultivation of the Great Holy Realm. Thinking that the senior was still nearby, Kang Yu immediately walked over, respectfully worshipped, and said, Thank you for your guidance. Take it, then. Zhang Ruokin lost the dark crystal. Kang Yu catches the dark crystal, and some of them are flustered, No, no, this crystal, I can't take it, it's the senior you won. The value of the wealth of the dark god crystal is too great, which is comparable to the net worth of an immortal saint. Kang Yun is afraid to imagine that he can own it. A puppet can restrain his greedy heart. Zhang Ruokin looks at him and secretly says that there may be some important things that can be left to him to do. It was you who won, naturally you. Zhang Ruokin said. Kang Yu shivered with his hands, thinking in his heart that a dark crystal, even for Qian Wenjing Dashan, is also a great fortune. The seniors are truly admirable and admire. However, he thought for a while that his predecessor would take a random shot and win a dark crystal. With the eyesight of the predecessors, a circle around this casino, it is estimated that a lot of stones have already been pocketed. Can't afford, can't afford. Boom. Above the casino, there was an explosive noise. There is a monk of the Shi tribe, scum, ran down the stairs, and the whole casino was shaking. He was full of emotions and said, let's go and see, gamble, and gamble upstairs. Qian Chai Jun, what a gamble, why are you so excited? A monk named Qian Chai Jun said, it is a colorful coral tree that is one of the two major weapons in gambling city. Boom. The monks on the third floor of the casino also exploded. Among the monks in the holy realm, there are not many people who gamble. However, as long as it is good to bet, most of them have heard the rumors of colorful coral trees in goddess building. It is said that the bottom price of the bet is a thousand stones. Without a net worth of ten thousand stones, he would never dare to join in easily. The great gods under the thousand questions have almost no qualifications to enter the game, unless they have minds like Wu Jiang. Go and see. Those who dare to participate in the gamble are definitely big men. I would rather like to know the true value of the colorful coral trees. I heard that betting on the most ideal state, its value cannot be estimated by the stone. The first floor, the second floor, the third floor. The monks in the gambling city swarmed towards the top of the castle, and the corridor was blocked. Zhang Ruokin seemed calm and not so crazy. Kang Liao was very interested and was as excited as other monks, saying, Seniors don't plan to go and see. Do you want to go? Zhang Ruokin asked. Kang Yi said, Of course I want to see the world. Then go and see. Zhang Ruokin's fingertips spewed an invisible space force wrapping him and Kang Yu, and the two of them shrank into two light spots, passed through the congested corridor, and flew to the top of the castle. Through the light film at the entrance, a powerful divine power fell on Zhang Ruokin and Kang Yun. If it weren't for Zhang Ruokin's protection of the Kang Yu, this one is afraid that he has been pressed to his knees and lying on the ground. No wonder, all the monks who want to watch are all blocked in the corridor. Because the monks with insufficient strength could not resist the might of God, they could not enter the top door. Shenwei is emitted from colorful coral trees. The top floor of the castle is not large, about eight feet long and six feet wide. The walls of the four directions are made of special crystals, and you can see more than half of the Yushan Palace. Except for Zhang Ruokin and Kang Chen, there are only twenty-five monks in the gambling hall. Presiding over this gambling game is the owner of Gambling Equipment City, Yes Yao, a middle-aged male saint who has been repaired by Bai Realm. It does not belong to any of the ten groups, but a tribe from the edge of the world, the Yasha tribe. Below the ten groups, all are clans. There are many people in the Yasha clan, and among the thousands of clan, it is one of the most powerful. In the extremely long past, they were among the ten. There are nine participants. 
Zhang Ruokin glanced at it, and six of them wanted to make opportunistic moves, betting a thousand stones. There are only three people who are really gambling. Sitting on the edge of gambling Taipei is a dead man with an old face, deep concave eyes, and deep-seated life. Even if he deliberately converges, no onlookers dare to approach him. The bet he has placed has reached 140,000 stones. Seeing the old man, Kang Yu's face changed, and she could not help exclaiming, Gambler! God! Zhang Ruokin showed his doubts. Although the dead strong man had cultivated to be powerful, he could perceive the cultivation as a level. Obviously, he could not reach the divine realm. A false is impossible. Kang Yun knew that it was useless to spread his voice in front of these big men with his own mental strength, so he whispered with awe, I am afraid that the of gambling is the whole world. The only one who is not a but can seal him. It is said that he once showed his mighty power in the main building of the twelve goddess of the goddess, and also killed the four parties in the gambling city opened by the Hall of the Dead and Kyun Kyun Yukatang, and even won the gods, almost never losing. The wealth you have, even God, may not be comparable. For all gamblers, God of gambling is the object of their worship, with awe in their hearts. Betting to win over the gods seems to have the true ability. Zhang Ruokin said secretly. Sitting on the east side of the gaming table was a monk covered in a black robe with a gaseous black veil, which completely wrapped his figure and face, and could not see the gender or the race. Even the hands that were exposed were engraved with magic lines. Hold your hand lightly and there will be dozens of ghosts. Zhang Ruokin found that the black veil on the man, although it was gaseous, was a real treasure which could be isolated from spiritual investigation, and it seemed to have other magical uses. Gaseous treasures are very rare. With the heart of truth, Zhang Ruokin faintly felt that this person's body was cold, not so much like flesh and blood, but more like the stone, ghost, corpse, and bone. Sitting on the west was Yan Jaxian. She is wearing a robe that can change her shape and face. The runes are dense and mysterious. If Zhang Ruokin knew her, she knew her special atmosphere, otherwise she could not see her identity. Behind Yan Jaxian, there are two great saints who are cultivated as deep. It is indeed a genius witch of the Yan Luo tribe, but just came to the goddess building, and actually sent two great sacred masters to follow. Zhang Ruokin said. Just follow, not protect. Zhang Ruokin believes that to the extent that Yan Jaxian is loved by the Yan Luo people, plus she is pregnant, she must carry a treasure like a belt of God of War. If you are pregnant, you should stay in the clan and raise your babies. What do you want to do when you run around? Just come to Goddess Building. Why didn't you see that this girl Yan liked to gamble? Gambling is not good. Unable to wrinkle. Kang Yu gently bumped Zhang Ruokin's wrist with a thin bucket and whispered, Senior, do you feel the time and space here have become a little different? As the controller of time and space, Zhang Ruokin still needs his reminder. This gambling hall seems to be only eight feet long and six feet wide. In fact, if you want to walk from the wall all the way to the table, you need to walk at least two miles. Colorful coral trees stretch the space. The closer you get to it, the more the space is stretched. The flow of time has also become very chaotic, fast and slow, and the time mark has turned into a small stream flowing in the gambling hall. Is it a treasure of time and space? Zhang Ruokin was puzzled and asked Kang Yu, what is the origin of this colorful coral tree? Kang Yu shook her head and said, how can a small character like me know the origin of this level of treasure? I just heard that it was dug out of an ancient tomb in Haishizing Guyu. It is said that the Lord of the Dead Temple wanted to break its seal to see if it was an intact treasure, but after knowing the identity of the owner of the ancient tomb, he gave up. Who is the owner of the ancient tomb? Zhang Ruokin asked. Kang Yu shook her head, saying she didn't know. Yan Jaxian glanced over and said coldly, What are you talking about, are you noisy? Kang Ye was frightened by the cold light in Yan Jaxian's eyes, and quickly hid behind Zhang Ruokin. No way, he is a holy king, 
and in such a gathering of top holy holy gods, he can still speak, which is already great. Zhang Ruokan clasped his hands on his chest, and walked slowly without fear. She didn't care about her eyes, but walked behind her, glanced at the chips on the table, and said, they are really rich, and they have bet 150,000 stones. Her halt. My girl, within three feet, don't let anyone in. The two sacred gods of the Beiluo realm of the Yan Luo tribe had sharp eyes and greeted Zhang Ruokan, preventing him from continuing to approach. Zhang Ruokan raised his arms to the left and right, and gave them a false press. Suddenly, the two sacred gods of Beijing Jing kept their hands in the position they had just reached and settled in place, as if they had become statues. This hand calmed everyone in the gambling hall, and no one dared to look down on him. Yan Jaxian frowned with two eyebrows and said, Space power? I didn't expect it to be a great space monk. Would you like to take a gamble? I can't afford to gamble like you, just come and see. Zhang Ruokan laughed. Yan Jaxian said, That's right, since you are a space monk, you should have a unique judgment on the colorful coral trees. If you can help me win this round, this girl will give you 10,000 stones as a thank you. Hearing this, the seven-handed old man with the title of God of Gambler gave a disdainful smirk. How brilliant his eyesight is, he has long seen the true identity of Yan Jaxian. This girl was repaired to be more than a hundred continents, but she did not know the heights and heights, and gambled on the colorful coral trees. At this moment, the bet has already bet more than 100,000 stones. She is obviously unsure and rushed to the doctor to seek help from a monk who did not dare to play. Is there anything more funny than this? Although the colorful coral tree is a treasure of time and space, it is impossible for a monk in space to make accurate judgments when spiritual exploration cannot be used. In the end, it depends on individual eyesight and ability. 10,000 Stones Zhang Ruokan was surprised and sighed again. What a prodigal defeat! Is it so easy for Fudeo Master to make money? Or is it because the family is thick and can spend freely? Even the top Tian Jiao like Wu Jiang and Greedy Baby, it is very difficult to come up with 10,000 stones. Yan Jaxian dared to claim that he would directly give away 10,000 stones. How rich Zhang Ruokan was, but she was far less proud. If you win, really give me 10,000 stones. Zhang Ruokan said. Yan Jaxian said, as a girl, how can you rely on your account? However, you'd better show a little skill, if it makes me feel you are useless, let alone 10,000 stones, you can't even get a stone. Then I try. Zhang Ruokan was quite interested in the colorful coral trees and observed them carefully. Not only observing the tree itself www.mtlnovel.com but also observing the changes in space and time in the gambling hall. After a moment, he said calmly, this is not a natural space-time coral tree, it has been sacrificed by people. Hai Shizingguo produces a variety of natural treasures of time and space, and sometimes grows empty coral trees, but it is very rare. The colorful ones are extremely rare. If it is a natural colorful space-time coral tree and it is alive, the price can even exceed the Supreme Holy Grail. Even dead colorful coral trees of time and space are worth more than 100,000 stones. However, after being sacrificed, its value becomes difficult to judge. Possibly, the price is higher than the living colorful space-time coral tree. It is also possible that the price is lower than the dead colorful space-time coral tree. More importantly, if the time is too long and not kept well enough, the colorful space-time coral trees may have been eroded, and their appearance may look magnificent and clear, but once they encounter the air, they will instantly become quicksand. 550,000 stones 560,000 stones The former is a bet from Monk Black. The latter, bet on the seven-handed old man of the of gambling, always surpassed his opponent by 10,000 stones. Zhang Ruokan's Shenyang God Wheel was able to shoot 300,000 stones, because it can conceive a supreme holy weapon. Other top-level king's holy implements, 
but they can't make such a high price. It can be said that the gambling game between the seven-handed old man and monk Black Gauze is already the pinnacle of the earthly world under the divine realm. It is destined to shake the heaven and, and become a legend. Kang Ye was so frightened that he was almost out of breath, and his heart was about to stop beating. Yan Huangta's eyes had been looking at the monk covered in black gauze, and his eyes were very curious. It is not surprising that a seven-handed old man can produce 560,000 stones. After all, this old guy has lived for tens of thousands of years, and has won over 10,000 games. But who is that black monk? Why did you get 550,000 stones? Zhang Ruokan said, we are about to win or lose. Why do you see that? Yan Huangtu asked with a smile. Zhang Ruokan said, the colorful coral tree is a dead tree. Even if it is sacrificed to become the Supreme Holy Grail, it cannot be called the Supreme Holy Grail now because it has no instrumental spirit. A Supreme Holy Grail without instrumental spirit has value above and below half a million stones. Yan Zexian showed a confrontational look, and wanted to raise his bar with Zhang Ruokan, and said, what if the spirit is just asleep? Or, is the colorful coral tree not dead? Zhang Ruokan shook his head without answering her. Yan Huangta sighed softly. His niece, who was smart by ice and snow, had the talents of hundreds of millions of monks. Unfortunately, he was protected too well, too simple and too astringent. Why don't you talk? Yan Jaxian said indifferently. Yan Huangta couldn't help but say, your two possibilities are too slim, and the wealth you need to spend, even a seven-handed old man, can't bear it. Just now, the seven-handed old man has said that he is letting go and betting on the chance of 20%. With more than 500,000 stones, betting on a winning rate of 20% or 20%, he has taken a huge risk. If you are gambling, the two situations you said. That is to spend 1 million, or even millions of stones, betting on a 1,000th win rate. The price is too great, even God, will not do it. Such things. Have NT the gods of the dead temple and the goddess twelve squares retreated? Yan Jaxian participated in the gambling for the first time. After hearing Yan Huangta's explanation, he suddenly realized that he stared at Zhang Ruokan secretly. Her playful face shrouded in embarrassment and red. The black gauze hesitated for a long time, put the black ship card in his hand, put it down again, and said, I will not raise. The seven-handed old man stood up and smiled with a long voice, now that the gambling is over, open the last layer of seals and see what the colorful coral tree is like. Zhang Ruokan has been watching the eyes of the seven-handed old man. Where does he seem to bet a 10% win rate? Did I look away? Zhang Ruokan used the heart of truth to perceive again, but the subtle induction told him that the colorful coral trees were indeed not worth gambling. The atmosphere in the entire gambling hall was pushed to its peak. The answer to millions of stones is about to be revealed. Who will be the final winner? Gambler. 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 In Gambler City, many monks are shouting these two words. The undefeated name of the seven-handed old man has long been imbued into the hearts of every gambler. Everyone in the gambling hall has a big identity, self-assertion, but also holding his breath, nervous. Yes Yao can be regarded as a veteran of the casino, but in the process of unsealing the seal, he was also trembling with a throbbing heart. Boom! The last seal was lifted. The colorful coral tree bursts out a brilliant colorful light, accompanied by the energy storm of space and time, impacting in all directions. Even if everyone in the gambling hall was well prepared, there were still more than ten people who were swept away by the space and flew out dozens of feet. Time imprinted light spots, although dense, did not form a harmful attack. Why dare to say that the colorful coral tree has been eroded by such an overwhelming energy storm? The pale child was excited, staring at Zhang Ruokan, with a sense of sting. Yan Huangta frowned, and sighed, it looks like the seven-handed old man has won again. It's so pretty, it's so delicate. It's so powerful in time and space. 
isn't the colorful coral tree dead, but a living tree? It's impossible. A colorful coral tree alive, this, this must shock the gods of the whole world. I lost contact with this kind of fetish. I knew that I should bet on everything. A monk sighed. Yan Zexian felt a little regret in her heart and felt that she should stick to her own idea. The treasures such as colorful coral trees were born, and no matter how many stones were born, it was worth betting. Or gambler's eyesight. After all, the emperor who slaughtered the heavens and sees it away. Just when everyone was immersed in the beautiful halo from the colorful coral trees, there were only three of them, still silent. These three people are Zhang Ruokan, the old man with seven hands, and the monk with black gauze. The seven-handed old man only laughed at the beginning. As the seal was lifted, the smile on his face narrowed, and his eyes became more and more dignified. At last, his face became pale, apparently something unexpected happened. How could this be? I cried in horror, somehow. Russell. On the gaming table, the colorful coral trees growing in a stone tripod quickly dissipated. The tree body gradually turned into sand and fell downward. The monks who were just agitated, excited and amazed just now were all stunned and couldn't believe the picture in front of them. Yan Huangta stunned for a moment, and then laughed, it turned out that the energy fluctuation just now is the last essence of the colorful coral tree. The seal was released and exposed to the air. When? Thinking of this, Yan Huangta couldn't help looking at Zhang Ruokan, and secretly said, it's better than gambling eyesight, this person must not be something in the pool. Impossible, impossible, I clearly saw the fluctuations in life, how could it be a dead tree? Impossible, never impossible. A strong mental storm erupted in the seven-handed old man. All the people who were close to him all flew and fluttered from his head. They fell on the stone tripod, pulled out two hands, and hugged colorful coral trees. The colorful sand slipped faster with the touch of your hand. The six monks who bet a thousand stones all showed excitement in their eyes. The difference is that three of them are so happy that the laughter can shatter the entire castle. Although the other three were also laughing, Zhang Ruokan noticed keenly that their eyes, if any, were fixed on the black monk. This one is fast and very vague, and everyone is attracted by the colorful coral trees. Except for Zhang Ruokan, no monk notices it. Zhang Ruokan had realized in his heart that a smile appeared on his face, and he sighed, Great. I do not know who is praised. Snapped. The seven-handed old man with a sloppy face pulled out an eagle-clawed hand and pierced the colorful coral tree. With a loud bang, the tall tree was completely smashed. The clenched hands of the old man with seven hands slowly opened, and I saw a faint colorful light flashing in the palm of his hand. Inside Guangua is an earthworm-sized bug with a colorful ring. It was the faint breath of life that you radiated. It was you. The eyes of the seven-handed old man all stared out of his eyes, shaking with trembling. Obviously, the seven-handed old man sensed the life fluctuations of the colorful coral tree and thought it was not a dead tree, so he desperately bet. Who would have expected that there was a worm in the colorful coral tree? Zhang Ruokan had new doubts in his heart. With his heart of truth, he did not sense the life fluctuations in the colorful coral trees. How did the seven-handed elderly feel it? It seems that it can become a of gambling. The seven-handed old man does have an unfavorable side, and he is afraid that he has hidden secrets. An undead blood racer wearing blood robes with ten wings in his back, looking at Yes Yao, smiled proudly, Night City Master, isn't it time to announce the outcome of the gamble? Yes Yao Wang said to the seven-handed old man who was still standing on Shi Ding, bowing his hand and saying, Senior Gambler, are you okay? No matter, no matter, willing to gamble to lose. The seven-handed old man closed his eyes, and his heart was difficult for a long time. After making their debut for so many years, they lost for the first time, and they also lost so miserably. The god of gambler is not so light, even if he has a shocking wealth, I am afraid he will have vitality this time. Wanza said in a low voice, 
smiling. Yan Jaxian was a little scared. If it were not for the blocking of Zhang Ruokin and Yan Huangtu, she might also bet on more than 500,000 stones. I can't believe what the consequences would be. Losing 150,000 stones is already the best ending. Staring at the tall and thin man who was called the King of Heaven and Earth, she felt a grateful gratitude in her heart, and a little curiosity. Ye Xiaoping regained his heart and began to announce, everyone can see that the colorful coral trees have lost their vitality and turned into sand. Although these colorful sands also have some value, they are far less than a thousand. A stone. So, the winner of this game is. And slow. A voice interrupted Ye Xiao's upcoming announcement. The hearts of the six winners were already about to mention their throats, and they were suddenly interrupted. Of course, they were extremely depressed, and there was a chill in their eyes, staring at the person who just spoke. The one who shouted slow is naturally Zhang Ruokin. Zhang Ruokin walked in front of Yan Jaxian and smiled, Girl, would you like me to buy the bug in the hands of God of Gamblers at the price of 1,000 stones? Yan Jaxian froze, and some reactions failed. Is this Queen of the King killing the heavens crazy? He spent a thousand stones to buy a worm. Wrong. The point is, why is he looking for her? That worm is not hers. In the gambling hall, a monk reacted quickly and understood Zhang Ruokin's intention. The pale man laughed loudly, Do you think everyone is an idiot when you kill the Emperor of Heaven and Earth? With a thousand stones, buy that bug, and the value of that bug is worth a thousand stones? So she win all right? Ha ha. The price of a bug, if all worth a thousand stones. Plus those colorful sands. The value of this gamble is more than a thousand stones. The price exceeds one thousand stones. First, the six gamblers who only bet one thousand stones are the first to go out. The gamblers with more than a thousand stones are only Yan Jaxian, the seven-handed old man, and the black gauze monk. According to the rules, the lowest bidder wins. In the end, the natural winner was Yan Jaxian. Yes Yao yelled at Zhang Ruokin, Sir, it is best not to break the rules of the goddess building. The value of a thing is not determined by you alone. Seeing Zhang Ruokin dare to show his bravery, the six winners were most angry. The undead saint, who bears ten wings in his back, said Shen, be a smart idiot. Bang him out, he should be banned from entering the goddess building in the future. I want to win, I want to be crazy. Kang Ye was so embarrassed that he felt that his predecessor would be the first time to come to Gambling City and would not make such a joke if he did not understand the rules. He wanted to help explain, but was not able to hold his breath out of Shen Gui from all sides. In front of many great saints, he was a nine-step saint, and was not qualified to speak at all. Zhang Ruokin remained calm and calm, and said, did you not think that the insects that can grow in the colorful coral trees are ordinary? As long as this girl is willing to sell it to me for a thousand stones. I have my own way to prove that its value, more than a thousand, will surely convince you. The pale man laughed in the sky, as if he heard the funniest thing in the world, and said, even if it is really a rare and strange species, the price will never exceed one hundred stones. Which one is not a strong man with rich experience? The real top insects, even if they haven't seen them, have heard of them. But this bug is definitely not among them. The six winners were already a little worried, and they feared that something would happen, and they communicated with each other. Immediately, they all put on a tough posture. Blast him out. If Goddess Tower doesn't do it, I will do it myself. Dare to make trouble in front of this seat. I really don't know how to write the dead words. If it wasn't in the goddess building, you would have been destroyed. Those who dare to take part in the game are strong and have a strong background. They didn't want to make any more theory, one by one, the powerful Shen Gui broke out, and swept over Zhang Ruokin. Zhang Ruokin did not change his face, but smiled at the corners of his mouth. I don't think anyone dares today. Yan Huangtu said flatly in a thunderous tone. 
Immediately after that, the four strong men standing behind him burst into tears, revealing their true body, erupting in the might of the Holy Spirit more powerful than the six winners. One of them is the middle of Jian Wenjing, and the other is the peak of Jian Wenjing. Another one, www.mtlnovel.com, has reached a lifetime of death. Some people recognized the identities of the four masters and said in a terrifying way, Earth Demon Suan Wuji, Suan Wuxian, Suan Wu Shadow. And, an elder demon, Kun Yun Huang. Although the demon clan is a clan, it is also a hegemon on the edge of the world. Who can make the four masters of the Earth Devil follow? You should know that among the four masters, they include the elders of the Land of Death. The eyes that looked at Yan Huangtu became nervous and shocked, guessing his identity in his heart. Where is he sacred? The six winners were all calmed down. Yan Huangtu found a chair, sat down calmly, and said, I mean, let the Emperor Tu Tianziati finish it. Do you have any comments? Romance Reading URL The Corpse Elder Life Hall, Pale Child Devil Tribe, also Suxu Emperor the Rakshasa Phil family, Phil Tintin. The Ninth Heaven Palace of the Underworld, the Cloud King Iron Blood King. Any one of the four is the existence of the great saints from all walks of life in heaven. In the world, they are even more fierce. At the moment, they worship a woman at the same time. White Girl. Zhang Ruokin's eyes were horrified, and it was hard to believe that a woman in the goddess's palace had such amazing energy. You know, the four masters are all from the big forces, have a god-level background, and should not be pinched. Wouldn't it be even more amazing if she volunteered to submit to her? Even the landlord of the goddess building has no such ability. Who is she? A monk named White Girl was sitting in the hall with her white fingers, holding a pen, and copying scriptures at his desk. The yellowed scriptures were placed next to the desk case. A golden casserole emits little green smoke. She apparently copied from the scriptures and stared at it from time to time. However, there is no word in the scriptures, which looks strange. What is even more weird is that the text copied on white paper is like a dark dragon and snake. After writing the next word, the previous word has disappeared. The four pale sons stood outside the hall, keeping their bodies in a bowed posture, daring not move. They knew that tonight's gamble against the seven-handed old man failed, white girl would be extremely angry. No one spoke, and the atmosphere was dead and solemn. Zhang Ruokin knew that the presence was strong, and their eyes could be easily sensed. Therefore, only at the beginning, he took a look, then closed his eyes and listened. Quiet for a long time. At night, only the sound of wind blowing leaves. After copying ten sutras in a row, the monk of black yarn finally stopped writing, closed the yellowish scripture, and put it in his sleeve. It seemed that she finally thought of the four people outside the hall. She said, tonight's game is not a complete failure. You don't have to be so scared, let's all retreat. Extremely pleasant sound. Just listen to its voice, and in your mind, you can imagine the most beautiful female body picture as beautiful as a gentle girl. The four of them were relieved and relieved. The pale man clenched his fists in both hands, his waist was bent to the ground, and said coldly, tonight if it was not the emperor who slaughtered the heavens and claimed to be an undefeated gambler, he would lose to the girl. God stone, but was won by an unknown woman killed halfway, causing the girl and the goddess building to suffer heavy losses. Next, kill him now, draw his soul and dedicate it to the girl. Twelve Goddess Square, 180th Floor Even if it is the most profitable goddess building that has operated for thousands of years, it may not be able to earn 500,000 stones purely. The loss tonight is indeed astonishing. It is impossible for any monk to be light-hearted. However, the monk of black gauze had a soft voice and an elegant and soft tone, saying, You were wrong by three points. The pale child was surprised, and asked, what three points? Brother Blackshaw said, first, the emperor who slaughtered the heavens and the earth is not his real name. 
Second, the nameless woman is not nameless, but rather famous. Third, I have already said that the game tonight is not a complete defeat. Therefore, whether the goddess tower suffered heavy losses depends on how the situation changes. At present, it is at least half successful. Zhang Ruokin whispered aloud, this white girl, dare to count the seven-handed old man, and almost succeeded, is indeed a remarkable character. Did she see through Yan Zhenxian and me? What did she say was at least half successful? Pale child asked, what is the identity of the emperor and the unknown woman who slaughtered the heavens? Shouldn't ask questions, don't ask them. Said Black Goss. Pale child said, don't let them go like this. Suddenly, Zhang Ruokin felt an extremely cold and cold energy that swept the entire courtyard. Even if he was hiding in the distance, he could feel skin tingling and blood clot. The Holy Spirit is almost to be pulled out of the good luck. Fortunately, his strength of the sea is stable, and there is the armor of Vulcan armor, only to block the unknown force. The scream of the pale child sounded, making the night creepy. Zhang Ruokin didn't know what happened, and didn't dare to see with his eyes. I just heard that the pale man rolled on the ground, screaming and begging, seeming extremely painful. Don't. Dare, never dare. Ask more, you shouldn't know. Never know. Please, let me go, let me go. Ah. It is possible to ask a top saint to ask for forgiveness and sorrow but imagine how much that kind of suffering is. This white girl is too moody. The pale child just asked one more question, and it was so painful. Zhang Ruokin murmured secretly and couldn't help but reflect. Was he too kind to the monks below? The wailing voice of the pale man gradually disappeared, and he climbed up from the ground with difficulty. The Tsing Yi robe had already been torn by himself, blood was dripping, and he knelt down and said, Thank you girl for forgiveness, and my subordinates dare not ask any more. The other three strong men, trembling, were extremely scared in their hearts. The voice of Monk Black Ga still sounded pleasant and said, I heard, you, you, and Sing Sing, invited Zhang Ruokin to Feng Kiwen, why not go? Go now, go now. Wanzi stood up, took three steps backwards, and quickly walked out of the courtyard. Phil Tianding and Yunhan Iron Blood King immediately followed and fled. The only emperor who still had blood was standing outside the hall. The black gauze asked, why don't you go? Emperor Suxiu quickly bowed and said, I have had nightmares on a regular basis in recent days. Not only can't I get into practice, but I've already affected the work for the girl. Please give me a cure. The nightmare is the scariest, scariest, and most fragile side of your heart. Why can't you face it? To overcome nightmares is to overcome yourself. Black Goss. Emperor Suxiu bit his teeth tightly, and said pale, under, underneath is just a mediocre. Well, you can admit that you are a mediocre, but you are sober. I will give you a dream to relieve you from the nightmare of ten years. Ten years later. If you are still obedient, the dream can continue. The sound is so eloquent that it can be imaginative and intoxicating. Zhang Ruokin was surprised and surprised. Who is this white girl, is she using dreams to control these top saints? Nightmare, Zhang Ruokin was also afraid. Because there was also fear in his heart, there was also fear, and there was something fragile. The nightmare is undoubtedly amplifying all this so that the great saints are plunged into fear and terror all day long, uneasy. At this moment, a weird scene happened in the courtyard. The Emperor Su also awakened like a dream, with cheerful laughter in his mouth, and his eyes were sometimes obsessed, as if he had obtained the treasure he dreamed of, sometimes he was greedy, like the delicate and slash or body of the most beautiful woman in the world, he is a generation of emperors, and the gods kneel at his feet. A dream, a life. Whoever does not desire is the protagonist in the dream, and everything is smooth and smooth, and you can get everything you want. This feeling is so wonderful, it is so beautiful that after the Dashin tasted it once, he fell for it and could never give up. 
Beauty dreams make people fall, nightmares make people fear. Zhang Ruokin stood behind the tree, smiled and shook his head slightly, and was about to leave. Suddenly, when he heard the black gauze woman, he called out, Master, have you found the identity of the emperor who killed the heaven and earth? A three-foot-high stone turtle came out of the corner. Lord Turtle is full of green, like an emerald body, walking on two legs, his head is only the size of a fist, his eyes are glittering, holding a volume of books in his hand, hoeing his head and walking to the black monk, Stutter said, Find, 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 here. Say. Root, root, according to, according to, according to. Monk Shake shook his head and said, Forget it. General, come and read. The stone pillar holding up the pavilion suddenly moved. In the pillar, two long stone arms were stretched out to take over the book in the hands of the Turtle King. Lord Turtle was a little angry and snorted at the stone pillar, saying, All, 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 yes, yes, I, 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 I know, it's all your credit. General Shizu said with a harsh sound of stone rubbing, according to the roster of monks who came to the goddess building tonight, it can be judged that the emperor who slaughtered the heavens must have changed his shape. It may be his monks. There are ten three. Where is the master of space? Asked the black monk. General Shi Zhu said, only one. Needless to say, I know who it is. Master Black Gauze said. General Shi Zhu said, there is another relevant information found here. There is a creature who claims to be the emperor who has killed the heavens and earth. Not long ago, he appeared on the Ice Ice Star and burned the slave market opened by the family. After naming, escape. The monk in black yarn was surprised, and said, I'll send a message to the goddess building of Ice King, so that they can capture the emperor who slaughtered the heaven and earth. I want to live. General Shi Zhu closed the book and said in a low voice, Should you deal with this emperor who slaughtered the land in the goddess building? We have more important things to do. He, let's put them on for the time being, and don't make any extravagant branches. Lord, go and keep an eye on the seven-handed old man, don't let him escape. If he escapes, tonight this innings, you really lost. Master Black Goss Zhang Ruokin breathed a sigh of relief, although it seemed that Monk Black Veil was powerful, but he did not see through his technique of change. If everyone can see through the 36 changes, he will not have to perform this technique in the future. At the same time, he was puzzled again. The Monk Black Gauze set up a pit to the seven-handed old man, apparently not just for hundreds of thousands of stones, but for a bigger plan. What is she planning? What secrets are hidden in the seven-handed old man? Also, is the Black King who appeared on Ice King a killer? Dare to burn the slave market of the family, and dare to leave a name, it's really emboldened. Zhang Ruokin whispered quietly, quit the Peacock Palace, return to the lively and extraordinary Yushan Palace, and his heart was difficult for a long time. What he saw and heard just now was too much information and he needed to be quiet. As soon as he wanted to be quiet, quietly appeared in front of him. Gu Shijing stood under a ghostly fire lamp, beside which was an eucalyptus silver flower, wearing a robe of robes, with her long hair dangled above her head, bound by a wooden clog. She stared at Zhang Ruokin and said, We're meeting again. When Zhang Ruokin came out of the Peacock Palace, he changed his appearance again. In order to distinguish it from humans and undead blood races, he turned into a half-fat cat with a tail and ears. Perhaps it was just the thought of Xiao He, who was born from the heart and felt it. Zhang Ruokin still had some confidence in his own technique of change. He stared blankly, waving the cat's claws, and said rudely, You have misidentified the cat, we haven't seen it. By the way, the emperor has no time to talk nonsense with you. You can't ask Switu to inquire about the news you can't inquire. She said. Zhang Ruokin just passed by from Gu Guqing's side, and when he heard this, he immediately knew that he couldn't hold it anymore. The flaw was not on him, 
but a leak on the side of the blood slaughter. Zhang Ruokan stopped and said, Where is the blood slaughter? Gu Shijing turned around, and stretched her right hand tightly, spreading her white palm, a Hmong bean-sized figure appeared, which was pinched into a mass of blood slaughter. The blood slaughter was apparently struggling and rebelling, but unfortunately, she could not escape the palm of her hand. Zhang Ruokan sighed, Ah! It's amazing, a great saint, you are easily pinched. Blood slaughter carries a drop of Zhang Ruokan's blood, which can be used to find him. It is not surprising that Gu Shijing appeared in front of him. Blood scream cried, saying, Brother save me, I didn't intentionally reveal your secrets to her. This devil's head is too perverted. She is proficient in sophisticated dementation techniques, and I was unable to hold it. Zhang Ruokan said, Behind the blood slaughter, there are two deities standing. I think you better let him go. Gu Shijing tossed his palm, and threw Meng Bin out of the way, and said, For me, he has no value, I'm only interested in you. You don't want to know, what's going on in the goddess building tonight. I, I can tell you. Stop it. Blood slaughter changed to its true size, and fell into the icy lake water, splashing a splash. Zhang Ruokan groaned for a long while and said, I really want to hear you continue, but unfortunately I still have a game, hurry up. Which game? Gu Shijing said. Looks like he told you everything. Zhang Ruokan really wanted to retake the blood slaughter that had just risen from the water with one palm. Gu Shijing said, Hey, pale sun, evil star, are not good. You go to the appointment alone, are you not afraid to die there? This is the goddess building. Zhang Ruokan said. Gu Shijing said, That's right, because this is the goddess building. Do you think this place is really a place of pleasure? Don't forget, Goddess House is one of the ten dark giants. Hey, pale, the evil star may not dare to kill you personally, but in the dark world, some are desperate. After hearing Gu Shijing's words, Zhang Ruokan was immediately awakened, realizing that she still ignored the enemy. Why tell me this? Zhang Ruokan said. Gu Shijing said, you should go to the appointment. When you come back, let's talk slowly. Return that blood to me. Zhang Ruokan said. Gu Shi shook her head and said, Your art of change is brilliant. I have to make sure that I can find you anytime, anywhere. The blood slaughter was soaked, and walked to Zhang Ruokan. He was very afraid of her aunt shooting and whispered, Forget it, brother, this female demon is so good that we can't provoke it. When it's time to admit it, just admit it. So, she didn't perform any dementia on you at all, did you admit it? Zhang Ruokan said. The blood slaughtered for a moment, and then he patted his chest seriously, saying, How is that possible? I may admit it to my own business. Even with the knife holder around my neck, I will never counsel you. Brother, believe me, her dementia is really powerful, she can't carry it, she really can't carry it. Zhang Ruokan didn't bother to care about him, turned around and left. Just after taking a step, he stopped again, and said, You can find me with that drop of blood, and I can also find you at any time with that drop of blood. Gu Shi is a close friend of Luo Yan's boudoir on Jing Ming's face, but Zhang Ruokan's devil's stone carvings, in Zhang Ruokan's view, is an enemy. This which let Zhang Ruokan see through. Not only her cultivation, but also her person. Every time she appears, her temperament is different. In the engagement, Gu Shijing is fascinating, with a perverse personality. She is called Luo Xiao, who is like a naive girl. But the meeting just now is like an old-fashioned and indifferent nun, which can kill any man's desire for women. Just came out a white girl www.mtlnovel.com There is one more quiet, but also to deal with the killings arranged by the puppets, pales, and evil stars, Zhang Ruokan only feels thunder in the silent place, and moments of crisis and death linger around. Before he knew it, he had crossed the bridge on the surface of the water and reached Feng Quiven, and his appearance changed. 
if you are the son of dust, your majesty is in it, waiting for you for a long time. A human saint who looked twenty years old, wearing a thin white veil, stood outside Wang Yuan to greet him. The breeze blew, the human saint's Suana's body was looming, the expression on the pretty face was shy and red, and she was extremely charming. She was full of admiration and whispered, the little girl Lian Ro has watched the projection of the eyes of the gods of all realms, and tonight sees the real son of Ruokan, such as seeing the red dust gods, it is the war of my people. Take me in. Zhang Ruokan said expressionlessly. It was a great provocation to bring in a Terran woman on purpose. Stepping into Feng Quivan, the air became much colder, such as a falling ice cave. Zhang Ruokan swept his eyes. In the room, there was a bronze-colored long table, the urn, the pale child, and the evil star, already sitting in the north, west, and east directions. There are three other stunning women who accompany them, two of them are semi-holy of the undead, and one is half-holy of the human race. On the table, in addition to the food and wine, there are also dishes prepared with human flesh and soul food made with human souls. A glazed lamp was placed in the center of the table case. The kerosene is clear and transparent, and the wick is like a bean. While burning, it emits ripples, and the fragrance is like sandalwood, giving people a sense of tranquility and distance. Haha! <laughs> Brother Ruokan, you have been waiting for you for so long, why are you here now? I think you have to punish yourself by three cups. Wu Shuluo smiled, as if he had seen a long-time old friend. The fifth child of the ghost master has a restrained spirit and no difference between the ghost and the flesh. He is in his thirties and has no white face. His head is smooth and he has no hair. The pale child and the evil star each looked at Zhang Ruokan secretly without saying a word. Zhang Ruokan sat on the south side of the table case, facing him, staring at the glazed lamp on the table, and said, Buddha oil lamp. It's the Buddha's oil lamp, he said. From the body of the Buddha, corpse oil was refined and made into lamp oil. Once ignited, it can suppress the spiritual power of the monk to leave the body, and it can also suppress the monk's spiritual perception. Just with this hand arrangement, Zhang Ruokan realized that the three men in front of him had the heart to kill him today. The pale man changed into a clean robe without the wolverine appearance in the peacock palace. He said, the ancestors of the Temple of Eternal Life once went to the realm of the West Heaven Buddha, dug a Buddha body, and refined a lot of Buddha oil. Ruokan if the sun is interested, the poor can send you some. Buddha is God. Zhang Ruokan covered his nose, and said politely, it's really smelly, where can there be such a smelly corpse smell, even Buddha incense can't cover it. The pale child's stiff and pale face became cold and cruel and he was about to have an attack. I held him. The pale child groaned, venting the anger to the human half-holy woman sitting on her lap, pinching her face and convulsing, her body trembling slightly. He stared at the human tribe named Lian Ro, and said, Don't hurry to poor Ruokan's son. Even with a lot of femininity, he raised the jug and filled it with a cup, and Xiao. Zhang Ruokan stretched out two fingers, blocked the glass, and looked at him, saying, there is no need to be so polite between us. I have only one purpose here, Jianyi's boundary. He stared at his eyes, lowered the raised glass, and said, what kind of identity is Ruokan, he's so interested in a barren weak field. Aren't you interested in there too? Zhang Ruokan followed up and said, how did the sword prisoner tell you? This matter has nothing to do with the sword prison emperor. Buying Jianyi's boundary, we just want to strengthen our power and train more people. Wang Zizi said. I shook my head slightly, the pale man was really a fool. Zhang Ruokan couldn't be sure that the sword prisoner leaked the secret. Asking the question just now is obviously a test. Pale child replied in this way, although it is a denial, but how is it different from acknowledging it? Sword Emperor is sad. However, I don't think this is necessarily a bad thing. They promised the Sword Emperor that they would never reveal it to anyone. They did it, and did not knowingly leak it. Today, 
Zhang Ruokan is extremely resentful, and he will definitely seek the Sword Prison Emperor to settle accounts. However, once the Sword Emperor broke through the Thousand Question State and repaired a surge, it would undoubtedly be Zhang Ruokan's rival. Even if the Sword Prison Emperor still could not fight Zhang Ruokan, he died in his hands. Will the forces behind the Sword Emperor give up? No matter how they calculate, they don't lose money on this account. Of course, we still have to see if Zhang Ruokan has the ability to leave alive today. Zhang Ruokan said, three people don't need to keep their eyes open and talk nonsense. To tell you the truth, I must have Jianese Jazi. He smiled and said, since Brother Rushan is so interested in Jianese realm, we can bear the pain. However, the purchase of a realm cost us three forces, and I don't know if you can. What price can you give by it back? Zhang Ruokan was simply, and said, three stones. At the moment when the three strong men were stunned, Zhang Ruokan took three divine stones from the space ring and threw them out, shooting at the puppet, the pale child, and the woe star. Hum. 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 The pale man's hand grabbed the oncoming stone, could no longer hold back the anger, suddenly got up, full of anger, and said, Give shame to your face, Zhang Ruokan, you should be frivolous, tell you the truth. It is the dazzling Ji of your body. Otherwise, I will give an order, and the entire Jianese boundary will be turned into a dead domain in an instant, and billions of souls will die for you. The Wo Star wearing armor, said, hiding all the bones, I just want to return to the body of the Great Red Saint. Zhang Ruokan shook his head with a sneer and looked at him, saying, if I didn't guess wrong, what does Disha Ghost City want is Kixing Gailian. If Chen Chen really is my confidant, he said. Zhang Ruokan took the wine glass in the hands of Lien Ro, put it on the tip of his nose, and sniffed, A sword south boundary, you actually want to sell three supreme sacred artifacts, do you think I must do this wrong? Hidden from the bones is the body of the great red saint, but the ring worn on the finger of the body is a supreme holy weapon. The ring could not be removed from her finger. Puppets, pale suns, and evil stars are all smiling. Smiles are different. The grin's smile was warm, the pale child's smile was hard, and the woe star's smile was like the bone fire in his eyes, beating with excitement. After all, Zhang Ruokan did not drink a glass of Chinese wine, and said, I tell you the truth. I never thought I would buy Jianese realm from you. Although the puppet, the pale child, and the evil star still smiled, all smiles became stiff. Zhang Ruokan said again, a long time ago, someone told me that the world is a place of weak meat and strong food. Even so, why can you buy things with stones? The entire room became dead. I want to steal Jianese from the hands of our three major forces. You are afraid of dreaming. Wanza said. Zhang Ruokan said, there are so many people in this world who like to dream. Hearing this, the pale child's complexion changed slightly. He was calm and still maintained his manners, saying, if Brother Chen has just arrived in hell, I'm afraid he doesn't understand the rules here. The rules of survival of weak meat and strong food are indeed true, but there are some basic rules. If you dare to take the Jianese realm, you undoubtedly want to start a large-scale civil war between the god-level forces. If everyone is like you, the realm is already in chaos. If you touch the bottom line, even if we spare you, the temple of destiny I can't get around you. Immediately afterwards, he drank a glass of wine, and slowly said, in recent years, the unobedient godsons, goddesses, and disciples who judged SISI were not in the minority. Brother Ruokan must think twice. Zhang Ruokan stood up, murderous overflowing, and said, Lest the temple of destiny to press me, this battle is imperative. If you are aware of current affairs, you will actively surrender Jianese boundary. Otherwise, Jianese boundary is your burial. Soul land. Farewell. His eyes suddenly became cold and frosty, and the light of his eyes fell on the female saint named Lian Ro. Well. The wine glass fell to the ground and shattered into pieces. 
boom. The puppet, the pale child, the evil star, and at the same time released the domain. There is a magnificent yin mountain in the sloping roads. The mountains are thousands of miles long, and the peaks and valleys are stacked. Tens of millions of ghosts pass through the mountains and rush to Zhang Ruokan like a tsunami. The domain of the pale sun is seven palaces. The domain of the Wo star is a grey sea of bones, and a faint bone like a mountain is faintly visible, with bone fire burning in it. Three domains, one layer on top of the other, suppressed Zhang Ruokan at the same time. Get up! Zhang Ruokan sighed, and the immortal King Sheng Xiang rushed out of his body, propping up a world, and resisting the suppression of the three domains. Lian Ro, who stood beside Zhang Ruokan, disappeared instantly. I do not know when, a black dagger appeared in her hand, and lightning stinged at Zhang Ruokan's temple. At this moment, she looks like a saint, and the breath fluctuation that erupts has clearly reached the level of a thousand questions. With such a close distance, with her unparalleled speed, it can be said that Zhang Ruokan has been sentenced to death. Zhang Ruokan's body sacredness was pierced layer by layer by the black dagger, just like paper. At the moment when it came out of the sheath, the three women sitting next to the puppet, the pale child, and the evil star were sucked away by the soul and blood and turned into three dead bones. Its wicked and evil power makes thousands of voices sound throughout the room, some crying, some begging, some giggling. The long dagger contains countless evil spirits. Seeing the black dagger, it was necessary to pierce Zhang Ruokan's temple, but Zhang Ruokan hit her with a palm as if had been expected. Oh! Lien Ro's eyes widened, with an incredible look in his eyes, and his body flew backwards. She had a full chest, and was blown open by the palm of Zhang Ruokan, and collapsed inward, her sternum was broken, and her internal organs became mud. Before she flew out, her left wrist was pulled by Zhang Ruokan and dragged back again. Zhang Ruokan did not show any pity for Xiang Xianjiu, and hit her with a single palm. Oh! Lien Ro's head exploded, which was seductive to the extreme, and turned into a ball of rotten headless rotten meat, which fell to the ground. She was still alive, her fingers and legs squirming. Zhang Ruokan suppressed her in the real space of space, making her physical body unable to recover again. Break me! The king of Fudoming shattered the three domains, and the surrounding scenes recovered again. Still in Feng Quiven, the puppet, the pale child, and the evil star are still sitting in the three directions of the table case. What's different is that the three women around them turned into ashes. Even the soft, holy blood spreads all over the house. Zhang Ruokan ignored the three of them, took up the wine glass on the table, drank it, then squatted down took away the black dagger pinched in Lian Ro's hands, looked at it, and said, Evil curse dagger. As far as I know it has been passed down for more than two hundred thousand years, and has absorbed countless evil spirits and blood. It is a cursed weapon that can kill demigods. You are not a monk in the world, are you from the gods organization? In Lian Ro's broken body, a frightening cold voice was made, Zhang Ruokan, you are really strong but I don't understand, how do you see in advance that I am the one who really assassinated you? Your technique of concentrating qi is very subtle and will be hidden in the realm of the Holy One. Unfortunately, even if you can hide from the demigod, you can't hide from me. Of course, Zhang Ruokan will not tell the secret of his own heart of truth. If Zhang Ruokan was not aware of it in advance and had some precautions, in the situation just now, even the Supreme Saint, there would be 10% or 20% assassination. First, women from the human race and the undead blood race were brought to a company, and various human flesh and blood meals were prepared, in order to affect Zhang Ruokan's mood. At the moment of hands-on, the three realms pressed down, trying to draw Zhang Ruokan's attention to three monks who did not exist at all. Later, Lian Ro was assassinated in close quarters, using the evil curse dagger to take Zhang Ruokan's life. The killing was intertwined, and it was laid out from the beginning. Haha, <laughs> Zhang Ruokan, you have become the target of criticism in both heaven and hell. 
it is one of the most valuable monks on the best saint bounty rankings. I don't know how many killer emperors want to take your life, you can't live long. Lian Ro laughed almost crazy. Zhang Ruokan said, the Tiancha organization actually cooperates with the rules of Earth Evil, the Hall of Longevity, hiding all the bones, and I don't know how the Temple of Fate will deal with them. You have no chance. Why? Because you have no evidence. Lian Ro's body burns automatically. In the flame, her calm voice sounded, dark incense is only a prelude, and the shadow of death will surely cover every corner of heaven and earth. When the peach blossoms are in full bloom, you will be reduced to 100,000 dust like me. Zhang Ruokan wanted to stop Lian Ro, but it was too late. As soon as her voice fell, she was burnt out, leaving only a pinch of embers. Even the great holy blood scattered in the room was burned out. I can stop her from exploding the holy source, but she cannot stop her from performing the mystery of the ember. The killer of the skyscraper organization is too terrible. She is not like a human at all, more like a weapon for killing. Even so decisively chose to commit suicide. She really is not afraid of death? Zhang Ruokan recalled carefully the words she had said before. Subtle fragrance is just a prelude, when the peach blossoms are in full bloom, you will be like me. Subtle fragrance, peach blossom. Oh! On the table case, the Buddha oil in the glazed lamp was burned out. The lights went out, and the whole room became dark, and only the murmurs of the ghosts in the evil cursed dagger could be heard. Without the suppression of the Buddha's oil lamp, Zhang Ruokan's mental strength could finally be separated. Puppets, pale suns and evil stars are still sitting on three sides of the table case, but Zhang Ruokan doesn't feel their breath and hum softly in his mouth, it seems that you still dare not openly. A cold wind blew outside the window and the bodies of the crickets, pale suns and evil stars broke down into three piles of yellow sand. It's all just an avatar. The puppet, the pale child, and the evil star stood in Gui Yanwan and looked at Feng Kiwen. The pale man wondered, Zhang Ruokan is really a greedy? With the subtle beauty www.mtlnovel.com, he can't be confused. It's not just a greedy person. It's just a ruthless person who destroys flowers. Sing Zingdeo said. Although the assassination failed, I was still calm and smiling, saying, Greedy infant, Yan Huangtu, Wu Zhang, which is not the first class hero in the world, but all lost to Zhang Ruokan in the hunting sky battlefield. Such characters, even if it's greedy, isn't it a beauty to kill? Bain Zingdeo said, Shan Xiang is not only a beauty, but also a first-class emperor-level killer of the heavenly killing organization. We must admit that Zhang Ruokan is more difficult to deal with than we think. If he's not strong enough, it's boring, he laughed. You can still laugh? Zhang Ruokan already knows the identity of Subaru. If he falsely reports to the Temple of Destiny, we will have big troubles. Wanzi was quite worried. Bane Star said, I don't worry about this. Zhang Ruokan's background in the Temple of Destiny is Fuel Jinggu. Unfortunately, Fuel Jinggu cannot control this one. As for the ruling department, if there is no absolute evidence for the energy in Zhang Rushan, the adjudication department will simply ignore him. What I thought of meant something meaningful, I received the message that Zhang Ruokan's relationship with the new goddess of destiny is more relaxed and closer than before. How is that possible? Sing Sing said. The pale man showed an unbelievable look, and said, These two men are on the battlefield of the hunting sky, but they are turned upside down. Bane Star said, The new goddess of destiny still has to rely on the support of the upper three clans. The conflict between the above three clans and Zhang Ruokan cannot come together anyway. The new goddess should not understand the importance. Xiao laughed and said, For the moment, the new goddess has just been sealed off. In addition, the cultivation is still too low to be able to convince the crowd, and he still can't direct the adjudication division. Even if Zhang Ruokan finds her, in the absence of conclusive evidence, what can he do? Can't us? 
The pale man touched his beard and nodded, Yun Zun thinks, will Zhang Ruo can really attack Jianese realm? Should it? Father God once said that Zhang Ruokin's ranking on the God Reserve list is very low because of his deep-hearted spirit. If he fails to fulfill his promise, he wants to become a and die nine lives. Martyr. Pale Zian smiled and smiled, it is better that we order now to put corpse poison into Jianese boundary, and turn it into a realm of undead ghosts. In this way, Zhang Ruokin must be mad and think it is interesting. Raised her arm shook her, and said, Kill, you can't just be fun, this is the best choice. Zhang Ruokin claims that why would he want to rob the South Sword Realm? How can this be? The pale child froze, and then reacted, with a sinister smile at the corner of his mouth, Very good, very good. If Zhang Ruokin dies in the South of the Sword, he can't blame us. Dang! Dang! Receiving a message from Ji, the guard of the goddess palace quickly rushed to surround Feng Qiwen. Fifty guards, all wearing blood armors and holding spears, surrounded the whole Feng Chuang, and the armor was like a mirror, which killed the knight and was dignified. Guard the night city of Vatican City and hit the ground with a spear. Wow! Under the ground, dense sacred inscriptions and matrix inscriptions emerged, and he shouted sharply, received a secret report. Someone in Feng Quivan killed three sacred goddesses in the goddess building to accompany him. The Lord came out by himself and escaped. Or should we go in and do it ourselves? The guards dispatched and alarmed many monks. Their mental strength, one after another, went in the direction of Feng Quivan. Who the is it that dares to kill in the goddess tower, and it is still in the holy land to accompany him? The landlord of the goddess building, but a very powerful person, has a deep relationship with the Temple of Death. Noisy here, no matter who he is, will not end well. Squeak! Feng Qiwen's door opened. Zhang Ruokin took a black dagger and walked out of it. The evil curse dagger was temporarily suppressed by Zhang Ruokin, but still, it exudes terrible evil power. Fifty guards felt only the darkness before them, and all the lights were swallowed up. They couldn't see anything they could only hear the sound of a curse. Night Vatican City was built to be strong, able to block the evil power of the evil curse and dagger, and saw the appearance of Zhang Ruokin. His face changed slightly, and he quickly bowed down and saluted, saying, I've seen Ruokin. Zhang Ruokin's gaze looked for a while, and soon found the three people, Wu Xing and Wang Ziyi, on the wing of Gui Yan Wan, and smiled at them. Then he stared at Night Vatican City and said, The three escorts were not killed by me, but by this dagger. Do you believe it? If Dachin said this, I naturally believe it. But, can Dachin go with me and explain to the landlord himself? Ye Fanchinj said humbly. Sorry, no time. Zhang Ruokin went straight out. Night Vatican City took a step and stopped his way, saying, since the great saint said that they were killed by this dagger, can you give it down? Always give the landlord an explanation. This dagger can't be given to you. The landlord wants to explain, you can ask the, the pale child, and the evil star, look for me, I can't give any explanation. Zhang Ruokin's tone was peaceful, but the momentum emanating from him imperceptibly caused the guards present to breathe. The goddess Lu clearly knew that it was the puppet, the pale child, and the evil star who settled in Feng Shiwen. Now that people are dead, but they only look for Zhang Ruokin, what does it mean? Besides, the top emperor-level killer of the skyscraper organization can be swayed and appeared in the powerful goddess building of the Intelligence Information Network. To say that this matter has nothing to do with goddess building, Zhang Ruokin did not believe that he was killed. Get out. Zhang Ruokin said. With these two words, Ye Fanchinj's ears seemed to be exploded with thunder, his face became pale and his body was shaking. In the end, he moved away and made way for Zhang Ruokin. Zhang Ruokin straightened his shirt and walked over. It wasn't until Zhang Ruokin went away that the fifty guards felt the pressure lightly and breathed a long sigh of relief. One of the guards was quite stubborn, and said coldly, Master Guard, 
can you just let him go? Killing anyone in the Goddess Tower will punish you no matter who you are. A lot of monks are staring at it. Even if Zhang Ruokan leaves like this, what is the majesty of the Goddess Building? In the future, how will he stand in the realm of fate? Another guard said. Ye Fanchenj didn't want to confuse Zhang Ruokan to see the landlord. However, the landlord all personally transmitted a voice and asked him to let Zhang Ruokan leave, and of course he could only do so. In the final analysis, the goddess tower is a dark force that cannot see the light, and dare not be too aggressive in the destiny realm. In the capacity of Zhang Ruokan, it really made a big deal. The last unlucky man must be the goddess building. Return to Yan Wan. The pale man laughed and laughed, the trick of respecting the respect is really brilliant. Zhang Ruokan is so mean, and the goddess building really can't help him, but he also offends the goddess building. Offending the goddess building is also offending the palace of death. Zhang Ruokan has no choice. If he compromises with the goddess building, the Yuanhui genius will be stigmatized. It is not only his face that is lost but also the face of the god of blood and the god of Fulu. Instead of losing face, it is better to let the goddess building shame. Wo Xin Road Pinglin looked at the departing Zhang Ruokan, and said, Fighting with Yuanhui level genius, the fun is endless. Out of Feng Quivan, Zhang Ruokan was thinking whether there was a way to get rid of the puppets, the pale suns, and the evil stars in one fell swoop by relying on the assassin of the organization. But in the end, I was too cautious, and almost wiped out all the evidence. With a bad curse dagger, they couldn't bring them down. Zhang Ruokan exhaled a long breath, and as far as he could see, he saw a burly 60-year-old man standing in front of him. The 60-year-old man stood by the water, nodded and smiled at him, and said, Old Yan Hanyi, I've seen the horse. Zhang Ruokan had seen Yan Hanyi and he followed Luo Shengtian to the goddess building. Yang Luo monks. Yan Hanyi nodded and said, the horses need not be so strange. The Yan Luo tribe is very big. The monks are numerous, not all of them are all loyal to the Yan Luo tribe. Responsible for teaching body style and spreading the light. Being able to be a teacher of Luo Shengtian and Luo Yan is by no means easy. Zhang Ruokan said, don't call me a horse, I don't plan to marry your princess. She married me. All the same, all the same. Yan Hanyi seemed to be a very good speaker. At least when he faced Zhang Ruokan, his face always smiled, and said, His Royal Highness God, I want to see you. It was not strange that Feng Xing made a noise just now, and Luo Shengtian knew it. Zhang Ruokan didn't need to guess and knew why Luo Shengtian was looking for him. Nowadays, how could it be easy to let him go by grabbing the handle? Zhang Ruokan refused clearly and said, I have some other things that I need to do urgently. Rather, you should tell me where the emperor is stationed, and then see me when I'm done. So. Yan Hanyi showed a difficult look. Eventually, he knew that he could not coerce Zhang Ruokan, and promised, Okay, His Royal Highness the Emperor God is Poinsettia. Poinsettia. A strange color flashed in Zhang Ruokan's eyes. Poinsettia is the flower name. Luo Sheng spent it. I didn't see that there was such a swaying heart under the solemn appearance of the godly prince. Horse, leave. Yan Hanyi's body disappeared instantly. Zhang Ruokan was surprised, Yan Hanyi was too fast, and seemed to move faster than space. After all, Space movement has a process of mobilizing the Holy Spirit. Is this the highest speed in the Holy Realm? Even if it is lacking, it seems to be a lot worse than him. Zhang Ruokan was very confident and could escape in the hands of any monk in the Holy Realm. However, in the presence of Yan Hanyi, can he really get away? Yan Hanyi left silently, and Gu Shijing appeared silently. She stood in the shadow of a broad-leaf silver maple tree by the water, like a ghost in the night, and said, You are weaker than I thought. I have reminded you that you are still falling into your calculations. Zhang Ruokan laughed, Is that it? I'm not going away with my whole body. 
your pursuit is to retreat from the whole body? Do you know that you have offended the goddess building just now and lost your face? I know, of course I know. The host of the goddess building is a woman, a very powerful woman. Okay. Then you know, women's eyes are generally not big? Great women have smaller eyes. If you let her lose face, she dares to let you lose her life. Zhang Ruokin didn't take it seriously, and asked, You are also a terrific woman. Is your heart small? Gu Shijing's eyes were as cold as frost, and she said, Your luck is very good. A major event happened recently in the goddess building. The landlord should have no effort to ignore you. What's the big deal? Zhang Ruokin asked. This is not the place to talk, come with me. Gu Shijing's body dissipated and turned into a ray of scarlet glow, entangled Zhang Ruokin's body. Zhang Ruokin watched while guarding. Gradually, his sight was completely covered by Hungzia, and he couldn't see anything else. What is she doing? Zhang Ruokin was uneasy, and her fingers were condensed into a net annihilation fire, and she was about to break open Hungzia. Suddenly, Hungzia dispersed. Zhang Ruokin found that he actually appeared in an antique room with walls full of calligraphy and famous paintings. In the northeast corner, there is a fan-shaped screen. Gu Shijing stood by the window, watching the scenery outside. Zhang Ruokin said, What method did you use just now, how did you get tangled up and you came here? I clearly felt that there was no spatial fluctuation. If you lend me enchanted stone carvings, I will tell you the secret. Gu Gu Jing said. Zhang Ruokin came to the table and sat down, You still tell me first. What happened to Goddess Building? Gu Shijing was very straightforward, saying, About one month ago, the great Saint Tanfei of the Shura tribe won five superb crystals in the casino of the Ice Goddess Building. Ordinary crystal, one can exchange ten stones. But a superb crystal, one can exchange for a thousand stones. It was recognized at the time that the five crystals were the ultimate source crystals. Zhang Ruokin couldn't maintain the relaxed state just now, and said solemnly, How is this possible? Since the disappearance of the Source Temple, no monk can major in the path of the Source to become a god. Other gods who also practice the path of the Source can gather the Source God Crystal, but also can not condense the best. Gu Shijing said, So this incident caused a huge sensation. Some people speculate that the Source Temple has been born. For such a big thing, the gods in heaven and will be shocked, right? Zhang Ruokin said. The birth of a permanent ancient temple, Zhang Ruokin can imagine that the gods will definitely shoot, and there may even be a large-scale divine war. Gu Shijing said, yes, if you let the heavenly world know that the origin temple was born, a large-scale divine war is bound to be inevitable. However, there is no evidence to prove that the origin temple has been born. Jing's news has been tightly sealed. All the people who should be killed are dead. Zhang Ruokin chuckled, the news came to you. I don't believe it. It can be blocked. The whole community knows no more than twenty forces. The reason they knew it was because when the supernatural source Jing Jing was born, the monks of these powerful forces immediately passed the message to the gods. Road. Zhang Ruokin said, Luo Ziwiun is one of them. In Luo Ziwiun mountain realm, under the divine realm, only I know. Gu Shijing said. Zhang Ruokin said, why are you so easy, tell me the news. Because to find the source temple, you need your help. Before waiting for Zhang Ruokin to speak, Gu Shijing continued, in order to find the source temple, five superb source crystals are the key. Zhang Ruokin said, from the five superb source crystals, Calculate the location of the Source Temple. Gu Shijing nodded, then shook her head, and said, Only the superb Source Crystal can't predict the position of the Source Temple. It also needs the blood of a Source Controller to be a primer. Do you know why, the gods think that the Source Temple is likely to have been born? It is because, in the last 10,000 years, nine Source Controllers have emerged from Heaven and Hell. In the past, there were not so many Yuan conferences. 
and there should be some monks who did not reveal the identity of the original master. Spiritual speculation is that the Source Temple is actively choosing the future master. Zhang Ruokin shrugged and said, I don't seem to be able to help such a big thing. You can't help, but you know the Source Control. Gu Shi quietly said. Zhang Ruokin said, Confirmation, but I have been killed. I'm not referring to Yan Wushan. Gu Shijing turned around, staring at Zhang Ruokin with eyes, sharper than the knife. Of course Zhang Ruokin knew who Gu Shijing was referring to, and was silent for a long while, and said, I have two questions. You ask www.mtlnovel.com first, more than a dozen forces, know this. There are only five supernatural source crystals, how do you divide them? Gu Shijing said, Tonight. All forces gathered in the goddess building to fight for the ownership of these five superb source crystals. Second question, this involves a permanent ancient temple. Even if I still guess, I think it should be presented by the gods themselves. Why did you come from this group of monks in the sanctuary? Zhang Ruokin thought a little funny. Gu Shijing said, I have already said that once the gods in the heavenly realm receive the wind, a large-scale war of gods is inevitable. Recently, it is an extraordinary period. They are monitoring each other's movements. Once the gods in the world have changed, they must be noticed by the gods in the heaven world. What extraordinary period? Zhang Ruokin asked curiously. Gu Shijing said, You don't even know the news that the Jade world is about to open. Zhang Ruokin shook his head, indicating that he did not know. You don't know the news opened in the Yahuang world but it's actually normal, that's a big event in the world of the Divine Realm, and it has nothing to do with me and other holy monks. Gu Shijing said. Zhang Ruokin said, These secrets, I want to know one or two. It's not a secret, you just need to ask God of Blood and God of Blood, they will tell you. After thinking about it, Gu Shijing still said it, saying, Yahuang Realm is one of the five prehistoric civilization relics in the universe, where you can find things that help the gods to survive the Yuan disaster, so for the whole heaven and the world of Godland is a great event. Every who is worried that the Yuan will not be destroyed will definitely go. The longer the gods live, the more they will go. Although they are built to be strong, they will be more difficult if they want to survive the Yuan. Even if you have the confidence to pass the gods who will be stricken by the next Yuan, you must go. Because a Yuanhui in the Yahuang world is only opened once, and any opportunity to enter them must be seized. Zhang Ruokin took a sigh of coolness and finally understood the significance of the opening of the Jade World, saying, Don't you say that all the gods in heaven and have to go to the Jade World? Gu Shijing shook her head and said, In theory, indeed, every deity breaks his head and wants to go. However, and heaven do not believe each other. How can they not leave some deities and cope with unpredictability? Variable? How many deities are left, and which ones are left, need to be carefully controlled. It is precisely because this matter is so important that in this critical period, heaven and will stare at each other's gods, and they must not be leaky. If the gods in the world are dispatched on a large scale because of the original temple, will the heaven world not notice it? So investigating and searching for the source temple can only be left to the monk's office. Zhang Ruokin thought secretly that it would not be difficult for the three gods of the Blood Master family to survive the next Yuan, so there is no need to rush to the Yahuang world. However, the God of Blood Extreme War has just become the great clan of the Blood Heaven clan, and he must take the team to the Yahuang realm. Between the mother-in-law and Pluto, there should be one left in the family. Zhang Ruokin said, you should go to those who are the source control, not come to me. You tell me these, do you want to force me to cooperate with you? No, even if I don't tell you, you will soon know that the Blood Master family was originally one of the forces that knew the news of the superb source crystal. Gu Shi quietly said. Zhang Ruokin's eyes narrowed. The news of the best source crystal came from Ice King. The family's huge power in Ice King is unknown, and it is strange to know the news. However, the power of Ice King is under the control of Suanqi, 
the true wife of the blood zest god. It is very likely that Xian Shi did not inform the blood zest of this matter. Gu Shijing continued, after Yan Wushan's death, the heavens, and together, there are a total of six originators, and three in. Wait a minute, I remember you said earlier that in the past ten thousand years, heaven and have borne nine masters of origin. Even if Yan Wushan died, there should still be eight. Zhang Ruokan said. Gu Shijing said, Yan Wushan can die. Is it true that the other masters are immortal? Genius has always been the main target of assassination in heaven and hell. Zhang Ruokan laughed, You're right. Gu Shijing said, There are only three alive masters in hell. The illusion of the dead is too young, and has just reached the semi-sacred realm. Based on his cultivation, it is too difficult to find the source temple. Hundred miles and thousands of nights at the Shura temple, Shiwu has reached the top and is a first-rate power in the sacred realm. Coupled with the strength of the Shura temple, he told him the news, where is my Luozhu Yunchen realm thing? The last one belongs to the Yan Luo tribe. Yan Huangtu got the moon first near the water tower, how could I have won him? In fact, these three are not the best candidates. Although they are the masters of the source, how close is the source to the source? Zhang Ruokan knew that Gu Shijing's fancy was the heart of Beiwa Fairy Givenchy. According to Shen Lian, born in the void of the universe, without roots and leaves, it is the power of the essence of heaven and earth condensed into a little, turned into a lotus seed, and a lotus flower blooming, is the innate source control. It can be said that Givenchy's heart is the spirit of the source and the embodiment of the source power. If she gets a superb source crystal, it is very likely that she doesn't need the gods to run the horse at all, and she can sense the direction of the source temple by virtue of the breath on the crystal. Zhang Ruokan said, Since I am qualified to compete for the best source crystal, why should I cooperate with you? Because of your current practice, you can't protect Givenchy's heart. She's coming to to help you, it will only be a dead end. But with me, under the divine realm, I am afraid that there is no monk who won her. Snapped. Gu shot a flick of her finger and the space shook. Around Zhang Ruokan, the space was like broken glass with cracks. With a bang, he brought the table in front of him and the chair underneath, and at the same time fell into the dark and boundless void, like a small island. Zhang Ruokan wasn't shocked on the surface, but in his heart he was shocked to the extreme. You know, this is the realm of destiny. With the cultivation of the Qing Sheng Grand Holy, none of the space can be destroyed in such a large area and it can enter the void space. Gu Shijing can do it. What does this mean? Zhang Ruokan took a deep breath and spread his arms, releasing space power. Immediately after the space was closed, the broken space returned to level, and he returned to the room just as if nothing had happened. Although Zhang Ruokan was very fond of the Source Temple, he also knew that if he met Givenchy, Givenchy would likely come. However, it was impossible for him to put her at risk because of the incident. Zhang Ruokan sighed, Unfortunately, Ji Fangzi and I can only be regarded as ordinary friends. She is pure and clean, and is a fairy who does not eat the fireworks on earth. I am a betrayal of the heavenly court and joined the world. She's afraid she already thought of me as an enemy, and wanted to kill me, and then hurry up. You found me, but you found the wrong person. Gu Shijing said, I have collected a lot of information about you and her. I think you should have misunderstood the words of ordinary friends. Why don't you believe me? Zhang Ruokan said. Gu Shijing said, I believe more in the charm of Yun Hui level genius. There should be few women who can reject you as a perfect man. You're useless to praise me, Zhang Ruokan said. Gu Shijing said, I know what you are worrying about, rest assured, the goal of Luozhu Yunchen and I is the Source Temple. Although the ancient ancient gods are rare, the Source Temple is too far away. I can swear in Luozhu's name that I will never do anything against her. Zhang Ruokan smiled and shook his head. Luo Ziwiyun's monks will not do anything against her. Zhang Ruokan still shook his head. Neither Luo Ziwiyun nor me will instruct other monks to do anything against her. 
Gu Shijing saw that Zhang Ruokan still did not loosen his mouth, and his tone became a bit cold. He said, Zhang Ruokan, you still didn't realize one thing, the moment the supernatural source Jingjing Jing appeared, she was already involved. It's impossible to stay out of this vortex. Do you think Luo Ziwiyun can't capture her without passing you? With strong strength, Luo Ziwiyun Mountain World will indeed pay a certain price, and it is even possible that the news of the birth of the Source Temple will be exposed. However, you cannot deny that the probability of success is very high. Once she is caught, it will be life or death, honor or shame in the future, it's not you Zhang Ruokan who can decide. Zhang Ruokan's eyes were slightly sinking. Of course he understood that Gu Shijing was true. At that time, Luo Luo in the realm of the Holy King could freely enter and leave the realm of truth in the core area of heaven. For the origin temple, Luo Ziwiyun Mountain must go to the heaven core to catch people. The probability of success is indeed not small. Gu Shijing said, not only Luo Ziwiyun Mountain World, but also Hell World, more than a dozen forces know the news of the birth of the Source Temple. How could they let Givenchy go? Maybe, there are already forces and they have begun to act. You thought you were protecting her. Actually, it was because of your inaction that you would harm her. Besides, the birth of the Source Temple is a huge opportunity for her. If she knew the news, she would definitely go even if she was at risk. Why don't you give her the option? Zhang Ruokan smashed the case and sighed. I have to say that you have not only cultivated a lot, but the word front is even more powerful. I was almost touched by you. Do you think these reasons are not enough? Gu Shijing said. Zhang Ruokan shook his head and said, No, that's enough. But, your cultivation is too powerful, and I have no sense of control when working with you. Givenchy's heart is the Ancient of Lotus, and you recognize that I have stone carving. What's the difference between the two of us walking with you and being a tiger? So you don't believe me, Gu Shijing said. Zhang Ruokan said, I can't believe you. The whole room became quiet, and neither of them spoke a word. Outside the room, footsteps sounded. Han Yunja's voice came from the outside, saying, Auntie shoot girl, it's over there. Gu Shijing stared at Zhang Ruokan, and said, the battle for the five superb source crystals has begun. Would you like to go with them? I'm not interested in the origin temple, so I won't go. Zhang Ruokan knew very well that Gu Shijing would surely follow him for a while. And at this moment, it was the only time he had the opportunity to arrange something. After Gu Shijing left with Han Yunge, Zhang Ruokan moved out of the room, changed his appearance, and quickly left the goddess building. Kang Ye waited on the shore of the lake outside the goddess building. After the gambling of Yan Jaxian, the seven-handed old man, and the white girl ended, Zhang Ruokan asked Kang Yun to leave the goddess building immediately to avoid retaliation for his reasons. What is the identity of the boss? He said, someone is going to be against me, it must be true. Kang Ye carried a huge cricket head, pacing back and forth while hiding his breath. He was not worried about Zhang Ruokan's safety, but he was worried that Zhang Ruokan had forgotten his little brother. He was a monk who had ascended to the world of hell. He had no background, no teacher, no backing, and he encountered his predecessors and was abandoned. What should I do? In the jungle. Zhang Ruokan's body emerged silently from the space, calling out, Kang. Kang Zi was overjoyed and rushed over immediately, laughing. Boss, I thought you didn't want me. Boss. Zhang Ruokan was wondering, this guy is really familiar. Seeing Zhang Ruokan's unwillingness to accept him as a younger brother, Kang Yu suddenly lost his eyes, and said in a discouraged way, Yeah, I am a holy king who has ascended to the world and has nothing. How can I be a younger brother? Zhang Ruokan has long seen that he is an ascended person, and the breath on his body is completely different from those of the Shulu monks who were born and raised in the Shulu Star Column. Zhang Ruokan patted his shoulder and said, You don't have to be arrogant. You can fly from the netherworld to the monasteries of Shura Star Column. All of them are extremely talented. 
just like the sword of Feng Chen thousands of years ago, he is the ascendant. Seniors know Feng Chen sword god. Kanju couldn't help but showed worship. Zhang Ruokan said, I don't know. Feng Chen sword god has soared to the Shulu star column for less than a thousand years and already has the power to cut god. Where can I compare with him? Kanglu said. Zhang Ruokan said, if you help me do one thing, I will not only accept you as a younger brother, but also give you enough training resources to give you the opportunity to peep at the Supreme Avenue. Really? Kangyu was so excited, almost roaring, two claws grabbed Zhang Ruokan's body and shook it vigorously. Zhang Ruokan was like a rock, without moving, saying, if you shake again, it won't be true. Kangyu quickly let go and smiled awkwardly. Zhang Ruokan said, I need you to go to the Kunlun Realm Merit Battlefield immediately. Your cultivation does not reach the Great Holy Realm, so you can enter it. What to do? Kanglia asked. Zhang Ruokan said, send me a letter. No, help me find someone with a message. Delivering a letter is too dangerous, what if it is intercepted? That man is a monk in heaven. Kang Zhen asked. Zhang Ruokan was surprised, and said, how did you guess? If you are looking for a monk in the world, where is the boss's practice, where do I need to do this one-sided monk? And, the boss is willing to pay such a large price to cultivate me as a holy king. Obviously this is a very serious matter. It's important and dangerous. King Yan said. Zhang Ruokan stared at him deeply and smiled, you are smarter than I thought. An ascendant without a backing and background, not only has to be a puppet with his tail in it, but also be smarter, otherwise he would already be dead. Kang Yu said with a sad face. Zhang Ruokan said, this matter is indeed dangerous. You can choose not to go to www.mtlnovel.com Why not go, my Kang Pai is a gambler, and it is my boss who deserves it, and gave me such an important task. If I am timid this time, in the future, I will never have a chance to see the road again. The boss is assured that if the real thing is revealed, I will not let the information leak even if I explode the holy source. Immediately after, Kang Ye whispered, Boss, can I ask a personal question? You ask, Zhang Ruokan said. With a look of anticipation and a little nervousness, Kang Ye licked his lips and said, Boss, are you Zhang Ruokan from time to time? Zhang Ruokan's gaze turned to him. Kang Yu immediately retracted his head and said, I. I. I just heard that someone was talking about Zhang Ruokan appearing in the goddess building and killing people. Then think of the boss, you are the master of space, and you let I went to send a letter to the monks in heaven, so I guessed this way. You can't blame me if you guessed wrong, don't you say? No, you are not wrong. Zhang Ruokan said. Zhang Ruokan led the Undead Blood Tribe to win the first place on the Tian Tian battlefield. It was a brilliant show. After returning, it was the divine marriage and the killing of Yan Wushan. The fame may not be enough to deter the uncle and pale. The most powerful of these great saints, but for the Kang Yu in the realm of the Holy King, the impact is too great, as seen in heaven and man. Wow! Zhang Ruokan shook his body and restored his original appearance. Seeing his true body, King Yun was almost fainted with excitement, and immediately knelt down on one knee, and said, King Yun would like to follow the boss all his life, his brain, and his brain, and then die. Zhang Ruokan took a new leaf from the heaven and earth and took out a white jade box. The new leaves were put in a box and banned with space power. Zhang Ruokan handed the box to King Yu, and said, Go to the Kunlun Realm's Merit Battlefield and give it to Ji Fangzhen in the Kunrui Realm and tell her that someone wants to see her. If she still remembers her old relationship and she still trusts her old friend, within three months, head to the Hundred King Royal City on the edge of Hell's Border and have a cup of 100 flowers. If Givenchy's heart is no longer in the Kunlun Realm, you go to the Endless Abyss, find a woman named Kong Lan Yu, and tell me what she said. Then, Leave it to her. Understand. Kang Yan secretly breathed a sigh of relief, 
the original boss just wanted to meet with the old lover. Taking the box carefully, he said, Boss rest assured that I will send it to the hands of the Fairy of the Hundred Flowers at the fastest speed. The news of the birth of the original temple was too close, and Zhang Ruokan couldn't utter a word to Kang Yu, let alone involve too many people. In the Kunlun realm, Zhang Ruokan absolutely trusted, and there were few strong monks. Kong Lan Yu is the most suitable candidate. Even if everyone in the world does not believe him, Lan Yu must be the one who believes him most. After Kang Yu left, Zhang Ruokan was thinking, how to deal with the next situation. Don't worry about the Jianese boundary. In Feng Quivan, he deliberately revealed his determination to force Jianese realm, but in fact he just wanted to hold him, making him feel that he could use Jianese realm as a trap to deal with him. Since then, the creatures in Jianese realm have been temporarily safe. As for the Source Temple, although Zhang Ruokan was interested, deep down, he still felt empty. Now, there are only five superb original crystals. Whether the original temple was born or not, I am afraid the gods are not sure. Looking for Mu Lingzi and the King of the Slayer who appeared on the ice planet is Zhang Ruokan's current concern. However, before going to Ice King, Zhang Ruokan decided to do something to shake the mountain. Lest anyone dare to challenge him. The world has the power of the gods to sit in the town. The number is as large as the 8,000 world in heaven. However, there are only a dozen or so forces who know the news of the supernatural source Shen Jing. The Palace of Longevity is not one of them. Therefore, after the plan against Zhang Ruokan failed, the Pale Child left the Goddess Building. As the great saint of the 10,000 dead and one life, he is a first-class existence, and of course he does not bring guards. Zhang Ruokan thought that Wanzi would go to the space teleportation array near the Goddess Building and leave. However, beyond his expectation, the Pale Child didn't actually send the array, but converged his breath, and quickly rushed along the tributary of this river, which seemed to matter. You should know that the Temple of Destiny is quite wide, while the metamorphic city is relatively remote, with a large area and a sparse population. Only the Goddess Building has a large space teleportation array. Once you leave the Goddess Building, you only need to walk on foot to reach another city. What are you going to do? Zhang Ruokan did not hurry to follow, quietly followed. Down the river, the channel became wider and wider. After about 30,000 miles, it became very barren and showed signs of fighting. The river was frozen, the blood-colored mountains on both sides of the river collapsed, and thousands of miles turned into red fire fields. Such a scary picture makes people scary. The most frightening thing is that before entering this area, Zhang Ruokan didn't even feel the battle fluctuations at all. Undoubtedly, there are mentally powerful characters who cover up the battle fluctuations and prevent them from being noticed by the law enforcers in the Temple of Destiny. The time when the fighting broke out should be within half an hour. How powerful is the confrontation in order to cause such destructive power? Why disregard the ban of the Temple of Destiny and fight in the Realm of God? How does the Pale know that fighting broke out here? Zhang Ruokan was full of doubts. Suddenly, he saw the Pale Child stopped on the frozen river, and his palm shot down. Oh! A large piece of ice broke, and a blood-red water column rushed up. At the top of the water column is a corpse. Zhang Ruokan was surprised when he saw the appearance of the body. It turned out that the Thousand Enlightenment Sacred Halls of the Shura Temple had thousands of punishments. Xin Jian was in the Gambler's City of Goddess Building, because he offended the seven-handed old man of God of Gamble, willing to be his servant for thousands of years. Even so, he is still the great saint of the Shura Temple, and even a disciple of the Spirit. Who dares to kill him in the realm of destiny? The point is, why kill him? Pale Child grabbed the corpse's neckline and sneered on his face, saying, What a pitiful fellow, who has suffered such innocence. Zhang Ruokan saw that the pale man must know what happened here, so he no longer waited, took out the purple gold gourd, and secretly urged. The pale man saw the danger and his face changed drastically. Wow! 
A purple gourd hovered above his head, and 72 million space matrix inscriptions emerged from the mouth of the gourd, forming a large array of space with a diameter of 800 miles, which illuminated the night sky as bright as day. Zhang Ruokin The pale child looked up. Boom! The space collapsed, and the pale child was immediately collected into the gourd. Taking Zhang Ruokin's current practice as his example, he may not be the opponent of the Sage of a Thousand Dead Lives without using the power of Qianqin Realm. However, this battle was not a head-to-head -head confrontation, but a sneak attack using the Supreme Holy Grail. Naturally succeeded. Zhang Ruokin just grabbed the purple golden gourd, and in the gourd, a loud noise was heard that made his arm hurt. If you are a child, you are in a state of peril and you dare to imprison your husband. Do you want to find death? The pale man growled in the gourd. I don't know, what holy art he has performed, the purple gold gourd is getting bigger and bigger, from one foot tall to one person tall to the size of a house. Of course, Zhang Ruokin was not afraid that the pale child broke through the purple gold gourd, hummed gently, and pressed his palm against the gourd wall, turning quickly. Just after more than ten turns, the pale child couldn't carry it, making a strange cry. What kind of gourd on earth are you, why is the time flow so fast? Stop! Stop! Every turn of the purple gold gourd can cut Xiao Yuan for a hundred years. The pale child was so badly injured that he couldn't resist any more, and the purple golden gourd became smaller again. Zhang Ruokin did not stop, but turned dozens of laps. The pale man was very angry at first, yelling and yelling in the gourd, but after Xiao Yuan lost a lot, his heart became afraid and his voice softened, the matter of the goddess building has nothing to do with the husband, it's a sloppy idea. What do you retaliate against me? Can't turn any more. Although the corpse repair is a monk who died once, but there is still Xiao Yuan, my body is almost rotten. Zhang Ruokin, I can give you whatever you want. Zhang Ruokin did not expect that the pale child, a man who died 10,000 lives, was so weak that he surrendered so quickly, and was about to take the opportunity to ask his doubts. Suddenly, Zhang Ruokin felt a terrible breath coming quickly. His face changed, he quickly sealed the purple gold gourd, moved the exhibition space, and hurried away. Instead of going to the goddess building, I went to the city where the monks are closest. Shortly after Zhang Ruokin walked away, Monk Black Veil landed on the river bank like a lightning bolt. Although the Turtle Lord is an emerald stone tortoise, the speed is not slow, but it is extremely fast. He runs quickly with two legs like a duck and appears on the other side of the glacier. Its two eyes turned and stuttered, empty. 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 It's the stamina of space power, and it's also the breath of Zhang Ruokin. The monk of black gauze sounded pleasantly yellowish, but with a bit of chill in his tone. Lord Turtle widened his eyes and pointed at the broken glacier. He said, the body, the body. Xing Jian's body is gone. However, Zhang Ruokin will not use such a mighty space force because of a corpse. If I didn't guess wrong, it should be that the pale man came up and let Zhang Ruokin run into this. Hey yarn monk! Lord Turtle said, for. Why? Because, among the monks who know this, there are only those who have something to do with Zhang Ruokin, said Black Goss. Lord Turtle no longer spoke, and cast a direct look at the what to do next look. Rest assured, my mental strength has been chased after him. It depends on whether this time and space passerby has a reputation. The Black Goss on the monk's body was scattered and the jade-white brilliance condensed into a sacred cloud, covering her dim and charming body. Every inch of skin was as bright as fairy jade, and the black hair swayed like waterfall. Her temperament was bleak, like the clouds in the moonlight, the pearl in the water, and no one could see her. Wow! Under his feet, the holy atmosphere containing the five elements and the origin permeated, and swept in all directions. In her mind, it emerged that there was no terrain or landform before it was destroyed. So, where the holy air flowed, the frozen river melted, 
the collapsed mountains re-emerged, and the fire field went out. In the soil, densely packed five-element original particles flow out, condensing various plants. For a moment, everything that was destroyed was restored, as if fighting had never erupted here. If Zhang Ruokin did not escape, he would be shocked to see this scene. At that time, Qian Xing Tian Niu also demonstrated the mystery of the original way in front of him. All matter can be reduced to the original particles and condensed into another form. However, compared with Bai Ching'er, her original accomplishments are as bad as fireflies compared to the scorching sun, which is 108,000 miles behind. When the origin and the five elements are combined, plant life can even be produced instantly. General Zhu hurried back. Although he was tall, his speed was a lot slower than Lord Turtle. He asked, Girl, I still haven't found a seven-handed old man. That old guy will not have been beaten to death by your palm. Is that right? Bai Ching'er shook his head and said, As a of gamblers, if he didn't even have this life-saving strength, he would have died already. But the girl's mental strength is not much weaker than him. If he is still in this area, how could he not find him? General Zhu said. Suddenly, Bai Ching'er frowned, and said to himself, Escaping. Who escaped? General Zhu asked curiously. Lord Turtle showed his proud look. There was something you didn't know, so he said arrogantly, Zhang. Zhang. It's Zhang Ruokin. This kid does have a little skill, and the cultivation of Bai Realm already has the strength to escape from my spiritual power. Bai Ching'er said. General Zhu dismissed his tone and said, even if he has condensed a second-class sage, it can only be regarded as excellent. The true Yunhui level figures are only the Lord and the bloody old thief. To shut up. Bai Ching'er didn't want to listen to it, mentioning that name. Yes. General Zhu shut up quickly. Hey. Lord Turtle snickered. Bai Ching'er closed his eyes and meditated for a moment, and suddenly, he thought of something, and said, I see. Just now we all went to chase the dummy of the seven-handed old man, but ignored the body of the thousand punishment. The girl meant that the seven-handed old man was hiding in the body of a thousand tortures. General Zhu said in surprise. Bai Ching'er said, this is the only possibility. The body of a thousand tortures, was taken away by Zhang Ruokin. General Zhu Zhou www.mtlnovel.com Bai Ching'er was quite decisive, and said, General Zhu, you go to the adjudication department immediately, no, go to the of death palace, told the high priest of death that Zhang Ruokin killed the Qian Wenjing Sheng Sheng Qian Xian of the Shura temple and captured the pale sun in the temple of the longevity. Can the death shrine step in? General Zhu said. Bai Ching'er said, the high priest of death can contain the high priest of Fulu, and he can also mobilize the relationship between the ruling division and Zhang Ruokin. I'm afraid that the high priest of death is unwilling to step in, because after all, the true cause of death is not difficult to investigate. General Zhu said. Bai Ching'er said, so you have to go back to the goddess building and let the landlord go with you. It is impossible for the high priest of death to not give this face. Girl, how about you? General Zhu asked. Bai Ching'er said, after all, Zhang Ruokin is a character with a large background. To clean him up, he must add more charges to him. The drama in the Goddess Tower tonight can just be used. A month ago, the superb source Shenjing appeared in the Goddess Building, a stone stirred up thousands of waves, shocked more than a dozen powerful forces, and sent the core children of the Holy Land to rush. However, there are only five of the best source crystals. How to allocate? Which five forces are entrusted to? It is precisely because this matter is of great concern and difficult to handle that it has been dragged on until now. Although the gods did not show up in person, they were already discussed behind the scenes. The forces with closer relations have also talked secretly, and secretly formed alliances to discuss the distribution of benefits. It seems that there are more than ten forces. In fact, small groups have already been formed. 
Those who have not entered a small group, it is obviously very difficult to fight for a superb source crystal tonight. Tan Fei, a thousand enlightenment saints of the Shura tribe, gambled on the goddess house a month ago and won five superb crystals worth five thousand stones. However, as some people recognize that the five superb crystals are the original attributes, everything changes. A man is guilty and guilty. He fell from the peak of excitement to the bottom of fear. He saw with his own eyes that dozens of monks of small influence were killed by extermination and washed the ground with blood. He didn't see any more monks who were killed. This is a major event that cannot be missed. The reason why Tan Fei is still alive is because more than a dozen monks of great influence restrain each other. Everyone wants to swallow the five superb source crystals alone, but no one dares to really take them. Therefore, for one month, five superb original crystals have been placed on him. He was imprisoned in heavy seals and had to wait for death. Because he knew that when the distribution results came out, he would be the next person to be killed. Tan Fei held five superb original crystals in his hand, sitting in the center of the stone platform. Under the stone platform, one after another came in, Yan Huangtu, Luo Shengtian, Xing Xing, and Gu Shijing. They represented a large force in one group, in groups of three or five, and looked towards the original crystal in Tan Fei's hands. The small five crystals, however, are likely to be the key to finding the source temple. Someone whispered and chuckled, the goddess Twelve Fang is fairly honest, and it keeps the five superb source crystals very well. Don't they be honest? The idea of playing five of the best source crystals is to die. Bai Ching Er was wrapped in black gauze and appeared to a corner not far from Shi Tai. I do not know what mystery was performed, her body is completely invisible and does not emit any breath. Lord Turtle stood next to her, and in the air carved out a series of space inscriptions, which turned out to be a space monk with a high level of accomplishment. The clues of the Temple of Origins must not be leaked out. Originally, I wanted to put all these things on the seven-handed old man. Unfortunately, there are plans to change now, and only Zhang Ruokan can be used as a scapegoat. Whether it's a gambling game against the seven-handed old man or hunting down Zhang Ruokan, everything is behind the Source Temple. Into, to, have. Lord Turtle raised his head and stared excitedly at Bai Ching Er. In front of it, a space array method with a diameter of about one meter is suspended. Bai Ching Er said, the seal that imprisoned Tan Fei was laid out by seventeen powerful monks. Are you sure that your space matrix has penetrated through seventeen layers of seals? Lord Turtle looked confident and nodded hard. Okay, let's do it together. I've never tried it before, killing a great question with a dream. Bai Ching Er closed his eyes, his slender white hands extended from the black gauze. The center of both hands condensed a group of illusions. Tan Fei, sitting on a stone platform, was in a very good state of mind. Suddenly, he became exhausted. His eyelids seemed to be heavy and closed slowly. No monk knew that Tan Fei's twin pupils appeared bloodshot and fell into a terrible dream. The point is, he didn't know he was in a dream and thought he was still awake. Nightmare does not come because you do not want to sleep, you will not come. Gu Shijing noticed something wrong with Tan Fei and looked suspiciously towards Shi Tai. Wo Xing and stood together, staring at Gu Gu with poor eyes. Wo Xing yelled, Gu Shijing, what do you want to do? This voice shocked all the monks under the stone platform. Some people took out the soldiers, some gathered the holy arts, all eyes were fierce, and they were all guarding against Gu Shijing, fearing that she would try to force it, and devour the best source crystal. Gu Shijing is about to speak. Bai Ching Er and the Turtle Lord, shot at the same time. A space wormhole mirror surface appeared in front of Tan Fei, sweeping in all five superb source crystals. Someone used space power to penetrate the 17-layer seal and stole all the original crystals. Gu Shijing's pupils were full of light, and immediately turned around, looking around, looking for the monk who stole the source crystal. How easy is it to penetrate the 17-layer seal? 
she was sure that the person who shot was not only highly accomplished in space, but also nearby. Zhang Ruokan, you don't want to kill me, die, let us all die together. Tan Fei, sitting on the stone platform, shuddered and shouted, stood up suddenly, a powerful Shura war spirit erupted in his body, and the immortal sacred body shattered an inch, releasing a brighter glory than the star. All eyes were staring out of their eyes, and shouted in horror, Escape, escape, run away, Tan Fei blew up the holy source. A great enlightened saint who blew himself up must destroy the world. If the distance is too close, the great saints who have died a lifetime will have to die, and the great saints of immortality will have to pay a heavy price. Sing Sing, Yan Huangtu, Luo Sheng Tian, etc., all are battle-hardened characters, smashing through the wall like lightning, rushing out of the room, just want to stay as far away as possible. Gu Shijing was closest, but did not run away, but instead formed a palm print and pressed out. Wow! The palm print was printed, forming a light wall covered with magic lines. In the other two positions, there are also extreme strong shots. Each of them holds a weapon, urges it to its full strength, and releases the domain at the same time. Yan Yu held a black umbrella and broke through the wall of the house, blocking the fourth position. Boom! Tan Fei blew up from the holy source and formed a devastating force that hit the defensive wall formed by the four strong men. In addition to Gu Shijing and Yan Yu, the other two retreated back and forth, the area released was constantly broken. Yan Yu looked up and looked up, whispering bad. They blocked the four directions of east, south, west, and north, but the destruction force formed by Tan Fei's self-explosion would still escape from above. Although the scope will not be too wide, it will certainly sweep the entire goddess's palace, and I don't know how many monks will die as a result. Suddenly, five colored brilliance illuminate the sky. In a white suit, Bai Ching'er stepped on the colorful clouds and fluttered down from the sky, forcing the violent destruction force back. The five strong players shot together, each blocking one side, such as sealing the energy of Tan Fei's self-explosion in an invisible box. The ground and the ground were engraved with defensive formation inscriptions, but they were still torn. Raging energy poured into the ground. Well. The goddess building is built in a lake and covers a vast area. At this moment, huge cracks appeared on the bottom of the lake, and they swallowed up the water. The formations in the goddess building are activated one by one, emitting dazzling brilliance. The nearby buildings remained unblocked and turned into ruins. Although the casualties were not large, the entire goddess building was destroyed by about a third, and the palaces collapsed, and countless monks fell into panic. What happened, who dares to fight in goddess building? Just now, I seem to hear that a monk shouted, Zhang Ruokan killed him. Zhang Ruokan is so ignorant of the heights and heights of the sky, that he really thinks that God of Blood can do whatever he wants to do in the world? Do N.T. know, the cripples slaughtered by the Kishan tribe were too arrogant and destroyed the bottom line rules of the destiny gods and died under the axe of verdict? Zhang Ruokan must have provoked anger this time, and almost destroyed a city in the destiny realm. No one could save his life. The storm has not subsided, Bai Ching'er has retreated and returned to the Peacock Palace. Five superb original crystals are suspended in her palm. Tonight's events will surely alarm the gods, and they must absorb and refine these original crystals as soon as possible without leaving any traces. She is the master of the source. As long as the refinement absorbs the superb source crystal, she can naturally find the source temple. Those other forces will have no chance. No, this, this is just an ordinary original crystal not the original five superb original crystals. Bai Ching'er's deep state of mind was suddenly broken, his face changed and changed. How could this be? Lord Turtle, who has always stuttered, was also taken aback by surprise and uttered a smooth sentence. After all, Bai Ching'er was not an ordinary woman. She calmed down quickly and said, Who is watching Tan Fei this month? Every force has dispatched manpower and goddess 12th place dispatched Chi Tiangao. 
Lord Gi knew that something was bad and returned. Chi Tiangao is still alive. Alive. Get him here, I want to question. Lord Turtle is very clear that the girl has spent countless efforts and energy for the origin of the temple. In this way, the two operations failed in succession, and all the arrangements and arrangements made before were afraid of failing. Soon, Lord Turtle brought Chi Tiangao to Bai Ching Er. Meet White Girl. Chi Tiangao dressed in black and bowed to salute. Bai Ching Er didn't want to waste time questioning, saying, Don't resist, open your sea of consciousness, I must know everything that happened during the past month of guarding Tan Fei. Kishan Gao said, OK. Bai Ching Er poked out a hand and grabbed it in isolation. Suddenly, Chi Tiangao's memory bubbles flew from the eyebrows, and kept flowing to her. After a while, Bai Ching Er checked all the memories of Chi Tiangao in the past month. Chi Tiangao said, White girl can rest assured that no one can approach Tan Fei. Tan Fei, not only our guards, but also a 17 layer seal imprisonment. Bai Ching Er carried his hands and shook his head, saying, You are wrong. Space forces can penetrate the 17th seal. Zhang Ruokan. Chi Tian exclaimed. Bai Ching Er shook his head again and said, Although Zhang Ruokan's spatial accomplishment is very high, but his mental strength is only 65, he cannot do anything under the eyes of a group of powerful men. If I am not wrong, the shot was supposed to be a seven handed old man. That old guy, I really underestimated him. He might have seen my plan for a long time. As a gambler, how can you not be proficient in space? When the five superb source crystals appeared in the Goddess Tower Casino, Bai Ching Er found the source of the supernatural source gods flowing out through layers of analysis. It is the seven-handed old man known as the of gambling. However, Bai Ching Er didn't believe that the five superb original crystals were exported by seven-handed old people. You know, the seven-handed old man has never lost. The information network of Goddess Twelfth Square is developed, and it is quickly found that the seven-handed elderly have spent countless stones in the past 3,000 years to buy various life-saving treasures. The amount of stone is large enough to shock the gods. Bai Ching Er made a bold guess that the seven-handed old man had spent all his wealth in order to continue his life. Therefore, it was necessary to take out five supernatural source crystals, in exchange for another elixir from the hands of another gambler. So that the superb source of the crystal, appeared in the casino. In order to confirm her speculation, she used colorful coral trees as bait and set up the tonight. The first is to win the seven-handed old man with a sum of stones and see if he has the ability to pay for them. Secondly, Bai Ching Er suspected that the seven-handed old man had already visited the Temple of Origin, and the superb essence of Jing Yuan was taken out of the temple. Moreover, the reason why the gambling skills of the seven-handed old man is so powerful is likely to be because of the treasures obtained in the Source Temple and the ability to see through the Source. So her second purpose is to see if the seven-handed old man has the original power. It turns out that the seven-handed old man has at least the ability to see through the origin of life, so we can know that there is a breath of life inside the colorful coral tree. In fact, from the beginning, Bai Ching Er's main goals were all seven-handed elderly. As long as he caught him, he could naturally find the Source Temple. As for the five superb Source Crystals, she intends to destroy them all. In this way, only she can find the Source Temple. Unfortunately, the seven-handed old man escaped and was taken away by Zhang Ruokan into a purple gourd. So she had to take the second step and take the risk, and in the name of Zhang Ruokan, she stole five superb source crystals. At the same time, the landlord and General Zhu were asked to ask the high priest of death to remove Zhang Ruokan. It is a pity that Bai Ching Er counted thousands of counts, but did not count the seven-handed old man as a treacherous man. He first dropped off five of the best source crystals, which caused her a loss. Lord Turtle was extremely nervous, and said, Girl, what should I do now? The more nervous it is, the less stuttering it is. For the sake of today, I can only go to Zhang Ruokan. Let's make a decision first, 
and take away the seven-handed old man and five superb source crystals. I hope I have time. Bai Ching'er's heart is firm www.mtlnovel.com No matter who it is, as long as she stops her from searching for the source temple, she is the enemy. The only thing she was worried about now was that the five superb original crystals fell into Zhang Ruokan's hands, and then fell into the hands of the adjudication department. Once the ruling division has swallowed the superb source crystal, where can other forces have a chance? As for the pale man and the old man with seven hands, she was not so worried. Pale child knows little. And the seven-handed old man. As long as the five superb source crystals are not exposed, who knows that seven-handed old talents are the key to the secret of the source temple. The love of the two dusts fades out of sight as the smoke and dust disappear. Now Zhang Ruokan and Prujna meet in hell, will the love of the two dusts resurrect? Follow the WeChat public account Fishinyu and reply to the keyword double dust to view. It's a powerful spiritual force. Fortunately, the power of Kyunkin realm has been used, otherwise it will be difficult to get rid of her. Who on earth is she who dare to kill a thousand enlightened saints in hell? Zhang Ruokan was chased and killed by Bai Ching'er's mental power all the way, and finally, he fled to the densely populated city of the monks, changed his appearance, and was able to escape. The white girl was obviously skeptic. Seeing her swearing not to kill Zhang Ruokan, she changed her position elsewhere. Even if all the monks in the entire city were killed, Zhang Ruokan would be found out. Back at Hanhai Manor, opening the Seven Star Emperor Palace, Zhang Ruokan immediately released the pale child from the purple golden gourd. Zhang Ruokan asked, Say, who is that white girl? Why did she kill Qian Qian? Pale Zi Xiao Yuan lost a lot, his body was rotten, lying on the ground, his breath was weak, and he looked sick. Don't say. Okay, it's worthless to keep you, just give me death now. In the palm of Zhang Ruokan's palm, a scorching hot flame of extinction erupted. Pale child's face changed greatly, and he said, Zhang Ruokan, this is the realm of destiny. If you dare to kill me, the adjudicator will never spare you, and the palace of eternal life regards you as your enemy. In any force, the great sacred world of Qunwen realm and ten thousand dead realm is one of the few masters. If it is in the cold world, the practice of the pale child is enough to be included in the top ten of the entire world. Luna ranks first, and he is at least eighth and ninth. If the pale sun is killed, one can imagine how angry the Changsheng temple would be. Dare you kill me, why can't I kill you? Zhang Ruokan flicked his fingers, an array of net annihilation fire fell on the pale man, burning his body, and making a cricket sound. Zhang Ruokan didn't think about it, he was going to search for the memories of the pale sun. This is not the battlefield of hunting the sky, the important memory of the pale child must be protected by the power of the gods. Moreover, the pale man is not the weak, but the great saint at the beginning of Wan Chen's life. His mental strength is also very strong. Although he is very weak now, Zhang Ruokan dares not to belittle him. In the event that the memory is searched, it will be worth the loss. You want to kill me, do you deserve it? Pangs's eyes were full of anger, and his mouth was shaking with shouts, and the dense rules of the Holy Spirit burst out of his body, condensing into seven Tao palaces, suppressing Zhang Ruokan. No matter how powerful a genius is, it is impossible to defeat the great saint of a lifetime of death with the cultivation of Bai Realm. In the view of Wanzi, he was captured by Zhang Ruokan only when he was attacked. Really fighting, even if he is very weak now, there is still a fight. As for the rumors, when Zhang Ruokan and Yan Wushan fought, a power approaching the Supreme Holy One broke out. In his opinion, it was completely based on rumors. Nonsense was impossible. Zhang Ruokan shook his head, and the armor of Vulcan came out automatically. The body was full of divine power and kicked out. A dense pattern of flame gods emerged from the left leg, and the power of the gods' legs exploded completely. Boom! The path of the pale child collapsed, the seven Tao palaces were torn apart, and the body flew out, 
hitting heavily on the formation wall of the Seven Star Emperor Palace, and fell to the ground again. How, how could it be so strong, your power? The pale man looked at Zhang Ruokan who came over step by step, his eyes were shocked. With the power that erupted just now, even if he is in the peak state, it is not an easy task to catch. Zhang Ruokan was burning all over, and the temperature in the palace became extremely high, like a copper furnace, and said, Give you one last chance, do you want to say it? The pale man knew that in his current state, he would definitely not be able to escape the Seven Star Emperor's palace. Zhang Ruokan had to be stabilized first and said quickly, Say, I say. Zhang Ruokan was not a hard bodied man. He must have been tortured by the white girl and his mental will collapsed. Otherwise, how could a slave be in the Peacock Palace? Such people will not have the opportunity to become gods in this life. Zhang Ruokan said, It's best not to talk nonsense, I, I have no patience. After I have spoken, can you let me go? Wanzi asked. It depends on what you say, what value it is. Pale Child lowered his head, pondered for a moment, raised his head again, and said, the identity of white girl is actually not a secret. In the world of hell, many monks know it. She is the queen queen of the twelve gods, the contemporary ruler daughter, Bai Ching Er. Sure enough, his status is not ordinary, no wonder he acts so recklessly. Zhang Ruokan snorted softly. Pale Sun said, there are rumors that the father of white girl is likely to be a great god. Of course, this rumor has never been proven, and the possibility of falsehood is relatively high. Many monks feel that Goddess Twelve is just thinking in the name of the great god of desolation, deter all parties. The lion-like dog guardian Ling Zun lying outside the palace door of Kixing Emperor Palace suddenly lifted his huge skull, two bronze bell-sized eyes looked around, looking for who was talking about it. A girl in the sky. Zhang Ruokan's eyes narrowed, his eyes were much sharper, and he said, Why did she kill Qian Qian? The white girl really has to deal with is the seven-handed old man. Seeing Qian should be killed by his hand. Wanzi said. Zhang Ruokan said, Why should she deal with seven-handed elderly? This. Wanzi said. Oh. In the palm of Zhang Ruokan, the annihilation of the annihilation flames burned again. The pale man narrowed his neck and quickly said, I don't know the specific reason. I think it should be because the seven-handed old man won too many stones in the casino under the goddess twelfth place. Therefore, the white girl will take action against him. Zhang Ruokan smiled coldly, You are so easy to cheat when I am? If it was only for the stone, how could that white girl take the risk of killing Sun Qian? After I captured you, she came to chase me and wanted it's never easy to kill people. Maybe Sun Qian was just killed by her. Seeing Zhang Ruokan still staring at him with a bad face, the pale child trembled, The pursuit of you should be because you discovered the secret that she killed Sun Qian and you must die. Zhang Ruokan said, but before she chased me down, I didn't know who killed Sun Qian. The pale man was almost driven crazy by Zhang Ruokan, biting his teeth and said, if you are the great saint, I really don't know what is going on. You spare my life, and I will help you take the south of Jian. What do you think? Zhang Ruokan frowned and fell into thought. Bai Ching er must have a great plan to deal with the seven-handed old man. However, the pale child is only a subordinate controlled by her using Dreamland, and it should be impossible to access the core secrets. The pale man again said, If the dust is great, I know that you are the dragon and the phoenix among the people. In the future, you must achieve the supreme avenue of gods. A big hand. Zhang Ruokan glanced at him and said, using people like you is too risky. The pale man sank, realizing that it was not good, and anxiously said, the great saint of the dust. Well. Zhang Ruokan pressed his palm against the head of the pale child, and the net extinction fire continued to flow from his palm, wrapping his body as if burning an old corpse, emitting a foul odor. Wanzi wanted to explode the holy source, and died with Zhang Ruokan. Unfortunately, 
his mental strength is not as strong as that of Zhang Ruokan, and his consciousness of thinking is suppressed by death. It didn't take long for the pale child to burn out, and there was only one holy source left on the ground. Hurry to absorb and refine the holy source. Zhang Ruokan threw the holy source to the magic sounds that were merging the body. The source of the sacred life of the mortal life, but it is impossible to find, the magic sound gladly accepted the past. The killing of the pale sun is to give a warning to those monks who intend to deal with Zhang Ruokan, but it must not leave any traces, or at least cannot be grasped by the verdict department. In the world, it is really weak and strong, killing is rampant. However, killing monks as powerful and background monks should still be more subtle, and should not be too brazen. Yao Qing, a master of disarmament in the adjudication department, was trained to achieve a life of 10,000 years ago. He only obeyed, the Divine Law Enforcement Ruling, one of the top ten rulings of the division. Divine Law Enforcement Rulings, and directly obey the ruling deities, is responsible for managing the order of the entire destiny deities. The upper priests of the twelve shrines can be sanctioned, and all monks who violate the rules of the destiny temple can be killed. It can be said that the law enforcement ruling of Divine Land is the existence of monks of all ethnic groups who are afraid. Even the Son of God and the Goddess will choose to retreat when they see him. Yao Qing, with the complexion of Taiking, led a law enforcement team consisting of dozens of people, wearing armor and holding a holy sword to surround Hanhai Manor. The two masters of land disarmament who reached the pinnacle of Qianwen Realm, the master of Xian Xian and the master of Dong Jun, stood on the left and right sides behind him, respectively. Under what circumstances, there are so many strong people in the adjudication department, which actually surrounds Hanhai Manor. Yao Qing Zhen, the leader of the disarmament, came down, and absolutely something happened. The Lord of Disarmament can arrest the Son of God and the Goddess, but the Lord of Disarmament can arrest the existence of the God's wives and concubines. If he refuses to arrest, he can directly kill him. Zhang Ruokan was too arrogant and arrogant in the realm of destiny, and finally suffered from the evil. Except for a few monks who stayed to watch, more monks stepped back and judged the murderousness of the monks, making them feel unwell. I opened the door and walked out of Hanhai Manor. He looked intently and was taken aback by the breath of the cause on the outside law enforcement group. However, thinking of Zhang Ruokan's noble status in the world, the fear in his heart is a little less. He said, What do you mean by surrounding Hanhai Manor? The master of Xian Xinjun gave a cold drink open the formation and take the order of the ruling master to capture Zhang Ruokan. Suddenly in his heart, as the grandson of the blood-threatening god of God, God's god-given Tian Jiao himself, the adjudicator said that he would go for it. At the moment when he was hesitant, Yao Qing emerged an impatient look and pressed out with one palm. With a bang, the inscriptions of the formations blocking in front of them shattered, and the ground where Hanhai Manor stood was shaking. The matrix method laid out by the matrix mage was instantly broken. Also a sage of 10,000 lives, Yao Qing is more than 10 times stronger than Wanzi. With his hands on his shoulders, Yao Qing walked towards the gate of Hanhai Manor and said, As a great holy slave from heaven, I saw three judges approaching, but he did not kneel. Death. He was frightened and was dragged away by two law enforcement officers. Well. His head was cut off by the holy sword. The sword of judgment can exterminate life, even if you are the great saint, you can kill it with one sword. As the heavenly pride of the faction of heaven once, at this moment, it turned into a headless corpse, and fell on the crimson steps, and the holy blood poured out like a pillar. The monks onlookers were uproar and backed again. The blood of a great saint finally awakened them and made them realize that this time the ruling division was real and would not be dreaded by Zhang Ruokan's special identity. Zhou Xian, Shen Tu Yung Kong, and Xixi were shocked and rushed out of the manor, just to see the scene where Xian was beheaded. If the three men's hearts were hit by heavy hammers, they would immediately kneel on both sides of the gate. It was not until this moment that they clearly realized how vulnerable their lives were in the world 
and a ruling army leader could say a word about their life and death. Yao Qing was as straight as a gun, entered Hanhai Manor, and came under the Kixing Emperor Palace. Zhang Ruokin was already standing in front of the palace gate, staring down at him condescendingly. Yao Qing expressionless, saying, Zhang Ruokin, if you are smart, don't resist, go with me to judge. Zhang Ruokin spread his palms, revealing the fate and order, and said, in my capacity, even if the ruling division wants to take me, must I give a reason? Yao Qing and all law enforcement officials bowed together and worshipped Zhang Ruokin. Worship is not Zhang Ruokin, but fate. After worshipping, Yao Qing's figure stood upright again, and said, the ruling department received the message. You killed Jian Qian in the Temple of Shura and captured the Pale Sun in the Temple of Eternal Life. Do you recognize these two things? Zhang Ruokin only knew that the relationship between the Goddess Tower and the Death High Priest was inverse, but did not expect that even the power of the ruling division could be mobilized. Recognition, of course, is impossible. Zhang Ruokin said, these two things are nothing but people. Some people want to frame me. I have no revenge and punishment. Why did you kill him? Isn't the pale child in the Palace of Longevity in the Goddess Building? He. Yao Qing said, since it wasn't what you did, follow me to the adjudication department, and when things are clear, you must be fair. The master of the Xian army and the master of the army held the chain of the gods, stepped on the stairs of the Seven Star Imperial Palace, and walked towards Zhang Ruokin. Boom! On the stairs, a strong white brilliance erupted, and the two main disarmament leaders flew out. After landing, they hurried forward, backed up, and became embarrassed. The Palace of the Seven Stars is a palace once used by the God of Blood, and based on Zhang Ruokin's current practice, he has joined forces with the Guardian Spirit and respect for the Heavenly Desolation, and the Defense Force is strong enough to block the Supreme Saint. How could the two disarmament leaders break in? Zhang Ruokin said with a smile, I am not willing to adjudicate the two military leaders to forgive me. However, if any monk is in trouble, the adjudicator will arrest me for interrogation. Wouldn't I have to stay in my life? In the jail of the adjudication department? So, I suggest that you better find enough evidence, and it's not too late to arrest me again. As soon as he returned to Hanhai Manor, the law enforcement officers of the adjudication department arrived, too fast? To be sure. It was Bai Ching'er who deliberately used the hand of the adjudication division to deal with him. Zhang Ruokin has heard that when he successfully merged the sixth kind of sacred meaning, he appeared the vision of life flowing backwards, flooding the temple, although the god of war in the name of Emperor Badu forced the past. However, with the style of admitting that the secretary would rather make mistakes and never let go, would he miss this opportunity to get rid of Zhang Ruokin? Zhang Ruokin was killed to guard the Destiny Temple. In this matter, Bai Ching'er and the Adjudication Department have the same interests and purposes. If Zhang Ruokin was arrested, he would be executed if he could not reach the Adjudication Department. At that time, even if God of War and his mother have the intention to save him, they are already too late. Now I can only hold fast to the Seven Star Emperor Palace, and it can be delayed for a moment. Yao Qing's face sank to the extreme. In the realm of destiny, there had never been a monk, and he dared to speak with the military leader of the verdict department in this tone. Isn't this the ruling division at all? Zhang Ruokin refused to arrest, and there was no amnesty to kill. Yao Qing's voice, such as squeezed out from the teeth. Give an order. Law enforcement officers of the adjudication department also launched an attack on the Kixing Palace. Of course, Yao Qing knew the Seven Star Emperor's palace, and knew that it was difficult for them to break into them. The reason to attack is to force Zhang Ruokin to resist. Once Zhang Ruokin rebelled, the verdict department could kill him whether he was guilty or not. Zhang Ruokin refused to arrest, please adjudicate the Lord to come in. Yao Qing carved a light beam of communication and passed it out. In order to break the Seven Star Emperor's palace and to kill Zhang Ruokin, it is necessary for the adults to decide to take the shot in person. 
After the five supernatural source crystals were stolen, the monks gathered in the goddess building immediately rushed to Hanhai Manor. However, Hanhai Manor had been surrounded and blocked by the adjudicator, and no monk could approach it. Bai Ching Er stood on a pavilion and said to himself, After all, it's one step late. She was able to ask the High Priest of Death and the Adjudicator to take action, but because both sides had the same goals, they wanted to kill Zhang Ruokin. However, she now wanted to prevent the Adjudicator from capturing Zhang Ruokin, but it was impossible. Seeing the corpse on the stairs, Xue Tu felt only that his scalp was numb and his legs were weak. He said, The Adjudicator, is coming too soon. It's a little too fast indeed. She shot her eyes silently, looking at Han Hai Manor who was constantly making roaring fighting sounds, her eyes were deep, she didn't know what she was thinking. Blood slaughter, my brother must have been framed. Now that you know, you haven't rushed to sue the blood? You thought you could save him. Gu Shijing said. Blood slaughter hesitated, then left quickly. As a post-blood disciple, he certainly has a way to contact the post blood quickly. Blood Slaughter chose to rescue Zhang Ruokin because, in the goddess building, Zhang Ruokin knew he had leaked information, but still rescued him from Gu Shijing's hands. In the beginning, it was indeed his fault to deceive the Supreme Holy Ghost. Blood Slaughter has seen that brother is a sentimental person and not as cold as it seems. Being so harsh on him may just be sharpening his mind. In addition, there is a Yuanhui level talented brother, his blood slaughter will certainly rise in the future. Luo Shengtian walked to Gu Shijing's side, his face was dignified, and he said, It's useless, the gods can't intervene in the mundane world, and it's useless to find blood. At the beginning, Qi Longfei, the slaughter slaughtered by the Qi tribe clan, was in the realm of destiny. A holy warrior of a thousand questions has caused serious deaths and injuries to a monk in an urban area, and hundreds of thousands of monks have fallen. After Qi Longfei was arrested by the ruling department, Qi Tian's clan chief immediately rushed to intercede. After all, she only has such a son, and it is estimated that there will be no more in the future. She has been held in the palm of her hand, and I do not know what it would be like to be drowned. However, the supreme master of the Qi tribe was stopped by the adjudicator. At that time, the adjudicator said something. There is no law. How can the world be forgiven? If the asks for forgiveness, why is the adjudicator needed? Immediately, His Holiness personally chopped Qi Longfei. Gu Shijing said, Zhang Ruokin is clever. As long as he hasn't entered the judgment division, there is still room for recovery. If he can arrive in time after blood, take him back to the blood judgment family, would the judgment division dare to attack the blood judgment family? No way. Luo Shengtian said, if that's the case, Zhang Ruokin would have to hide in the family in this life, and he can no longer go out. Don't you help God's kingdom? Gu Gujing said. Luo Shengtian said, I have sent all the monks out in search of the pale sun and sunkyun. As for the matter of the goddess building, we actually understand that Zhang Ruokin is not so powerful. In the eyes of so many strong men underneath, God stole the ultimate source of the crystal without knowing it, and killed Tan Fei through a 17-layer seal. It must be a very scary character. He can call for the existence of wind and rain under the gods. What if Ruokin really killed Sun Qian and captured the pale man? Gu Shijing said. Luo Shengtian was silent for a long time and said, the ruling division has long been killing Zhang Ruokin. In the destiny domain, after all, it is still the destiny temple. We see ANT help too much. Unfortunately, the blood of war is not in the destiny domain, otherwise he has a strong personality, and the judge will be a bit jealous. Blood to kneel on one knee in the world of blood after the blood, and quickly recounted the cause and effect of the whole thing. Master, you must rescue your brother. Once he is brought into the adjudication department, I'm afraid, the consequences are unpredictable. The shadow of the gods behind the blood is thousands of feet high, like a mountain standing in front of the blood slaughter, saying, the gods cannot intervene in the world, 
and the judgment of the ruling department has always been notarized, and you will not be wronged against your brother. Therefore, you do not need to worry. I heard that the Justice Department had long wanted to kill brother. Shwetu said hastily. After the blood said, even if you want to kill Chainer www.mtlnovel.com the ruling department must show evidence. I believe that Chainer's ability, even if she really kills people, must erase all traces. No for other things, just step back and continue to cultivate as a teacher. The blood slaughter never thought that Master would have such an attitude. At the moment of her brother's life and death, she actually believed in the adjudicator. You still have the mood to cultivate? This is the master who rescued brother S daughter and did not hesitate to fight with Zihook and God? Is the master afraid of adjudication? Abnormal, too abnormal. What is the problem? The strongest method of whitewashing was released, not only did not blame Chi Yao but also hurt her in turn? Pay attention to the WeChat public account Fishinyu. Reply to the keyword the strongest whitewashing and let the black take you to the truth. Divine enforcement ruled that Zhou Yunong rushed out from the billowing black clouds, like a light shuttle, lazing towards the ground. Boom! There was a loud noise. Except for the Seven Star Emperor Palace, all the buildings in Hanhai Mansion collapsed, the inscriptions of the formation method were destroyed, the dust was flying, and the view of the monks present was blocked. The advent is intended to deter. After a while, the dust dispersed, and Zhou Yunong appeared below the Kixing Emperor's palace. Hanhai Manor, once beautiful as a sacred place, turned into a scorched wasteland. Zhou Yunong is a monk of the Ming race. The upper body is a human, the lower body is a tadpole, a shawl with long hair, a handsome face, and a python-like creature wrapped around his arms, one blue and one red. Half a man and a half. Meet the Lord. The law enforcement officers of the Judgment Division all kneeled on one knee. Outside Hanhai Manor, exclaimed, Godland's law enforcement ruling came in person. There is no room for maneuver, after all, Zhang Ruokin is on his own. Seeing Seeing was in a good mood and laughed, I didn't expect that we didn't need to take any action at all. Zhang Ruokin first died in the hands of the adjudicator. Not so happy, shaking his head gently, saying, strange, really weird. Where is it strange? The time has passed so long, why haven't the gods of the Blood Master family appeared? It stands to reason that they cannot give up Zhang Ruokin. Chu Xing laughed, it's not easy. The Yahuang world is about to open. The gods of the Blood Master family must have returned to the world of blood tribal wings to discuss and arrange. At this moment, it is estimated that the news has not yet reached the Blood Heaven Tribal Wings the world. With a dignified face, he nodded. In any case, the law enforcement ruling of Divine Realm came, and Zhang Ruokin did not have a chance to come back. The death of a potential enemy is, after all, a happy thing. Yan Huangtu, Yan Zexian, Yan Yu, and monks of the Yan Luo ethnic group gathered on a wide street. They are so powerful that it is difficult for outsiders to approach. Yan Jaxian stared at the Seven Star Emperor's palace without a blink, saying, the law enforcement ruling of Shenyang dared to capture Zhang Ruokin. He doesn't know what the character of the blood god of war is. Yan Yu said, if the ruling department would compromise or not do anything because of a god, then there would be no need for the ruling department. The ruling person should be ruthless, selfless, and fearless. Yan Jaxian said, Don't you think that the adjudication division appeared too quickly this time? It actually came to Hanhai Manor before us. Yan Huangtu and Yan Yu looked at each other and smiled. Yan Huangtu said, Xian Er, are you worried about Zhang Ruokin? Yan Zexian looked cold, and said, How is that possible? Although Zhang Ruokin's talents are high, he is a despicable person who betrays his position and kills his friends. Such a person deserves his death. However, as far as matters are concerned, there is indeed a lot of suspiciousness in this matter today. For example, Yan Yu said. Yan Jaxian said, first, 
Zhang Ruokan has no injustice and punishment. Why kill him? Second, based on Zhang Ruokan's performance on the Kishin battlefield, he is obviously a cunning and intelligent person. Even if he wants to deal with the pale child, he will never leave a trace, and the judge will find him. What else? Yan Yu said. Yan Jaxian thought for a while, his eyes brightened, and said, There is still the most important point. If Zhang Ruokan had stolen the best source crystal and killed Tan Fei, he would definitely escape the Destiny Realm immediately. How could he return? Go to Hanhai Manor and wait for the Adjudicator to catch him? Does anyone want to frame him? Sienner, in the future, if you encounter a major event, you have to think as much as you do now. Yan Yu smiled with satisfaction. However, who stole the superb source crystal, why should he blame Zhang Ruokan? Could it be? Yan Jaxian's fingers point in the direction of He Sing Sing. Yan Yu said, the two of them really have the motive to bring Zhang Ruokan into trouble. Unfortunately, they did not have the ability to steal the crystal and kill Tan Fei. Yan Huangto looked at Yan Jaxian's abdomen, and touched his chin, and said, Zhang Ruokan is caught in the adjudicator's office, he will probably die. Do you really care about his life or death? Yan Jaxian recalled all the past, and was still full of resentment against Zhang Ruokan, and said, Uncle Wu. I know what you want to say, this child, I can raise it myself. It is a good thing to rule that it would be a good thing if the ruling secretary could really kill Zhang Ruokan. Lest there be a father like him, the child will be scolded at birth, and he cannot raise his head to be a man. The secret of the mother of blood shadow, the less known the better. Even Yan Huangtu and Yan Yu do not yet know the truth. Yan Yu calmly said, Since you don't care, we are happy to stand by and watch the liveliness with peace of mind. Luo Shengtian looked at Zhou Yunong's tall body, knowing that the other party was a first-class figure under the Divine Realm. He could not fight hard, took a deep breath, and said, I'll go to Fula Shrine. It is too far to return to Tian Luo God Kingdom to save Zhang Ruokan. Fulu Temple is the nearest choice. The God of Blood and the Voice of the Sky are all from the Fulu Temple. Even if the Fulu Deity does not intervene in the mundane world, you must remember the incense? No matter how unpleasant he is to see Zhang Ruokan, Zhang Ruokan is now engaged to Luo. How can he, the Emperor, sit and watch? Gu Shijing said, Let us not say, you see ANTC the deity of Fulu in your capacity. Even now, it is too late. Zhang Ruokan refuses to arrest, Zhou Yunong can kill him directly. Instead of rushing to Fulu Palace, it is better to persuade Zhang Ruokan to raise his hand to surrender, and go to the iron prison of the ruling department first. Going to the hell of the adjudication division, is there any chance of survival? Luo Shengtian stomped his feet and said, Is Zhang Ruokan sure to die today? Gu Shi quietly shut up and seemed to be thinking about something. More and more monks gathered near Hanhai Manor. Anyone who hated Zhang Ruokan was smiling and smiling, thinking that he was dead today. There are also some monks who would like to take a shot and rob Zhang Ruokan. It should be noted that the five original crystals are likely to be stolen by Zhang Ruokan, and naturally he cannot be allowed to fall into the hands of the adjudication department. Instead, they are outside the realm of destiny. Perhaps they dare to take the shot and kill the monks of the judgment division. But in the realm of destiny, who dares to act lightly? Yao Qing bowed down and said, the false accusation against the adjudicator, Zhang Ruokan blatantly resisted the arrest of the adjudication department, viewed the adjudication department, and regarded the temple of destiny as nothing. Zhou Yunong nodded, a pair of golden pupils, and looked forward to the Kixing Imperial Palace. I saw, however, Zhang Ruokan's yet heroic figure was standing in the center of the palace gate, wearing a crimson red armor, and he wanted to fight with the judge to the end. It has been many years without encountering such a daring monk. Zhou Yunong said slightly, If you are the son of the dust, you are the of blood, why haven't you made your ancestors dare to act like you? You know, what are the consequences of being an enemy of the adjudication division? 
Zhang Ruokin didn't show fear because of the other person's cultivation and identity, but smiled, I have never been against the adjudicator, it is the adjudicator who wants to kill me. Why is there no reason to add crime? Outside the Hanhai Manor, someone whispered softly, death is imminent, and you can even laugh. Zhou Yu Farm Road, the ruling department has always been fair and will never wrong any monk. Now, this ruling gives you two choices. First, open the defense formation of the Seven Star Emperor Palace, and return to the ruling department with me. The matter is clear, and you are innocent. Second, I personally broke the defense of the Seven Star Emperor Palace and took you back to the adjudication department. You only have three counts. 1. Zhang Ruokin stepped up decisively more than everyone expected, saying, No need to count, you must get me to adjudicate the division, you have to show sufficient evidence, otherwise I can't give up. It's too arrogant. The ruling master asked you to break the Seven Star Emperor Palace now, and his subordinates are willing to personally cut off Zhang Ruokin's head. Yao Qing said. The other law enforcers were also angry. There has never been a monk, so dare not to look at the adjudicator. Zhou Yunong was still calm and calm, and said, Since Dust Chen wants evidence, this ruling will give you evidence. Bring witnesses. A total of seven monks came to Zhou Yunong. One of the Rakshasa monks bowed to Zhou Yunong, and then said, Heavy in the lower Rakshasa prison, in the city of Huazhang, I saw with my own eyes a space array method with a diameter of hundreds of miles. The space power of Zijin Gord. Yes, I was nearby at the time, and I saw Zijin Gord earning two silhouettes. One of them was like a pale man. Another monk said. Zhou Yunong looked at Zhang Ruokin at the gate of the Seven Star Emperor Palace again, and said, Is there nothing you can say now? Zhang Ruokin's face did not change, and he said, Yes, I did use the purple golden gourd in the Huazhang city, but I did not take the prisoner Qian and the pale sun. Besides, where is the cultivation of my hundreds of realms? Got them? Zhou Yunong sensed the breath of the heavenly guardian Saint Guard, and the light from his eyes saw the trail of the Saint Guard appearing in all the streets. He knew that he could not wait any longer. Let's explain these things to the adjudication department. Zhou Yunong's finger pointed at the sky. Suddenly, a spiral of dark clouds appeared above the Seven Star Emperor's palace, and dense thunder and lightning intertwined among them, releasing a destructive power that made the entire city's monks deter and tremble. Just like divine punishment. Boom. A thunderbolt with a diameter of three feet rushed out from the black cloud vortex and struck above the Kixing Emperor's palace. The barren sky awakened like a lion, with a long howl in his mouth, Lian Zhan's palace dares to attack, you are looking for death. The tiles, pillars, walls, and window lattices of the Seven Star Emperor Palace all appeared dense lines, bursting out a dazzling light, and confronted the pillar of lightning that fell from the sky. The entire palace shook constantly. The seven-handed old man stood in the temple, his face changed and changed, and said, You, you are too daring. Zhang Ruokin's face was deep and condensed, and he said, The revision of the law enforcement ruling in Shenzhou is very strong, and the Seven Star Emperor Palace will not support it for a long time. You hide it first. Hidden? Where can I hide? The seven-handed old man regretted it, knowing that he should not have hid in the body of Xing Qian. Although he avoided Bai Ching'er, he encountered Zhang Ruokin, the master of death. The world of Qunkan. Zhang Ruokin said. The seven-handed old man asked, What, where do you say? A door to space opened in front of Zhang Ruokin. He urged, If you don't want to be caught by the adjudicator, go in quickly. The seven-handed old man had no choice but stepped into the door of space. The voice of the burial gold and white tiger came to Zhang Ruokin's mind from somewhere, You seem to be unable to stay in the destiny realm, otherwise I will help you and escape from this place. Variables have occurred, please wait. Zhang Ruokin also noticed the sacred guard of the destiny division. Once the destiny division intervened, there was still room for maneuver in this matter. Sure enough, 
there was a dispute between the Destiny Division and the Adjudication Division, and the two sides were in a row. Maintaining the order of God's domain is the responsibility of our Destiny Division, and we should give Zhang Ruokin to us. Zhang Ruokin killed Sing Qian and captured the Pale Man. He chose the law of the temple and should be sanctioned by the Adjudication Department. The Lord Xian Jun and the Puppet Monarch are both Qian Wenjing Sheng, who will keep all the saviors from the outside. Not long after, the two sides broke out and fought. Tian Ming Si did not have a master sitting on the town, and was put down by a large number of Xian Junzu and Sun Monarch. The main arm of Xian Jun held a tomahawk and stepped on the foot of a destiny guardian in a great holy realm, grinning, just by your group of goods, the destiny division still wants to compete with the adjudication division? You are suitable, stay in Shen Chan, do the janitor. Ha ha! The monks of the adjudication division laughed. The adjudication division and the destiny division have been fighting for many years. Both sides have deep grievances and they have the opportunity to suppress and humiliate each other. You're admiring the division, so good tone. A majestic sound, like a thunder, blew from the sky. A white light appeared between heaven and earth, making all monks momentarily blind. Boom! Master Xian Jun felt only a wave of air, hitting his chest. Suddenly, his body flew out like a cannonball, fell under Zhou Yunong's body, was inlaid into the ground, his armor was broken, and his body was bleeding. Wait until everyone returns to vision. I saw, headed by Emperor Yuiyu, the 100,000 Saint Guard was wearing armor, standing in all directions of the Seven Star Imperial Palace. The light was bright and st. Zhou Yunong stopped attacking, and his eyes fell on Wu Yueming Huang, sighing softly, Why is Tian Ming's secretary trying to intervene in everything? Wu Yu, aren't you retreating? I heard that there is a big event in Chennai. Natural Emperor is going to go out of the customs. Yu Nong, hand Zhang Ruokin to my Emperor. How about this matter to be investigated by our destiny department? Wu Yu ordered the Emperor. Zhou Yu Farm Road, no. Zhang Ruokin commits a felony and must be handled by the adjudication department. The Emperor Yuiyu guessed that Zhou Yunong would not let go easily, and said, The two of us fighting here is not a solution, it will only make the monks laugh at it. Why, Zhang Ruokin chooses who to go with. Zhou Yunong shook his head www.mtlnovel.com The words were stern, You better not get involved in this matter, I do it all for the temple. What a coincidence. The Emperor also wanted to do something for the temple. Wu Yu's eyes looked like electricity, facing Zhou Yunong. Although the two top powers in the Divine Realm did not fight, the aura that erupted on the two had already collided together. Murder and warfare are brewing, and in the air, lightning, wind blades, and death fires appear. The law enforcement officers of the ruling department and the sacred guard of the destiny department also broke out the sacred power, and they made a sound like a thunderous sound when they met together. Neither side conceded, and the war broke out. Wow! Prujna drove a winding meandering river, flew from a distance, landed not far from Zhou Yunong and Wu Yueming Huang, and said clearly, both the Judgment Department and the Destiny Department belong to the Temple of Destiny. When is the Optimus Pillar of SI, what time do you face? It is better for the Goddess to personally interrogate Zhang Ruokin. If Zhou Yunong and Wu Yueming Huang were present alone, with their cultivation and identity, they would not sell the face of the newly born goddess. No matter how great the rights of the goddess are, they are immortal. They can command them. They are characters who may break the divine realm at any time. However, Prujna picked exactly when the two were present at the same time, and they could not compete. The timing was very good. As long as Zhou Yunong and Wu Yueming Huang promised to be judged by her this time, in the future, the great saints of the whole Destiny Temple, those commanders or military masters who have a thousand questions and a thousand lives, will definitely become unwilling same. The goddess will no longer be a bauble. Zhang Ruok enchanted, if it can be judged by Her Royal Highness, the verdict and the jury of the Emperor, it should be fair and just, 
and of course I would like to go with you. During the talk, the array of inscriptions of the Kixing Emperor Palace faded away, and the light gradually faded. Zhou Yunong and Wu Yuemenghuang felt that the trial by the Pruchna goddess was a compromise, so they both agreed. Zhang Ruokan, Wu Yuemenghuang, Pruchna, Zhou Yunong, as well as thousands of law enforcers and sacred guards, went to the temple of the goddess of fate. Chu Xing whispered coldly, Zhang Ruokan is very lucky, god of destiny and Pruchna are mixed in at the same time. It is not easy for the judge to kill him. I can't seem to be lucky. His eyes were deep and pointed. Wo Xing was surprised, and said, How do you say? Tao, let's not talk about this first, Zhang Ruokan's life can be taken at any time, but there is only one source temple. Finding the best source crystal is the most important thing. Isn't divine origin Shenjing stolen by Zhang Ruokan? Xing Xingdao said. Road, is Zhang Ruokan so stupid? He stole the best source crystal, but returned to Hanhai Manor specifically, waiting for everyone to contain him. The evil star came back and nodded, this is indeed a strange thing. Secretly, said, you sent someone to check immediately, from Tan Fei's explosion to the source of law enforcement forces, who has visited the adjudication department during this period. After thinking about it, he added, during this period, monks who have entered the Mountain of Destiny, it is best to check it, there may be surprises. Do you suspect that someone is in trouble with Zhang Ruokan? The person who is in trouble is the one who stole the best source crystal. Wo Xing rode. She patted Wo Xing's shoulder and said, let's break up. Go to Destiny Mountain, and I'll go to the area where the Zijin Gourds said by those witnesses. Zhang Ruokan had already ruined the corpse of Wanzi and Xing Qian, Zhou Yunong and Wu Yueming Huang naturally did not ask the result. The witnesses Zhou Yunong looked for only saw the large array of purple gold gourds erupting. He did not see at all who was taken into the gourds. Zhang Ruokan claimed that he was charged with two sacred slaves, which was to deal with the past. Is it wrong for the slaves to escape and become masters and use the purple gold gourd to take them back and suppress them? Hand over those two sacred slaves? I'm sorry, I've killed it, and it's gone. The trial was deadlocked. Mr. Zhou Yunong laughed, well, there is no proof, Zhang Ruokan, you dare to let this ruling search the soul and explore your memory? As long as your memory is no problem, you can leave immediately. When speaking, Zhou Yunong's mental strength was released to form a powerful sacred power, and his body was as tall as a true giant. Zhang Ruokan can withstand his might, let alone his coercion? Exploring my memory? Zhou Yunong, how brave you are, do you want to peek into the secrets of the Blood Peer family, or do you want to learn from the practice of stealing the Blood Peerless God? Really insulting the children of the Blood Peer family? Zhang Ruokan urged the Blood Evil Spirit into the belt of God of War. Suddenly, the simple and unbelievable belt on the waist was full of blood, releasing the air of spirit and the idea of God of War. Behind Zhang Ruokan, it condensed into a pair of blood-red bat wings. God of War Belt The monks in the temple of the goddess were all shocked. No one had thought that the god of blood extinction actually gave such important things to Zhang Ruokan. Where is it like treating a grandson who just returned from heaven? Even if you are the eldest son of your uncle, you may not receive this treatment. Zhang Ruokan took out the destiny decree and said, my celestial destiny is a combination of the twelve deities, representing the will of the twelve deities. Although I am not a monk in the destiny temple, I can count it. Are you the most honorable guest of the temple of destiny? Have destiny, and have been searched for souls. Who will want this token in the future? Who will work for the temple of destiny? Who will put the twelve deities in your eyes? You do not use me as lord. Zhou Yunong shot the red copper table case with sharp eyes like a sword. Zhang Ruokan said, Want to search my soul, yes. But, do you dare to let the Lord Huang search the soul? Wu Yuming Huang rubbed his fingers, showing a eager look. Zhou Yunong smiled angrily, I have done my utmost to work for the temple, 
and I haven't done anything that violates the law. Why should I be searched? Zhang Ruokan said, Since this, then the Qing ruling told everyone that I would tell you, I killed Sun Qian and captured the pale man. Some burial gold tigers used the burial gold to help him cover his memory. Of course, Zhang Ruokan was not afraid of being searched for souls. However, Zhang Ruokan is a Yunhui level genius, the son of the bloodless family, so don't lose face. In the holy realm, a monk was searched for souls, and it was more shame than to kneel. This person, I can't say. Zhou Yu Farm Road. Zhang Ruokan said, Why can't you say? Bring him up. I can confront him and see who killed Sun Qian and arrested the pale man. My emperor thinks that Zhang Ruokan's words are very reasonable. Yu Nong, this matter is of great significance. You still summon that person and let him confront Zhang Ruokan. Wu Yu Eming Huang said with sincere eyes. Zhou Yu Nong shook his head and said, What if he is retaliated by Zhang Ruokan? I will never pay this person. The Emperor Wu Yueming wants to say that it is better to let the Emperor search your soul and find the answer in person. After thinking about it, it's not realistic, just let it go. Trial, again deadlocked. Zhou Yunong shifted the topic and said, In the Goddess Building, you killed Tan Fei. Tan Fei? Who is Tan Fei? I have never heard of it. Zhang Ruokan said. The master of the Jun army standing in the lower left corner of Zhou Yunong said, Tan Fei is the great question of the Shulu tribe. He died in the goddess building. He yelled out your name and claimed to be you. Kill him. Are there any worse injustices? Zhang Ruokan said. The chief of the Jun army showed his anger, and said, You said it was a marriage disaster? Who do you think would be willing to sacrifice a great sacred god? and marry a great sacred god. Of course Zhang Ruokan knew who Tan Fei was, so he took his heart and said, Excuse me, can you describe in detail the surroundings of Tan Fei when he died, the monks present, and the manner in which he died? This. The chief of the army looked at Zhou Yunong. Zhang Ruokan learned from Gu Shijing that the five superb original crystals are in the hands of Tan Fei, so the monks who are expected to participate in the battle for crystals will definitely not publish the truth to the public. Zhou Yunong and Wu Yueming Huang are both deeply thoughtful and must be able to detect the clue. Who is hiding? Why conceal? What happened, forcing a great enlightened saint to explode? And why are so many holy strong men gathered tonight in the goddess building? As long as Zhou Yunong and Wu Yueming's minds are attracted to the goddess building, they will not keep staring at Zhang Ruokan. It seems that the High Priest of Death has concealed more important things, but he regarded me as a knife to remove Zhang Ruokan. What kind of character Zhou Yunong was extremely displeased in his heart and burst of cold light on his body? Wu Yuma said secretly, Today's matter, most of the Goddess Tower is the center of the storm. Zhou Yunong and Wu Yuming Huang ignored the Prujna and talked to each other for a while. Then, at the same time, they conveyed their will to Prujna sitting in the center. Immediately, Prujna announced, Xian Qian was killed, Wanzi was captured, Tan Fei blew himself up. Three things seriously threatened the order of the destiny realm. However, there are still many doubts, and the goddess decided to send the destiny division and the judgment division to jointly investigate. Zhang Ruokan still has the biggest suspicion and is temporarily detained in the Temple of the Goddess. Zhou Yunong and Wu Yueming Huang each led a brigade and rushed to the Metamorphosis City where the Goddess building was located. In the Temple of the Goddess, only Zhang Ruokan and Prujna were left. The whole world has become quiet. Zhang Ruokan stood below, staring at the cold and dusty new goddess sitting above, chuckling. What's the point of being a goddess? www.mtlnovel.com Prujna had no grief or joy on her face, and said, Isn't it thanks to you? After hearing this, Zhang Ruokan's heart seemed to be pierced by a needle, and somehow he thought of the original Jizi feast. If it wasn't for him to send Huang Yanchen to the position of the realm and to Qi Yao's side, maybe the two would not part ways and break up. Maybe now, the two of them will also have children, or in the Kunlun realm, 
fighting side by side in order to survive. Or bring the old world and the people and people of the central empire of Shengming, and three or five, and fled to the universe to see the prosperity of the starry world. Or, for the sake of children, Zhang Ruokan is willing to give up the hatred in his heart, look down on the life and death of the world, look for a place in the mountains and rivers, and enjoy the peaceful days of the children. However, if that is the case, Zhang Ruokan will not grow up in battle, and it will be even more impossible to get so many opportunities in Kunlun and Hell. The future may be a god, but it is definitely not far away. Zhang Ruokan took a deep breath, withdrew his thoughts, and laughed at himself, Today, thank you so much for being a goddess, otherwise, the decision of divine enforcement will never give me a chance to speak. It's not me who should thank you, but your fiancé, Princess Luo. Why do you think that the Emperor Yu Yu would intervene in this matter? Prujna looked cold and looked out the window. Zhang Ruokan murmured for a moment before whispering again, I was wrong, take back what I just said. Her Royal Highness is not as useless as I see in your eyes. You can know Luo's actions, and you can see that you must have a lot of eyeliners. Look down on you, the means are good, no longer like before, anything can be seen at a glance. Human, if you don't learn and grow, what is the difference between living and dying? Prujna said. The destiny department and the adjudication department are very efficient, and the results were found in less than half a day. Like a slender body like a willow, like a crane in the clouds, noble and flawless. She stood in front of the temple of the goddess, and her hand grabbed the aura of light from the sky, glanced, and returned to the temple. Tell you the good news, Tian Ming Si found Tianese pollen at the place where Tan Fei blew himself up. It is almost certain that the murderer who killed Tan Fei was a seven-handed old man. Zhang Ruokan was meditating with her eyes closed. When she heard this, she was surprised. How can that be? When Tan Fei blew himself up, the seven-handed old man had obviously been put into the Zijin Gourd by him. Is it possible that the seven-handed old man is using a mental power avatar, or is he leaning? Wrong. There are so many strong men gathered in the goddess building. How can a seven-handed old man rely on avatars or corpses? Zhang Ruokan said, with Tianese pollen, even if you judge, the seven-handed old man shot. Three thousand years ago, the seven-handed old man was chased by a pseudo-god, and he used Tianese pollen to escape. Tiananhua is extremely rare. In this Yuanhui, only seven-handed old people used it once. Prujna said. Zhang Ruokan said, I don't believe that only seven hands of old people have Tianese pollen. It is true that some top powers should also store a small amount of Tianese pollen. However, the law enforcement ruling of Shenzhou admitted that the monk who had informed him was the seven-handed old man, so everything was true. The seven-handed old man killed Sun Qian, captured the pale child, killed Tan Fei, and finally gave you the trouble. Prujna wrote. Although Zhang Ruokan already knew that Tian Ming Si would help him, most of the crimes on his body would be washed away, but when he heard this conclusion, he still felt ridiculous and furious. Immediately, a strange look appeared on his face, which made him very funny. Informed. How could it be a seven-handed old man? Zhou Yunong was a wonderful man, and he threw the pot onto the seven-handed old man, giving everyone a reasonable explanation. There is no need to guess, there must be an unknown dark transaction behind this. The worst is the seven-handed old man. People are in the world, the pot comes from the sky. Zhang Ruokan smiled and said, Why did the seven-handed old man kill Qian Qian and Tan Fei? and why did he capture the pale? Where did he go now? This is not something you need to care about. The destiny department and the adjudication department have issued the highest level arrest orders and reward orders for the saints, and hunted down seven elderly people throughout the community. Prujna said. Zhang Ruokan asked, how much is the reward? You will know the amount. Prujna gave him a cross and said, now you can leave. Zhang Ruokan walked out of the Temple of Goddess, exhaling a long breath, thinking while hurried on his way. 
the adjudication department was willing to give up this opportunity to kill him. Then, it must have encountered something more important. Most of them already knew that the news of the birth of five superb source crystals. However, this matter cannot be announced to the public, so it was just announced that the seven-handed old man killed Tan Fei. Why the seven-handed old man killed Tan Fei was vague. However, who in the end left Tianese pollen at the scene where Tan Fei blew himself up? Are you helping me? No, the other person is trying to get rid of the seven-handed old man and transfer all his spears to him. Zhang Ruokin realized that he must leave the realm of destiny immediately. First of all, the strong of the adjudication department and the destiny department will certainly immediately calculate the whereabouts of the seven-handed elderly. Zhang Ruokin knew very well how powerful the destiny was in terms of reckoning. He wasn't sure in his mind. Hiding the seven-handed old man in the world of Qunkin could avoid their reckoning. Only the farther away, the lower the probability that the Shrine of Destiny estimated that the seven-handed old man had fallen. Second, Zhang Ruokin was worried that the adjudication department would have further action. Once he left the destiny realm, the adjudication department dared to deal with him. Then, Zhang Ruokin must kill them without staying, instead of holding hands like he is now. Many monks, standing under the mountain of destiny and seeing Zhang Ruokin leaving unharmed, all showed disappointment. God of law enforcement ruling in person, why not Zhang Ruokin, who else can threaten to get him? Zhang Ruokin is firmly established in the world, wait and see, the next hundreds, even thousands of years, will be his era, all monks will be stepped on his feet one by one. Yes, isn't it? Zhang Ruokin, after all, is the only one who can cultivate in the realm of the realm. In the realm of God, monks who are stronger than him can be found everywhere. The evil star is a little bit wrong, so said. At the top of a holy tower not far from the mountain of destiny, Bai Ching Er looked at Zhang Ruokin's figure. General Zhu said, the girl is clever, and wants to capture Zhang Ruokin, and he can directly capture him by the hand of the adjudicator. If he wants to let him out, he can use Tianese pollen to marry the seven-handed old man, and he can let him out. Yuan Yuan level genius cannot escape your position. Bai Ching Er's face was calm and elegant, and said, Zhang Ruokin is more powerful than I expected. He should have discovered that the seven-handed old man is the ultimate source of crystals. Why do you see that? General Zhu asked in surprise. Bai Ching Er said, Zhou Yunong and Wu Yueming did not find the seven-handed old man in the Seven Star Emperor Palace. It can be seen that the seven-handed old man was hidden by Zhang Ruokin in a very secret place. Moreover, the ruling department and the destiny department now want to see seven. Old man with a huge reward. Zhang Ruokin didn't hand over the old man with seven hands, don't you think it's strange? The only possibility is that Zhang Ruokin knows that the seven-handed old man has extraordinary value, and the two are likely to have reached a cooperation. General Zhu said, will there be another possibility? The seven-handed old man has taken away Zhang Ruokin. Bai Ching Er was silent. General Zhu said, what does the girl mean? The mental strength of the seven-handed old man has reached the 69th level. It should not be difficult to win Zhang Ruokin. Zhang Ruokin's spiritual will is strong, which can consolidate the second-class sage. Where can the seven-handed old man win? He also said that even if the win is successful, it is also a dead end. Will the god of blood jealousy let go of the monk who lost his grandson? Bai Ching Er said, if I didn't guess wrong, Zhang Ruokin should immediately leave the realm of destiny and return to the world of the blood tribes. Lord Turtle stuttered, that, 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 how? General Zhu ignored it directly, and said, once Zhang Ruokin returns to the tribal wing world, he will enter the sea like a fish, and no one can control it. He must be intercepted halfway to capture him. Who says no one can control? Bai Ching Er said. General Zhu knew that the girl has always been courageous, often shocking, and she was worried, and advised, the Blood Heaven Tribe Wing World is the most ingrained place of the Blood Peer family. 
The Blood Peer family has three true gods, and the girl must be don't take risks. Yahuang realm is about to open, most of the gods will go, and the Blood Wing Tribe Wing world is not Longton Tiger Cave. Why can't I go? Whether it is the superb source crystal, or the seven-handed old man, I will take it back. Bai Ching'er's five soft and white jade fingers slowly protruded, grasping the small figure of Zhang Ruokin who had already gone, and closed his fingers, and squeezed them into fists, as if holding him in the palm of his hand. No one can take what belongs to her. The Shura constellation is the core territory of the Shura tribe, and its status is equivalent to the ten-winged worlds of the undead blood tribe. It stands in the starry sky, reaching billions of miles, and emits brilliant starlight. The stars, suspended above them, are like light spots, as small as dust. At the top of Shura's stellar world, the light is the brightest. It is one of the most sacred places in the entire Shura tribe, Shura War Soul Sea. All monks who flew from the other world to Shura's stellar world came out of the Sea of War Souls. They must undergo the baptism of the Sea of War Souls before they can reborn and become a true Shura. The Sea of Shura's War Spirits is boundless, and Shura's War Gas condenses into a liquid, rolling endlessly, rolling up thousands of waves. Farther from the sea, there are thunder and lightning shuttles, sending out heartbreaking and destructive waves, and the Great Saint cannot be approached. Wow! A figure wearing a black robe flew from the universe and landed on the shore of the war spirit. He unbuttoned the black cape at the beginning, revealing a thirty-year-old face with a beard, sharp eyes, deep noses, a tall and straight figure, and a strong temperament. When he arrived at the beach, he suddenly stopped, and Shen said, Who? The sound was louder than the thunder in the distance. His flesh and bones moved, his face instantly changed, and he turned into an abandonment. After the blood, he stepped on the waves of the sea of war spirits and walked out of the thunder and lightning. His pupils were burning, and he stared at the man in the black robe without blinking. Despite her efforts to restrain her emotions, her body still trembled slightly. The man in the black robe never expected that the blood would actually appear here. Looking at the woman he once loved the most, even if he had made countless imaginations after the two met again, he told himself that he must not let the other party see the flaws, but after all, he could not control his backlog of 800 mood. He wanted to turn away and run away, and wanted to remove his gaze, but his body was as petrified as he was, standing still. Do you want to hide it? Does it make sense? Should I tell you to abandon the sky or Zhang Ling? After the blood came to him, his eyes were as resentful as when they were separated 800 years ago. The difference is that this time the hatred is stronger. The man in the black robe smiled bitterly, Ching Yin. His face gradually changed back. It turned out that you practiced the magical powers in 33 heavens. The black and white body can change between Shura body and human body. There should be some other treasure in your body. Otherwise, you can't hide the deity of the Temple of Destiny only by the black and white body. The man in the black robe said, Don't ask, I won't say. Just like 800 years ago. The voice after the blood became a bit cold and sharp, and a bright light appeared in the eyes, saying, 800 years ago. I promised you to stay in the endless abyss, before Kun Lun was broken by hell, or practiced never be born until you become a god, or until you hear the news. At the time, I asked you why? You told me not to ask, I must wait for your news. I didn't ask because I believed in you. I promised you and did it. But you promised me to take good care of the dust, have you done it? Zhang Ling you are so disappointed that you are not worthy of being a husband or father. The man in the black robe just wanted to speak, but was interrupted by the blood, 800 years ago, have you ever thought about how I spent in the endless abyss? In these 800 years, have you ever thought about going to endless take a look at me in the abyss? Just in order to wait for your news, I am angry with myself and imprisoned myself in the endless abyss for 800 years. I thought that one day you would come to the endless abyss to find me, but that day never came. In fact, 
until the sixteenth year, when I learned about your disappearance and the death of Chenner, I cried for a long time. For eight hundred years in the endless abyss, I sometimes wonder if you have been killed. It does nt make sense to continue to wait. But because I believe in you, I chose to wait. How good it is that you are dead, why should you suddenly appear in front of me again? The man in the black robe did not dare to look at her, his eyes closed slightly and he said, I'm sorry. I'm sorry to finish it. You're sorry many people, in addition to me and Chen Er, as well as the court officials and people who follow your Zhang family in Shengming Central Empire. Although one sentence after the blood was fiercer than one sentence, in my eyes, I was already full of tears and said, the truth, I just want to know the truth now. The man in the black robe regained his spirits, straightened his waist, walked from behind the blood, walked to the sea of war spirits, looked at the endless sea, and said, you should know that to become Shura, to rise to the sea of war spirits, you need kill. To kill many, many people, to make yourself cruel and bloody, not only to do so, but also to make your heart completely like that. This taste is not good. If you kill for me, only become Shura for me, and join Hell, I will be moved, and I can even forgive you for your ruthlessness and indifference for eight hundred years. But in fact, you are not united with the cabinet, kill the new goddess Feng Feng. You sneak into the world, what are you trying to do? He asked after the blood. The man in the black robe said, it turned out that there was a leak. When Chen Er was targeted by the adjudicator, you didn't make a shot, you just wanted to force me to make a shot, and then found me out. After the blood said, if you can do nothing but die, I won't give you a chance to speak at this moment. I will greet you with my palm print and the blood sea mirror. The man in the black robe tightened his brows, his eyes full of sorrow, saying, Ching Yin, these eight hundred years, I am really sorry for you and Chen Er. However, I am only for survival, and more people. You asked me eight hundred years ago, why did you stay in the endless abyss? In fact, I just want you to live. The Kunlun realm cannot tolerate an undead blood, just like the verdict that SI cannot tolerate dust. Home, country and world must make a choice. If the world is gone, where does the home and country come from? The former Emperor Ming disappeared www.mtlnovel.com or died, isn't it a good thing for you? Hell world can tolerate an undead blood race who fell in love with humans in Kunlun world? It's intolerable in this crisis in a troubled world, many people are struggling on the brink of death. I hope you are the daughter of the god of blood, not the wife of Zhang Ling. When a person stands in that position, he must bear his due responsibilities, even if he leaves everything behind. He who owes you and Chainer will be able to repay you with my life after I have done that. At that time, I must tell you the truth. With a bang, the man in the black robe turned into a light mark, rushed into the sea of war souls in Shura, and disappeared in the place with the most thunder and lightning. After the blood, he was standing alone by the seaside, gazing at the back of his departure, and couldn't hold back the tears in his eyes. After all, for the man she loved throughout her life, she couldn't get it. He became a for eight hundred years. How good is Chi Yao's talent for cultivation? Her biological mother was ignored. Follow the WeChat public account Fishinyu and reply to the keyword Chi Yao's hung mother to view. How wide the world is, I am afraid that it may not be clear to the deities. The monk could only look out at a distant starry sky and stare at a yellow starry river across the universe. It has existed since ancient times, like a Huangchuan river. A river formed by countless stars. Of course there are borders in the world. There are tens of thousands of planets scattered there. The forces of the Ten Clan and the Temple of Destiny have become weak. The dark forces and the various ethnic groups are the masters here. The Hundred Clan King City is a very famous city on the edge of the world. It is a royal city established by 137 clans to fight against the increasingly powerful dark forces. It is also used to negotiate with the Temple of Destiny and the Ten Clan. Greater Benefits 
twisted into a ball, have the right to speak. Monks of different races can be found everywhere in the royal city of hundreds of people. They have different clothes, different cultures, and even different languages. The coexistence of multiple ethnic groups has created prosperity here, but it has also made management very difficult. That's why, the monks on the side of heaven can easily enter the city and probe the news of hell. The Bliss Ghost Forest, built in the eastern part of the Baicheng King City, is a dense forest covering an area of 10,000 acres. The ghostly fire in the forest floated, but it was a grim and exciting place. Peach Blossom is sitting in a building built from the skeletons of giant monsters, alone, tasting the blood wine made by the Xianyuan tribe. The wine made from blood does not have a taste. The skeleton building was tied with red diamonds and wind chimes. The wind came, the wind chimes swayed, and Hong Ling fluttered. Beautiful and beautiful. But peach blossoms are more beautiful. She looks as if she is only twenty years old, young, and beautiful, her skin is more delicate than babies, her eyes are bright and big, and her pink eyebrows have three pink peach blossoms, which makes her look full of vitality, like a fairy. She was sitting on the blue stone, and the blood wine in the glass was as crystalline as amber. In the Bliss Ghost Forest, many monks looked at her from afar, her eyes salivating. After all, a woman like her is not always seen. However, no one dared to go forward to drink with her, and did not dare to have the evil thoughts of holding her in her arms or under her body. Because in the pool in front of her, seventeen bodies had been floating. Blood stained the pool water as red as wine in a glass. Those bodies were once monks who wished to drink with her. Among them, there are beautiful men who are extremely handsome, there are also monks who have become powerful sacred realms, and a more distinguished family of young masters. Without exception, whether you want to chat or have a deeper purpose, all were killed and fell into the pool. The owner of Bliss Ghost Forest did not dare to approach her, only hoping that this beautiful killer could leave as soon as possible. At this time, another man walked towards the pool. In the Bliss Ghost Forest, Excited laughter sounded, ready to watch the lively. See how the man was killed. Since ancient times, men who died of beauty have been innumerable. Like moths who knew they would burn themselves, but still rushed into the fire. Seen from this, they died unjustly. The man, dressed in a frigid cloth, holding a rusty iron sword in his hand, looked young, and did not have the breath of the cause to escape. No different from an ordinary human who has just learned to practice sword. Those monks looking far away are curious. How did such a downcast human being enter the royal city of a hundred races? How did you enter the bliss ghost forest? Never mind. He's going to die anyway. Ten steps, nine steps, eight steps. In the eyes of everyone's surprise, shock and curiosity, he walked to the woman with three peach petals in her brows and sat down. Sitting on the same piece of blue stone. He also took it easy, took the glass on the blue stone and took a sip. I found it. I found it, I found her identity, she is the number one killer emperor of the heavenly killing organization, named Dehua. According to legend, there is no monk in the realm, she can't kill. This, how is this possible? The black-skinned monk who just ran over stared in shock at a man and a woman sitting close by the pool, lowered his head, and stared at the information just found in his hands. Immediately, he was not sure whether the woman was a peach. The information stated that Dehua would not allow any monk to enter her three feet. It would not allow a man to sit beside her and still drink her wine. You said she was a peach flower, so who is the man sitting next to her? Is it a peach tree or a peach leaf? Ha <laughs> ha! I think it's peach blossoms. Many monks are ridiculing, and do not believe that the famous killing emperor, Peach Blossom, will appear in the royal city of a hundred ethnic groups. Peach Blossom is indeed the first killer under the God of God organization, just like outside rumors, she also believes that under God, there is no monk who can't kill her. As a matter of fact, she should have crossed over to God and stepped into the realm of God. However, she knew that once she passed away, 
she would be dead, so she kept suppressing her realm. Why? Because I have killed too many people, I already have a heart knot. The reason for the knot is that she still has good intentions, and every time she kills, she will resist and be uncomfortable. Every time I kill someone, there will be one more heart knot. The demon will also be strong. However, after thousands of years of killing, she has become accustomed to killing. Murder is the most direct and fastest way to solve problems. She sat here drinking and waiting, most annoying when someone came near and looked at her with a pair of eyes that wanted to possess her. If you do nt kill them, do you still waste time and reason with them? She was never a reasoner, it would be more painful than murder. She hates everyone in the world, maybe there is no one in the world, she can be relieved, clean, and think about whether to learn calligraphy or embroidery next. Of course, that was before. Now she has a person in her heart who is not annoying. The only person in the world who is not annoying. Even if this person has been opposing her for a while, her heart is almost perverted and secretly happy, which is an interesting thing. This is the commoner man beside him. He is also a killer. His name is Ale. On one occasion, Peach Blossom and Heart and Monster Battle defeated each other, and they floated in the universe, their bodies could not move, and the dignity of their bodies kept escaping outwards, so that a peach forest grew around their bodies. Maybe a year, maybe a decade. Too long. Very long. She thought that she would die in this effort can be relieved. At that time, Ale entered the Peach Blossom Forest. At the deepest part of the Peach Blossom, she saw her naked and naked and lying there motionless. Tahua has always been very confident, not only killing people, but also about her looks and body. More than 90% of the people she killed were men who slapped her beauty. She knows men so much, don't say that she can't move now, even if the men know that she is a murderer emperor there will be countless people who are not afraid of death, and rush at her. But this time she guessed wrong. She thought Ale would invade her, but Ale didn't. Maybe she wasn't interested in her, or maybe the person who chased him was too strong, so that he could only suppress his heart. The monk who hunted down Ale was Wu Wu, a great saint in a hundred realms. Wu Li chases into the peach blossom forest, Ale hides. Wu deliberately knew that Ale was hiding nearby, but he couldn't ignore a beautiful woman like Dehua, and based on his cultivation, he didn't take Ale, who had just broken into the great sacred realm, at all. Wu Sun, who is practicing evil ways, just wants to pick up peach blossoms and make himself develop rapidly. At that time, peach blossom was so disgusted that she could not wait to die. She thought that Ale would take advantage of this opportunity to escape but he never thought of it, but he suddenly stood up and stood beside her, directly facing Wu Wu. That picture brought endless shock to Peach Blossom. Ailee's back is the most upright back she has ever seen since she practiced, and she will never forget it. Ailee is certainly not Wu Wu's opponent, but his swordsmanship is almost the same. In the end, he was seriously injured and dying, and temporarily frightened Wu Liu. Ale immediately fled with peach blossoms, hiding in Tibet from the Middle East in the universe, and avoiding the pursuit of Wu delusion for three full months. In fact, at the moment of remembering Ale in his heart, peach blossom had suppressed the demon. But she did not immediately kill Wu delusion. Because she wanted to see if Ale was disguising herself or not trying to do anything to her. It is for this reason that in those three months, she saw the toughest man in the world. No matter how desperate she was forced, no matter how many injuries she suffered, no matter how dangerous the situation, she seemed not to be over him. He can always break through and live with her. And he is also the most indifferent man in the world, as if he is not interested in her stunning beauty. Save her just because she is a weak woman who has no power to fight back. It would be a rabbit, a cat, maybe he would do the same. In the end, Wu Delusion died under Ailee's sword, and she did not have a chance to shoot after all. Ailee's repairs are too fast. When she left, she asked Ail, are we friends? Friend, 
I have only one, but not you, he said. When the two met again, it was the day she took on the task of killing Zhang Ruokan in the best Saint Bounty rankings. From that day on, they not only became friends but also became enemies. Ale has been chasing her for a whole month, from heaven, all the way to hell, just to stop her from killing Zhang Ruo this. During this period, they also fought several times. In fact, it is not a fight, because every time, Ale will be seriously injured by her and dying, there is no power to fight back. She thought that Ale would definitely retreat. However, every time Ale can catch up again. Just like this time. Dehua looked at the wine glass in his hand and said, You are the first person to dare to drink my wine. I'm just thirsty. After all, in order to chase you, I've been flying in the universe for three days without sleep. After drinking, the commoner man's pale face finally recovered some blood. Dehua said, You are too slow. Just at your speed, you want to stop me from going to to kill people. Did I catch up? If I don't wait for you, you can catch up? Besides, even if you catch up, I can kill you with one sword, you can't stop me. The commoner man shook his head and said, You can't kill me. 